Who wants oh, who wants well, ups on this? Oh, okay. This is a helicopter one. Helicopters. A lot of helicopters. Adam's reaching for it. Oh, sorry. It's fine. <laughs> what is this? This is the hornet's nest. There's a bunch of other helicopters in here, and they're gonna fuck you up. You um, gotta like fly in through these things to not get shit. shot. You Kill don't know which else. way is up and which way is down. Whoa! Oh! Right. Okay, well, that was fast. Dead. You gotta get. He moving. didn't even move forward at all. He <laughs> just went <laughs> down and up. I was just trying to get my bearings. Get out! Oh, oh, oh my God! Whoa! Oh. 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 Is the game? Oh, I thought the game was becoming widescreen. Shit. Not like a fight was gonna break out or something. Rillo, we need to we need to bring '90s '90s male aesthetics back. No, we don't. Yeah, we no, do. we don't. Men look like cartoons now, and I love it. Well, it's because of steroids. Nice shot. But I mean, steroids, steroids were then. Yeah. Now it's weird. Yeah, but there's more steroids. Yeah. Arnold Schwarzenegger in the bodybuilding age of the early '80s, yeah. late '70s, early '80s. That was a golden age. Big big mustaches and dudes <laughs> who who weighed who weighed 280 pounds of pure muscle and would tell you that they had never taken a drug in their life. <laughs> All natural, baby. Ah! Oh, shredded you. Man. Yeah, I need a flight stick like that guy. Are you trying the guns now, Adam? Yeah, for close range combat. Too close for missile, switching to guns. There. Hey, we could talk about there Top Gun. Go. They're there finally making that you sequel. What sequel? Top Gun. Is Kenny Loggins still alive? Yeah, probably not. He is. He's my like, mom knows him. I think Kenny Loggins is like 38 years old. <laughs>my mom knows him. What do you mean she knows him? Like he's a, he's a very not primally. He's a very friend. You sure about that? No. I actually don't know that. Highway to the danger, the danger zone. zone. Is Maniac <laughs> written about your mother? Has she been on his yacht? <laughs> Which is his, what he calls his dick. Kenny Loggins is happily married. There's nothing wrong with it. Don't Hey, how'd you do Adam? that? I don't know. Adam, great job. Hey, highway <laughs> to the first place. Zone. You completed the objective. I don't think anyone's ever done that before. Well, we're going out on a high note with GTA. <laughs> what the fuck? Stefan saying Kenny Loggins is writing the music for Top Gun 2. Hey, the Dream Team's back. Oh. That 40 year old's gonna make it. <laughs> Boom! Yeah. Oh, look at those shots, guys. Oh! What? You ever think about the fact that James Cameron was filming Terminator uh -oh. and. <laughs> 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 and then he filmed the scene with Linda Hamilton, and she's having sex, and he's watching from the beginning. He was like, "Who's that? Was me." So then he had sex with her. Yeah. Kyle Reese. What was his name? Michael, Michael Bean. Michael Bean. Bean. Yeah. I'd like to get fucked by that guy. Well, he's weird. I mean, he's awesome, but he's yeah. not great. James, you son of a bitch. No, he's not. But he's awesome. Guys, he was in Command and Conquer 2, which is getting remastered, so we can all see Michael Bean again. Remember, James Cameron loves him. Don't ever forget, he's in every James Cameron film. Oh no! Oh! Oh! First oh. Bruce! Bruce, you're doing okay. Damn it, I can't wait till Red Dead comes out. I'll be better at that. Oh, will you? And we can end our Red Dead Redemption 2 gameplay. Well, none of us will ever play it again. 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 again, 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 again. Wait, did they reboot Dirty Dancing yet? Yeah, they did Havana Nights. Technically, soft reboot. What? It's a soft reboot because it takes place in the same universe as Dirty Dancing. And I'm pretty sure Patrick Swayze was in it, right? Or is he dead by then? I don't know. He's in Ghost. He is in Ghost. I'm saying now. He's a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Woo! Bruce. Man, we are shredded in the <coughs> helicopter zone. So, am I the only one that was like... At the, the spectacular stunt finish of Fallout, when they're doing the cool helicopter shit. Am I the only one that was like, why was that not as cool as it should have been? The, Those were awesome! The cruise did was Tom pretty Cruise cool. Tom Cruise was flying that helicopter through a fucking cl cliffs and shit! Was yeah. Henry Cavill's mustache worth it? Yes. Uh, yes. Absolutely it was, it was Okay. His mouth is so <laughs> unnatural. It's funny too, because looking at it, I can't imagine how they could have done a better job. You know, all the world's wealth and resources and the smartest people in the world mm. trying to make that lip look normal, and they just couldn't do it. I'm pretty sure the CG artist didn't give a you shit. You think it was like it was spite or just happened? I mean, Probably Paramount a weekend they had. The Paramount made them <laughs> yeah, do it. They like do. basically were like the two old men from Trading Places arguing with each other yeah. about that shit. With poor beautiful Henry Cavill stuck in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> and the first apartment I had when I graduated college, it had this full mirror in front of the toilet, so when you were pissing, you had to stare at your own dick. Hmm. But also when you were jacking off... You don't you, have... Lawrence, was, you could have just turned your back to it. How do you... What? No, the mirror was facing the toilet. You're staring directly at the mirror, you, so... You jizz into Kleenex, Lawrence. Yeah, or your roommate socks like the rest of us did. That's... <laughs> That's a waste of paper products, Bruce. I'm, not, I'm ashamed of you. You for don't have to use very much of it. Just yeah, I use do. a little bit. Bruce, yeah, I do. When you're staring at pictures of Henry Cavill. <laughs> oh, yeah.
Fuck. Back then, though, all you had was pictures of him from the Count of Monte Cristo, and that's weird because he was underage, you sicko. <laughs> To be fair, <laughs> Guy Pierce was in that movie with him. <laughs> and Guy Pierce has always been handsome. What happened to Guy Pierce? Yeah, he's fine. He's still in shit. He's doing things. He was in Iron Man 3. He's rich. Oh, you don't yeah. care. He was in Iron Man 3. I remember I remember he was like he I saw him in Memento. I was like, this oh, guy Pierce guy's guy. taken off. Yeah. And then I saw him in Time Machine and I was like, uh and then he disappeared for a decade. Oh, oh wait. You know, my bad. He was in Count of Monte Cristo. Two seconds. That was Jim Caviezel. <laughs> Hold on. Guy Pierce might be in the Count of Monte Cristo. I think he's the bad yeah, guy. He is. He definitely okay. is. Okay. Sorry, but he's not the Count of Monte Cristo. Guys, that was no. my. That's Jim Caviezel. That was my first date I ever took a woman on. Whoa. Was, I went, Look up the year. I know. I was like. It's probably 2000. I was like 15, <laughs> unfortunately. Oh, two. I forgot about this movie existing. Oh, no. I was much older. It's kind of okay. Whatever. You guys watch the shitty version. Gankutsu. I was Gankutsu. Way this is the best version of Count of Monte Cristo ever. Really? Really? It looks like it's a vampire. Awesome. I've never seen it. Rule. Oh, sweet. I yeah. read that book and I was like, I'm still a little confused. And I had to like do the spark notes afterwards, figure everything out. Watch that movie and I was like, I guess so, but it seems so quick. This version is fucking sick. It looks like okay. it looks awesome. And then it's also the best translation of that story ever. Oh, yeah, right. So good. As he usual. went to space prison. Yep. What space the, prison. What the space fuck are you talking well, about? Well, because remember, uh, whatever the name, the, the dude went to an island prison. Yeah, yeah. But in this, it's space prison. And instead of finding an old man who gives him treasure, he finds a space demon that attaches his, his to his heart like a parasite. Was this produced by Luke Basson? Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, oh yeah, you're locked into this thing. Solomon is an actual DJ. I didn't know that. Uh, they were they're all real DJs. I yeah, thought. I just it was GTA teaches me more about real life than it ought to. But yeah. I was I was going past some club in LA and it was like it's featuring Solomon. Yeah. I was like, Fuck. Rockstar okay, will always real. be cooler than you. Yeah, that's and what they, I've like, learned. It's confirmed. They're super yeah. into music culture, which I appreciate a yeah. lot. Their that's soundtracks are always on fucking point. It's like when they got spoiler inside of Red Dead Redemption Two. You talking about Jeff? No, there's a musical. Number they do later, but you guys are. Oh, Kings of Leon! <laughs> Did I get it right? That's it's it. Weezer. <laughs> oh, Weezer! <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would be Little Lion Man, whatever band that is. <laughs> Mumford and Sons? There we go. Mumford oh, yeah. and Sons. Yeah, that's the one. They're more popular than. Well, they're not more popular than Weezer. Can someone that. tell me which one's Mumford? <laughs> Mumford is the old one. <laughs> And so the rest of them are his kids? I don't know. I think he's the main dude. The people say I look like him. Guys, I just realized Mumford and Sons like is, is the reboot of Hootie and the Blowfish. We don't know who's who. What? Yep. There is no reboot. Nobody can re recreate Darius McCrary. GTA. <laughs> when are they rebooting Highlander? Probably soon. They rebooted every shitty well, 80s because franchise because Adam's so far. friend owns the rights. It's your friend, too. He's all of our friends. Oh. Bernie Burns. He doesn't own the rights to. No, he doesn't. I, George Rooster Teeth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I remember hearing that. Why would he buy the rights to that? Because why not? Why wouldn't you? How much was it? I mean, like cheap. <laughs> yeah, I was. I, I, really? Do you know the number? <sighs> like, I don't. I have no idea. I've never heard the number like, discussed. Maybe, maybe like, like. Okay. Like. Uh, what? Uh, I don't know what he's doing. Why did you start with the leftmost hand? No, no, no. Like so that number. Okay. And that number. All right. Yeah, I that think you got it. Right. I think you got it for that. I think. I don't know. Don't quote me on this. There is no way. Why aren't you saying? You're showing your hands. Not what I'm doing like this though. You can't. T yeah, you can no, probably you tell. Can. Tell. It was seventy-five. <laughs> I was also just guessing. I don't know. Seventy-five dollars. <laughs> that, that's what I assume it's worth. <laughs> I mean, you're absolutely right. I mean, it could be only one. Here we are. I, the, I had print. Princes of the Universe stuck in my head for like a week last week. What's that? Prince Queen's of the Universe. Queen's theme song. Yeah. Oh. It's a song from Princes yeah. of the Universe. We should probably get off Highlander. Princes of yeah. the Universe. I can't. Look at him. There, that's Adrian Paul. What yeah. else was he in? What else does he Who need to cares? be in? He's been in other things. I know he has. For this shot, you'll be wearing a leather vest and holding a katana. Is that Man. okay? Doesn't matter. I'm telling you, nothing was better than being a sweet, cool dude on TV in the early 90s. I know. Nothing was better. Yeah. You made enough money uh -huh. that you could afford some fucking sweet-ass house that would burn down eventually. <laughs> a nice car. Right? A nice car. Yeah. Uh -huh. You weren't so busy or so well-known that you were being bothered by people, but if you told anyone, they'd bang you. Sure. That's true. And then also, you were shredded. And you were shredded. Because you were working out. Yeah. It, basically, your your <laughs> regimen was 
film for like five hours, uh-huh. go do karate, <laughs> and then and then go snort cocaine or whatever yeah. in your mansion. That was all you had to do. That's awesome. I love GTA. I've talked about this many times on many GTA gameplays. I play all the time at home. What are those controls? Uh, well... Left to make your character go left. Right to make your character go right. Seems pretty rudimentary, but... And then up to make your character walk away from the screen. How am I going to take off in that airplane? Get off that runway. Oh boy, there are a lot of controls you got to hit at the same time to do that. Uh... So we're playing a map with two other people? I know, this is just a practice. Is it? This is so that you guys can learn the buttons. Uh, Lana, what are we playing today? This is called Gaming Room. Um, it's basically like a very chaotic racing map. There's only two people. There's only two people. Well, the fans I mean, are getting it. I know, it. but They're we'll, we'll it do it again, okay? That's and fine. I'm already third, so it's All not right. going great. Oh, you're but already last. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna talk about it. It's okay. No, nobody's playing GTA to win. Everyone yeah, plays GTA to win. Every, every fan that we play with plays yeah. to win. Oh, they are geez. always trying yeah. to beat I us. I misspoke. Least. I'm having a lot of trouble. I thought you tested all these maps. There we go. That, I have that's, that's your thing. Go become a car. M car. There. You're right. like Bumblebee or uh, who are the other two Transformers that hunted him? Shockwave. No. In the new one, they can be a helicopter, a car, or a person robot. A person robot? Well, like, what, I don't know. What do you call them? A humanoid robot? Yeah, I guess that's right. You're right. Wait, what? When they live on Cybertron, they they look like humans. They have two legs, two arms, right? Yeah, but they're still turning into jets and shit. On Cybertron? Yeah. It's called Cybertron. <laughs> that's not what happened in. Uh, in the first Transformers, they all saw cars and they turned into cars, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, they, they scanned them and they, they had went, a, they had a oh, DVD okay, copy of the film Cars. cars. Yeah. No, no. And the new one, like, there were already jets and cassette players and stuff on Cybertron. How do they know about that? I don't know. That's Michael Bay. Is he still making those? No, no. it's Kubo and the Two Strings Man. Yeah. He did Wait, a great really? job. Yeah, yeah. No, apparently he did a better job than Michael Bay did. Oh, absolutely. He gets emotion. Michael Bay get explosion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that's it. Some say Mark Wahlberg was supposed to play the Haley Stanfeld. Roll. <laughs> What's her name, Adam? Haley's stands <laughs> fall. <laughs> you got it. I should have had that roll. Mark. <laughs> Mark. Mark, <laughs> Mark Wahlberger. I can't believe it. That's how it I should have been Haley's dying pill. What's the name of his uh, burger chain? Wahlburgers. Wahlburgers. Yeah, he runs it with Donnie and who? Uh, Marie. Fun fact about Wahlburgers: Mark Wahlberg works at every Wahlburgers. At every single one of them, he's secret boss. <laughs> Not really every a single one. Boss but he, he's, he's like, oh, Mark. it was me the whole time. Hey, I'm Mark Wahlberg. Hey, I got a New York accent. <laughs> Look, guys, I got that. Oh, that's bad. Bronze medal. Is it my turn? Yeah. Who's pro? This is gaming room. Gaming room sounds like a failed TV show that either G4 Machinima Welcome or Game Trailers gaming room. would have created. <laughs> What do we do on Gaming Room? We play Candy Crush. See? <laughs> fuck my life. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. I'll teach you how to floss. Just testing out the buttons. Yeah, how they, how's that? Is that You're really warming them up? Is that, is that up a, to your standards? Up down, got it. Do you guys think you've ever had a heart attack? <laughs> I just didn't notice. <laughs> I think I had one at one RTX. Time I wondered if I had a really sore heart and I wondered if I'd had a heart attack. Uh-huh. Really, it was just congestion. Yeah, women experience heart attacks different than men, too. Oh, Wait, really? Yeah. I don't know exactly. Um, I just saw a headline recently with a beautiful, I'm sure, beautifully written article that I did not stop to read. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. You see, that's Killed the sound Mark it. Wahlberg makes. Oh, I got it somehow. Wow. And I died? died? What the yeah. fuck? Are you surprised? I absolutely am. That was not at all what I had told the controller to do. Oh. <laughs> he shouts at it. <laughs> Everyone knows that I obviously uh, have no latency when it comes to controlling a yeah. video game. Mm-hmm. And the video game is the problem, not me. Yeah, I know. I usually go, play as good as Bruce. <laughs> I shout that at my controller. It just doesn't happen. It no. doesn't happen. Oh. Wait a minute. There we go. All right, there they go. Launch over the I thing and make it. make it. Oh, you know, oh yes, oh, I got it. Fucking it. Woo! That's it. You bet. Look at this, son. That's our boy. Well, the, the thing is, is that what you want to do is you want to bide your time. So, okay. I'm in third right now, uh-huh. but I'm gonna make that big move. You missed your checkpoint. I did, but I'll make it. Is this it. part of the plan? <laughs> Shit, Bruce, you're so good at this. Well, you know, like in Mario Kart, how you can't stay in first place the whole time, or else you get hit by those blue shells over and over. I mean, sure, but you know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, then that's kind of the same thing. Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. I realized uh-huh. I made a mistake. <laughs> that noise that I made, I don't know, uh-huh. that was yeah, the, yeah, yeah. That was, I realized I had made a mistake. But again, just biding my time. Mm-hmm. For uh, what? I, well, I told you, well, I'll blast ahead once they all get hit by blue shells. Mm. <laughs> like, see, Turbid thinks he's going to win. Mm. I make him feel comfortable, make him feel safe. And then, 
just at the very last minute. Bang! Look at that. See, I passed him. Oh, that's right. Fourth, Fourth place. place. That wouldn't have happened if you went behind him. Exactly. Oh. This is the way I play video games all the time. I don't know if you guys ever watched. Whenever I've never I play seen games. you play hey! a video game like this. Uh, <laughs> well, the thing is, what the fuck? Uh, is uh, <laughs> when I'm playing a video game, I'm honorable, and I don't hit anybody, and they don't hit me. So yeah, I passed you let, them, you let them make their own mistakes. I let them make exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, imagine the guy that crashed into Dale Earnhardt and killed him. Imagine that guilt that you'd have to carry for the rest oh, of your I life. Oh, I'd say pride. But then imagine being the guy that ran into Stephen King with the fan. Right. I did not give a shit. Yeah, yeah. And no. then you just kind of made Stephen he, King. He actually made out the best yeah. because Stephen King bought the van from him. Well, and also Stephen King that spawned a lot of really good literature from Stephen right? King. Right. So it's like that dude was like, "You're fucking welcome." Yep. So thank God he did that. We yeah. can thank him for Dreamcatcher and the rushed ending of the Dark. Tower series. Man, mm -hmm. Those are great. Before then, people don't know this. J.R.R. Martin and Stephen King were best friends. Do you mean G.R.R. Martin? Yeah, he mixed J.R. <laughs> yeah, I know. But Gurr told Steve Gurr. S. King, you don't need, you don't owe them anything. You take as long as you want. He said, that's great. Thank you so much. I'm gonna go walk down the street real quick and grab my coat. And he went, you got it. And they got hit by the van. <laughs> and then he, from then he was like, I could die at any moment. Then he said, I need to finish these books now before I die. That was 30 years ago. He's written a million books. And he's literally written one million books. It's true. Did you say that he was driving down the street to get his coat? He's just walking down the he street. Walking, you want to go by walking. noon, he's so rich. <laughs> he's done a lot of really fucked up stuff. Like, just there's so many fucked up things. Teenage boys, like, fucking each other in the ass with guns. Like, there's a lot of weird that shit. That's rad. <laughs> Who's playing next? <laughs> Oh yeah, Elise. It you. Oh, no, it's you. Elise, you want to race? I don't care. I'll do whatever. Okay. It's not. It's not about the game for yeah. me. Bruce has now imbued his knowledge onto you, much I, like uh, true, I have. Stephen King had all those kids take a turn on the one girl in the sewers. Jeez, oh, are you talking it? about it? Yeah. yeah. What? Isn't that is weird that it, like a grown yeah. man was writing about that, but. He was also high on cocaine. Yeah. Collectively in this room, we could probably never finish a novel together that would even get a. A fraction of the acclaim oh, the he has, yeah. no or way. sales, no. anything. He can be high on coke and write an award-winning novel and but not have, remember it. Has this room tried getting high on coke and writing a novel? No. <laughs> Every That's night. That's a good BTS. That's a good BTS. I'm gonna crap. I'm totally oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, you're not. You're alive. You gotta do those controls Bruce told you about. Remember, left bumper, right bumper. Oh, the wrong way. Okay. okay, okay. You're gotcha, gotcha. far outside the oh, hypercube. I'm going down. I'm going down. Mayday, just, mayday, just, mayday. <laughs> just crash. Just crash. Oh, I just gotta get to that car. Oh, Come I'm on, guys. <laughs> oh, I hate, I hate this game. <laughs> There's a Stephen King book where someone eats semen off of bed sheets. I feel like I should know this. <laughs> But Elise is really excited for Doctor Sleep, the sequel to The Shining. Yeah, they, it's like Grown Up Danny. The mm -hmm. book has come out, obviously. Does he still do the finger thing? I know <laughs> he does not. <laughs> yeah, I heard he's like a vegan, so they're like, "Why wouldn't you eat that food?" He goes, "Cause meat is murder or red rum shit." <laughs> 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 the one thing from The Shining. <laughs> Flawless delivery. <laughs> <laughs> Do I need to boost there no, to get that? that? No, you, you just gotta hold down the thing. Time, well, then what thing? The yeah, which the one, right Bruce? The gas. You, you're a terrible <laughs> coach. I know, you're right, I was. That I fell down on the job on yeah. that one. Yeah. Come on! Oh, hey, yeah. It's Charlie's! You know what? It's never about the game. I mean, it is about the game right oh, now. Geez. You oh, did man. it. You're doing oh, well. Come on! Do not fuck with me! Again. Do not <laughs> fuck with Elise! <laughs> DNF, baby! I'm a shine in the death match. You are. You always shine in those death matches. Uh, and I shined know. in this as well. I you, shone in this. <laughs> shone so bright. Murder! You guys are never gonna get good at this game if you don't practice. <laughs> this is one thing I always say as a coach. Then how are you get good? I told you, I practice all the time. You I went on that GTA retreat last year. I stream under a pseudonym. Uh-huh. What, what is, is it? it? Uh, Binja. <laughs> Right? Bruce Ninja by yeah, the B. We got yeah, it. Yeah, it just yeah. wasn't good. And because people no, binge your fine. streams. Because they binge my streams. Oh. <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Elise. You get it. You get understand. It. What, do you, what do you call your Twitch chat? The bingeons. <laughs> That's not racist. I, no. No. Oh, I mentioned it earlier, but you also said you went on that GTA retreat last year. I did. I you spent a lot of money to go on that week-long retreat, Bruce. I got to meet the creators of GTA. Yeah. Grand yeah. and theft themselves. No, neither one of those people. The creator of GTA is Tom Cruise. 
He wrote GTA. Days of Thunder. Okay. By himself. Inspired him. Have you ever found Tom Cruise attractive? No. Me neither. No. What about when his face is all fucked up in Vanilla Sky? Or when he uh, did that rousing speech in uh, the movie that's not Boogie Nights? And he's like, Magnolia. Res- he's like, respect my cock. Yeah, I like that movie. Yeah. yeah he's great in Magnolia. All women yeah. love him in that movie. Don't you gather around and watch it with your friends during your uh, Tupperware parties? or whatever? During your cycles? <laughs> You're all synced up. Yeah. You're all bleeding out your butts or whatever. And just, That's right, Adam. Watching late I'm, 90s Tom Cruise movies. <laughs> Adam, you've been married for years. You yeah. should know a little something about women. What? He does. Oh, that's true. He's he knows about that. I know what women want. In the sequel that's coming out for some reason, what men want. <laughs> Why is that a movie? A lot of what are we playing today? This is a death match that I have not tested. <laughs> all right. How professional. Yep. Oh, there I mean, they I go. didn't know oh, that I was supposed slide under to do that. Thing. So. <laughs> you did not slide. You oh, jumped damn. right over it. <laughs> he had a rocket launcher and you had a shotgun. Holy <laughs> like Bruce coaching. Early, yeah, that, this is the... Yeah, now teach me colors. That is helpful. Twitch.tv yes. slash Binja, everybody. Binjans unite. Oh, hold on, my right's here. <laughs> you took the... Is this your best friend? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> You're like, let's go, wheelie crash. <laughs> Bruce, do you have any advice for Adam? Get better. He's jumping. Out. A is jump. It's not. It's not? No. Oh, I know why. Because I configured my controls differently at home. Uh. <laughs> we can't do this bit because that was a previous video. Yeah, I know. I mean, we can yeah, always, right. we can throw back. We were, we were talking about something new. I forget what it was. Like Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise, that's oh, right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Girls love Tom Cruise. He's Do 55 they? years old, but women love him. I don't really want to fuck Tom Cruise. Yeah, no, a lot no of analysts both said that she's not attractive. Well, like, attractive. I'm not, it's not a hard stance. I'm not like, hell no. I'm just like, no. You can tell me you're not hard around Tom Cruise. <laughs> I mean, I am. Yeah, Boy, if you look so at Tom weird. Cruise's face and you put a line down the middle, yeah. he has his tooth right in the middle of his face. We'll see it after the gameplay. I have the same thing. Tell us about it. So when I smile, my teeth are not perfectly lined up. See? That hmm. means you could be famous. I don't think mine are either. I could be the next Tom Cruise. That means that women will be like, eh, I don't really want to fuck <laughs> no him. Wants eh. sex That's not true. There are other people that love to have sex with Tom Cruise. Uh, where are they? Well, they're mostly male. Zero percent of this room. This not zero percent. Adam wants to. Do you want to fuck Tom Cruise? Adam? Absolutely. Oh, See? my bad. I'm well, sorry. I guess he seems to be more of an alpha, so you he'd probably be fuck fucking you. me. Yeah. <laughs> and Christopher McQuarrie is filming it. Mm-hmm. He's, oh, he man. films everything of yeah. his now. I know, and that would be yeah. great. It'd make millions of dollars. Let's say. Tom Cruise goes up to your husband or boyfriend and they go, I'll give you $1 million to have sex with me. Wait, wait, wait. Tom Cruise is offering me. Yeah, it goes to James, says a million dollars. Alana just comes up to you and says, do you want to fuck? (laughs) For a million dollars? No, no money. (laughs) The answer is no. What? You won't have sex with Tom Cruise for free? I would for a million dollars. Wait, wait. Yeah, wait, I'm just having sex with him for free, and he asks yes. James and then if you, that's okay. But, but you both <laughs> make, that's the hypothetical question. Both, no, no, but you both make a million dollars. A million dollars is not coming to play with a lot. <laughs> hey, what, okay, why? Is she just lucky to have sex with Tom Cruise? Is that what this is? But well, she gets a yeah. million dollars? Absolutely, she's just lucky fuck? to have sex with Tom Cruise. No, uh, I don't. I wouldn't. No, no I, don't, I don't want to have sex with Tom Cruise. No, all the way across the board? This is one of those rare times where I do think no means yes. <laughs> no, I didn't get it. That's unfair. <laughs> you guys missed what Adam said. That's fine. What'd you say? It's a stealth joke. You will see in the edit. Okay, here we Mike. go. Watch out, Turbin's gonna try to run you over. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, what a move! A stunt show. Guess Kick what I learned him. that from Tom Cruise. Kick him. Look at you guys circling each other. This Accomplishing is, nothing. Yes, is it firing? No, there, there you go. Jesus Christ. There you go. Action it, movie star. Is it Proud firing? I'm still mad that I didn't get. You didn't get what? what? Nothing. It's fine. You didn't get asked. No, dollars. you don't get a million dollars. No. You don't have anybody to to. I just get sex to share that. Yes, that, that's a privilege with Tom Cruise. <laughs> is what he tells you. you? Why are you leaving the compound? Sex this is a privilege. Is the most beautiful gift a man can give a woman. Absolutely, it is. You know what? Not all of those men give that sex away for free. <laughs> What was that sentence? What did you just say? You know Not I'm all man. else men can have it sex for free. You know what I meant. You know that, Bruce, your secret is safe with me. It's one of my favorite yeah. phrases is, you know what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> Good shots. You, you're doing great, Adam. I think you're going to get him. You just, persistence. Persistence. I'm done here. Uh, he's, he's just, just walking away. <laughs> uh. <laughs> 
Oh, get out of here. Oh, oh he gotcha. <laughs> the king is the king of Australia, right? We talked about this. Yeah. The queen of England is the queen of also Australia. Is it like a joke king? Like yeah, I mean, England? they don't do anything. They, she just owns all the swans. But like swan or like, like a bug. Billy Corgan swan. 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 All of the above. Are you familiar with the swan? <laughs> no. I owned the swan album. You were the only one. Two or, I, I two or swan it. albums. Oh, God. There's one. There was one. <laughs> oh, my gosh. How many copies did they sell? It was great. Swan. It was 100. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, behind you, behind you. Turbid tried to get you. Look, he crashed. Nice Has move. that strategy ever worked for him? No. No. Okay. Just keeps trying. I think he's gone. Oh, <gasps> that's what you think. Good job, Adam. Oh. Good job. Good job, Adam. <laughs> you should get that one shot off to scare him. This one's for Zwan. Yep. <laughs> that's about right. Yeah, that's about right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone, for the references to Zwan. <laughs> Nobody knows what it is. I apologize. I don't. I uh, really fucking have no idea. Well, I mean, the entire and band of Smashing Pumpkins is basically just Billy Corgan, but he went, I want to do my own band. No. Zwan. For Zwan, he got Billy, uh, Jimmy Chamberlain, who's like one of the best drummers ever. He did. Smashing Pumpkins drummer. If two of your three members are in the band, I don't care if you call it Boxcar Racer, it's still Blink-182. <laughs> <laughs> Alana, do you know that reference to Boxcar Racer? No. No. Okay. Understood. At one point, there was a huge band. No. In the world of uh, angsty teenagers like myself, yeah, they called themselves Blink 182. I know them. So Tom and Mark would always <laughs> fight because Tom Nobody wanted to sing about space. Oh, and let's, Mark let's wanted about, to sing about let's girls. Talk about a new band like Ariana Grande. God is a woman. That's not. That's how it goes. Sings it. Uh, yeah, I don't even th think those are the lyrics. You will know God. Yeah, that's, those are the lyrics. So when Mark and Tom couldn't see eye to eye, they would make you? new albums. It's your song. What? Boxcar Racer. Stop talking about Blink 182. Uh, so plus 44. Like... Talk about new people like Ed Sheeran or something. Jeez. <laughs> Fucking Sean Mendez. Something. Transplants. <laughs> oh, God. That's a deep cut. Alana, you know what transplants are? Definitely. Not. Oh, I love transplants. Damos Egos. Damos Egos. Oh, gosh, that song That's is a, terrible. It's, a, it's an awful song. Damos Egos. Damos Egos. So let's talk about Thank You Next. But you know who I... Who's that? That's the name of the song from Ariana Grande. Yeah. It's oh. blowing up the charts How right now. How does it now. go? Blowing up the charts. <laughs> How does it go? It came out that Pete Davidson has a huge dick because of the music video. Who's Pete Davidson? Oh my you know. gosh. Oh, the guy from SNL? I really like the idea that there's this like Bruce tabloid watch where you're like, fucking Pete Davidson. That's all I do. Oh my yeah. god. Bruce, you don't know. Bruce is up on... Uh, Watch his moves. Yeah. Hup. Bruce I, he he is. Hup. Like Bruce is pop culture. What did you want to say about Pete Davidson's penis? No, I was just... Wait, hold on. Well, isn't, too, yeah. isn't Ariana Grande just small? So, so maybe that's, that's what that... Pete Davidson said. Yeah, Pete that's, Davidson what, that's said, what Pete Davidson yeah. said. He said everything's big to her and then he said that now, How every modest. girl he dates going forward oh, no, 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 is going to be disappointed when they see his dick. <laughs> Ooh, I'm getting shot. Oh, there we go. This cool. Watch these moves. Watch these moves. Yeah. Watch. Watching. Huh. <laughs> I just fell Bang! Off. Wow, that actually oh, wow. Pretty He's got them both. That was pretty sick. You see how they can't uh -huh. hit me? This is a this is what you call pro gaming. Uh huh. I saw you trying to sneak up on me, dick. Uh huh. Oosh! Run! Oh. Uh, this is what you call pro gaming. At least you want to try? Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. Here we go. What are the buttons? <laughs> I only play this when we do this. Hey, is uh, Elon Musk still oh, dating I Grimes? Five minutes here? I don't know. Yeah, I think, I think they broke up. Did they? I think Elon Musk Bruce and Grimes. tabloid, did they break up? At least, at least they broke up, right? I think so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Grimes is also rich and talented. Oh, yeah. What? That's is he door? rich? You get, she, I mean, she You get rich, rich by right? singing like a baby? Um, That's cool. I don't even know what kind of music she makes. I don't either. Who Grimes? Yeah, yeah. at least you know. It's, it's like grimecore. It's, like, yeah. <laughs> it's a little like 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 grime and bass. Grime and bass. Yeah. You just arrived and hung Oh man, you rolled up. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to talk about Grimes. Oh, yeah. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. Oh, okay, let's back to the Grimes. Yeah, so listen to Grimes. It's free. She plays everything, and it's free. Yeah, that's right. Music's free right now. You just have to pay for it monthly, but after you do that, it's that's free. All free. Yeah. Those are great moves, Elise. Look at you. Learn from the learn master. Learn from the best. Learn from the master. That guy's gonna jump. Look, he's, out. he's gonna he's, jump out. He's behind you. He's on the you floor. Gotta turn around. And hit B. No, they're gonna. They're, oh, they're oh, gonna try right to trap me head, there. Right in the head. Turn around. Right behind you. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, behind you. Uh, oh, 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 that's all right. No, that's all right. It's okay. No, no, no. no, we'll get him next time. It's, it's cool. You shot at the boxes in case someone was there. <laughs>
Well, I'm sorry I let you down. Uh, Bruce had trained me, and I failed. Well, we had a lot of fun here. We're going to go home and listen to Grimes. Has anyone seen Bohemian Rhapsody yet? No. no. I, I know, I'm not good. crazy about it. I don't really like it. There's literally a moment where he's like lying in bed, and he like has his eyes closed. Also, he sounds like Bane. <laughs> really? He's like, yes! <laughs> the fire rises! <laughs> but he has those giant fake uh, teeth in. Every single time he comes in, he goes like, you're a real queen bitch. And he goes, <laughs> and then it plays Queen Bitch. Oh. Like it plays this song and oh. it shows them performing it like, Queen's the best! And like a manager's like, we need to sign Queen! I'd rather it be either true to life, uh -huh. dirty, raunchy, gross, which mm -hmm. is, we know what the 70s was like, yeah. so ew. Or do it like Rocket Man, where it's just up its ass and insane. And he's like, he, I think he's like this. flying at some point. Did you make this up? You know, it's real. This? What really? do I do, Alana? What's, what, Go what fight I... people. Punch right. them off a of platform. Do I need a gun? Oh Nice. Nice. Hit well. him. Oh, come on! <laughs> right away. <laughs> Fucking shit. Here's you, the thing: you can't mash those buttons because GTA starts a list of the commands that yep. you give it. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Twenty minutes ago, and then it tries to execute all of them then, all at is, once. This is a reference no one else in this <laughs> room will get. But you know, when you're playing a fighting game and you put input commands on, and mm. then the whole left side of the screen gets filled with input commands yeah. that you did press. No, no, yes. no, awful. <laughs> That's what Bruce is doing. That was you, yeah. Bruce. That was that one was all you. <laughs> he just whiffed. Get up there. Get. Get him, meet him in the middle. Right, go, 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 go. King of the hill. Nice. nice. That should count for you. No oh, points for that, but good. Going. Nice, ignore Bruce. The, ignore the bullets in your head. Oh. All right, you got numbers on him, Bruce. <laughs> bang. Yeah. Bang. 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 Yeah. Oh, bang. Do something. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. Wake up. <laughs> yeah. What <laughs> happened? I don't know. I'm mashing these. Yeah. I'm mashing these. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I just get ganged Maybe up Maybe if on. you jump on the, the little shock things right there, it'll, it'll bounce, it'll you, bounce you over. I yeah. love it. Give it a shot. <laughs> okay, here Werewolves we go. Werewolves conduct it. But, oh, there's something in the middle. It's oh, a platform. Oh, okay, yeah. that's why. Hit that so I don't have to fall all the way. Oh, Watch your knees. Oh, oh, perfect, Bruce. Mm, there you go. You ever wonder what that moment of, moment of panic would feel like if you fall off something high? Mm -hmm. I always you, feel like committing suicide by jumping <clears throat> off a building seems like a bad idea because you'd be like, this is actually really fun. I could have been bungee jumping this whole time. Or it gives you time to think and go, wait. <laughs> exactly. We, talk, we yeah. talked about this before, but don't forget that you generally the human body dies before it ever hits the ground. Is that true? Just, yeah, go, you go into shock. Oh. The body just goes, nope, and they shut it down to protect your brain. To protect your psyche oh, from having to experience body. that. Oh, Little come on. No, no, no. Loser. There were seven and a half minutes left. What I the think that they probably they hit got 30 the, or whatever. Yeah. Holy shit. No two who plays it next. Kills. Hide. Yeah. Under that platform. Wait for him to come. All right, got it. Bang. She's a grown-ass hey, woman. She don't man. need no man. Who's he talking about? I mean, he's right. He's, Anyone? Uh, <laughs> he's right. Ariana Grande, I guess? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, she's like 25. Yeah, she's she looks very young. like she's twenty. Hey. Yeah, I agree. All right, <laughs> I agree. <laughs> sure, that's it. She just looks like a baby. Twenty is a baby to a twenty-five-year-old. <laughs> Good I point. I, I don't... From my perspective, yeah. she no. looks really. You ever, you ever graduate high school and then go back to college and be like, these children <laughs> wearing diapers, prancing about my algebra class. <laughs> Have you guys ever noticed that when you go back to your childhood <laughs> home, mm -hmm. she had that yeah. everything is super small? No, they, small. they yeah. fucking you know sold mine. Because it looked larger to you when you were a little kid. You're right. I think it's really cool. Do Americans just not move? Yeah. Like, my family's moved like four times. My family's never moved. Wow. I've Your family's never moved? Never moved? Nope. Wow. Oh. You're really lucky, actually. Well, when I was a child, we moved from Naruma to Cairns Those are to both Lake's entrance. Places. Wait, she means Cairns. Yeah. Not Cairns. Cairns? Well, Cairns. I mean, I think how she pronounces it is probably how it's pronounced. Thank I disagree. You. Oh. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> it's got an R in it, Australians! So you said you moved from Balloon Land to where? <laughs> I was born in Cairns. Uh -huh. Cairns. Moved to Lake's Entrance, and then to Naruma. Numa Numa? Naruma. Uh, which had the sexiest beaches? Probably Cairns. Yeah. You bet it did. Everywhere has sexy. the sexiest beach in Australia. Yeah, I know. It's true. One time I went to uh, Santa Cruz with some Americans, and they were like, look at this beach. And I was like, this beach is a shithole. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And they were like, oh, it's so yeah. pretty. No, no. Mo most of the beaches on the on the West Coast, yep. most of them are yeah. garbage compared to the rest it's of the world. It's a shame. One of my favorite things I regularly hear people say when I'm <laughs> by the beach here is people always talk about the Pacific being really cold. Uh -huh. They're like, you don't swim in the Pacific Ocean. It's a really cold ocean. Like, that's the same fucking ocean that hits Australia. But you have to realize that Go when Americans talk about things, Bang. they're only referring to 
to the thing as it pertains no. to America. Well, that's <laughs> that because America is the center of the world. Yeah, so they yeah. disregard the fact. <laughs> look at a map. <laughs> yeah. yeah, look people. at a map. You find out where America is. <laughs> Bang, right yeah. there. In the middle. I was talking with some people the other day because the, <laughs> the wolf blood moon happened. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's pretty and, awesome. Uh, and uh, Elise and I went to the beach with some friends. That's right. Brag I about it. other friends. <laughs> what are their names? Where do they live? <laughs> Who are they? <laughs> but I was thinking about the fact, I wonder what would happen if oh, human geez. beings existed on one of those, like Europa, or one of those moons around Jupiter. The cool moons. That are like, like, have water and are very similar to Earth, except that instead of being on this giant sphere and having this, this tiny little moon surrounding you, yeah. there's Jupiter. There's no way you could become a species that thinks it's the center of, and most important thing. Because, you know, you could, mm. because you're constantly confronted with something that is Jesus way Christ. more dominating and <laughs> frightening true. than and you. The, isn't the storm on Jupiter like 50 times the size of Earth? Yeah, it is. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's Some massive. ridiculous shit like that. <laughs> it's like it's like Adam right now in the center of all those bodies yeah. getting Arr! kicked and punched. Mm. Oh, to 25, 20, 20. You, you can do this, Adam. It's like the Super Bowl it is. <laughs> Get the kill. Oh, you got that kill. One more for Twisted Anthony. One more kill. Back crazy eagle. Go, go. Oh, wow. He jumped to 20. Oh, damn, by uh, one. What? Mad Crazy by Eagle one. won it for his team. Mm. Nah, nah, nah. We, go play, replay the footage, though. You, we hit each other at the exact same time. Yep. You know what? What? You guys notice who won? What? Mad Crazy Eagle, the official bird of the America. The best bird of America. Mm. The best what's, bird. What's Australia's official bird? An emu. Oh, of course I it love is. emus. Oh, it's going to be like a dodo or Horrific something. Horrific monsters. Have you ever heard them scream at you? Oi! Oi! <laughs> Oi! <laughs> That's where Australia's <laughs> got it from. Oh, here it is. Oh, is it a warble? That, I can't a tell. That's, that's, that's a heartbeat. That's a big old heart. Did they do roids? Sounds like Ronnie Coleman's heart. <laughs> <laughs> two two new uh, sightings in the men's restroom today. One was just a fat pubic hair right on the lid. Fat pubic hair? <laughs> just just sitting there. It's like, that's a big one. So, someone just go... <laughs> like, yeah. You don't do that after you pee. I, I always, I always shake off my dick and then I take a comb and I <laughs> <laughs> comb it down a little bit. Yeah, yeah. And then, um, yeah, yeah, new, new piss on the seat. That's I'm fun. Oh well, yeah, that's normal. Keep it up, it's world. Like, like the girls' end bathrooms of... are really clean. You guys, they're really nice. Everyone yeah. has a great time in there. That's that's we touch true. each other's. I've taken a shit in a girl's Big bathroom. Bloody handprint. There's fucking, yeah, there's <laughs> blood everywhere and pubes. Yeah. and there are also pubes. Why are there pubes in a girl's Look. bathroom? Well, because women have pubes too, James. I suppose. What kind of, what kind of women? I think if that were true, I would have seen. I actually did go to a wedding on the weekend, and oh, wow. uh, a bunch of, of girls in the bathroom just took their clothes off. That's I saw yeah. several That's boobs. Do. When yeah. do they start kissing each other? Were they drunk or so? Were they so? I mean, they were drunk. Oh, well, that's normal. So like, did, I didn't get my boobs too. out. And James then and I take off our clothes in front of yeah, each other absolutely. all the time. But we have pubes, so like, that's a way to cover your shame. Is it? Mm. Yeah, God gave man pubes so that way you couldn't see all the genitals. My pubes aren't long enough. You'll pubes. hit puberty one day, Bruce. It's, it's, it's more just, just <laughs> Damn, a, everybody's <laughs> slamming me right now. The Bible's full of metaphors. No. Oh. And when he said Moses went up there and saw that burning bush. Is a hot redhead. Yeah, he was like, yeah. tell them to shave their pubes, Moses. <laughs> come on, come on. You can't do, do it, you fell asleep. Oh, oh. shock. Did you see Drop, drop. You got this, Alana. Just run up B. Yeah. yeah. I'm telling you, GTA's got that list of commands. Mm -hmm. You'll add it in there, and that's before, uh, what is it, trip, mm -hmm. and after uh, dash. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, oh, Tarby got you. Uh, came out of the women's restroom. Yeah. <laughs> that was a, what a crazy women's bathroom. This was during was a wedding? I touched a couple was, of them. Was there a man yeah. dressed as a woman in there, like <laughs> the movie Ladybug? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I don't the think movie so. movie Ladybug. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, hit him! Oh, I, I can't hit them! I was hoping we'd have one video where we don't mention Jonathan Brandis this week, but here we are! <laughs> mm, right. Quit the gun, it's, the a faster, it's a faster kill. Yes. That was, that was... Oh. <laughs> you know Jonathan Brandis is, Lana? No. I didn't think so. Hey, did him. you ever see Sequest DSV? <laughs> That's the end of the video, everybody! <laughs> Would you like to take a guess what the Red Dead Redemption font is called? Western. No, uh, wait. Horse font. Rockstar? Cowboy? Chinese rocks. That's right, it is Chinese Shit. rocks. You're right. Also, welcome to my weird fucking world where I remember font names. Can we start the gameplay now? Who wants to go first? I'll, I'll take it. Generally, Adam goes first. It's because he's the alpha of Funhouse. It's because I'm we know alpha. he'll do the best. Yes, he is the alpha, and we are all betas. Yep, all just Adam's betas. We're the omegas. Let's say we're the omegas. Ooh. That's. You would think that'd be better, but it's worse. No, it's way worse. <laughs> yeah, Adam always goes first in races. No, I, no it's usually James. It's because we want him to race it so that we can see where the pitfalls are, so we can fuck it all up, and then we'll get better. Lawrence, <laughs> what are we playing today? 
Uh, downhill extreme. Wait, no. Oh, uh, downhill extreme three. Sorry, yeah. sorry. New Lawrence. What are we playing? New Lawrence. <laughs> we traded up. Uh, actually, we're playing downhill extreme three. Oh, that's what I sound like. <laughs> Lawrence, shut up. Oh, that's what I sound like. Oh, we know. Like. <laughs> Met a lot of doing Lawrence anyway. <laughs> Just a theory. I think a dude could look at anything and think, yeah, that reminds me of a blowjob. What if that sucked my dick? <laughs> You're right about that. <laughs> Lawrence, let's do that. You want to do the blowjob test? Yeah, sure. All right. Oh, is this the, like you lick your elbow uh, or something? You tell me if this makes you think of a blowjob or not. Ready? Wait, can I Shit. be thinking of a blowjob before already you already No, no, you can't think of a blowjob right now. Think of an elephant or something. <laughs> All right? You're gonna have a really narrow window here for this. Okay, are you ready? So think of your elephant. Okay. And then I'm gonna give you another object. and You tell me if it makes you think of a blowjob. You ready? I'm already thinking of a blowjob again. Just think of an elephant. I'm trying. You got an elephant? But it's got a trunk and it think looks like Dumbo. a dick. Watch the think Dumbo of, trailer Think of Dumbo. Think of Dumbo. I just watched Dumbo and that movie sucks. Anyway, yeah, sorry. Think about it. All right, you ready? Coffee cup. Yeah, I thought it was mm. a blowjob. Okay. Uh, lettuce head. Head? Bruce? Mm. Billy? I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Um, hold on. I, wait, let, me, let, me, let me cleanse my... Diesel engine. Vin Diesel, but no. Blowjob again, huh? Yeah. Because Vin Diesel kind of looks like a living penis. Something that doesn't make you think of a blowjob? Yeah, give him something that, that would definitely move his mind away from a blowjob. A dog. Dog. Oh. It's fucked up if you say yes. <laughs> that, uh, that he thought of it, though. He hesitated. I, tr uh, I tried. JFK assassination. JFK assassination. That's a great one. No, I get off to that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's not fair. You, <laughs> you can't even accept blowjobs. I mean, you don't know that. Bruce, you can blow into a dick. You can blow into a vagina. It's not that hard. <laughs> I don't know that you want to blow into either. Oh, yeah. dear God. It's like a balloon. That's what sex is. Um, <laughs> so what was the verdict on dog? Uh, no. I think he thought of a blowjob. He just didn't want to admit it. A little bit. It's Why more this? like doggy style. There was a Reddit yeah, thread recently in uh, like our relationship advice that was a guy who yeah, found that? it really hard to have sex with his girlfriend after he found out that she put peanut butter on her vagina and made a dog lick it. What's wrong with that? Whatever. I mean, wait. So wait, wait, wait. What? <laughs> I mean, it was... Not right after, so right? She, he didn't no, get, he didn't like get sloppy seconds. Like several years later, but he right was like, after. no. I mean, whatever, dude. Like, there's all sorts of wrong things going on down there. If you Sorry. can't forgive something that happened years ago, you have to just, just give up. No, you're right, because I put my penis oh, in a lot of different yeah. things. <laughs> no, 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 no. And I've washed it many times. So if you found out that someone that you were dating got head from a dog, you're still like, I don't care, we good. It's, well, as long as you've had a shower between those two times. Wow. It's not even an I don't care. It's a I find you more attractive now that I know this. I think it's right? pretty rad, yeah. Uh, well, what? I thought that was the issue. Well, Didn't she's in, she's in oh. touch with her sexuality. She sexually assaulted a dog. No. She didn't sexually assault that dog what they wanted. wanted. <laughs> that dog wanted the peanut butter. <laughs> you know he did. And <laughs> she wanted something going on <laughs> while watching that actually. I never did that. I never did the vacuum. I did that vacuum. vacuum? I did the vacuum. Yeah. Vacuum How sucks. would that be pleasurable? Get it? There's a hole. But would that not just be painful? It's just pulling. Hmm. I mean, it can be, but the thing is, the penis can withstand a lot of punishment. When you got a vacuum, you can control the suction power to a degree. Hmm? But if you have a very spirited partner hmm. who is just like, how does like, that feel good? I don't understand. My God, this lady's gonna suck my guts out. It's I've had like, I've had that happen to me too. Well, did your guts suck that? Well. I felt like it was gonna happen. There were there were two. I was like, whoa! Yeah, you're like your cheeks start caving in, and your like fingernails start growing you, backwards. There's a write up on Kotaku. Someone went and reviewed all the Overwatch porn. Mm -hmm. mm. And it, what they think of it? Tracer with a dick with Widowmaker is number one. I just I think people are trying to step onto our business here. You know? Oh, oh yeah, Kotaku's oh. been. We should have done that. that first. My 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 Christmas wish for 2019. Christmas. Yeah, it's months away. Is that uh, is that women? Alana, you're going to be made to account for this, by the way. <laughs> is that what? women could accept the fact that they find really messed up stuff insanely hot sometimes. What about Ted Bundy? Everybody's chilling off over yeah, him right every, now. Do not find him hot. Every girl's flicking their bean over Ted Bundy Is it Ted right Bundy now. or Zac Efron? Is it Zac Efron? It's Ted Bundy? I thought so. That's what I thought. Oh, no wonder. But yeah. I don't want to fuck him. Yeah, well. At all. Well, other women do. Mm. Yeah. So what about that, Alana? <laughs> yeah, what about that, Alana? <laughs> You're right. It's a good point. Yes. <laughs> well, now, hold on, hold on, Alana. Now, fair play. Ask us a question about men, and we'll answer for them. All men. We fuck vacuum cleaners. Any question you want. <laughs> yeah, why do you fuck vacuum cleaners? Because it feels good. <laughs> why does it feel it good? Right I don't a hole's understand. A hole. right, because anything around your penis feels good. All right? Even if it's hard Anything. It doesn't matter what it Compared is. Compared to yes. the alternative, which is lonely. Which is nothing. Yeah. Everything feels good around it. Even a whole bed of nails around it feels better than nothing. Right now, it's lonely. It's lonely all the time. Except for when it's inside something. <laughs> Am I wrong? No. 
Is that wrong? This is the best TED Talk we've ever yeah. done. <laughs> TED Talk. It's a TEDx, let's be honest. I'll give a TED Talk about how penises are lonely. What place did you get, Lawrence? Fifth. Fifth. Oh. Well, that's anticlimactic. I thought it was first. Oh, and look at that clapping for you. Thank you. Thank you. Stop clapping for him. Yeah. <laughs> you're all thinking about blowjobs. Yeah. Oh, now I'm thinking of blowjobs again. Oh, well, you're right, did. What do you think is going to be bad about oh, Battle Angel, Angel Alita? Alita? The CG, probably. Everything's going to be bad about it. The acting, the CG, the writing, the directing, the producing. It's got Christoph Waltz and uh, Extreme Inline Skating, and I can't think of a better movie. Question. Is Alita the Battle Angel hot? No. no she's never been hot. No? no. She's I, not hot. I well, think they're trying to make her fuckable, as James Cameron would say. <laughs> Don't people call big eyes blowjob eyes sometimes? I'm no, sorry. I have never heard that. What? That's really? A first, that is a first for me. I think people say I that. I think you're thinking of blowjob eyes as when someone looks up at you. She looks a little bit too young. So like, yeah. but she's, like not. she's like cool no, she, robot body and no, stuff. No, but she's she's normal age. Where's I the? She's eighteen. She's, Alita Battle Angel is of age. Don't forget. She's oh, of in normal Japan. age. And uh, she's a robot. Now, but but we would still not fuck her. You can program no. robots to be whatever age you want. Yeah, so like the big eye look comes from the manga because they're trying to make her look like sure, that. Sure, but some things look better in two D. Yeah. Drawn, yeah. Like, rather than. But what if you didn't? That was the one question I don't think anyone ever brought up in the meeting. Said, "Well, what if we didn't?" Yeah. <laughs> I bet somebody did. Yeah. And they went, "Fuck you." <laughs> you know, have you ever thought about how the the coolest people in the world are the ones that don't think they're cool? Who do you think is the coolest person in the world? Tom Hardy. Damn, All that's right. a good answer. All right. That's a really good answer. I thought a lot about this. I, mm. Keanu Reeves. He's into it. Keanu Reeves also. I don't think Keanu Reeves is cool. He's too sad. That's what makes him really cool. Yeah, because his life is tragic. You would say that. And he's still fucking cool. There's a whole subreddit called Keanu being awesome. It's about Keanu Reeves being awesome, like when he's in the airport. Yeah, those are good answers. And he's trying to get a selfie, and the girl's like phone didn't work, and then he had to walk away while an entire press was mobbing him, and she went, oh, I didn't get the photo. And he goes, oh, cool. And he went back. He got it. That's pretty good. Who's the coolest woman in the world? Keanu Reeves. <laughs> Gina Davis? Like, I think Emma Stone's pretty cool. Emma Stone's cool. How yeah. about uh, how about Aubrey Plaza? Mm. Okay, all right. I just wanted to throw it out there. I check. like Aubrey Plaza. I, I, I like, like her too. too I just, I mean, like. She wasn't the best in Who's Legion. Who's the coolest woman in the world? Let's name one. Is it just the coolest Helen woman? Helen Mirren? Helen Mirren? No. Julie, mm. Julie Louis Dreyfus? Julie Louis Dreyfus is pretty fucking cool. Lead actress in Halloween. Oh, Jamie, Jamie Lee, Lee Curtis? Curtis? Jamie Lee Curtis. She's pretty fucking cool. All right, this is my vote, but it's my vote alone. Okay. Lucy Lawless. She's cool. <laughs> I mean, no, I she think she's cool, cool, but not everybody thinks she's cool. That's I, why he said I, my vote alone. I, I can't imagine one person goes, Lucy Lawless, pff, not cool. Good for you, Adam. I can think of somebody would, that would do that. And they go, like, Lucy Lawless, you, who? You find me that son of a bitch who has a problem with Lucy Lawless. Who's the coolest woman in the world? There's got to be a cool person. Mia Jovovich. Mm. No. Ruth Bader Ginsburg. No. no. Not feeling it. Lucy Lawless wins. I'm sorry. Definitely Venus and Serena Williams. 100%. Yeah, pretty but you can cool. only pick one. That's unfair because oh, there's two. I don't know. Hmm. How about Battle Angel Aaliyah? Oh, I figured it out. I figured it out. What? And and you're all going to say I'm right. <laughs> Oprah Winfrey. No. Mm. <laughs> cool? <laughs> She's insane. Is Ellen cool? She's cool. Nah. Oh, okay. All right. Well, never mind. I, I mean, she was she'd, cool. be, she'd be fun to have at a party. She's brand like, safe. If your car broke down, she wouldn't get out and change the tire. 51, seriously badass ladies. You um, need to go to a GQ article to figure this out? We should be able to figure this out on our own. I don't need GQ to tell me who's cool. All right, fine. You know, go down the list. I want to see who it was. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Carly Claus. I don't Oh, think Jennifer Lawrence. I don't think no. she's cool. No. Come on, guys. Oh, she's cool. Oh, uh, Tessa Thompson. Zendaya. Tessa Thompson's a good one. She's really cool. She's very cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's badass. She's extremely cool. Wait, she's in Westworld? She's like the... Wow. Uh, Executive. Yeah, That's right. Holy yeah. shit. All right, we Maybe figured we it out. It out. The answer is always Keanu Reeves. Oh, Alana, Keanu what are we playing today? This is Mofo Kart. Uh, I think this one's called Block Fort, and it's basically designed like uh, Mario Kart Battle Mode. Remember that? All right, you get rockets and you shoot other people's cars. Or you just drive around in circles like Bruce here. No. No. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no. 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 Oh. Ah. Still oh. invincible. Ah, ah, oh, ah, oh. Move car. 
Whoa. Whoa. That was a cool move. You got to go up above where they can't see you. That's so fun. Hey, got him. Nice. There we go. Uh, yeah. yeah. You suck. Okay. Ooh, I dodged him. That was cool. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Riff, which means he's actually James Bond, and you're just the Run! idiot. You're the Dave Bautista who's going to die. That's sad. <laughs> Guys, watch this. I'm not into Daniel Craig. I don't know why. It's something about his lips, I think. Uh, mm, they're I they're really like thin. This guy down. He's got thin little British lips. Some of us have thin lips. I'm sorry. <laughs> we can fix this, Adam. We have in the injections for it. Yeah, I've seen people who do that. They look like human cats. I keep leaving pamphlets on your desk and <laughs> you haven't like taken the hint. They look like human cats? Yeah. Who? Yeah. What? Uh, have you ever seen Ron Perlman in the 1990s adaptation of Beauty and the Beast? Nope. That's kind of what people look like with enlarged lips. They get these weird sort of like cat. What are those things called? The big. Oh, I know what you mean. Yeah. yeah. Got them. Yeah. Got them. Oh, yeah. The, I got two the, people the with big, that. You guys are missing it. You know, the cat cheeks. Sorry, Bruce. I'm talking about something really important here. <laughs> yeah, Bruce, can you shut up, please? <laughs> I, I apologize. Oh, yes. Did you see that shot? Yes. Bang. Kill streak, Bruce. Whoa. That was a really great shot, Bruce. <laughs> Thanks, Bruce. Oh, oh, oh fucking did it. He's so good. Uh, Bruce, you're only two kills away from first place there. No? Oh, now one. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. You're doing really good, Bruce. I'm gonna win. Lawrence, how do we feel about a Fast and the Furious spinoff movie coming out this year? Oh, Hobbs and Shaw? Yeah. Man, uh, I don't know if they can stay as Fast and Furious, but I'm okay with it. You bet they can. Yeah. So here's the thing: the world of Fast and Furious is too big for 18 main movies. <laughs> oh. We gotta fuck. have we gotta have side stories. Okay. And we know from movies like Solo, that those are a guaranteed success. Yeah. <laughs> Especially so. when you call it Hobbs and Shaw and no one knows the characters' names in these movies. Why is it called that? Because I know apparently those names. are the characters' names from Fast and Furious. Nobody knew that. Did not but, know that. Yeah. Nice, Bruce. <laughs> Who are the two main actors in Hobbs and Shaw, and which one is Hobbs and which one is Shaw? Well, that's a trick question. Hobbs is The Rock. That's right. That might the be Rock's right. Which process of <laughs> well, elimination... Turn Hobbs. over! Wait, I already forgot who he said. <laughs> Who's who? <laughs> so Shaw is uh, the guy from Meg. The Meg? Yeah, <laughs> yeah Jason Statham, right? That's you got right. it. Hey, Adam, you got Wait, it. Wait, is I Shaw Jason Statham? <laughs> yes. What? Yes. Oh, I didn't know God damn it. Know. Did you guys not see the last movie? No. We did. What the oh. fuck? That were yeah, we were next to each other. Yeah, I think Bruce fell asleep. <laughs> I wish I had. You guys ever get day drunk on white wine? No. It's no. great. Day drunk on white wine? Yeah. I'm not yeah, a do single do that, mother. I am a single mother. <laughs> I'm an Wait, what do you live mother? like? What are you the mother of? I have Dragons. three TVs in my apartment, and it's a studio. <laughs> what have you named them? <laughs> TCL, Samsung, and yeah. Vizio. I've always wanted to go to a Margaritaville and ask people like when their life went wrong. When did they realize oh. nothing was worth living so for? So Sharon, how did you get here? I mean, no one knows how they got to Margaritaville. It's true. Nobody knows how they got to Margaritaville. It is like it is like the pirate ship of lost. It's souls. like a Twilight Zone episode. Yeah. It's the Hotel California of. Uh... <laughs> of chain restaurants. It's nice. I'm, I'm out. Oh, oh shit, I got hit by seven Damn. missiles right there. Oh, Fucking third. If you could have a scouter that could tell you the arbitrary statistic of any one thing, what would you have it How tell recently you? did you masturbate? Uh, How recently mm -hmm. did you go to a Margaritaville? I gotta really think Those about types. this. But my, it'd only be set in hours. What's the one thing I want to know all the time? <laughs> I mean, just imagine somebody walks out of a bathroom at a Walmart and you scout him and it's like, masturbated five seconds ago. And you're like, well, oh, good for him. All right. I mean, I usually just tell people. <laughs> My seat is all over the toilet seat. And partly uh -oh. on my wrist. And I didn't clean it up. <laughs> this one got into my hand wound. Enjoy, Walmart. Do you guys think that it's a cruel joke by oh, nature? Okay. That the exact moment you need precision aim when you're coming is the exact moment it's really hard to aim? Why do you need well, precision aim? Well, you don't aim? need precision aim. Biologically, it, yeah, you, it'll just, it just goes. Don't fire it all over the wall at the jack-in-the-box. You're, sur <laughs> you're supposed to be... You're surrounded by a vagina. Yeah. So oh, actually, sure. it funnels it oh, all. Oh, for sure. We all get surrounded by vaginas when we ejaculate. <laughs> Some of us don't have to masturbate in the bathroom at the Walmart. <laughs> Who's, who here has masturbated in the ocean? <laughs> <laughs> Am I the only one? <laughs> what, like from a helicopter? <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'd have time. <laughs> from a heli no, in the ocean. <laughs> I, come on, guys. Oh. Take that, Poseidon. <laughs> Adam, do you only have one kill? Yeah, I'm really into this conversation. Come on, you got to do it. What if, okay, here's a scouter idea, yeah. uh -huh. that you could and then like get a complete uh, breakdown of what their ejaculate tastes like. That I would, I'd be all right with that. Because then I want to find out what mine tastes yeah, like. Yeah, do we get I don't want that. <laughs> I don't care about that at all. I think it would guide the course of something of like dating. Yeah, wouldn't it, like, no. wouldn't it matter to you, Alana, if you're like, oh, it tastes like pineapple, we're good. I and mean, then if it was like, it tastes like vinegar, we're bad. No, because it's not, you know, you don't have to deal with that for very long. 
You kind of, is it, you just want it to be over with? You're a real good <laughs> Sometimes they, it tastes all right. You're a real good person, Alana. Yeah. But it's like, a it's trooper. not there that long, you know? You're good. A trooper. God Actually, you know what, Lawrence? Uh, to flip that on its head, mm-hmm. I would like. It applies to women, too, by the way. I was going to say, I would like a calculation that tells me what someone's vagina tastes like. Yeah. Mm. Cotton candy. You well, know fish. if everyone was on their period. Wait, so does. It's all right. I'm, am I going to regret asking this question? <laughs> does blood get on the clitoris? Because I've never had that problem. <laughs> I mean, not really. <laughs> so what else? What else are you eating? This is like sex ed. <laughs> oh no, I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> why would you? Teacher, wait? does blood get on the clitoris? Does blood get on the clitoris? <laughs> I'm just saying, like, in your guys's experiences, because that's usually where you're you're focusing usually on the North Pole. There, well, you got to spread you know, around. Spread the love. I. <laughs> nah, Adam's yeah. right. Hold on a minute. You got to show your woman some love everywhere. Gonna kiss the legs, mm-hmm. and then you go uh, maybe kiss her eyes. I like the knee pits. I get right in the knee pits. Knee pits. Yeah. All right. Adam's right. No knee pits. Knee pits. Lana, let the man tell you. Yeah, knee pits. How many times we gotta say it? Oh, proper. It's an erogenous zone. Works. I can show you the graph if you need me to. If there's anything sweaty on a woman, I'm kissing it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there was a new kind of Japanese porn mm-hmm. that takes place in an alternate universe where dicks just grow out of things. And once they do, women just satisfy them because that's what they want to do. So there's like there's like a restaurant, and then Wait, like two so ladies are talking, and then a dick just pokes out of the like the bench, and so she starts jerking it off, and, and then she just sits on it, it, and they're just talking. Oh, yeah, so that's a thing. I got you there, there's, a, there's entire like subgenres of Japanese porn where the universe is different and the rules of it are different, and you just have to kind of figure it out. It's like a mystery. Yeah. I don't know that I like that. There was a time stopping one that I wasn't cool what, with. It what's kind of uh, what search terms are you using for these like films? Parallel universe. So, <laughs> the the bummer is that like there is a word for like that universe, much like Fast and Furious. Now it's Hobbs and Shaw. You just got to kind of know. Mm-hmm. Uh, there is a Japanese term for it. Uh, if you want, just like I'll find it for you, Adam. Don't worry about that. Now, I'm just wondering how you found Lawrence it. Lawrence will text it to you later tonight. Yeah, even if you don't ask, like that time yeah. that he told us that he jucked off to his own dick. I didn't want to know about that. That was a challenge. You guys said I couldn't do it, so I had to do it. I don't know that I ever said anything about you not being able it's to do it. It's on a podcast. I, I, think I think I said you shouldn't do it. Well, I did, and now it's done. You got to get more kills, Adam. I'm trying, but Come on. I'm very distracted by I know. Focus everything. On the, focus on the race. Don't worry about mm-hmm. how many dicks are around. Whoa. Nice, nice shot. Yeah, you can do that. All right. <laughs> I've discovered something. What? Uh, in India, there's a total subgenre of porn where, like, your family's hot aunt comes to stay, and then you get the banger. That's everywhere. That's yeah, just I don't India. think that's a. Yeah. No, it's a whole thing. And there's a, there's a particular word for that ant porn. Oh, that's really very hot. I mean, it's just incest porn. Ooh, that yeah, is quite hot for a millennia. But no, no, no. Well, dudes aren't allowed to date, right? So, like, the only the only women they see are in their family, and the most approachable one is your aunt because it's oh. not your mom or your sister. Lawrence, do you know all of these things about all these cultures? You know, let's just say yes. I mean, about their porn, yeah. You're on Indian porn websites and Japanese well, porn websites it's, it's all the time. Indian. I found that screenshot screenshots of Facebook threads were a bunch of horny Indian dudes, like, typing uh, whatever the... How is that representative of an entire country full of millions of people? Because there's tons of the screenshots. There's so many, dude, and they're all real excited. A girl sent me uh, boobs the other day. Why? So he was like, I'm sure you get a lot of dicks, so I thought I would just like make your day and send you some boobs. And I was actually really happy about that is, it. That is really nice. Yeah, that happens sweet. to all of us all the time. <laughs> I'm gonna, when, I, when we first started in the hot, hot year of 2015, Snapchat was blowing up. I said, it's time. Let's you, make a fun out Snapchat. That's what we did, yeah. Mm-hmm. I expected nonstop roulette of dicks and, and never got one. You didn't get oh, one no. penis in your Snapchat account? No. That's, that's actually really good. Good for our fans. <laughs> Nice shot. Oh, you didn't get the kill. Didn't I? No. Oh, then you, then you exploded on the butt. It's all been there. Much like those videos, <laughs> Lawrence <laughs> watches those anti videos. Mm-hmm. <laughs> don't like this conversation anymore. I think that anti thing exists all over the world. Look, there is. An it's a episode. specific fetish in India. There's a specific episode about the X Files. Ah, this family ah. becomes like almost super people because they're so inbred and then they end up chopping the mom's arms and legs off oh. so she can't move Damn. but they still impregnate her but then the twist is she was in on it the whole time cool wow do you guys remember when, when we played kingdom hearts the other day it was great wasn't that pleasant it was pleasant what yeah. if what if we did that <laughs> fix the conversation you tried alana but let's talk about kingdom hearts porn in japan yeah. <laughs> oh boy yeah they're all way young i told you and have you seen the movie the core I have. I haven't. They d- dig a big hole to put a bomb. Wait, no. Wait, why did they go to the core?
I just guess uh, just quit on. Options, maybe. Quit. Give options a go. You know what? This is fun. This is good. Yeah, good gameplay. No, that won't do anything. Heard you guys talking about Graceland. That was cool. Can't talk about Graceland anymore. Oh yeah, we've uh, talked about Graceland before, right? About how it's garbage. Oh, well, Graceland's Graceland cool. Is nice. Back in the day, when you guys would like carry over a topic between episodes, it was murder. Try to get those edits to work. <laughs> Why? You haven't talked about Lunar New Year yet. We haven't. Yeah, I saw a really mean tweet. A young woman who said, I'm not allowed, unless someone invites me to a lunar party or I'm from a country where they celebrate Lunar New Year, I'm not allowed to enjoy Lunar New Year. I want to celebrate this cultural event, but am I appropriating it by enjoying it? Well, sure you are, but you can still enjoy it. Yeah, can I? Yes. How you doing, Ryan? I'm doing great. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing for the Lunar New Year? Uh, all my friends growing up that were like Hindu or Muslim, sure they observed Ramadan or celebrated Diwali, but then they all had Christmas trees. They all they did it for the presents, you know. And I was always jealous. Of that. Uh, I, the only difference on my tree was that the kid had blue lights. What? <laughs> he was Jewish. Oh. oh, I thought it was a snow removal vehicle because those have blue lights. Duh. Duh. <laughs> what? Is she going to the She's store? Really Happy Lunar New Year! No, that's chili sauce. Why do you have that? <laughs> uh, Alana, what are we playing today? Well, yeah, that's a weird title. I think it's called Blow the UFO. This is a trick race. A trick race? Yeah, there's some unexpected nonsense in here. It's gonna be it's gonna be a tough time. What involves tricks? Whoa. Cool tricks. I like cool tricks. Hey, I was gonna ask. What's up? I don't know if I've asked this before. It's uh, it's one of my favorite questions. Uh, uh -huh. Say you like, you're single, right? And you go mm -hmm. on a date, and it's incredible. And then you have sex, and it's the best sex you've ever had. Yeah. But then the morning after, you find out that they're huge racists. Like you come across their Twitter, uh -huh. and it's just like, full of racial slurs. Doesn't matter. What do sex. you do? Oh. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this out there. You crazy kids shouldn't be sleeping on the first date. Because if it's worth it, you'll wait. Thanks, oh Mike. My gosh, play the game, Grandpa. <laughs> With all this Lunar New Year talk, I better not like go on Instagram and then you see pictures of you time. like celebrating uh, Lunar New Year with all your Chinese you can't friends. Do it, Adam. Keep using that plural word like it's gonna go somewhere. <laughs> this video is gonna come out three months after. No, I know. <laughs> Nothing is ever relevant. Shit. What's gonna be happening? Groundhog Day. Did the groundhog see its shadow? Berlin Wall fell. <laughs> How good is Bob Ross? Like a businessman on the streets, but a freak uh, in the smock or whatever he wore. <laughs> <laughs> Jim Henson was a beautiful man. Who's Jim Henson? <laughs> Kermit. Sesame Street. Uh, Muppet Man. <laughs> the silence means that I just definitely offended someone. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. What Muppet movies have you seen, Alana? Several? I wouldn't I, know how to tell you which I guess maybe seen. it's quicker if we just go down the ones you haven't seen. Go ahead, we'll wait. I made Adam watch one for Treasure Island. <laughs> it's good! <laughs> and then I the whole time I just watched his face to yeah. see what his reaction was. I enjoyed the Muppet parts, but then the problem was every time there was anything slightly silly that I should laugh at, at least turned around and stared at me. <laughs> And there was all this pressure to enjoy it. And I think I had a fork, because I was probably eating, as I most often am. Oh. The issue there, though, this is this I told Lisa afterwards, and Hello. I think she hates me for it. Kermit the Frog, or the person doing his voice, is not Jim Henson, because he had passed by this time. It all falls very flat. It's like, hello, I am Kermit the Frog. And you're like, close. It may have been Kevin Clash. No, 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 it was probably Steve Whitmire. <laughs> What? These are my, you got fire these are my celebrities. People are allowed to enjoy things, but then people like to have a very two-dimensional um, idea of who you are. Oh, absolutely. So I always bring this example up, but like- You're the like, Halo guy. Yeah, Adam loves Halo. He always loves Halo. Anything Halo, he loves Halo. Send him Halo. Same with Elise and Muppets. Yeah. Alana, I guess you're like the DJ? She's, guy? The, she's the EDM synthwave cool guy. I mean, I got a lot of content about hash browns. What makes you simple? I really like uh, uh, costume bands. So like <laughs> Guar and oh, uh, like uh, uh, radioactive chicken heads. Uh -huh. You know, weird bands like that. So I don't know if that's a type, but I'm throwing that out there. <laughs> a couple weeks ago, Max Sabbath was playing. Oh yeah, I'm buddies with those guys. You, do, you are? Yeah. Oh man, I really was. My like, God, he's. I was awesome. really interested in going because I love McDonald's. Yeah. Um, not that big a fan of Black Sabbath, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, maybe costume rock is the way to go. I think you could argue that the Muppets are costume rock. Yeah, they. Oh yeah, they do have done many a musical performance. <laughs> <laughs> they have. I got it. Fuck. Yeah, this one's a mess. I'm actually glad you're doing this, Adam, because I, I don't know if any of the rest of us will be able to finish it. I no. want to die. It's tough. <laughs> <laughs> Unrelated to the gameplay. Groundhog Day is 
such a goddamn good movie, and it's yep. such a simple concept. The Groundhog Day formula is impenetrable. Anyway, then there's Happy Death Day, and I heard that's good, too. What about Happy Death Day to you? The new one that I think is out by now. I'm seeing that, yeah, on Monday. Uh, what is it? This is coming out in 2020? Yeah. Yeah, this that is, movie's out now. Should be out on DVD. Check it out in your local red box. It's good, maybe? Concept. Happy Death Day Do? Happy Death Day Do do that to you, too? That's part three. <laughs> Are you street smart if you're on an island, but you, like, know how to survive? I thought street smart was you can outwit a magician. What if you're in... The uh, the pretend city that North Korea made on the border of the DMZ. <laughs> so there's no one actually living there, and right. the speakers just play things to emulate human life. That is actually more cruel because everyone is going to just nod and say hello. <laughs> so you think you're street smart. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, you're a fucking idiot. You might as well be island smart. <laughs> yeah, what would you rather be, guys? Island smart or street smart? <laughs> Tom Hanks figured it out. <laughs> It wasn't hard. He took his own tooth out in that documentary. Partly no, in Memphis, too, by the way. I'm FedEx. sorry, what? <laughs> Did you start oh. walking here as, like, some tourist insider from the Bureau of Memphis? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Please come to Memphis is what their, their tagline. Is it Tennessee you there? No. <laughs> oh. It should be. What? No. Call your people. <laughs> Tell they them. won't pick up. We... Uh, what is it? It's California. It's yeah. great. We're the volunteer I'm state, please. Tennessee is. Oh, Florida's I'm loving it. Who wants to go next? I'll go. This is tough. Adam, you may need to give him some tips. What? Um, just do what my favorite state... Uh, North Dakota does. Yeah. Keep the North Dakota. Not South Dakota, jerk. <laughs> South Dakota's slogan Don't is keep the North Dakota. <laughs> Someone in the chat That's said, tell them about it. Dollywood, Ryan? Oh, yeah, Dollywood in Pigeon Forge, Gatlinburg. <laughs> it's fucking awesome. Dolly Parton has her own theme park. I it's love legit. Dolly Parton. Wow. Yeah, I love her too. And you love puns, so now you got Dollywood. 80% of the town burned down a couple years ago, though, so That's Dollywood's cool. in some trouble. I'd rather be alive in Hollywood, Florida. <laughs> Or sorry, dead in Hollywood, Florida, than alive in Dollywood, Tennessee. <laughs> Take that back, Adam. I hate Dollywood. Florida. <laughs> Morgan Freeman was rear-ended by a friend of mine, and he's not really even a friend. He's just a guy who cut me with a <laughs> Morgan tool Freeman once. <laughs> lives in Memphis. I'm just saying. No, you're, you're still off the mic. <laughs> oh, you mean like said that? Like in the future, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got it. If you're gonna be in this video, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Alana, how do I make a really sharp turn? This car's actually what? not too bad for this. In this game. Uh, I guess break and turn. Oh, okay, so just hold the left yeah, just thing slow and then, down. all right. Been good to know three years ago. <laughs> Bruce brings it up the most, but he's like, you know, after five years, you think you'd memorize the controls of GTA. Ooh. We play once a week. Sick. Oh no! <laughs> no, you got it. You got it. Oh, I did. Yeah. Uh, all right. Are we back to commenting on the game? Yeah. That's a new thing. <laughs> Sometimes we guess, talk about the game. I guess it's an old thing, really. Yeah. I was wondering how long it would take to get to this moment. I know. Where we just we look and go we we sit at, we sit on our front porch and we look at the sunset and go. <laughs> We're out over. of content. We did it. I we did probably, it all. I we can finally cancel this fucking show. Please tell me there's more than ten people in this game. Ah, uh, there are eleven. Yes. Perfect. Well, I'm out of material. <laughs> How many people do you think are not watching some fine programming at Amazon? because they refuse to log into their Amazon <laughs> account on their TV. A lot. I think people forget. Bruce being one of them, because I keep trying to get him to watch Patriot. And I was like, hey, just watch on Amazon. He's like, I'm not going to fucking do that. And he's to come to Netflix. He's like, what am I, a pussy? Alana. Basically. Mm. But it's I like, you, you what can, do I do? You can use the mountain as a jump. Oh, perfect. Sorry. It's you okay. Are. No, it's fine. <laughs> How dare you interrupt us with the game? Yeah, no, it's fine. <laughs> I was we're talking about with subscription services. Yeah, no, was, Is there another way to get up this item? No, no, he's doing it wrong. He's just squeaking. Oh, nudes. No, I was looking up Bezos's sex. I remember reading these before because they don't read like they read like a computer yeah, okay, that's trying I to. I love you, alive girl. I will show you with my body. I want to smell you. I want to breathe you in. You can't see it, but one of the related images is a bicentennial man. <laughs> <laughs> are you pro or against bicentennial man? I'm indifferent. I'm anti. Really? You're anti bicentennial man? Oh yeah, he's awful. What did he do to you? He's just a robot that loves. He bored me for two hours. Is it and a half because hours. he's not human? Is that what it is? Yeah. Is there a thing on the screen that's telling me which direction I'm supposed to be going? Okay, there we go. That, if you look that's at the... true. No one here is known for their great yeah, gameplay side note, prowess. Doesn't matter. It never matters. We talk about Jeff Bezos and Muppets or whatever. 
I mean, so did good, right? Let's go home, yeah. everyone. Enjoy did your weekend. Did good. Do you have any final thoughts on uh, reading people's private messages? No, who had, didn't tell you I'm what's against it, really bad ones? and I feel bad for Jeff Bezos, which is kind of weird, you know, because <laughs> yeah. it's like... It's, that's an embarrassing thing. I feel weird that I have sympathy for... It's an embarrassing thing to go out. Yeah. What's like a Woods' messages? I'm glad that he's fighting them. You know, that's yeah. cool. That he's yeah. like, hey... Fuck you, National Enquirer. Here's here's all your emails that you sent me. No more Prime for you. Right. Three day shipping only. So imagine you're messaging your dominatrix, or, or someone found the messages you do send to your dominatrix. I wouldn't like it. Yeah. I mean, yeah. my punctuation's all off. All right. <laughs> See everyone. And visit yeah. Memphis, Tennessee. Don't. <laughs> you forgot to eat all these. All right. Oh my God. We're starting with Mofocart Double Deck. Oh uh, boy. Ryan, what? is this your first GTA gameplay? Yeah. Here you go, bud. Oh my God. This is it. They finally asked me to be in a gameplay video. This is the best moment of my life. Now do not screw this up for us, Ryan. Don't you dare embarrass us again, Ryan. Listen to me. I'm the captain now. All right. So what are, what are we to plan? This is Mofo Caught Double Deck. This is basically like um, battle mode in Mario Kart. Got it. But you have cars and rockets. Ryan, for the people who don't know you, yes. you edit for Funhouse, That's true. and you're a GTA master. Um. Yeah. That's correct. I got my grandma to buy me GTA for Christmas. Like the first one oh, that boy. came out. You were uh, like, buy it for me, grandma. And she's like really Christian. And uh -huh. so I was like mortified <laughs> for the rest of my adolescence that she was responsible for this game in our house. GTA 2 has a cult in it. So that's kind of like religion, yeah, right? So if you told her that, like you could drive around a bus that a cult owns, that's kind of like a good thing. I will tell she you that. Understood. My mom bought me uh, the box set of GTA 3 Vice City and San Andreas for like my 12th birthday and didn't even question it. Mm -hmm. And here I am, yeah. playing it for work. Haven't killed anyone yet. The whole As the whole world was saying Manhunt will turn you into a serial killer, mm -hmm. I was playing it and look how I turned out. I'm fine. I mean, sometimes I will find a squirrel and I'll cut it open just to see what the insides look like. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it was already dead because I smothered it. Yeah, that doesn't, oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Do you know how to play GTA, or did your grandma teach you how to play it this way? Uh, <laughs> I, I can use a refresher, so I'm just killing people, right? So yeah, you're picking yeah. up rockets. Uh oh, oh you're off to and, a good start. And what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to aim at them and then click in the left stick to fire your rockets. Yeah, just like grandma taught you. Just like grandma <laughs> taught. She never went over that with me. Oh, oh and that's oh. a rocket. It's every grandma for himself out there, Ryan. And, and I can't just okay. All that's right. okay. You were doing great out there. It's all good. Twisted Anthony um, is very good. Do I have a rocket? I think it's left stick. Okay, is my rockets work. God. Oh, that's a dead car. Okay. Uh, we were talking about the Super Bowl before we started. Yes. Ryan, you like sports? I, I like football, and I like, and then I watch the rest occasionally. I like going to them. But what happened with the Super Bowl? It was the most boring game of all time of any sport ever. Why? Essentially, you had two really good offenses that could could and two good defenses that couldn't. Beat so, each other. So the problem was the this teams were too good. Yes. And everyone complained that the game was yes. bad. It was, yes. it was uninteresting yes. exactly. because it was too good. Teams were yes. too good. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Hey Adam. So do you think a better football game would be? Honestly, the best contrast was last year. Ooh. Every single time they got the ball, it was a touchdown, like all the way down the field. And then everyone's like, sweet, this is like 60 to 50. This is really fun, even though it was kind of ridiculous. But then this time the teams were better, but everyone hated it. Um, I, see, the thing is, this is why humans can't have nice things. Because what they got was a Super Bowl between two really good teams. Yes. But Which it sounds like the other year was a Super Bowl with two two bad teams. Two worst teams. I mean, so Lord. would you rather watch an How do you go in reverse? Fight? How do you go in reverse again? Hold, hold left trigger. Sorry. Hold That's, left trigger. Hold yeah. left trigger, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, thank so you. Funny. Imagine if you went to an MMA fight, and wow. then you, the one guy just came out of the corner and got knocked out yeah. first throw. People would say that was a great match, but it was actually a bad match. Yes. But what you want is an MMA fight where the guys are just grabbing each other and holding on to each other the whole time, because that means they're both good. But it's not fun to watch. But it's not fun to watch. Mm -hmm. uh, Stop streaming and start streaming uh, again. Ryan, close your mouth. You look like a dumbass. Hurry up. So are you from Memphis? I am. I have Born my race. guilty pleasure song is Walking in Memphis. Oh, yeah. I love it so yeah. much. Do you love the song or do you hate it? Oh, we love the song. Yeah. Everyone sings it all the time. <laughs> we <laughs> we all love it. Being serious. We, we're not serious. <laughs> I don't know anything about Memphis. You know Elvis Presley. Oh, yeah, I know him. Yeah. He's, from he's, our, he's our number one export. Okay. We've uh, talked about Graceland before, right? 
about how it's garbage. Well, oh, Graceland cool. is nice. It's a regular large house yeah. on a regular large lot, and everything around it is trash. Right. Like yes. across the street is <laughs> just know. a bunch it's of so really disgusting strip malls that are trying to cash in on the fact that yeah. Elvis lived across the street. The Heartbreak mm. Hotel is down the road, and yeah. it's just a shitty motel. Oh, did I get him? No, you missed him. Oh, well, shit. Being from Australia, we have a lot of people who have like weird cult-ish collections of anything to do with the royal family. Do you guys have that in Canada? Because you're people also love the royal uh, family in Canada, but right. I don't think we have anything like that. People have their own like museums where they show off their spoon collection of Queen Elizabeth or I something. I don't really understand. Oh, we were talking to someone who went to the house. They went to the house from uh, Halloween. Fuck. Someone down the street from the Halloween house has their own horror movie house museum, and it's garbage. I mean, they were like, you can pay $5 to go in the Hocus Pocus room. <laughs> it's just their living room. There's a similar thing with Graceland, actually. There's this old dude named Paul oh. that uh, McCloy, who has a place called Graceland 2, T-O-A. Nice. And uh, he painted his house pink. He was like, you can come to my house. It's open 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Here's leaves from the day Elvis died. Here's his report card from third grade that so, I somehow got. His yeah. son was named Elvis McCloy. Yeah. And it was a big, oh yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you got someone. Fuck yeah, fine. You got two get people. One? That's you got your two. two. That's two. two. Oh, get wow. that, get right. that, uh, the spanner. You're, you're on fire. Get the spanner so, yeah. real quick. Oh, no, shit. that's the wrong way. I'm trying to backwards just, into it. Just that. that He's got yep. it. He's got it. He's got there. He's got there. Yes. There it is. Nice. Wrench is put I'm out good fire. Look at you go. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, oh, wow. I can't believe I did that. That's the dead oh, person. Uh, fuck. I if you could open a museum for something, what would it be? I could open, like, Coliseum 2. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know? I could open the Louvre 2. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> White House 2. Yeah, White House 2. There's if no you stopping. live in a White House 2, then you can open a White House 2 too today. <laughs> this franchise is <laughs> like, shit. You gotta think big. Probably um, Graceland 2. He died all, recently. All Paul's stuff. Oh, Paul's dead? It's a really fucked up sad story too. He shot his handyman. Okay. Murdered his handyman accidentally, kind of. Well. Threw through his door. And then the next day had a heart attack on his porch from the wow. grief. Holy Broken shit. and heart. died. Yeah. For did, real. He, did he like struggle and try to crawl to the toilet? <laughs> <laughs> Just like my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> Who is yours? The Rock. Oh well, yeah. He liked one of my tweets once. And so I print out that that <laughs> tweet, and that's in the museum. Does that make you a stalker or an enthusiast? No, it makes you a, a um, curator. <laughs> I changed my answer. Selena Gomez. I give her all my organs. You ever get, you ever get a, call, a phone call from someone, and it's a number that's similar to your number? Yeah. Yeah. And it's like that's like trying to trick you. To Always spam. That's the black market. If you ever want to, no. if you if you get a call from your own phone number or something close to it, that's how you get in touch with the black market. Have you ever fallen for one of those? I, I, I screen all my calls. My phone calls are all redirected to a call center. I have a South Asian man, hmm. Dinesh, takes my calls. I trust him with my life. In fact, when I die, I want him to be the curator of my museum. <laughs> <laughs> He'll just take the phone off the hook forever. Yeah. I worked in a call center for a while. Uh, everyone got laid off and replaced by people in... I think it was in the Philippines. Mm. Ooh, uh, that's exotic. nice. Yeah. Do you think they would have given you an option, like if you had still been there, to continue working with the company, but it requires you moving to the Philippines and taking a 90% pay cut? <laughs> 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 We're not going to tell you you have to leave. But if you want to stay, here's what you have to do. You have small hands, you get 15% more. Small like, hands what, dial faster, Alana. <laughs> what, kind of, what kind of calls did you have to take? So it was for uh, mostly people's emails being broken. Just yeah. a lot of walking people through things that were their own fault that they just thought were your fault. Was this an Australian call center? Yeah. So the Philippines isn't that far away. It's like a six hours, maybe. It's like their Canada. That's what we always call it. <laughs> were people yelling at you a lot? And yeah, lots and of... it was international, so I would sometimes have uh, men from, I don't know, countries where women don't work, be like, it's disgusting that you have a woman in the workplace. Oh, Jesus. really? And then I'd have to just transfer them to a manager. All right, Here's well, a man. anyway, <laughs> you, did you try your password? <laughs> have you tried turning it on? Thanks. I, uh, uh, recently blew one Lawrence Sontag's mind by mm -hmm. telling him that there are certain countries in the world where women can take menstrual leave. Really? Oh yeah, so I think like Japan Where? is one of them. I need to go. You can take it every month? I don't, but I would well, like I the time. <laughs> well, yeah, I just think you spare everyone in the office the whole gab, gab, gab. Yeah, that's what we do. We get our period and then we can't shut up. Well, you can't stop talking about how you just got your period. You're like, oh, last week I was in such a bad mood, I'm leaving but now I'm in a great everywhere. mood, but I can't do anything about it because I'm oozing out of my vagina. I have said that, that's true. Every time. Ryan, tell me the truth. On the days where I come to your desk to give you notes, yes. and I say, 
hey, I'm here to give you notes. I have my period. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when yes. I tell you that, yes. do you notice a difference in the notes that I give you? <laughs> yeah, they're usually the lots of exclamation points, all in caps. <laughs> Would you describe them as more curt? Than yeah. Like, all right, well, thank you for your honesty. <laughs> I'm gonna go cry <laughs> over there now. See, this is something you could do at home. My brother-in-law just got a job that offers paternity leave. If you have a dog, a dog? that di dies or oh. or something, you can take paternity. Um, that doesn't sound. Or you like, adopt the dog. I was gonna say the yeah. adoption makes sense. Yeah. Both of them. There Aww. would be like bereavement. <laughs> yeah. Think, think about all those times that the end credits of something have a in memory of. Everyone on that big list had to keep going even though that key grip died. It's a good point. Are good you gonna point. cry now? I just sneeze. Are you gonna cry? Yeah, she's on a period again. <laughs> My period sneezes. <laughs> if there was one social welfare thing that exists somewhere else that you wish existed here, what would you want it to be? Um, what's that, what's that like a uh, Middle Eastern, um, like a paradise uh, place? Oh, with the virgins? Or, no, just, <laughs> they like built their own beaches and stuff. Uh, oh, Dubai, kind of. Dubai, yeah, yeah, Dubai. I wish that I lived in a place that they were investing in all this insane tourist okay. stuff, burning through all their yes, oil money exactly. at a disgusting pace while right. they fire I mean, they have, like, sand into the ocean. They to build have a more ski islands. field yeah. inside a shopping center. We need that. Yeah, we yeah. do need that. You're right. I think that all, like, there's something about people who are born in Dubai from families who were also born there get like a million dollars when they turn 18. I'd like that too. Could be fairy tale <laughs> bullshit, but I like it. Seventh place. You know, I'm oh, part of that. Thanks for getting me That's seventh, Lana. Out of how place. many? Eight. <laughs> oh, I thought it was out of like 12. Yeah, did you have to say mm. it? I keep thinking that. It's fine. Just I was going to say uh, panty machine uh, vending machines. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I missed that. What did you say? I said uh, panty vending machines. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, wait. I was hoping to play the first half so that way you could pull it together. But now I'm going to have to keep it going. Yeah. Oh, geez. I don't even know the buttons. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. I only play Super Bowl now. You guys know that. Yeah, you've sold us. What sport is Super Bowl the Super most Bowl. Like? I'm glad you asked, Ryan. Yeah. Super Bowl is a mix of... Throw ball and soccer. <laughs> throw ball, throw ball okay. being a sport I just came up with, with right okay. now. It's Canadian, so it's it. everything exactly as it is. It's literal. So, Lana, James always makes fun of me because he says that Canadian terms for things are very literal mm -hmm. in their descriptors. So, like, in America, you would say kickball, which they call kickball. We would call soccer baseball. Really? <laughs> yes. And it's nonsense. He also no tried way. to, he also a cartoon tried, to he tried to gaslight me by telling me that, th that this was not true. So I contacted like two friends back home and I was like, what is the game where you're on a baseball diamond and you kick a, a soccer ball? And they were like, soccer baseball? Are you are you crazy? Soccer baseball. <laughs> I've actually never heard of that. <laughs> I thought kickball honestly was a thing where you like kicked a ball against a wall. I mean, kickball is okay. pretty literal. Soccer baseball is literal in like a worse way because I still don't know how to play it. And it takes longer to say. No, I don't think Australia has whatever kickball or soccer baseball are. We have extreme handball. Yeah, we got extreme handball too. Yeah. So it was basically, you know, two people on two squares and you would just hit a tennis ball with each other. Four square? Is that what you're talking yeah, about? Yeah, four square. Four square was a good sport. It's awesome. Whoa, it was like tennis, but if you didn't have... Hand oh, four square was with really big... You had a really big, you used a kickball, yeah. or a soccer baseball ball, yeah. as it's referred <laughs> in Canada. Oh, sorry, you were supposed to go. Oh, no, please, I don't know. <laughs> Tell me how to drive. Triggers, or go. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna shoot. All right, click in on the left stick. You just drive over it, once you've got one there, then you click in on the left. Oh, I already got wasted. <laughs> nice. Have to fly, have to fight, have to grow. Oh, nice hook. Fire! I did. Oh, did it again? No. Did it? Oh. Problem is, if you get too excited when you turn, then you'll accidentally fire your rockets. Mm -hmm. I did that the whole time. It's funny to watch, though. <laughs> Can't use your big old meat paws. Again, oh, oh. you accidentally fired it there. I know, Light hands, these meat hooks. These meat hooks. Yeah. You could never work in a call center. They wouldn't yourself. let you work in the Philippines. They wouldn't, yeah. No, They'd be offering not. everyone that move with the 90% pay nope, cut, but they'd be like, again. but not Elise. Oh, geez, I'm so sorry. I can't. Hands are too strong. I can't not. Can't oh, okay, oh, you oh, did, did it immediately again. again. I'm so again. sorry. There's no... Why are you apologizing? No, you did it again immediately. Jeez, my dear. All right. Now and don't again. fire it. No, she did. She okay. Hurried. So pick it up and don't fire it. There's no All right, way. Now just turn. Baby's, she did not fire it. You didn't fire touch. it. Fire. Go, 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 fire. Now go, fire. fire. I, I was. Oh, uh, you must have already fired it. You did dodge those rockets in like a James <laughs> Bond kind of way. Yeah, it was pretty sick. It's like a, a field goal. Still, still. Oh, you fired oh, two at the same time somehow. I apol I want to give an apology. I want to apologize to the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Oh, oh you dodged no. it again. 
You're slippery. Go, Fire. Go, fu mm. Oh, nope. Mm. Oh, just missed him. Bad spot, bad spot. Oh, and then you got blown. Oh, my contacts are drying up. You gotta blink, too. Thumbstick, hey. blinking. Triggers, thumbstick, you blinking. Just... Uh, schoolyard sports. Which favorite schoolyard sport? Um... What's well, I'm thinking of the, the non-offensive word for it now. What's the... The non-offensive word for it. Come on, Memphis. It's, it's, uh, 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 what's the... It, it's where you... Somebody has a ball and then they run away from the crowd of people that, you know... We called it <laughs> in Tennessee. Oh my Whoa. god. Holy okay. shit. Oh shit, That's... we're streaming right now. Oh <laughs> it was god. a bunch I mean, of kids. you were just saying what it was called was and you also were acknowledging called. that it shouldn't have been called that. Exactly. I mean, we had I don't know what that thinking is thinking called. What I is think it was called the... Tag the... <laughs> everywhere else <laughs> except for Tennessee. <laughs> My god. Wow. I like that you're sweating. <laughs> you're like <laughs> you're like a politician. Hold on a minute. I'm planning on my apology already. Wow. Good job, Ryan. Your first gameplay video and you said something so offensive it had to be beeped. I'm ashamed that I'm you. You fucking suck. Wait, why did I leave that part in? I'm editing this. Look, you gotta, eat, you gotta eat the mic. I am eating the mic. I'm really good in that. I keep brushing my mustache against it and it's like... Ew. How often would you say you brush the stush? The stush? You brush the stush. How often? I brushed it this morning. Yeah, what do you feed it? I feed it testosterone that I rub on me every morning. <laughs> That's not a lie. Ooh, brag about it. Do you actually use a topical testosterone I to do. grow out facial hair? Yeah. Well, I, I mean, the facial hair is, is a is Can a. Can you put it anywhere and it'll grow hair? It legitimately says, "Do not rub it on your dick." <laughs> so you did try it, right? <laughs> Other thing, somebody did, and then they got in trouble for it, and so they put the warning on the bottle. Was that you? Are you referring yourself saying. in third person? Did you just use it on the tip? <laughs> I just use it like I just. I just create a line of it on the bottom. Of I want the two long hairs that I can use like feelers, like an insect would. <laughs> like a catfish. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just like touching around down there. Oh, someone's close. It's because we, we turn on all the lights in our apartment mm -hmm. to save on energy, and yeah. then you just can tell where and we I also am. don't want to see each other during sex. <laughs> yeah. Someone in the chat uh, asked if we can predict exactly what happens in Elite Battle Angel, so mm -hmm. that by the time this video is edited and out, we can see if we were correct or not. Here's what I want to know. There's, it's clear in the trailer that she has like a regular robot body and then at some point upgrades. But she doesn't upgrade to having a vagina. Which to me know. is like suspension of disbelief. I can't get into the movie now. Right, so that, that's why when that happened in Bicentennial Man, that's when you bought into Bicentennial yeah, yeah. Man. He immediately goes, can I have a dick? That's the first thing he asks like as a robot. He's no. like, can What's I get a dick? And what, then, if she, what if we, we don't know, maybe she opted out of the vagina. Which again is not believable. Every woman <laughs> wants a vagina. So yeah. Put that on yeah. the pillow. Some men yeah, want you're vaginas probably not wrong. too. They're yeah. pretty cool. So. Vaginas are pretty cool. Alana, what, the, what's the objective in this one? Uh, right, do race. Car. Oh. Do race, get checkpoint. My oh. mustache is a very private thing. What's its name? I don't have a name. I'm gonna let you name it. Linda the you mustache. Go Linda? No, 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 turn around, John. <laughs> no, I don't need to turn around. Do this. Okay, Exits. yeah, that works. Oop, accidentally went into action view. Oh, what am I doing? Action view again. Is this like Ratatouille where Linda's giving you tips on how to play GTA? What Ratatouille are you watching? Ratatouille, yeah. he's doing the, rat's doing the cooking. Yeah. Oh. Your mustache is the mus pulling your up your head. Oh, Linda's my mustache. Yeah. I've already forgotten the name. We already established that. I'm in fifth, at least. Linda's in fifth. Drift this whole time. You're supposed. This is supposed to be one continuous drift. You would know that if you had seen the best Fast in the There was a drift. Yeah, I did that. You are a drift prince at best. I wonder yeah. if you know how, how we do in Tokyo. Tokyo. If you've seen it, then you Ready? And then drift. You know you have to go. Drift, there. drift, drift, Pop drift, drift. 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 Have you been to Japan, John? No. No, when you want to go? When you take me? 20, we should go 2020 when uh, Mario World opens. Yeah, that's what James and I are waiting for. Okay. So he's yeah, been, that's he what John and been. I are waiting for, too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the only thing is, you got to be careful crossing the street in Japan. Why? Because there's people drifting all over the place. Oh, Jesus, no. <laughs> it's just exactly you had like me the there. movie. You had me there for two seconds with like a legitimate like traveled James fact, and it's not. <laughs> Ask me anything about traveling around the world and I'll give you a useful fact that you can use in that particular place. How do you greet someone uh, politely in Turkey? Climb to the top of the pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear about the people that, that supposedly had sex? On top of the pyramids, yeah, they filmed like a sex tape. It's fantastic. Wow. That's How? so cool. Do they say that they broke in? That it's like went there's some fences and then they just ducked down behind a dune until it got really late. Then they snuck in. And then they went up there, set up a camera, and banged. Tootin' coming, you know? Nice. <laughs> if you just go back and watch the tape, that was just at least staring off in the distance, not listening to anything James was saying for the past five minutes. Tootin' toot toot. 
Kitten, cum, cum, penis, penis. 90% of the time, that's what it would be. Fairbone. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's just that, yeah. it's just the beautiful mind moment of Elise going through a vocabulary. 90% of, words. of the time, that would be, but this was King one of the, the uh, elusive times where it just. If you could have sex on top of any national Ooh. monument, which would it be? Uh, I think Great Wall of China, because then a bunch of like Chinese tourist families would like be taking pictures with us. I want to I do it on the. Uh, on uh, Abraham Lincoln. His yeah. lap. I'm blanking on the name of the monument right well, now. Well, we'll go do a lot of Which yeah. monument would I have sex no, on? Not no, not like which, which, like, world wonder, this. I guess. Man-made. I'm going to go with the Great Barrier Reef. Oh. <laughs> the Great, so the great Barrier Reef? reef? <laughs> Were you going to say the Great Barrier Reef? Yeah, but then you said man-made. <laughs> More like Great Barrier Queef. Mm, exactly. Oh, 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 no. Were you sitting there thinking for the whole time of how to come <laughs> up with that? That was what that? he said. I feel like Great Wall of China is a good one because they have... Great Wall of China. They have parts of the wall that uh, uh, shut down for... Like maintenance, I guess. Construction. <laughs> now you're just making sex fun <laughs> about anything we say. I think Linda's a bad influence on your attitude. No, Linda's a great influence on my attitude. <laughs> I don't know. I think she, she gives me whispers you things. Confidence. Where's the worst place to have sex? Just in general, just like Guantanamo Bay. <laughs> I've got this plenty of fucking going down there. Yeah, but Ooh. it's not. It's not no, good. Not no one's having want. a good time. I want to have sex in the Oval Office. The Ugh. Oral Office. <laughs> the oral orifice. Sure. <laughs> Don't clap that one. I, that was a good one. That was quick. I liked confidence. That was, that was like, that was instantaneous. You should do a show about improv games. I bet I'd be pretty good on it. <laughs> I have no desire to ever have sex in front of other people. What about behind other people? Like, they're not allowed to turn and look. If they do, they turn to salt. <laughs> I would just be screaming, Don't look! Don't look! The entire time. <laughs> Don't you do that anyway? I do. <laughs> Even when it's just you? <laughs> <laughs> What's the James on the spot moment? Moment that you look back with the most regret and um, <laughs> distaste. Nothing. Uh, James is a delight and always a welcome guest on the show. But there's like gotta be kind of one. Minute. Any bad moment on the spot, I completely erase from my brain. <laughs> you don't just, remember any of that show just then. Just remember the good stuff. <laughs> Not <laughs> even a certain team for working legs. That was such a good time. Comes it up. pops up because yeah. it's just three people <laughs> making fun of a guy in a wheelchair. And if you don't know the show, out of context, making it fun with horrible. a guy in a wheelchair. <laughs> no, he didn't make any of the jokes in the clip that circulates. Hashtag four working legs. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly the reaction. <laughs> what did you bring to the table? I brought a fucking wheelchair. Technically the wheelchair brought you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm just gonna go home now. <laughs> uh, well you can't. We took out the ramp. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like two people on the opposite team making fun of him and then immediately his teammate joins in and makes fun hey. of him too. That sounds like the host problem. It is. It, it is always the host problem. Yeah, have you ever had two people in wheelchairs on the show at the same time? I have not. Mm. Well, there you go. Mm, sounds like a host Team problem. no working legs. Yeah. <laughs> if you were offered the opportunity to go sing the national anthem at like a baseball game, would you go do it? No. No? No. no. Would you? I, in I, a heartbeat. No. Because I wouldn't be able to do a good job. Oh, I wouldn't be able to do a good job either. I don't have but a passion. But I don't want to pull I, a fogey. I would say with any any national anthem, I wouldn't want to be in a situation where I am mocking because that's a pretty big deal. Yeah, like, no, I, I would. Want to, I would give it my all. Like I don't yeah. care if I'm fine with the Roseanne thing of her singing it shittily. Or the land of the free. But me personally, I'm like, nah, it's kind of a big deal. The national anthem for I a lot of people. I would do a mashup so. of. Uh, the anthem in America the Beautiful, Waves of Rain. Also, I'd have to be kneeling while I'm singing, so it's like a whole big mm. thing. You have to kneel while you sing? They yeah. don't. They don't kneel while they sing. Wait, oh, John, you, John, you didn't, you he didn't doesn't get it. You didn't, you oh didn't get it. Oh my god. Joke. Ask Linda for some oh, more tips. No. I don't get most jokes. Run them by Linda. That's my superpower. Before you say something. <laughs> really want this Linda thing to pick up. What's after the flag was still there part? And our oh, flag was still, still there. there. What's next? Oh, say, does that star spangled banner yet because you can't kill freedom <laughs> and the eagles ball by choice. <laughs> America! Is your car too slow to make this jump? <laughs> it's just bad. That's not good. Yeah, it is, yeah. Oh, no. It's L not great. Try, I think, with bikes, if you lean back, that's not going to help. Yeah, if, get if you speed. kind of lean, lean the car back, Okay. Uh, I don't know if that'll work. Motorcycles, if you lean it back, it'll go oh, further. Yeah, I don't know if that'll help with a car. You might just be stuck here. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, no, that's uh -oh. going to no, 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 hurt the no, speed. No, no, no. That's not going to work out. I, that was my strat, though. I was going to, you know, yeah, get yeah, some speed. Yeah, yeah, get some of that downhill. Using physics. There you go. 
because that banner always fucking waves. There it is. This, this is the you one. This is, it. this is the there one. There you go. Yes. Nice. For the land of the free. And then you hold. And what else? Tell me what else. And the hound. Oh, no. <laughs> Boom. The only thing the the American National Anthem is missing is a reference to, like, deadlifts. <laughs> <laughs> like, and our bench is real high. <laughs> Does it mention uh, eagles at all? Uh, no, I don't think that so. It seems like a miss. Yeah. I don't think that when the National Anthem was written, anyone knew what eagles were. Mm. So, like, it wasn't until later think, they were like, yeah. that's ours. Or that ah. they even met yet. Look at that Look fucking how fucking guy. cool that bird Look is. Look at that, he's got a hat on. What's Canada's national bird? Do you guys have one? Probably, yeah, absolutely. Oh, it's so a blue-footed bird. Who decided that every single country, oh, you want to be a country? Bird. You fill out this paperwork. You need a song, you need a bird. Canada, you need a flower. You need a flower, yes. yeah. And you gotta pick color for your currency. Oh no, we got a lot of colors in Australia. Yeah, a lot of other countries have multiple colors. Yeah, what the hell, James? Yeah, Canada is beautiful. Currency. In fact, yeah. I'd say most James. countries have multiple well, colors. Also, Australia is different sized. Everything's a different it's size efficient. because they care about blind people. Yeah, right. They're faking it. <laughs> I mean, Canadian money has uh, Braille on it. Does American money not ah. have Braille on it? No, we no. don't care. Didn't not that. at all. We don't care. We want them to accidentally give us a 20. Did you not watch the scene yeah. in Daredevil where Ben Affleck has to fold the money in a specific way so he knows which denomination it is? Did you not watch the scene in Seinfeld when Jerry is wearing the glasses to keep Lloyd Braun from thinking he's crazy and it blurs oh, yeah, his vision so he takes out money and it's accidentally 100? We don't even use money. We just take out credit cards we can't pay back. <laughs> yes. That's in the national anthem. Get that <laughs> debt. Yeah. Use that debt to buy guns. Yeah. Merck. It's well, fine. I'll take that DNF. Two DNFs. I'm good. That's it's rough. whatever. Just like America. <laughs> We've had a few DNFs. Yeah. <laughs> so, John, before we wrap this up today, would you recommend a mustache? Like, how do you feel about it out of 10? If you can grow a proper mustache, definitely. If you can't, stop. Well, he used yeah. the topical stuff, then. you got to start smearing test. Yeah. Testosterone. You just gotta start lip. smearing flammable alcohol. Is it a cream? It's a, it's a gel. A gel. It's, it uh, says do not put it near open flame because you will burst. All right. Well, you learn something every you day. Can, I have some with me if you want to try some out. Don't. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. Your lipstick looks really nice. Oh, thanks. Is it like a lip tint? It's like a yeah. It's like a stain. It's pretty. But I I always have to like use chapstick or whatever to because I'm a crypt keeper. <laughs> oh hey. Someone else is digging for compliments. Your lips are very dry today. <laughs> I like the sound it makes, the crinkling sound it makes when you smile. It's like someone's opening up a Nestle's Crunch Bar. You know, want to hear something funny? No. Growing oh. up, I thought the bar was called Nestle Bar. It's my favorite candy bar. I didn't realize until much later, it's technically Nestle is the company and it's the Crunch Bar. I loved Nestle Quick when I was a kid. Don't change the subject. <laughs> I loved a lot of Canadian well, Canadian UK chocolate bars. So like, I loved Coffee Crisp, um, Aero bar. Bars, bar. Smarties. Uh, I'm okay there. Oh, Smarties. I like Smarties. Smarties are good. Smarties are worse M and M's. No, I think they're better than that's M&Ms. a take. So. That being said, I I'm a peanut M M&M and M man myself. Right. Some people don't like peanuts. Can't have peanuts. I honor that. But just know that any <laughs> other M M&M and M you're having is worse. That's like the fact that I can only lift. Smaller weights, yeah, and I can't lift weights as big as you can. Yes, you are That's inferior. All I can do. That I, that I, but it's not your fault. I am the M M&M and M to your peanut M M&M and M. Exactly, is what I am. you're um, both kind of the peanut. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, elevator death match. What the oh, hell? Oh, this is cool. What is this? And th- there should be just tons of like hallways and, and places to sneak up oh, on people no. and stuff. How do I get through the door? <laughs> the door doesn't open. Can't. This is my John Wick. This is my John Wick moment. Watch your corner. Oh, he's right there. Oh. He's right there. Get up. Get, oh, no. Nice, he shot that door though. This is like the end of Aliens, mm-hmm. except instead of Ripley like picking up the girl and <laughs> That's how blowing, up the, blowing up the queen alien, Ripley turns a corner and one alien fires a gun at her. Whoa, Whoa what is this? What? Oh, the hell am I? Cool. This is where uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger didn't kill anyone with that giant gun that probably accidentally killed someone. Like, me- how, how does John Connor know? You remember the railgun and eraser? Yes. This is the fucking best gun ever. Go down somehow? There you go. go. Staircase Hello. located. You fucking pro gamer. Oh, you suddenly go. goes up. Stop. There. Got it. There you go. Yeah. You're coming up on some... Oh, they're around this corner. Yeah. Yeah. No, they're not Maybe around this corner. There. They're... You want that? You want that bigger gun, though? I'm gonna go shotgun. You think you can go shotgun? He's yeah. not ready. He's not you ready. You ain't ready for no shotgun. Hottie with a shotty. Pick right up there. the carbine rifle and be happy you have it. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> okay. Still bad at being bullied about guns by at least one <laughs> damn <laughs> millennials. Oh, jump onto the the sca- the scaffolding. Where's the scaffolding? Out there. Jump onto that. Oh yeah. Write it down. Okay. Oh. Ready? Yeah. Oh. It won't let me. Oh, you can't jump out. Oh, behind you! Behind you! Behind you! Above you! Okay, go! 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 No. Oh, too high! You're all so close! <laughs> Come on! Just, Come on! Just aim better! <laughs> He's toying with me! He is definitely Just run up and hit him! 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 Stop aiming! Run up and hit him! Oh. Up and hit him. Oh. No! I think you shot him though. I did! You I'm did get you. one hit. I like that you're playing this like you're just running around the level trying to collect all the guns. I'm trying to find people! <laughs> It's There's like a- it's Banjo Kazooie, and you're like, let me get all those notes. Yeah, it's just, very pleasant. Wait, did you gather nuts? Oh, oh hit him! Pop him! Pop him! Hit it! Oh, god damn it! I finally find him. You should just hang out in a darkened corner. That's what I do most days, anyway. I was gonna say, yeah, what yeah, should yeah, you do in the game? Just, oh! Uh, hey! What do you think killed you? The bullets or the fall? <laughs> <laughs> you kind of landed on the top tip of your spine there. The bullets startled me. <laughs> oh! Did you get? Did you, you did that? You killed the man. I you did that. I hit him. I don't think One. I hit him with a bullet. You did it. It didn't All come right. anywhere close. He had a heart attack. <laughs> he spooked him. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, he got it. Wow, he's way more aware than you are. They're going to regret it for messing with the zinger. The zinger. <laughs> I've been trying to get that nickname going for yeah, three years. You keep years. going. How's, how's it working? <laughs> yeah. It's not working. It's just me. <laughs> just me for now. This, this is, is really intense. intense. We're on level 50. <laughs> it's like Ghostbusters. How does it keep Oh! Oh, come on, 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 come yeah, oh. Shomu's boss. Oh. Oh. oh, you stop shooting! Oh, come on. Oh, come on. No, uh, nope. He's gone. He left. He went back to his time. <laughs> Where is no, no. Top him, top him. Hit him, hit him. I'm trying. Oh. You just gotta aim at him. This game is broken. He's gonna come through that door. No. No. Just yep. There you go. You got him in the butt. You just got it. Oh, oh, I got him in the dick. Damn it. Can I just sit down at the desk and do some work? 90 seconds of out. Can I just like... Are you fucking nerd? Can I just like go on Reddit or something? Pretend you belong here. There's a guy around this corner. (gasps) Come on, John. John. Come on, John. Come on. Come on, John. Just pop him one. Oh, you got him. Yeah, you totally got him. You got your three kills. three kills. That's one. Hell yeah. I'm good. That didn't seem right. (laughs) Okay, there's two people on the staircase. I'm upset. You got it. You can survive There's three of them now. They're above you. They're above you. They're above you. Go. Oh! That was a great shot. That was such John a good. That much. was such a good shot. It was. That's the kind of shot that someone would do when good, they accidentally no, kill a loved one. <laughs> you know, <laughs> they good think job. they hear. They think they hear a break in, but it turns out nope. Show me how it's done, Elise. How do you tumble? If you're oh, aiming with left trigger and you hit yeah, X, then you'll do a roll. I like that you called it a tumble instead of a roll. Get ready to tumble. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Stay oh, yeah. in here. Yeah. No, this is your safe no. place. That's oh, your nice safe tumble. place. Nice tumble. Nice tumble. Sorry. Okay. Come on, come on. Yep. Tumble, yep. tumble. Oh, yeah. Elise. Oh, Elise, tumble. Watch it. There you go. Oh, it's a tumble. Yo, yeah, tumble. How do I hit him? Because my stop fist? aiming and then and then hit a tree. Oh, you shot him three times. How do I hit him with my fist? Just just punch. Just hit B. Punch. B. Stop aiming and hit B. Stop aiming yeah. and hit B. There you uh, go. You definitely <laughs> own that. He did not give that to you. <laughs> <laughs> no. He saw a tumble and he respected the tum. Yeah. Like, Uh-oh. Oh, he's back. He's back. On the bottom, I think. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't miss a, a shot. I have a broken heart. <laughs> Respect the tumble. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, Great reaction man. time. Great reaction All time. Right. Tom. Yeah. I don't tumble. Oh. Great kill. Oh. Great kill. Oh, 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 oh. Give it to me. Oh, oh. Tumble. You, you can't tumble while you reload. a lot of bullets. Oh. I reload and tumble at the same time. You're a champ. Okay, we're learning. We're learning a lot about what we can and can't do while tumbling. You gotta shoot. All right. So you gotta shoot uh, the gun. Uh, <laughs> You got, yeah, oh, you, got, oh, you can't just tumble up there. You, you have, have to shoot, but so close though. That you was have your to double tumble kill into position. Oh, now I'm on a John streak. It's okay. My own dad used to say that. Yeah, but where's he now? Not playing GTA. No, he's not. All right, we have another stairwell situation. Are they? Stairwell where are they? They're, they're they? above you. They've got to be above you. I'm going up, baby. Normally, when I play GTA Online Deathmatch, I use my 5.1 surround oh, sound oh, headphones. Oh, 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 get acid. You'll, oh, you'll, tumble. You'll, you'll oh break good tumble. tumble. Careful break, with break. that. You're going to hurt your you hip going down the, the stairs stair. that way. Oh, look at the down way. the stairs. Uh, make sure you look ahead. Uh, he's in that direction. Stop Beat. looking away oh. from him. 
Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, teleported. Oh, that Whoa. was odd. Uh, still looking in the wrong direction. <laughs> Uh, yep. Here we go. Okay. Nice shot. Okay. Here we no, go. No, no, no. no. She's got tumble. this. She knows. Tumble, guys. There's that guy. Okay. This is oh. Gunkata. Oh. This is Gunkata. I, I was almost there. You are also in slink mode, too. Oh, yeah. So if you want to run, you, there you that, go. That's yeah. her style. The slinky bandit. You ever seen Elise walk around the office? She's just always slinking everywhere. <laughs> oh, you got a shotgun. Okay, yeah. Nice, nice. That's more your style. I got it. Oh! I missed it. What happened? Yeah. You got it. it. That guy she just was keeps walking. <laughs> you just saw a gun come up behind her like a shark. Here we go. Waiting. Right around waiting. the corner. Pop. Roll. Pop. Go. 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 Oh, no. I missed. I missed every single. I missed every single shot. Area. Yeah. I wasn't aiming to kill. Shoot to scare. <laughs> That's the warning. <laughs> yeah, I remember in Star Trek we used to say that. Oh, Set God. phasers to scare. Did you just say I remember in Star Trek we used to say that like mm-hmm. you were in Star Trek? I was in Star Trek. You don't know. Oh, cool. John played uh, Jory LaForge's eye mask. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> just wrapped <laughs> around. Yeah. Guys, I need you to be my eyes and ears in the stairwell, okay? Well, that's what John did for a career before he started in his new... Oh, there's system. someone there. Oh, oh, uh, this guy's this guy got a beat out on you. Ace, All that, spades. This looks like a not scary farm <laughs> haunted <laughs> mansion. Yeah. This is the, actually, this is very much Universal Studios with The walk, Walking Dead The Ride. Yeah. <laughs> which is just a rundown place that they don't have to worry about cleaning because it looks spooky. What do you think about making a funhouse uh, haunted maze? This, is, this isn't an episode of Open House, but I will answer your question anyway. I just, anyway. No, I was just thinking of it. Just, I think that's a good idea. You, you want to know my Mortal Kombat fatality, too, if we were in Mortal Kombat? The scary stuff in our maze would just be like, at some point, you'd be asked to sit down in a chair, and when you do, you'd reach in between the cushions, and you'd find, like, a sticky, balled-up paper towel. <laughs> that's like, oh, ooh, and the lights would flicker. Make you uncomfortable, mildly. Yeah. <laughs> it's ectoplasm. You only have to... Endure us for in one hour of us talking about what we find interesting in pop culture from 1998. Cole loves that shit. I was alive. Were you? Barely. What year were you born in? 91. You remember the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? And oh, Power, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Power Rangers. Rangers. Power Rangers. Yeah, remember you remember all those. Power Rangers, I remember Thomas the Tank Engine. Oh. Okay, that's a little after Thomas my... Thomas the Tank Engine. If you close your eyes, Cole kind of sounds like Jacob. A younger Jacob. Though Jacob's probably younger than Cole. Jacob's younger than Cole. But in spirit? Hey, it does. Yeah, it's weird, right? Say uh, Jiminy Jillikers. Jiminy Jillikers. Yeah, that's Jacob. Wow, that is Jacob. (laughs) Say, I love Return of the Jedi. I I love love Return Return of the the Jedi. Jedi. (laughs) That they're the same person. Holy shit! I didn't even hear two voices. I have curly hair too. I have curly hair too. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's, what's your catchphrase, Cole? I used to go, child please. Okay, oh that's good. That's a Jacob okay. catchphrase okay. for sure. Alright, ready? Child please. <laughs> It's in stereo. Thank you very much, Jacob. It's like I have surround sound. Thank you, Jacob. I appreciate that. We'll we'll figure this out later. You guys should be friends. I heard you're good at video games, so we can be friends. Oh. It's the same voice. It's the same person. When James and I went camping as adults last year. Uh, I remember that. We uh, we were hanging out with all the cool developers working on that Psychonauts game. Mm -hmm. And there was a guy there who sounded exactly like Joel Rubin. Oh, yeah. We, we were walking in the woods and we'd close our eyes. And it would sound like Joel yelling. <laughs> a voice yeah. twin. Yep. I think I'm seeing him tonight. Oh, yeah? Oh, that's right. You are seeing him. We'll yeah. see him tonight. Yeah. We're all seeing him. And he's going to be without baby. Oh. Well, Joel on the loose with an entire glass of wine Man, in him. Man, <laughs> baby. Oh, you know, he is my favorite married white woman. <laughs> he's comfortable in his masculinity. Like there, well, yeah. He's he's impregnated a woman. That yeah. is true. That's, that's the most masculine Shit. thing you could do. I don't know if any of you are he, actually men. Shit. <laughs> How did they film the beginning of Look Who's Talking when the Beach Boys, yeah. uh, also Here we, we just lost a member of the Monkees recently, which sounded like the Beach Boys. That's, so that's not the Beach Boys at all. Rest in peace. What are you about? How did they film the sperm back then in the 80s? How did they do that? Microscopes. What are you talking about? Did, could cameras film that or was it... Like, yes, well, microscopic of they could. cameras. I assumed it was puppets. The 1980s was only a few years ago. <laughs> How'd they do it? Mm, I'm with you, Adam. <laughs> get around, get around, I get around. Get around, round, round, I get around. I get around, round, round, I get around. Once again, rest in peace, monkeys. We'll miss you. Mo- no, the no. Beach Boys. They didn't play their own instruments. Actually, the guy who just died did. Oh, the he, one. Was the one. he was the only one who's actually a musician, and he was really bummed. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine how bad it must feel to have people hate you for playing instruments, but then people love you for not playing instruments? I remember hey, Ashley sh- Simpson got caught lip-syncing. Oh, that she was did. terrible. Um, that one was awkward. On a Monday, I am waiting. 
Who would ever lip sync, lip sync, lip sync, lip sync, lip sync? <laughs> Why is Turbid not in here? That's the first time anybody's ever asked that question. <laughs> Alright. Did they s- Oh, I gotta- Alana, play. what are we doing? This is a different track because the other one only have four laps. <laughs> so what are we doing on this track? Uh, it's supposed to be like inspired by Hot Wheels. Cool. So she has a bunch of like cool trick stuff. They just film commercials in our office all the time they and really it's annoying. Do. Yeah, Cole. that fucking smoke machine, man. It's a yeah, killer. No, right? It's always yeah. so smoky. Cole, you know what Hot Wheels are? Yeah, I love Hot Wheels. I had a dragon. That's what? not a car, Cole. <laughs> it turned into a car. There's a Hot Wheels dragon. Push the chain and transform a cement truck into a vicious beast. Like one of those dragon back. dildos? Uh, yeah. You can show that. Get a load of the Sliminator. Go slow, go slow, go slow. Yeah. Slow, 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 slow. Turn left. And there and you go. Whoa, 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 Ride the wall. Be oh, like your dragon. There you go. You nailed it. Oh, that was great. Good job. Good job. What other things did you make up as a kid because your parents wouldn't buy you the toy you wanted? I got a Hot Wheels dragon! Oh, me and my brother would play games all the time. We'd be playing Power Rangers. And oh, like you would be the Power Rangers? Wait, hold on. Would you be playing a video game of Power Rangers? No, we'd be out in our backyard. Mm -hmm. and we'd be playing. And I'd make my brother be all the Power Rangers. And he'd be fighting the invisible baddies. And I was the worst of them all, the visible baddie. Your childhood sounds sad. No, I did that with Pokemon with my sister. I was getting laid. <laughs> Not you, all you guys are nerds, and I was getting laid. I think yeah. anyone says anything, like, I had a sandwich for lunch, and you're like, yeah, I was getting laid. Yeah. When I was, look, I was that dude, I, I pregnant girl at 12. Lap. That's not cool. It, it was cool. totally legal, though, because... Yeah. <laughs> By the way, whenever you start the sentence, yeah. it was totally legal though right. because it was, it's, it's not right. It's always going to be followed up in a court proceeding, but that's <laughs> no. totally okay. Cool, go slower. Slow down. Remember, slow when, down. remember when you went slow the first time? Or oh, second time? Yeah. yeah. Think back to those days when you and your brother were fighting me. your imaginary <laughs> friends. No, he was fighting me. <laughs> Did anyone play uh, Goldar? No. Uh, sometimes. Goldar. Who's your favorite villain? Your favorite Power Rangers villain? Goldar. Invisible Goldar. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was gonna be I was gonna be visible if I was Goldar. <laughs> cool. <laughs> My brother doesn't and exist. I also didn't understand why parents fight, so we tried to fight, and we didn't get it. Oh, oh like you tried to have an argument? That's, that's really yeah. actually nice. very sad. That's, and that's also very sweet. That's did a very you, sweet thing to do. Did you ever walk in on your parents fighting, but sometimes your dad was on top, and then sometimes your mom would get on top, so she uh, was winning? I was that was top. me, and I was getting late. He was getting late! I'm Cole's dad. Wait, hold on. The timing it, might work how, out. Yeah, how old is Cole? He said 91. So I, he was born 11 years after me. You would have been... I could be Cole's dad! Wow! I yeah. hit puberty when I was 11. How do you know you hit puberty at 11? <laughs> what? How do you know? What do you mean, how do you I like know? Grow hands I, or like I mean, it doesn't all happen it's at a pretty once, big though. When you come, that's oh. how you know you hit puberty. Oh. Right? Girls, I feel like it's when you get your first period, probably. Don't yeah, oh, yes, come? first period for, for women, definitely. But I still haven't got mine. But for <laughs> Don't worry, Adam. <laughs> You'll get it. You're I'm only waiting. one birthday away. I'm waiting for the perfect man to break my hymen asunder. <laughs> your butt hymen? Your behind? Yeah, my behind. No. <laughs> Mr. Uh, Wright will call him, <laughs> but he's going to be Mr. Wrong when he's up in there in my what stink a, hole. Mr. Wrong, but it feels so right. <laughs> <laughs> no, You're stink no, no. so romantic. It's, <laughs> it's a painful process. <laughs> no. You don't have a butt hymen though, do you? That's not a thing, butt right? Hymen? No, you don't. Because no, it no, breaks no. when you poop it. True. It breaks yeah. when you poop it. <laughs> so, Cole, how much would you say you actually loved the Power Rangers growing up? Um, I loved them a lot until Pokemon came out. Fuck you. What, what's, what's wrong? What do you mean? You I don't know. I just thought they were, Power Rangers was cool, and I was going to hit them with some sweet knowledge that how I'm connected to the Power Rangers more than you know. Go just on. Remember every time when they were randomly just walking around the park for God knows why, and then they would just fight the Putty Patrol? <laughs> yeah. That was in my hometown of Castaic. <laughs> Golly, Anakin's great. That's wow. He sounds just like Jacob. It's unsettling. Oh, I love Phantom Menace. Now, sound like the Jewish one. Oh, what? A Watto? Boy. <laughs> it's gonna be like Joel? I don't know. <laughs> no, he's talking about Watto. That's racist, Watto? or... Racist? Oh, you turn yeah, off Collision. Oh, why'd you turn uh, off Collision? Oh, wait, no. I, I don't think I did. I think it was just... Oh. Yeah. Ah. Wait, oh, well, you. How come some of them are visible, like uh, the Cole's brother? Invisible baddies! No, like Cole's brother. I did turn on traffic, though, so all these cars. <laughs> oh, <there's traffic. laughs> They're just gonna show up. That's good. <gasps> Wait, Breeze, do I have a brother? Well, hold on. You've got thousands of brothers <laughs> across the world. Alana's right. This, these gameplays always yeah. turn into me bragging about getting laid. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we get it, Bruce. You get laid. Yeah, actually, you know, you know what? I'll tell the truth, Alana. Because mm -hmm. every guy that I've ever met that talks about getting laid is not getting laid. Is not getting laid. Oh. So here's the truth. I'm getting laid. He's getting laid. <laughs> oh, my man's getting laid. I'm just Remember the Coney documentary, Invisible Children? Yeah. That yeah. was about all the kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh yeah. my Father brothers. For, yeah. Yeah, you bet. I was the one, original one out on the corner slapping the sidewalk naked. 
You guys remember that about Coney? I what? what? <laughs> no, what? <laughs> He's not Coney. I know. I yeah. Did he, did he ever get elected? You know, John Smith used to work for that guy. He he told me, in a very um, engaged stupor, that he was very much he he, he missed that whole Coney thing. By maybe a week. No, he just Ooh. missed it. He worked but, for that guy. But John had actually traveled to Uganda. He was working for that dude. That, he said that was his mentor growing up. Wow. Uh, show that footage of that guy slapping the sidewalk. It's a meltdown of a man. Yeah. You get to watch the meltdown happen in real time. This is what happens when religion suppresses your homosexual feelings towards other men. Do we know he's homosexual? Who, Coney? Yeah. <laughs> he's also oh, gay. Oh, no, the no. traffic. <laughs> <laughs> I love um, that you made it. It finally kicked in. He reminds me of friends of mine who were uh, basically because the religious oh, upbringings fuck. were not allowed to live the lives they were. <laughs> oh, I so see. what they did is they put they put it way down there. Yeah, and yeah. I was like, yeah, I wish I wish they were allowed to just live the lives they wanted to. And oh. I think oh. when he's I think when he's slapping the sidewalk, you're seeing a lot of that coming he's, out. He's, yeah, he's letting it all out. Yeah, that's what I love about Tony. <laughs> <laughs> it's just nobody's making it. Well, it's because you put all the traffic there. Yeah. That person's just you watching. You turn off collision. I think it's really funny. You turn off collision with the other players, but then there's so much traffic uh, no, there. Sorry. <laughs> oh. You know what you should do is just add more, pile more problems. I think I figured out what Alana laughs at. Uh, problems. She laughs well, at when she gets to fuck other people. Yeah. When that's... other people are fucked. Yeah. Bruce, that's what getting laid. No, I'm not no. talking about getting laid. Getting fucked and getting laid are two very different things. Very different things. I'm so confused. What? <laughs> I did what? laugh earlier What's today by repeatedly giving Andy something in Apex Legends and then picking it up before he could take yeah, it. Apparently, you guys are playing Apex Legends way wrong. Yeah, no, we did Andy bad today. Crying. It was very uh, very I, poor. <laughs> it was so bad that I don't know that we'll ever release it. We got murdered yeah. over and over. The other side of that Just like your invisible brother. <laughs> <laughs> you murdered my invisible brother? You were, no, he's because invisible. He was Weren't you the invisible baddie? I was the visible baddie, Bruce. Paint this picture yes. for me. <laughs> You're the visible baddie, but your brother's off to the side fighting yep. air? <laughs> yep. What were you doing? I was waiting for him to finish fighting the air, then I would fight him. So once your brother was winded, yeah, you got to finish him off. Yeah, because yeah. he was oh, the truck. Even so though he was younger than me, he was bigger fuck? than me. Oh, okay. Wait, bigger than you, Cole? You're tall. He's taller than me. Oh. But don't tell him I said that. I, mean, I won't. That's he's invisible, so I can't. Cole, do you have any pictures of your brother? No, you don't. I, I knew it. I knew you didn't have any pictures of your brother. He's gonna show us his phone, and it's just gonna be a picture of a tree and like an empty field. He goes, there he is. It might be a vampire or a ghost. You did invite me in. Shit. Shit. Wait, hold on. If you take a photo of a vampire, not there. It should. I don't think he shows up. Right. The clues it, should be there. That's the thing, right? It's a, it's a mirror thing. So what if it's a mirrorless camera? Do those exist? Yes. Lens? Yeah, they do. So then it sh you should be able to take a picture of yeah. Dracula. Uh, hey, hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Here's how to take a picture of Dracula. <laughs> Use a mirrorless camera. Yeah. <laughs> this is the part, Cole, where we have we, to forget everything we just we talked just talk about. about any so of that. We, we did a whole video with all those bits, right? Yeah. Don't talk about Jacob. Don't talk, talk about, about Dracula. Don't Man. talk about me getting Separate laid. Video. Oh, no, you can talk about me. <laughs> That's we video. always talk about Bruce getting laid. <laughs> <Bruce> getting laid. <laughs> All right, what are we playing? This uh, is a death man. What do I do? Oh, there's a bad guy. To, uh, break my Who's home. talking? Uh, Shut up! <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Stop trying to give me a tutorial about this. Watch this guy, right? I'm gonna get him. Oosh. Oosh. No! How could you miss? No! Oh, cool. You look like the cover of an album. Oh, what am I? Oh, what the? What are they talking about? <laughs> oh! <laughs> You see him skate over to me? Damn it. We're all looking forward to when roller derbies come back. I actually kind of like this map. It's aesthetically pleasing. I really like it when you say things with zero enthusiasm, Adam. Uh oh That's most things, yes. It's aesthetically oh. pleasing. You know what? I'm happy. All right, I'm gonna get this guy right here. Watch his moves. Oh. oh, you dodged his no! machete and then specimen hit you in the face. <laughs> I walked up to her, let her shoot me in the face. You need to act mad at her so we get more Chipotle. <laughs> The specimen is here. We should mention Oosh. she got us free Chipotle for lunch. She, she did. She got nice us free Chipotle for she lunch was very she, apologetic. She thought that we were upset at her and we weren't. Specimen! Specimen! Yeah, that's me. Hi. Uh, all right. Hey. Can you, Hi. Can you not talk through the whole thing? Because we need to use the game. We need the game audio just a little bit. That's, I think that's a yes. Are you drunk? Only, only, a, only a tad. We're over this question. Stop <laughs> answering. Yeah, never mind. Remember what I said. Don't talk through the whole thing. That's a weird moment. When remember we we had to explain to Lawrence. Uh, how it's sort of like, oh. when you're doing videos like this, you turn it on. You're like you were faking being mad at him? Yeah, it's sort of <laughs> like how you guys fake orgasms. <laughs> 
Just let that one sit for a while. Shut oh. up! <laughs> Oosh. There we go. For everyone who upsets Bruce, uh, send us catered Chipotle. <laughs> oh. Yeah! Nice. Oh, hello! Oh, go, go! Oh, if you had to screw that up, Bruce, I would have been really disappointed. I know. I was... That guy's got a big gun. Where? Up top. Oh, he's on the... I have to go get... Oh, no! whoa! He almost tripped me there! Yeah, Ghost Rider. Hey, hey, uh, hey, so, hey, yeah. hey! Why don't you get on that gun? What? No, that's weak. I'm gonna go punch people. Hey, Cole, you're young. Yes. What's your favorite Batman movie? Do the Dark Knight trilogy count? No, those are the Dark Knight Ooh. movies. Okay. Also, it has to star Val Kilmer. Batman Forever. <laughs> oh, that's your favorite Batman, yeah. huh? We'll, we'll take it. I did really like that what growing up. What the hell? Yeah, what's... We all do. Are you jo I stood on top of him like I mounted him. Only got eight seconds left. I have to get more kills. Come on, Bruce. Come on, Bruce. We're losing. You can get it. You need five kills. Come on, Bruce. There's someone trying Don't to fuck you. this up. Don't fuck this up, Bruce. You're going to fuck it up, Amari. You get Amari. No, he's reloading your ball. Oh, oh, loser. I was about to get that kill. Look at me prowling on him like a mountain lion. Man, I lost at Apex today. I lost at this. This is a bad day. Have you won at Apex? It's a good thing yet? none of it's been yeah. recorded, okay. so no one will know. No, the whole hour and a half that we played with Andy and lost over and over and over yeah, it was recorded. Yeah, it was bad. Uh, it was really bad. I yeah. accidentally lost the footage, though, so. Is Alana still playing with the controller? Yes. Yeah. So is Andy. Yeah. I don't want to. Say what your problem is, but I think I know what your problem What's is. What's my problem? It's us being on controllers, but Bruce didn't get any kills either. They're like, there they are! If you have a bobsled team <laughs> and uh, two of your three members refuse to get inside the bobsled, they're on skis, and no, they just one of them has to down. do all the work. <laughs> I, try, I wasn't doing any work. Nobody was doing any work in that. Bruce is humble, though, except when he talks about how many women he's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I've never talked about my number. He doesn't say women he's fucked. It's getting laid. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying I'm getting laid. <laughs> I said my number because you have one in your mind. Here's I don't have my number. Oh, Here's the good. thing. Well, everybody does. Everybody have a number. People can you, or can you just times. Think of it. People. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Can you just think of it right off the Thinking top of your head? Number, I yeah. can't. I can, yeah. I don't like to do that. That's because you get yeah. so late. No, that's not no. why. It's actually it's exactly the opposite. I like to think of everybody as like. Individual you shouldn't keep people. Track of you don't it. want to turn them into a statistic. Exactly. Yeah. I don't want oh. to be like, yeah, 70, 80, 100. <laughs> <laughs> even, though, even though that's much too low. Yeah. I think I know because someone asked me sort of recently and I was like, Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, and you were like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 30, 40, 7,000. Yeah, it's about 7,000. A like, gentleman never tells. But well, a complete scumbag like Cole will. <laughs> well, also when I say I'm getting laid over and over, that means I could be having sex with one woman. You ever think about that? Mm. That's true. Yeah, that doesn't mean one I'm getting laid by time. multiple people. Don't use the gun, just hit him with it. Oh I'm gonna fly away. You can't hop How that. Can get of course I can. Fence. I don't think you're no, allowed. You, can't. you don't have a hard hat. What are you trying to do? Of <gasps> course. Hard hat? Oh. Yeah, he's a construction site. Oh. He's not allowed to... <laughs> <laughs> I silently laughed at my own joke. <laughs> If you have an orgy, and yeah. you don't necessarily have penetration with every person, do you count that as having nice. sex with every person at the orgy? No. Like, do you add ten? Penetration is sex. So oh. does that mean lesbians have sex? Yes. I mean, you lesbians call it whatever sex. you want. They penetrate each other with dildos. So it's only sex if they use dildos. And that um, hole is penetrated. Okay. So, finger? <laughs> <laughs> okay, got it. Hand jobs do not count as sex. Hand jobs, not sex. What about no. fisting? Yes. Fisting counts as sex. Hole is penetrated, yes. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Come on, my rules are solid here. You know why. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I don't Everyone knows what sex is. <laughs> when a hole is penetrated. <laughs> is that true? Any hole, like a Any pie hole. is fine. Any, a, like Ear a, hole, eye an hole. Eye? Nostril? Nostril. All right. It doesn't matter. I, what would yeah. be sex that doesn't have penetration? Oral I sex? Think, yeah, I think oral counts as sex. Tongue penetrates hole. I, okay. I know, you sound like you're doing a, a haiku or something. <laughs> Tongue <laughs> penetrates. Tongue penetrates hole. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Magical. <laughs> <laughs> Does it work? Tongue Stop penetrates gun, punch hole, and then you said beautiful, magical, horny, which is seven. <laughs> it so you is. Just, yeah, I got you it just, right. You just need to end with the five. I just need to end with five. Um, taste salty and taste sweet. Salty and sweet. Yeah, I wrote my own haiku. Beautiful haiku. I can be a poet. Wow. So, anyways, uh, try to think of other forms of sex, and I'll tell you why it's sex. Uh, 69ing. Yeah, dick penetrates mouth. You yeah. have a real focus on penetration. I keep telling you, anything penetrates hole, it's sex. <laughs> anything penetrates <laughs> hole. See, he did it. You sound like a robot. Goodbye. Nah, look, he really did do it, didn't he? <laughs> Sounds like I sound like a mm. robot. Tongue penetrates <laughs> hole. The only thing I can think of offhand, other than, like, because a hand job's not sex. But <laughs> Ooh, wow. What if you make a hole out of your hand? That's not a hole. Is that a hole? Do we, do we consider this a hole? What would it be? Yeah, all right. If you were to tell someone to do that, are you saying make a hole with your fist, or are you saying, like, make a cup? I guess I don't count a hand job as sex. A titty fuck. 
Is that sex? Mm. That's yeah. kind of a hole. I that's like a, I don't, I don't count that because the pleasure seems to be a one way street. I would. Uh, that's not true. Some, okay. Some women get pleasure from that though. Sure. <laughs> some do. dudes get pleasure from getting their balls stepped on, but I'm not going <laughs> to say that's cool. I like that. I like that as the definition of sex. It has to be <laughs> something penetrates whole. <laughs> Something penetrates home. We have a haiku. <laughs> we already know. Well, we used to say, uh, if a woman cuts a hole in her thigh, and then you have ah. sex with it, yeah, is that sex? Ah. But Who I said say, that? Uh, that was uh, actually Bones' brother. Yikes. <laughs> so if it pierces, yeah, and then blood okay. comes out. Jesus, I hate that. So, Does that mean stabbing someone is sex? <laughs> yep. Yeah. So, I, would, I would actually say yes, it is. <laughs> oh, uh, God. Get him. You got stabbed and you're all sad about it, but doesn't matter. I had sex. You still had sex. Oh. You got laid. So when the bad guy from the hit movie The Cell is being hung oh, by those no. hooks. I don't know what that is. is. That, yeah. so, you never seen The Cell? I, mean, I think I might have seen it once. Anyone getting hung by hooks having sex. That's sex. Yeah. For sure. Isn't that, what is that called? Hooking? Get her. Oh, Adam. Oh, she, Adam. Hit, Adam. she hit B before me. She, <laughs> I know. That is the name of the game. Well, you just got the fastest internet in the world, What are you Adam? doing, Adam? Not what here, though. Um, We're literally next to a spectrum and... The Wi-Fi is always cutting the but fuck the out. The thing about Adam's internet speed is that it took him so oh. many months and so many failed attempts to get it that yeah. if you average out the amount of hours that it takes <laughs> to download something with how long it took him to get it, yeah. it's not really that fast. I will, I will catch up. Right. Yeah. She's right I, I did yeah. the math. If I have that internet for the next 12 years, <laughs> it'll eventually even out. <laughs> I, I don't think I've ever rescheduled anything nine times have you in told my life. A, have you told the story about what happened with that? I... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there it die. is. That's the story. <laughs> I found out that I get fiber in my neighborhood, mm -hmm. and I qualified I for it. Great. And so I said, yo, internet provider, can we install you? They're like, you bet. We're real excited to install this in your house. <laughs> can't wait like, to come to your house and install this, Adam. I can't wait to do it. It's a it's a combo deal. We do it all at once. I'm like, cool, let's do it. They showed up, and they're like, we just got to get in your neighbor's backyard. I said, yeah, my neighbors are usually pretty cool. They weren't that time. Well, they weren't home. They're always home. Weren't home that day. I went, <laughs> shit. And the guy was like, well, I can't do anything. I said, all right, we'll reschedule it. Did it the next week. Told my neighbors, hey, you go in your backyard. Is that cool? They said, yeah, that's fine. We'll leave, leave the gate unlocked. Cool. They didn't leave the gate unlocked. <laughs> oh. Round three. <laughs> Are we on three? Okay, yeah, we're on three. Uh, the guy this shows is a long up. story, everybody. This Just guy so shows up. Oh, it's fine. We're in the lobby. <laughs> Third time, guy shows up. Can't wait to install that fire, everybody. I'm like, I can't wait for you to do it, man. <laughs> in L.A., Thank it never rains. Now. It is it's rain. been raining for like the last six weeks. Yeah. This is the first week where it started raining. Oops. And they went, too much rain, man. I can't work in this. I went, you got it. Don't want you to hurt yourself. Totally fine. See you later. Round five. Or oh, was it four or five? Yeah. Then we moved to number four. It yeah. rains another week. Guy just doesn't show up. Fair Round enough. Five. Yeah. Round five. Guy shows up, gets in the backyard. We finally did it. He climbs the pole, Checkpoint. comes back down and goes, yeah, man, uh, when it rains, it pours. There's no internet coming out of that pole. <laughs> no internet coming out of the pole. Six guy shows up. He goes, I don't know what that guy was talking about. That's the wrong pole. Oh. He should have been using that pole. Oh. Did you ask your neighbor if you go in the backyard? Oh. <laughs> so we go talk to the old blind deaf woman, and she goes, what? I said, we just need to go in your backyard. Check it out. Who? Oh, man. There's internet in your backyard. Yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, you got it everywhere. She doesn't lock her gate, so I just went, yeah, she's cool. Oh. So mm -hmm. go back go back there. The guy goes, you're all good to go. I would install it, but I'm not allowed to. What? Seventh guy shows up. He goes there, and he goes, all right, this looks good. We can do that. Ooh, these trees. I don't like these trees. <laughs> I said, what's wrong with the trees? And he's like, they're, uh... We can't, I can't, I can't get any wires past these trees. I, we got to call the guys to come trim the trees. Don't worry. Sense, yeah. They'll take care of it. Mm -hmm. He puts on the speakerphone and goes, hey, I need uh, some trees cut down. The guy goes, we can't do that for like five weeks. <laughs> uh, okay. It's cool, man. <laughs> so he leaves. Another guy shows up. Eight. He, number eight shows up and he goes, oh, these trees are no problem. I can work with this. Nice. Okay, good. All right, cool. He goes, fortunately, I don't have the equipment to work on right now. <laughs> <laughs> so we got to reschedule this. I'm like, you got it. <laughs> That's cool. Number uh, nine. Number nine. Scheduled to show up on my birthday. Yeah. Uh huh. He's supposed to come at eleven. Right. Eleven thirty rolls around. He calls me. He says, "Hey man, I'm running late. We got to reschedule yeah, this." Cool. And, I, and I just said, "Dude, you're number nine. I don't. I can we just do it, please? It's oh. fine." And he went, "All right." Oh, <laughs> we did it. Did That's you what tell they were him waiting for all along. Afterwards, I did. I said, "Hey," Thanks, I, I, I said, "I said I don't want to be a dick." But or I'm like I don't want to sound like a baby or whatever or anything. But I'm like it's my birthday today and it actually means a lot that you you actually came and Thank finished you. this for me. Sort of serendipitous. And he was like, oh thanks. And he goes, 
My kids are having birthday soon. I'm like, I don't give a fuck. I'm going to work. Get the fuck out of here. Shut up. my internet. Make I it got, faster. I got, I got my internet, you asshole. But then what was the one that, that sent you the text? That's uh, the good one. Oh, man. Maybe the guy who actually saw that was number 10. Oh, that's right. Because number nine never even showed up. Yeah, number nine was supposed to come on Saturday. And they're like, we'll be there between 9 and 11. You got it. Didn't show up. 11.30 rolls around. Hi, where's the person coming? They're on their way. Uh, when will they be here? They'll be there around 9 o'clock. I'm like, it's 11 o'clock here. He's like, yep. Mike, so they're gonna be here two hours ago. That is correct. <laughs> they were. I mean, were they right or were they right? No, they didn't show up. Oh, oh, okay. I love it so much. And then, and then I called them and they said, "We're so sorry. They're gonna show up between five and six. I said, "No one shows up to anything at five and six on a Saturday." And yeah, they're like, true. "Don't worry, he'll be there." And didn't show up. Didn't show up. Just, <laughs> right. just fucking no show, man. <laughs> Cole, you're doing great. You, you got a minute and a half left. It's almost tied up. Get this yeah. kill right now. Bang. Oh, one time. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Shit. We are playing Slap a Bike, which I'm actually really excited about. This one's really fun. This one? Wait, what about the other maps that we played? All terrible. We've been playing good or bad maps for years, <laughs> yeah, for four right. or five years. You're yeah. Right. Turns out it doesn't matter because we just end up talking about whatever music we're listening to this week. What are you listening to this Weezer's week? Weezer's the Blackout. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's Fortnite land. And you can just stand there and listen to it? You don't stand there. What do you do? You skateboard. You floss. Wait, you Weezer's for kids. Why is Weezer for kids? Because of Teenage Dirtbag? <laughs> Isn't Rivers' his son named Pilot Inspector? Your name Pilot is Inspector Cuomo? I met Weezer, you know that? I'm listening, I just don't care. I was going to see Weezer at a secret <laughs> show. What's up? With a, and it was awesome, it was this tiny little venue. Very did, uh, I was standing, shut up! I was standing out back, I was underage. And two cool dudes walk up, two cool dudes walk up. Where am I? And, uh, oh, hey, Bruce. And I go, oh, hey, how did you get in? And they're like, mm -hmm. oh, we're with the band. I realized two of the guys that got in were in the band. One of them was the bassist, the other the guitarist. You ever go to like a bar and the music's so loud and you can't hear what the person's saying, but it seems like it makes more sense to just nod and smile? <laughs> There's no ambient noise here, but that's what I just did with you. <laughs> Alana, what are we doing? Uh, this is Slap a Bike, where you have to watch out for windmills. That's basically the catch. Adam's doing a great yeah, job. Yeah, he is doing Ooh, shockingly Oh, well. nice job, yeah, you'll Adam. You'll see people just get taken out. Well, I was really digging that nice story where Bruce met some nobodies. They're in what Fortnite now, this? Adam. They're in Fortnite, the most famous <sighs> game in the world, and the most famous band in the world is in the most famous <laughs> game in the world. I've got my hash pipe. Doom, 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 doom. Are you making this up? That's no, a real song. A real Weezer song. That's from the Green Album. They were the voice of a generation. Come on, I don't know which generation. Like 50 of them. Oh, oh. Maybe Star Trek The Next Damn. Generation. That was almost advantageous. Was really cool. oh. Pork and beans, pork and beans. <laughs> oh, <laughs> pork, and pork and beans, right? <laughs> That sounds like like an old lullaby that like like farmers would sing because they didn't want to actually have to teach their kids about like what happens to their skin when they get the plague. Hold on, I have I have this uh, quandary for you. Okay. Why does everyone want achievement points in Xbox? I get Why? achievements. Why? And trophies. How come? Because that feels like getting more value out of something you've spent money on. But that's fake, though. It's all fake. But, but, she's it, but right. I can justify that. It does, in it that, does like, create additional replayability of the, the product thing that you have purchased. purchased. Well, I, I, but I disagree. See, to me, it's all fake, just like the achievement points and the trophies. Achievements and... are the only reason Jack has a job. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my I mean, gosh. they are called <laughs> achievement hunters. Okay. Sorry, Jack. We love you. We originally, when we were starting this channel, because they needed a new name. We're trying to come up with stuff. And it was gonna be, we also hunt achievements. And then uh, Steve Achievement it. Hunters. Mm. Steve, Steve, Steve Steam. Steam and the Steam and Hunter. Steam Achievement. Oh, Steam Achievement. Achievement. Oh, he definitely right. said then, Steve. Uh, the Steam and Hunter. Huh. What? Oh my, I, in my head, say? just so you know, in my head, it was me getting up and then punching the monitor. <laughs> I saw, it all, I saw the whole thing flash in like an instant as soon as I heard that. Be nice to our fans. I'm a pretty peaceful person. Yeah! I'll be the killer. I'm mm -hmm. pretty meditative. I'm not generally prone to violence, but <laughs> wow, that was... <laughs> I can hear you, you know. He just said, I can hear you, you know. Yeah, we know that, Turbid. Yeah. We're aware. We're making fun of you. That's the beauty of it, Turbid. I can't hear you. <laughs> hey, Turbid, uh... just like Jack, we love you. <laughs> <laughs> if I could create a console, I would make the, like, rewards called Cuomo's. Oh, oh like Rubik's Cuomo. Cuomo's. Yeah. Or, or his brother, Leaves. Is his brother really named Leaves Cuomo? What do you think? No. <laughs> the answer is no. It's actually a trick question. He has a sister, and her name is Lakes. That is gotta be a joke. One of us is t telling the truth, or both of us are lying. Oh are we those that door from the labyrinth? Yes, we are the shield men yeah, from the labyrinth. Yeah. When I take a shit, this guy down here gets it on his head. When I eat shit, I like it. I, I hate shit. 
I love shit. <laughs> Which one of us is lying? <laughs> what? Okay, Google. What's Rivers Cuomo's brother's name? <laughs> James was right. Yes, James was right. I thought you were fucking with me. You were telling the truth. I was telling the truth. Wow. That makes me sad. What are you <laughs> gonna name your children? Let's say you have two boys and a girl. What are you yeah. gonna name them? Boys gonna be first boy's gonna be named Rockets. Okay. Second boy, Howitzer. All right. Cool. I like this military theme. Yeah. And the girl's name is gonna be. Oh. <laughs> Right away, uh, like, oh. Rose from Titanic. Oh, oh. so her whole name is Rose from Titanic. Titanic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Word. okay. Alana, what are you gonna name your kids? Uh, I'll name my that's son Barricade. Ooh, that's a good oh, that's name. An awesome like a transformer. Name. Fucking rad. That's cool. You can either call him Barry or Cade. Yeah. Depending <laughs> on the day of the that week. That works out perfect. Yeah. That's cool. What and the girl? girl is just go. Girl. Oh, that's that's good. Girl. All right, Adam. I think I'm gonna just name all after Gears of War characters. Ooh. So, so like who? Marcus Phoenix. Coltrane. Ice T, Cliff Blazinski, Carmine. Man, you know, Gears of War has the coolest character names. You're yes. wrong, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna name my kids Luke and Leia, so just so you guys know. Oh, right? you fucking Wait, nerd. They're both boys? No! I have a boy and a girl, and their name's Luke and Leia, and they're twins. Are they gonna uh, kiss? No, they're not gonna kiss, they're well, twins. Well, then it's not a good name. Yeah, <laughs> stupid. Why do you name them Anakin and Padme? Yeah. What? The true lovers of the Star Wars universe. <laughs> I don't want my... Uh, son and daughter. Whoa! 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 Whoa. Whoa. That was wild. Kids. Why don't you name your kids 3PO in R2-D2? That's a great idea. Oh! Then they can both be gay robots. If you have a bastard, you name him BB-8. Why is BB-8 a Boston? Because yeah, he gives him the middle finger. Yeah. Or a thumbs up. It's unclear. Mm. I vote middle finger. That's I, what a I vote middle finger. I vote middle finger too, Whoa. even though the novelization says thumbs up. But like novelizations that? have been wrong well, before. Yeah, when have novels ever been right? That's also for kids. That novelization's exactly. for babies. No, it's not. It's yeah, for adults who want more. novels are for fucking more. children. Uh, adults don't read. Books no. are for babies. No. Kids, kids read. I'm gonna say it right now. Yeah. Kids What's read. Yep. Put this on yep. one of those quotes yes. on the subreddit. Books yep. are for babies. <laughs> Movies are for adults. And they always will be. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> what do adults read, then? They don't read porn. anything. They, they not watch movies. Just porn. They read porn. They porn watch out. porn. They read movies. If there's subtitles on a television show, it's gone. It's Canceled. <laughs> I hate it. It's the fucking babies. Oh, 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 help. Oh. Help. Oh, no. You've been knocked down. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh. Ah! Well, anyways, books are for babies. Don't ever forget. Yeah. You outgrow books. Mm -hmm. When you become 10 years old and you can come, <laughs> that's when you don't have to read a book anymore. I just need to get the checkpoint. Sorry, guys. Oh, you get the checkpoint! Oh, no. You get the checkpoint! <laughs> you were in the way! No one's talking to you. Everybody hit him. Everything like, is in the way in this map. That's that's the whole thing. Yeah. I want to change my kid's name. Okay. okay. Blade. Yeah. Good. First one's Blade. Yeah. Second one is Stephen Dorff. Archibald. Okay. <laughs> Damn it! I find watching people get taken off. I know. Just get shot oh, up in the air. It's great. You know how many games have come out since this game has come out? There's Thousands. So say, many other things. Nine. There's there's even. Free alternatives. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Two of them we mentioned earlier yeah. today. One of them has Weezer, the other doesn't. Mm -hmm. Wait, which one? Does well, Apex have Weezer? Apex does not have it Weezer. Fuck! Okay, wait. So. I got my wingman! Well, no, Fortnite gets Weezer. Apex has got to get something cool like a puddle of mud. Oh! All right, here we go. Oh, Bruce is right. Bruce never races. Oh, yeah, you're right. Alana, your turn. I don't want to race. Alana will win. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, oh shit. Nice. Well. Get that mic. You're on fire. It won't let me move. Can, can you hold Y? Come on. Nope. That's how I would like to go. Whoa! I want, I want to have a heart attack, and then the thing explodes. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the coolest death. Oh, oh this is a bad spawn. Actually, I got a good question for you. How yeah. do you guys want to die? How do you want to die, James? Hmm. How do you want to die? I want to die in a recreation of the sequence from Fuck. GoldenEye, when Xenia on a top kills that general with her legs. That is a good okay. way to die. I'd like to die in some sort of interstellar space travel, like either go through a black hole or be... That's a great way to die. I guess I'd like drown in my favorite liquid. So milk? <laughs> well, she's setting up for a joke there. I'm not gonna say it. Come. Oh, I thought you say breast milk. <laughs> I, I would say cum is a liquid the same way gack is a liquid. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> No, that's so, not true, because Gak doesn't stick to your fingers, but cum does. Well, it's interesting. <laughs> it's interesting because cum makes you gag, but gack, gack makes, makes you cum. <laughs> Wait, hold on, Alana, you know what Gak is? Uh, I'm guessing some kind of glue. I knew she didn't know what Gak was, because nobody knows what Gak is. She, uh, uh, I'm sure she at least knows what Floam is. No, nobody <laughs> no. knows what that stupid garbage no. is. No. What the fuck is Gak? Show pictures of it, it's stupid. We'll never talk about it again. <laughs> what is Gak? It's like Play-Doh, but worse. 
Okay, okay. Well, hold on. It was Play genius. Also, Play-Doh you could actually do something with. Gak was literally nothing. <laughs> yeah. Well, hold on. And it would just be a sticky thing that literally all you could do was stretch and then put back in the jar. And it made yeah, a fart noise solid. when you put it in its container. Oh, yeah, you could fart it. So the weird thing about Gak is that it felt wet, but it wasn't. <laughs> right, nice. yeah. And Nickelodeon was built on the backs of people who were, like, covered in Gak. Slime. Gak and slime were different. I know, That's but that, but you bought Gak because it looked like slime. But it wasn't, because it was wet, but it wasn't. 90% This is a lot to process. <laughs> Alana, did you have that when you were a kid? Do you have any things that you could touch that were wet, but weren't? <laughs> oh, hey, was... Have you guys ever had sex? Just curious. Once or twice. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say. Um, well, what do you, how do you define sex? Because no one well, really can. We, yeah, we discussed good. this literally last week's we did. GTA no and really did not And how do we conclusion. define it? Penetration yeah. in a hole. In yeah, any hole. Any Anything hole. that goes no, into any that hole. Not, oh, what if no. I stick my finger in your ear? Yeah, sex. Yeah. Yeah. sex yeah. No, I said uh, equal pleasure from both parties. Well, you're wrong. It's penetration. Yeah, that's absolutely not sex. That's the worst definition <laughs> I've ever heard in my life. Did Sandra Bullock and Sylvester Stallone have sex in Demolition Man? Because they were sitting across their little recessed... Uh, air oh, jacuzzi. It was in virtual uh -huh. reality. We're or in virtual yeah, reality. No. Helmets. It doesn't count. That wasn't sex. He saw her boobs. So what? And her Did vagina. It doesn't count. Welcome to the Demolition Man podcast. I would do that. Yeah, I know you would. We, nobody asked for it. And in truth, I don't want to talk about it. Demolition Man has been right about everything. <laughs> Uh, Alana, what do I do? What do I do? Big old spooky Bruce, maze, and yeah, you've Bruce. got a shotgun. This is Tron. Oh. Remember, remember when Wesley Snipes fights all the cops? Uh huh. And he uses the anti graffiti oh. guns to ah! yeah. kill the guy. Wait. And then he grabs is the camera. Oh, I was pressing the button a hundred thousand times. And the home, home, home of the, the, the brave. <laughs> Play ball. The Come demo on. cast. Watch this. Uh, oh. oh. What am I watching? Watch. Yeah, I'm watching. But each episode well, is we, devoted to one universe? minute of yes. demolition. Nice. <laughs> you know they're gonna make a sequel. Boo! Look at those moves. <laughs> he says ah! he to said, himself, look at the and brains <laughs> came out of your head. <laughs> Boo! Wheels moves. I keep huh. finding bits of uh, discs oh. in this room. Alana's well, got her hands in front of the screen. <laughs> yeah. She knows. Look at these doing. discs. Oh, I, yeah. I really can't see yes. now. What are they shooting at? Yeah. Nice uh, one, Bruce. You just killed Ali G. Glad oh, yeah. I watched. What? Watch this. Watch this, guys. Ah, go, go, go. Yeah. Wow. wow. Kill you streak. Found, you found the kill zone. Don't go to my corner. <laughs> yes. All right. I, I cannot be stopped. It's a cool man. It's not made no. of plants. Get him, get him, get him. Oh. Yes. Wow. You killed Malcolm Moore. <laughs> <laughs> Proud of you, Bruce. Oh, no, no. You're doing great. Oh, 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 no. Wow. Oh, she boy. got wrecked. <laughs> Both of you. Ah, run, 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 run. Oh, Bruce Miami. usually wins. Bruce has done well before. Yeah, Bruce usually wins. Oh! Yeah, Bruce usually wins. He says Shit. his blood explodes yeah. out of his spine. Oh. Fuck you. Bruce! Yes! <laughs> oh. 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 Bruce, only 47 uh. more kills. <laughs> There's so much more time left. Oh my I don't know god! If I can maintain this pace, excuse uh, me. Murder, death, kills. That's a good reference. To Thanks. That. Uh, Maybe we, we call discuss it, it on episode 15. Maybe we call it Ooh. Murder, Death Podcast. Murder, Death Cast. What are like you that. talking that's about? Good. We're talking De about Demolition, Demolition Man. Man. We never changed the subject. Yeah. I want to please make them change the yeah, subject. Yeah, I'd love to. I haven't seen it. So I should just call it some some sort of inside joke. So just like Rat Burger. That's good. What are they talking about? Um, oh, or, uh, fuck. hey, did you also forget Dennis Leary's in this movie? This is oh, the same shit. way John Spartan oh, shit, found Dude, what happened? all the I win? hostages. No, no, he didn't find the hostages. Oh, that's right. Well, his they name was John Spartan? Yeah, and he is him versus Simon Phoenix. Are you listening to this, Alana? No. Guys, I really and need then, you to start thinking about what we're going to title this and video. And he goes, he goes, please, he goes, please, dear Lord in heaven. Uh, <laughs> How much do you weigh? Please, I really need you to start thinking about what we're going to title it. And he throws the guy through the glass. Please. Yeah. Rat Burger! I need a promotion. <laughs> Oh! No! Uh, what? Adam, remember, you're gonna have to make the thumbnail for this, just so you know. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's just this map's pretty Rabbit good. Simon Phoenix, yeah. give oh, it a thumbs up. No! Yeah. Oh, Except, I'm gonna use the, the cover art from Double Impact and see if anyone notices. No one will. No okay. one will notice that. You know yeah. what Double Impact is, Alana? No. Thank you. Can yeah. I leave? I mean, pretty no, 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 I, I mean, can it, leave too. What's it your favorite matter. childhood movie? Harry Potter 9? <laughs> <laughs> Sick fun. I watched a lot of Scooby Doo. Okay. So okay. live action Scooby Doo films. Oh, live action Scooby Doo. Yeah. Okay. James Gunn's live action Scooby Doo. I was a big That's fan. That's right. You know, it was originally supposed to be rated R. Was it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's like a rated R version. Oh, gotcha. I know there was a controversy because they swap bodies. 
at I'm, one point in the do. first film. Oh, yeah, yeah, they, they do. do. Slap eyes. With what the dog? And, uh, they touch each other's boobs. Yeah, they like look at their own boobs and stuff. Mm-hmm. What Ron happened to Freddie Prince Jr.? Ron Atkinson what happened to him? Yeah, uh, his dad killed himself. He married uh, Sarah Michelle Gellar. Mm-hmm. Did he really? Yeah. Oh, Good for that. Together. Fuck. Yeah. Wow. Turbid got me. I know he plays Sea of Thieves. Do you think like, we could get him in a gameplay? Freddie Prince Jr. We should. Yeah, yeah, he's a big fan of Sea of Thieves. I know that because I was supposed to host the Sea of Thieves panel at San Diego Comic Con and I got kicked off because Freddie Prince Jr. is a fan. I guess. Oh, Son of a bitch. Wow. Go away, Turbid. That's Good night. kind of a compliment, though. Yeah, I'll take that it. That you fine. were almost a part of something and said, no thanks, we got Freddie Prince Jr. Yeah. I would definitely and, think oh, that as a compliment. But in this year? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. <laughs> Here's what we do. Okay, uh-huh. we invite Freddie Prince Jr. here yes. to play Sea of Thieves with us. All right. When he arrives, they go, oh, I'm sorry. We have Alana here. Mm-hmm. Oh, we could She'll be out. subbing in for you. That's a great Boom. idea. You get Freddie Prince Jr. back. Thank no. you. That's really sweet. But then when Alana leaves, we actually recorded Freddie Prince Jr. Alana, you make maybe five minutes. Yeah, I will. So that way they can't talk about Demolition Man as long. Yeah. We moved on, but you brought us back. Yeah, thank you. I almost forgot we were talking about Demolition Man. Did, what else did you watch? Alana. There was this one movie about a horse that I really liked. Mm. Uh, horse. Mr. Hands? Is it the one that <laughs> became Hans. a franchise? I oh, think I know Spirit? She's yeah, spirit. Yeah, spirit. That's it. My friend Flicka? Oh. Like it's spirit like, oh, Fl- <laughs> I've seen Flicka. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that. <laughs> What's the one about the racing zebra? A, 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 a zebra! But I want to be a racer! Oh, no! What? <laughs> With Frankie Muniz? <laughs> I think so. Wait, what are you talking about? I only saw the poster. Racing stripes. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Have I told you guys about Skippy before? Yes. Okay. Yeah. What's, what? It's important. Skippy, the bush kangaroo, is a uh, popular we, yeah. sitcom in Australia. First time we went to Australia, Lawrence raved about Skippy. Because Good. we went oh. to a museum and they had a Skippy exhibit. Yeah. He's crazy. <laughs> He's so cultured. That's why he climbed that yes. bridge and then jumped off that bridge. He jumped off that bridge? Skippy? Uh, no, Lawrence. Oh, right. Skippy yeah. is also a man of Yeah. Ooh. Don't even use your gun. There's no need for it. I mean, you use it to hit people like we hit you. <laughs> Did you see me take one shot? <laughs> <laughs> I heard kangaroos in Australia are like equivalent to deer. Yeah, sort of. They're, they're a little they bit just, of a pest. They just jump in front of cars and then yeah. people eat them. Alana, have you ever encountered a kangaroo in real life? Yeah, plenty. Oh, I was just wondering. Like you're walking out of a bar or something? Yeah, like yeah. sometimes you can walk past a big old group of them and they'll look at you like you came to the wrong neighborhood. Like they'll be eating their grass or whatever <laughs> and then you'll walk past and they'll all be like... Really? And they'll just keep staring at you until you're gone. Cool. Okay. Wrong neighborhood, they're trying, they're motherfucker. They're trying to box you. Yeah, they won't fuck you uh, up. Alana, have you ever encountered a koala in real life? Yes. No, I mean like in the, in nature. Yeah. What? Yeah. Like crossing the street? Yeah. Getting syphilis? Yeah. No, it's um, chlamydia, but... What else? Alana, have you ever encountered a platypus? I don't think what? I've seen a platypus outside of a zoo. You've never seen a platypus? Okay, I don't all right. think so. Aren't those fake? Nah, they no, can't. Oh, they're okay. real? I always get that mixed up with jackalope. The jackalope. Yeah. A lot of people have ever encountered an emu in real life? Yes. Really? Yeah. Man, your I life is way more exciting than mine. <laughs> I thought there's too much emu talk. What is this, emu chat? Know, It'll be people, a real rival for the Demolition Man podcast, I'll tell least, you that much. Rat burger! Yeah, please, people please know, by they know what emus are, they don't know what a fucking Demolition Man is. <laughs> Nobody knows what that shit is. I mean, he wasn't really the demolition man. Yeah, he was. The question was, who was the dem? <laughs> he was. They <laughs> called him this, the is demolition this the man. Podcast right now. Well, they literally. <laughs> the problem is, James and I break up because we can't decide oh, wow. who, who is the demolition man. Oh, no, no. it's explained. There's a it, point in the movie yeah. where they go, John Spartan, you're the demolition man oh, no, no, because he's such a reckless cop. Oh, we can't agree. This so must we be the end of the podcast. <laughs> no, it's been one minute. Anyway, speaking of things that you watched when you were a child. Yeah. Oh yeah. What would you do if you found out that Bob Ross was like? A pedophile or a racist? Oh, I would be like, like. How bad yeah, would that fuck you? I'd be up? like that. That makes sense. No, yeah, it makes sense. Oh. Everyone else that everyone else that's good is bad. Mr. Rogers is the only only man I think in the world that's not a pedophile. So Mr. Rogers is the one that you watch as a child. That would really okay. Me. What if he was a giant racist? He's the. Yeah, he's. Yeah, he's the. Yeah, we he know was, he's not a racist because he let that uh, black guy sit in the pool with. Oh, him. we had a black friend. Yeah. yeah. Oh. But a gay he let black him sit friend. in the pool with them when other people wouldn't. Beat. 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 Wake up! <laughs> yeah, you don't have any kills. <laughs> oh, I got you got one. one! Oh, you did? Oh, you wow. T- oh, wow, okay. Nice. Alana, what would you do if you found out Bob Ross was a pedophile? Or Steve Irwin. If I found out Steve Owen was a pedophile. Yeah. yeah. That would hit me harder than Bob Ross. Oh, absolutely. Steve Irwin is a treasure. Did Apparently, get... PETA uh, tried to take down Steve Owen for something recently. They did yeah. recently. And they got was a it? Google Doodle. And they failed. For his yeah. birthday. And they were like, oh, well, alligators. Yeah. Boom! PETA failed. It doesn't matter. Yeah. It's crocodiles. Say, did you call them a pedophile? <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs>
Hey, Alana. Yeah, what's can up? Can you make it first person next round? Sure. sure. It's his I'm Adam, by the way. Yeah. It is his gameplay. It would really help my Twitch stream. Yeah. You got it, man. Is somebody streaming this on Twitch right now? Sure. Bring that down. <laughs> <laughs> Copyright that. Someone do that. <laughs> hey, guys. Who uh, Who's streaming on Twitch right now, guys? I'll advertise you. Hey, Turbid. Just Turbid. Turbid is? Of course. Copyright it! <laughs> Get it, bring it We're down. We're going to need an 80-20 uh, an cut. Well, yeah, yeah, we get a cut. Yeah. Whatever bits you get, Turbid, those are ours. <laughs> Give me your bits. Oh, this is oh, super so scary, scary, Adam. Yeah, this is like laser scared. tag. Shit. <gasps> this was a, it was, was a good call. I this feel good about it. This was a really it. good call. Man, those those Twitch bits, they're <laughs> rocketing. Shoot them. Yeah, shoot them. What are you doing? Bang, no. All right, no, good call. Okay, shoot them. Sorry, Adam. Bang, no. That was first person There's someone out. behind you. Magic that could be really good. You have to reload. It takes yeah, forever. Yeah, he usually wins. Whoa! Oh, nice roll! Uh, uh, nice job. Nice job. Oh! 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 Yeah. oh wow. That's a lot more brutal in first person. Oh, There's something about seeing zero two seven run up and then getting not <laughs> silly. Want it? Do you own any DVDs? Yeah, I own several DVDs. You do? I have a mighty DVD collection. Okay, didn't ask you to brag. Yeah, Shit. I have the Dark Knight trilogy all in Blu-ray. Whoa. Uh, I've got all not the Blu-rays of every Miyazaki Once film. I asked about DVDs. Ooh. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, yeah, he did ask about DVDs, not Blu-rays. Oh. <laughs> Those are not the same thing. DVDs are for poor people. It's true. That's what At I this was... point in time, they are true. How many Super Bit DVDs did you have? They'd basically be the same movie, except the packaging would have Super Silver. Bit written all over it. <laughs> I have all of uh, Dragon Ball Z Kai on DVD. Of what? Dragon Ball Kai. Ooh. Yep. Do you have Weekend at Bernie's too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no DVD collection is complete until you own Weekend at Bernie's Yeah. Too. On DVD? <laughs> Alana, you're aware, of the, you're aware of the plot of Weekend at Bernie's, right? No. What if I guess? Okay, I know literally nothing about Weekend at Bernie's, right, yeah, aside guess. from the title. Right, so guess, guess the plot. There's, it's really hard. This Weekend is, of Bernie's 2. I don't know that you're going to guess the plot I mean, of Bernie's 1. I don't think you're going to be able to guess It's the same plot, more or less. No, it's not. Uh, it's, uh, it's like a high school reunion. No. So, no. Can you give me like a small hint? Yes. The main character is dead. What? <laughs> that came out of nowhere. Yeah. Are they solving their own murder? No. 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 So, the, do you want another clue? Or yep. Mm. Uh, it takes place in the Poconos. <laughs> that's the second one. No, it isn't. The it second one's U.S. Virgin Islands. Oh, that's right. Oh my gosh, how do you know that? Because I own the DVD. Richard and Gary. Why is it called Weekend at Bernie's? His, his name's Bernie's. Discover that someone has been embezzling money at their company, and they go to tell their boss, Bernie, about it. Now, the problem is, Bernie's the one who's embezzling the money. <gasps> he's doing it for the mob. <gasps> and so Bernie invites them to his beach house in the Poconos, if I recall. And that's the end of our video! No! <laughs> we have to talk about the sequel when Voodoo takes over. Shut uh, up. Right? Yeah. One, two. Ooh. Did you, what? That was the Elise. fuck just happened? I just ate one of those old man bars, pretty good. They're not old man bars! Oh, we got new old man bars? I want to be one of those old dudes that's just like, like, you can't tell if they're just like kind-hearted or creepy. It's like the I, old man that tried to jerk off in front of you, at least. Right. Not really. Did he not succeed? You really, really want to know the female experience? Life. Yeah. Yeah. I I said, Elise, why don't you do chat roulette, but screen share me? <laughs> because as a dude, all you get are dudes who are clicking away from you. Yeah. That's all you see, and that's what you think the world is. And so she does chat roulette, and it's everyone is wait, wait, wait. Like, like it, <laughs> yeah. it's all men it was begging so for her not to hit next yet, <laughs> and then <laughs> desperately trying to get to their dick. But then, yeah, one was this very sweet old man. And I thought, oh, okay. And he had books. He had a shelves full of books sure. behind him. Encyclopedias. And then he stepped up out of his chair, and then moved the chair, and then immediately <laughs> started going for his dick. It appears it's only the purely the domain of seventy-year-old men that think maybe someday. I could still bang a 22-year-old woman. I'm gonna do the thing that really toxic men do, where they explain <laughs> using science why men are assholes. Men can get people pregnant forever. Oh. Yeah. But women can't get huh. pregnant forever. Well, they lose so potency. So men's natural desire is to gumballs. constantly get things pregnant. That's caveman thinking, you fucking assholes. Diane Keaton has showed us that when women get to a certain age, they love having sex all the time. Because of that one movie where she showed her, her yeah. Boobs. Oh. Every woman post sixty turns into Stevie Nicks. They look. They love dream catchers and like <laughs> sensually fuck. Oh, they turn into Stevie Nicks at, at eighteen. Yeah, right. That's what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. My favorite phrase that Lawrence can ever say is, "All women." <laughs>
<laughs> uh, Lawrence, what are we doing today? Wait for that one. Super Stunt Sky. Yeah, it's Stunts in the Sky. Uh, I think we may have played this map like four years ago. Really? Yeah, okay. we're back. Sounds good. That's fine. Uh, hey, we're reliving our old favorite maps hey, that we can't remember. Hey, this game came out 45 years ago, so just be lucky we're still doing anything. <laughs> remember when everybody asks us to play Chaser again? It's like that, but in GTA form. I leave it to Elise to tell us what's cool these days. Yeah, what's cool, Elise? You're I am young. the youngest person in the room. Does uh, that mean you're furthest away from your sexual peak? I'm no, sorry, I shouldn't women have been enter their sexual peak in their 30s. <sighs> I'm counting on it. Dreamcatchers are cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> Long oh, oh, oh. black skirts are cool. James, right. be careful. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I know. She's getting up there. She's yeah. getting aroused. She's, she's going to be at her sexual peak, yeah. but I'm going to be completely unattracted to her. Yeah. <laughs> you guys want to play a game? Yeah. Called Who Fucks More? <laughs> Diane Keaton or Judith Light? Judith Light. Which she's, one's dead? Her eyes are spaced further apart. Diane Keaton. I will also go with the Keaton. Diane Keaton was in her prime before the 80s, whereas Judith Light was in her prime in the 80s, and all women who are in their prime in the 80s are just non-sexual beings. Man, you know who just tipped into prime? Cindy Judge Lopper. Judy. Oh. Oh. She put uh, out a bluegrass album. Cindy Lauper? Yeah. You she don't. put out a bluegrass album. It's pretty fucking solid. We all have different things that make women attractive to us. For <laughs> me, it's the breasts. For Lawrence, it's how they play bluegrass. Dame yeah. Judy Dench or Helen Mirren? Oh. Helen Mirren. Helen Mirren. Judy Dench. What? I think Helen Mirren has MS, doesn't she? You, know you mean Moore, mass right? sexual appeal? Julianne Moore's what? vagina is like the real twister. What about Julianne Moore's gaping vagina? What? I don't know. Oh, it sucks you in. Are you just thinking about the scene from Boogie Nights? I've never seen Boogie Nights. I was more. How can you be like? I don't understand. How can you be like? Oh, Julianne Moore. She's so hot. I'm so into Julianne Moore. Julianne Moore, and not see the movie where she plays a hot porn star, and she she literally says to Mark Wahlberg, "Don't pull out. Just come in." <laughs> All while her husband Burt Reynolds is watching. No. Burt in... Reynolds got to marry her. That's, that's not, not fair. No, that's, I don't, I'm not sure Adam's seen it. <laughs> I, I don't know. Yeah, that movie. What, what do you mean you don't know? Some movies are gonna leave a mark on me, and I don't know if I can function. I like don't want to. I hate hyping things up for friends. You already did. You what? just did. Boogie it. Nights. Yes. I mean, all we did was describe the scene that happened. And it's too good. It's great. The it first is a great movie. Is that shot there? is ten minutes long. Like, it's a great movie, and I can say that. Oh, all right. Even though I put Hellboy on in the office over there. Yeah, that was pretty good. It was weird. It was oh. random. You just put. I just thought I'll put on a movie for us. I'm in a different room now. Yeah, Adam isn't in the room. <laughs> I was at a doctor's appointment. I thought it was Last Witch Hunter for I a second. I don't know your life. <laughs> <laughs> it's on the calendar. Wait a minute, yeah. you guys. Well, yeah. Do, do you think Tina Fey tipped in? Tipped? What? What? Huh? To to sexual prime. Oh, I mean, she's been in it. I mean, she's been yeah. there for a while. Tina yeah. Fey. What have I been doing? She's a highly sexual being. I God think. bless. Yeah. Yes. Look how many kids she has. One. Do you think that GTA makes us think and talk about sex because it's like Holes. torpedoing through a hole? Mm -hmm. yeah. well, why do you think we always pick a pink car? A lot of imagery. Yeah. Reminds me of home. Oh, he hit me. <laughs> we gotta pee. Land in that tube. <laughs> oh, yes. you know what Lawrence said he's gonna do this weekend? What? Play the single player in Battlefield Five. I did say that. Oh. You know what else I'm gonna do? What? I got I got a hot little bubble mailer yesterday. Uh -huh. Cost twenty five dollars. Right. It is the fifth feature film from one Neil Neilathan Breen. Oh, oh no, you did. it happens. And nice. my address and name was on the front, written by hand. Oh. Which means that Neilathan Breen himself probably touched that mailer. And yes, I rubbed it on my face. Ew. Yeah, so I've got whatever he has now, which is to say talent. It looked <laughs> like it was maybe written in a motel pen. It was definitely, it was the... not a high flow ballpoint. Okay. I can, I not can hotel, that. motel. Even no. my one of a kind <laughs> original Billy Zane art wasn't done that, wasn't customized. Done by dress oh, yeah. written by hand. One of his many assistants, I'm sure, okay. took yeah. care of it. What, what kind nice. of nachos should I bring? Uh, good blood. question, Sandra. <laughs> okay. You know what? It's International Women's Day, <laughs> Sandra. You All choose right, what kind of nachos you want. Me? Oh, yeah. that reminds me. So, yeah. uh, I've been I've been for the past couple of months trying to decide what the sexual act of 2019 will be. I think it's pegging, guys. I think it's pegging. I thought last year was Yeah, I think I people like already done. Yeah. 2018 was I mean, more. We're done with it. You know what James and I do? We like to do the the uh, home alone where I put two uh, feet on either side of his face like mm -hmm. ah! And he him, comes and so hard. I come real hard. <laughs> Slip I, uh, on the stairs. like that little boy. Wait, so did you guys watch the the Michael Jackson documentary? No, not yet. There's things in it. You're from California. Weren't you invited to the Neverland Ranch when you were a kid? I was busy that night, unfortunately, because he thought I was Corey Feldman. Oh, really? I could see that. I could see you passing for an old Corey Feldman. <laughs> <laughs> the Corey's got fucked by Hollywood, sometimes literally. That. I just know there's a part in the, the Neverland documentary where they talk about one of the, oh the victims when he was a kid and Michael Jackson was an adult. They went out and they went ring shopping. Oh, no. Because they were like, 
Michael would tell him like one day we're gonna get married and oh. it's gonna be great. And then well, was he saying we, you and I are gonna get married, yes. or when Michael Jackson grows up, he's gonna marry a beautiful yeah. adult? Well, the problem is that the woman or the person working right. at the ring store was like, oh, "What is what? Why is the child trying the rings on?" And then they went, "Oh no, no, it's for a woman." It's for like my girlfriend, and she has the same size fingers as the small child that I happen to have with me. Well, I mean, I, I've shopped with my size and child before. It's yeah. actually yeah. much easier if you can find a child that wears the same size clothes and jewelry as you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Then you can try on twice as many clothes yeah. in half the time. You just grab them off Craigslist. They have all their measurements and everything. Yeah. I think I like there's that. an app, Size Child. Size yeah, yeah. Child, yeah. Adam, you love Lululemon, but you have no idea how any of those pants you buy there look from behind, yeah. do you? <laughs> Imagine if you had a child your size <laughs> that you could put the pants on. <laughs> With your I, I guess since they don't allow mirrors in the store, you're right. Uh-huh. Sometimes when we're in the, we're in the gym and you're, you're doing your thing, I, I sneak a peek here and there. Yeah. Okay. okay. You got a pretty nice backside there, buddy. But it'd look even better if it were a child. <laughs> stop, just oh, stop. Oh, no, I, I like that you put, <laughs> put me on blast for liking Lululemon. <laughs> I feel like such a basic. Is that putting you on blast? Jess mocks me endlessly. Why? Because she's like oh. jealous. She, well, she's like, it's so basic. She's is like, it basic? No, it's, it's not. a little. Apparently, basic. it's basic. You guys turned me on to it. There, it was a very oh, nice you Christmas me gift. Me on blast now, dark. At least cornered me, and she's like, "Hey, try these on." <laughs> well, we were at lunch, and I said, "Let's go to Lululemon." Oh, that's right. <laughs> and then we ran in the store, yeah. size child in hand. <laughs> the Benjamin Button or whatever his name was. What's the porno for Benjamin Button? Benjamin Butthole? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If she had sex with Benjamin Button when he was a baby, would that be illegal? Because he's yes. like 60. But he's got the, yeah, he's got the mind of an adult. It, mm. it, it depends on the age. No, that's what I'm saying, though. Yeah. He's 60. Well, he's like a 60-year-old man, but that's when he's a baby, remember? Because she oh. used to treat him like a baby. Yeah. I don't know why he wasn't a man-sized baby. I said it before. I'll say it a hundred times. Oh, like uh, Starman? If he's a, if he's a baby-sized old man, mm-hmm. yeah. then when he's dying, he should be an old man-sized baby. <laughs> no. Uh, Imagine a baby. That's type, in, type in tall baby. Uh, there, that's a tall baby. How? Mm. Try the second photo on the... That's, <laughs> that's what he sure looked like at the end of the movie. Yeah. I don't know why David Fincher <laughs> spent so much money on uh, What a wasted CGI. opportunity. I am five foot five, oh, but I used to be five foot six. I think I've shrunk an inch. Your spine. This is my like, spine. Are you yeah. buttoning? I might be buttoning. Oh, James gets to have sex with you when you're a baby? Ugh. So here's the deal with that. What do I have to do, Lawrence? You gotta kill people. Oh, That's yeah. it? You're gonna get sprayed. Oh, no. Whoa. Oh, they got me. They yeah. Got me with the Wa- hose. Water's no joke. Oh. Oh. Also, tires. The good thing about water oh, uh, is that if water creates a wound, it also cauterizes the wound instantly. It's like a lightsaber. Mm. All right, I need yes. to approach this differently. Everyone I thinks that George Lucas is such a visionary. Differently. But really, he just invented water. Who oh, cares? Geez. Oh, he's right there. Get that, comes. Get that. Oh, he's he's a guy. Oh. Or driving the smart car. Whoa. Sometimes I wonder what I did with all of my humor. Before, mm-hmm. I had a bunch of people to spew it at uh, unfettered on the internet. And I realize, I think you mentioned Panic Room. Yeah. When I f- saw Panic Room in theaters, I went and told a bunch of people <laughs> that I had seen Panic Room in theaters. And they asked me how it was. And I said it was really good, but it was weird that there's only a Panic Room in it for the first 15 minutes. And then afterwards, Forrest Whitaker goes to a treasure island and starts digging for treasure. I just lied about the plot of the movie. Mm-hmm. And everyone else is like, wow, that is really weird. And that's what I did to amuse myself. You're a sociopath. I'm a sociopath. Yeah, yeah. I had an accomplice. My friend say, Chris helped me. Yeah, but you lied because you didn't You didn't need to. No. You did it for your own jolly. I just go, wanted to, to go, see go, them go. be manipulated. But I think I'm fine. <laughs> The therapist I never talked to yeah. tells me I'm fine. Most sociopaths also think they're okay. Unlike the My Chemical Romance song that would lead you to believe otherwise. I don't know what you're referencing. The song's called I'm Not Okay. Is that on the Panic Room soundtrack? It might be. <laughs> Bathroom. Bathroom. Full play. Draskin doodle. Come out of my asshole. Oh! oh Hit him. Come on, come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hit Get the road warrior. Oh, nice. Boy, nice, nice, drums. nice work, gang. Did you guys do it? Yeah. We did. Oh, oh. And then you all got murdered because you were all standing together. Oh my gosh. Uh, now that we're part of a, a big nope. corporate hierarchy, I found <laughs> out we get like special corporate discounts. Ooh, tell me more. One of them was for the hit group, Blue Man Group. <laughs> what? Up to 45% off tickets. What, wow. for Vegas? I've been wanting, yes. I've been wanting to see Blue Man Group for over 10 years. I'm wow. wondering, am I going to see them too late? 
Are, are they, they, they going to be irrelevant? No, I, I saw them like six months ago, and it was fantastic. So you get 45% off tickets to Blue Man Group, so they uh, only cost $6. <laughs> What other? I never went because they were too expensive. The tickets were like seventy Whoa, bucks. Whoa! Awesome. Yeah. What other Vegas acts uh, can we get discounts on? I because like I like I've said every day, Chris Angel Raw is uh-huh. now performing. You, it's it's Mind Freak without all the glitz. Now it's, it's Raw, baby. I was going through my photos. Yeah, I was trying to. I was I was updating oh, yep. uh, profile <laughs> pictures for people when they call me. Never. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And one of them that I saw on my phone is a picture I sent to Lawrence of Chris Angel, <laughs> where he was. <laughs> Replicating one of the most famous Houdini tricks, where Houdini was naked with a bunch of chains on him, uh-huh. except it's Chris Angel, so it's gross and it smells bad. <laughs> <laughs> so that's Lawrence's profile oh, picture. Call, in your phone. Yeah, I'm calling you up right now. Where's your phone? Hold it up so everyone can see Lawrence's number. <laughs> yeah, it's a good idea. It's gotten out a couple of times. I got a, a few <laughs> random calls of like, people would call me and I'd answer because I don't give a fuck, and I'd be like, hello, and they'd be like, hello, and I'd be like, who? Hello, and they'd be like, uh. I guess they thought there'd be like an answering service or something. Yeah. Like I have You've a reached the million dollar estate of Lawrence <laughs> Sontag. <laughs> if you have your your party's extension, please dial it now for a free one million dollars from Lawrence's estate. Press eight. Oh, Someone call oh honey. cool. We got two eggs left. Yeah. I'm an egg man. Who I, wants an egg? Ooh, I had one earlier, so egg. I'm okay. When you, Lawrence, you want an egg? Yeah, bud. When you guys you want win. me to wait until? You, oh, you're not playing. No, I'm not playing. Fuck it. I can eat an egg right now. I can't believe all the eggs got eaten. What do you mean you can't believe? They're delicious. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Oh, did you make them? Yeah, I did. Oh, they're okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> mm. That's oh, yeah. right. Mmm. Mm. You were taking a lot of bites to eat that egg. Yeah, I like savoring eggs it. In. No, I like savoring it. Like grapes. I eat eggs like grapes. I eat all foods like I'm in the Great Depression. Take little nibbles at a time. Mm-hmm. Once you live through the hard times, you mm-hmm. don't you don't forget it. Who at Funhouse do you think would be most susceptible to becoming a Scientologist? Jacob, Jacob. probably. But he wouldn't he wouldn't actually believe it though. Oh, right. Well, you just say Jacob, do this, and he'd be like, okay. He would want, he just didn't want to be rude to them. I think. Yeah, yeah. You know, if you can get Bruce to be on something's, like be behind something, be an he's going to be behind it one hundred percent. He's yeah. a big get. So if you get oh. Bruce, I think you theoretically you could find a scenario where you get Bruce. And then, and he's whole hog. And Bruce would be a big get, like you said, be a big oh get for God. Scientology. Yeah, and Bruce Bruce would bring a lot of people with him, too. No, Do you good. think uh, Bruce would be one of those that gets those big medals in that, that giant infomercial summit? Oh, I hope summit? so. Yeah, yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah. He is great. I don't have anything against the fact that it's basically a cult that uh, ruins lives, mm-hmm. but I do think their sense of a design is real tacky. <laughs> it's Yeah, it's pretty ostentatious. James, hold on. Hmm. I went to at least one year of college to get this. All religions are cults. I'm Boom. Sorry. Yeah, but some of them no, have that's better true. design aesthetics. A cult, by definition, has to have a living, uh, a living leader, uh, like a prophes- prophesizer or whatever. Oh well, well the, the the person, Robert's dead, so they're they're out of the woods. But oh, I but think they pass the mantle. Yeah. Well, Mixca- Miscavige. Miscavige. Oh, Mis- David Miscavige. Yeah, he or- he basically he took it. Like, as soon as he did, he's like, "It's my turn." Do you think he killed L. Ron Hubbard? No, oh. I think cancer did. Oh, and even at towards the end, he was like, "My books aren't that great." <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe he chose to d- die because that's when his spaceship came. That's a lie I would use. Why do the aliens need our bank account numbers? <laughs> aliens love money. I've always said that. Once Avengers Endgame comes out, I might stop I like watching those Marvel those. movies, and I'll just be like, "Oh, it ended. All Marvel ended," and I'll just stop. Yeah, right. Do you dare me? Oh my god. Sure. You da- oh my god. Do you dare me? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Do you dare me? Oh my god. What if I tell you this though? They go, next Avengers movie has a Wolverine in it. Oh, oh no way. God. Oh my god. Like, oh, oh my god. No yeah. way. Um, they did Ghost Rider right. Oh, wait. Oh. They've already done him right twice. <laughs> Once really well, and then another time even better. Yeah, but now better. Better. Because, because the CG, they can make um, monkeys better now, so now, they can make better Ghost Riders. Now Johnny Blaze is CG and yeah. Ghost Rider's practical. <laughs> what a move! <laughs> wow. You're, man, that dude's playing chess. Chess with your brain. He's a 9,000 IQ. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, he's playing checkers. James is playing chess. You know IQ doesn't really mean anything. How dare you? It's a fake number. That That's what but I paid for it. Fake smart people came up with. I pay me. $50 a month to be in Mensa, so I know you're wrong. Hmm. Are, is anyone in Mensa anymore? No one's no one's styling on Mensa so. these days. Well, no, because we found out. I'm sorry. Other people found out that anyone getting Mensa, because they're all cheating on the test, so... There's a new secret, there's Mensa 2, 
And that's really hard to get into. I can oh, do it. How much does that cost? Three hundred and fifty dollars a month. I'll do it. <laughs> Even I'll Gina Davis it. couldn't get in. What? what? Wow, Gina Davis, the smartest actress other than other actresses. <laughs> she was in Mensa. Yeah, I know. in the nineties. What about uh, the girl who plays Winnie Cooper? Oh and, uh, yeah, she's a math nerd. Yeah. She gets off to math. You whip out your 13-inch dong. She goes, boo, boring, yawn. But then you go, four divided by two. She goes, splooge. Yeah, wow, math. Horny. You didn't even divide Whoa, anything. Whoa, that was cool. <laughs> it's just simple math. Arithmetic, if you will. What's your favorite kind of math? Matrix uh, equations, which I know what you're thinking. You yeah. only said that because it's called matrix. Uh -huh. But actually, matrix math is pretty cool. Because you do all those numbers in a box. Yeah, they're all on a grid. <laughs> Feels good. It's like it's like many math problems in one. Oh, you mean Sudoku? Yeah, that's fun. When you learned matrix math, was the matrix in theaters? Yes. Yeah, and it's all same. I could think about. It was so sick. <laughs> also, did, your, like, did your teacher have to like have to keep snapping you back to reality? No. Like, I know we're learning matrix math, but you got to stop fantasizing about Neo and his friend Trinity. Why don't you just program me to have no how to do it? And then they released the car, the Matrix. Did you not buy that? My dad owned a Matrix. Oh, yeah. It's a lot. Only because they made he was the a TV fan show of the, the Matrix. Yeah, that's why. Actually, my dad did take me to see it because he's rated R. I really want to see. He took me to see the Matrix, uh -huh. and at the end, he goes, "I don't know what it is." <laughs> <laughs> he's very dismissive, and if you know my yeah. dad, he's very. Cer there's certain things where like. He would sit there for two hours and 15 minutes watching a movie and at the end of it not have any idea what the actual concept of the movie was. There's, there was a TV show called The Matrix. I'm sure there was. Threat Matrix. My uh, bad. That was the one. Embarrassing. Yeah, that was real embarrassing there, for me. There's a new show coming out called Whiskey Cavalier mm -hmm. that they're advertising around town. Yeah, it's supposed to be like stylish. I don't know. It could be fake. There's this show called New Amsterdam that just came out and I learned that there's an old show called New Amsterdam st starring uh, Jamie from Game of Thrones. Should have called it Old Amsterdam. Yeah. <laughs> well, didn't we see the preview for New Amsterdam? And then we were like, <gasps> that was cool. Uh, we saw a preview for New Amsterdam, but weren't we in Canada or something at the time? And we were like, oh, it must be a Canadian show. Except it's not. Which is the worst compliment you could ever give to someone. <laughs> it must be Canadian. I was just wondering about Whiskey Cavalier because I don't think that show's going to be on nine months from now. Mm. But What TV show will be? You'd be surprised. Aside from Young Sheldon. NCIS, Young Sheldon. New Amsterdam. I just remember Everyone Loves Ray was on for like 35 <laughs> years. Everyone Loves Ray? Mon, Raymond. Who calls it that? I never watched it. It looked boring. For a show with love in the title, Yeah. everyone hated everyone. If you ever watch an episode, it's always, Raymond, your mom's coming over. And he goes, I hate my mom. <laughs> and then they all laugh. And she shows up and she goes, I hate your wife. And she goes, <laughs> and she goes well, I hate you, Raymond. And he goes, I hate everything. But then you watch Everybody Hates Chris. And there's some love in There's, there's some, some love, love in Everybody show. Hates Chris. It's yeah. weird. It's kind of like Iceland Greenland. Greenland is icy. Iceland is Greenland. Oh, I put on Uncle Drew last night. James didn't want to watch it. I'm well, sorry, what? She put on Uncle Drew and then fell asleep. It was like if someone farts in a room and then leaves. No, it was late. It was way too late. I'll pick it up tonight. I've been watching oh, a lot of people's game. court. I got it. <laughs> Uncle Drew. It was Jack's in it. Jack Patillo's in it? Jack. Oh. Anyone want to yeah. choke me until I come? Ready? Yep. Oh, car parkour. That sounds fun. Oh, I think there's some, I think we should, we should pick an activity that all of us enroll in and do. Some sort of self-improvement activity. Please, let's do martial arts. I'm going to throw it out here. What about dressage? What's that? I don't a know dressage? Yeah, horse dance. Oh, dancing. the horse stuff, yeah. So you mean we have to train our horses to horse dance? Or? Yeah, well, we learn to be jockeys for dancing horses. I already know how to do the Gangnam style dance, so I'm good. No, 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 no. You're training you're a horse. You're riding a horse. You're training a horse to dance. Oh. But you're getting it to go. Could like, we wear one of those costumes stuff. where we dress as a horse and a la Johnny Knoxville, we enter a competition as a horse? No. I feel like it might be easier to find a person dancer than a horse dancer. Mm. You can get one for like 15 bucks off Craigslist. That's true. I call John Smith. Oh man, he's a stout boy. I know, I'll ride him. You're gonna have to put him down though. If you climb on his back and he his knee goes or something, you know, he has shoulder issues. He's that glue now. Goes. We gotta turn him to the glue factory. Yeah. I don't know if that's true anymore, but I still wonder how many people drop their dead horses off at the glue factory. And we d no. Wait, we don't we, do this anymore. We use chemicals now. Do we people do that? Do they drop their horses off at the glue factory? Lawrence, doing? what are we playing today? Uh, extreme car parkour. Uh-oh. We're car parkour. We remember, that way, yeah. yeah. Remember when parkour was in everything and everyone was obsessed it with it? Still it still is. still is, right? Yeah. We're doing it now. Move hey. the boxes! I heard that Fiat's are actually Turn. one of the worst Turn. rated cars by customers. So. Turn. Wait, they're, they're bad for customers? Like, you don't people, like them? People who own Fiat's go. hate them. Oh, uh, parkour! Jump over! Do I just jump? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You gotta make the jump. Nice! Oh, 
Uh, uh, nice job, Lawrence. Parkour. You're actually, first. Guys, dedicate to the jump. A little life advice from the from the uh, parkour crew. You got to dedicate to that jump. You might be scared, but your fear is only going to make you miss the jump. You got to tell yourself, I'm going to do it no matter what. Oh, Me? No. Yeah, I, I bet that I bet that. Oh, I think I can. No, I can go. I can just switch under there. there. Oh, I don't know about that, Fiat owners. Get out of the way, Dick. He's, in, he's your first placer. Oh, time for me now. Away. Time for me now. Oh, shit! Oh, it's a, it only has oh, one. Oh, look at him go. It only has goes. one wheel drive. I, I drove past a guy fuck. in a Flintstones car the other day. He had his legs down on the ground? Like, it was like a bicycle, but with a full <laughs> cabin that he was in. Yeah. And then he was pedaling, and I was like, I don't think you're supposed to be on the road, bro. He was really fuck. actually trying to save the uh, save the environment. Which He's I trying, yeah. Oh, oh boy. Why don't you just start over? Yeah, we're in the we're we're in the shit now. It's gonna be all these idiots, all these assholes. You're one of them. What? 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 I looked up like parkour shit on Google once and uh -huh. like looked up some jumps what? and then I tried some of them. First one I actually tried was the one where you just jump and you throw your legs okay, on the yeah. side. Lawrence is so good at this, he just something? stopped yeah. to, to describe his parkour. Nobody's even near him. Lawrence, I'm very proud of you. Thanks. Oh, there's a guy right there. Fuck, I, I lost it. I, I lost told it. you. Oh, Lawrence, you had that hammed up. Oh, he's waiting for you. Yeah. You should give it to him. Push him in. Oh, right. I didn't mean to. I was trying to stop. Oh, that was really nice of him. That was very nice of you. Wow. Do you think after Avatar, every dude with a ponytail was trying to shove it onto things to bond with it? Remember that? References. No. no. It isn't just a ponytail. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a sex organ. It's a sex right, organ, but, yeah. Well, yeah. It's also like your phone. If I had a rad ponytail, I would be in the mall food court, sitting there with my burgers, and I'd be like, I'm going to bond with you, cheeseburger. You can't fuck a Can cheeseburger. you just put it in your mouth anyway? Isn't that bonding with it? If I were a gross human that doesn't respect the environment, yeah, maybe. but if you're a Navi, that's what you are. No, but if you're a Navi, no, I'm a Navi. I'm uh -huh. blue skin. Uh -huh. Listen, if you're asking me whether or not I think young Navi put their ponytail in shit just to see what happens, yes, the absolutely, is always yes. Of course they do. Yeah. He speaks the true true. But you, as a human being with a ponytail. Shouldn't feel inclined to do that. I may be a 35 year old ponytail man, but I'm a 14 year old Navi man at heart inside. You can't how does tell him what he's not, and what he is. You can't do it. He's allowed to be whatever he wants. You know how I have the there's criterion version of things, but then there's also the James version of things mm -hmm. yeah. where I only change one small thing. Right. It's all of Avatar, the whole movie. Okay. At the end, he's resurrected, and then she tells him that she's 12. Oh shit! <laughs> show his face at the end, <laughs> and then it rolls credits. The credit song has to be "The Middle" by Jimmy Eat World. Sully, I'm twelve. It just takes some time, little girl, and a little you never thought to ask about how old those aliens are, how how they age, or anything. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they're yeah, they're tree people. They don't really. They don't whoa, have them. Adam! Whoa! You can't call them tree whoa. people. Are you joking? Yeah. Man. They mostly lived in the trees. They, they were forced to the trees yeah. because earthlings came there to steal their unobtainium. <laughs> the next avatar better have them working at a mall. <laughs> oh, that'd be... Oh, wait a minute. How, how did James Cameron not come up with Avatar 2 on Earth? <laughs> avatar 2 colon on Earth. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be so cool. Then all the Pandorians are here with us. They're just sitting there at the, <laughs> at the yogurt land. And like, you want strawberry like or District mochi? District 9, but with, no. with avatars. avatars. <laughs> They're not called avatars, guys. We're racist. They're yeah. called Navi. What's on the other end of the color wheel from blue? Yellow? Red? I don't know. I don't, I don't have a color wheel. I don't actually just know. Filed yeah. away I get brain. what he's saying, because racist people call Native Americans yep. red. They just inverted it. Red skin. Oh. Oh, is it? Wow. I didn't know that. I didn't know that either. It was on the other island. Wow, seriously? Oh, no, you guys are so woke, you didn't even know that? There's so a whole are we so unwoke? Woke. No, we're slept. <laughs> what happens to the deaf dude with the cum, cum ba baster? The what? Hmm? Huh? The oh, Stephen Lang? Yeah. He dies. He gets shot by Big Arrow. There had to be a, like, a whole crew of like, kind of weird girls with like greasy hair that were super into him, right? Weird girls with greasy hair. I didn't know that you'd pick out the greasy hair thing, but yeah, yeah. I don't know why. I mean, that's just that's that a subset a... Of, of Avatar girls. Find me one female who likes Avatar. You don't make that kind of money with just one of the sexes seeing it. That's true. Both okay? sexes saw it. Both of them. I were all and everything the in between. There you go. Well, it was both back then. <laughs> it's all now. I think we were all tricked. Now, now we're all woke. All right, how yeah. do I do this? What do you mean? Oh, I'll tell you when. It's after one. That wasn't even close to after one. <laughs> sorry. It was practically no, set two when I heard I'm you sorry, click I'm in. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, fun. you're in hours. Oh no. Uh, I'm, oh. I'm, 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 I'm doing it backwards, guys. 
Yeah. Uh, just like a real parkour. Oh my god. Oh my <laughs> god. He was grinding on your shit hood. now. Oh, oh, Jesus. oh no, they backed me into this corner. Yeah, you <laughs> can't gonna... move, oh, everybody. Oh, this is I, like won't our... well. I won't want this to get out and dump gasoline and <laughs> throw a match on your car. Stop it. Stop, stop, stop. stop. This feels oh, like yeah. LA traffic. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Jeff. Hey, move. Oh, there we go. I can't move. <laughs> There we go. I remember I was like, I think I was like nine and went to a karate class and I was the oldest kid in there. It was like something where they were like, let's just throw kids at Lawrence until they push him out of the circle. So at some point I had like five children shoving me. And like, they were like shoving me, but they were shoving me towards a wall. And I was like trying to hold out and hold out and then my muscles gave and then they rocketed my head into the wall. No. And it made a thunderous bang. No, no. And then I you, cried because I was you, embarrassed. You, you lived an episode of Seinfeld. <laughs> Look at this. I can't do anything. All right, I gotta start. Over. <laughs> you have to start from the beginning. Yeah, I know. I know. Wow. And away we go. Uh, at least there's nobody here. Somebody wow. close the probably fence. still there. This is like driving around. Oh. <laughs> oh. How does it take this, this long? Is like the Even if you just go one at a time. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Move. <laughs> This is, this is why. Yeah, this is yeah, why. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's always the best when the guy in the back honks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's gonna off-road it the whole way. It's just gonna be my life for the next fucking 45 minutes. And you're like, oh, you, oh no! You gotta restart! <laughs> nice. All right. You gotta restart. <laughs> At least that guy's got a top pop. Oh, Joker! <laughs> <laughs> He's late for work. <laughs> my boss gonna kill me. right behind me. Oh no. This is what it's this like. This is like my actual life right now. <laughs> I hate this. Everybody, drive back a little bit. I got a plan. Oh, there's one guy. There we go. We got a new new presidential candidate stepping forward. Man Mountain, restart. Just give me some space. <laughs> He's not laughing. Yeah. This is no laughing matter. Okay. No. Okay. Okay. One person. Oh, there we go. I moved a little bit. Okay. Yellow guy's gonna move though. Restart. It's the yellow guy up in front of the white car that's running. Someone has to restart yeah. in order for all of us to move. <laughs> Yellow car! <laughs> Green car, you're fucked. You gotta restart. No, I don't need to restart. They need to. Hey, hey. Restart! All right, I'll do it. It's not gonna change Why anything if you do it. Well, I'm gonna try and jump them. <laughs> oh, sure. With what momentum and what ramp? We'll and here we go. Oh. Oh. Like, Everybody's going this way now. What? Rainbow. I'll it back. Yes. Oh, you did it! I've driven to Vegas multiple times where a car off to the side of the road has been on fire. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Careful, Bruce. Turns. Ooh, you're losing it. Careful. Careful. Joker's here. <laughs> I made it! Oh, Careful. shit, I got poked. Oh, oh. You gotta go across. Yeah. Joker! Oh, Joker! Joker! Oh, yes. The Joker helps. He helped you. He's gonna collect that Wait, favor later. You owe me big time! <laughs> there you go, checkpoint First one. First checkpoint. It's all right. Man, you, you vaulted yeah. over Joker. Yeah, Can you guys wait for next Joker? Or is Jared Leto still Joker? I don't know. I'm not no, sure. Joaquin Phoenix. Joaquin Phoenix is new Joker. Oh, damn it, you're right. But who's Suicide Squad Joker now? Jared Leto's still. They can't recast him. He's too Jared iconic. Yourself, <laughs> when you when you wrong. Listen, when you walk up to any young person, anyone under the age of 29, you say, Who's the Joker? They go, Jared Leto. What does he look like? Seth Damaged. That's <laughs> oh, what people shit. know. People are, ah, fuck you, asshole. Yeah. I can't move. I yeah, see, you just gotta get the back tire up. See? <laughs> well, not like that. <laughs> That's what I was worried not about. Launch yourself out. Does the term 30 seconds of Mars mean something? Yeah. And it means that you're super fucking high. Really? Is that really? Mean? I don't actually. I, know everything. That. I, if you don't know what a is. band's name means, it's heroin. Joker's or back. What does Power Man Five Thousand mean? It means fucking rad. <laughs> Later, Joker. Oh, you Joker. Then <laughs> <laughs> you go right over too. <laughs> no. Uh, oh, jeez, I gotta start over again. Oh, please don't, you. don't joke at me. They showed the. Uh, oh, I did the same fucking thing. Oh, oh, girls on no, just them and no. an empty studio. And there's oh, like there a we ring. Go. Right, here we now go. Now we make up some time, Bruce. There if you go. guys could be in Duran Duran or Flock of Seagulls, what would you pick? It's a trick question. Flock of Seagulls. Duran. I look great in Flock of Seagulls. Neither. <laughs> Video's over. I wipe myself so hard, I bleed every day. Actually, I've been Fuck. bleeding a lot too lately. I think the air is just dry. I'm dry. It's dry. You guys dry need now. to get a bidet. I got yeah. a squatty potty, at least threw it out. She oh, threw is that it the out. one we won in the crane game? <laughs> No, that one got stolen. Well, that was in the main Hello Kitty right? squatty potty that I was like, oh, good, stolen. we'll have one for work. Yeah, it was there. It was in our bathroom for two days, and then someone took it. <laughs> Everyone looks at James and thinks he has the perfect life, but no, he he's suffers probably like the, the rest worst of us. life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I got a little exercise. You oh, ready? Yeah. I'll start, 
and we're all going to complete the sentence that I stay. No, it's not a joke. Spot you now. couldn't even finish I the know, sentence you true, started. Right, right. <laughs> uh, it's not another spot joke. This is just a normal thing. Okay. Well, that's a contradiction in terms. It. But though, first, so. do the double finger. Uh, no. Oh. All right, go ahead. Here we go. All right, ready? This will be the intro to the video. Okay. Ready? Grand Torino. It's not Grand Torino. It's Grand Torino. <laughs> First of all, oh, I forgot because he's a grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> all right. I'll start again. We'll start again. Ready? Right. Grand Wizard. Fucking shit. What? Adam. Yeah, we're going to Adam. Sure, sure. Grand Theft. Auto. Is five. You're supposed oh. to say five. Oh. That's supposed to be the intro to the video. So technically, we've been playing online. Yeah. But it's not really GTA 5. All right. Grand. Theft. Auto. Five. You son of a bitch. What? You're supposed to say online. Yeah, we just discussed it, Lawrence. <laughs> I wasn't listening. Uh, hey, what are we playing today, Adam? Uh, we're playing Bomb Ball 3. <laughs> what are we doing this, Adam? I have no idea. Oh, you gotta, okay. You, you gotta put it in the goal? Up That's there. Not how that works. You gotta push it into the target, and then it explodes, mm -hmm. I guess. All right, yeah, there you go. You got it. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Bang. James wins. Oh, it's Rocket League. Scored. How Great. dare you press it? Oh, my yeah. friend. But actually, that was your teammate. Yeah, I know. Oh! Press right on the D-pad to use the gun tower. Oh. That's cool. What? Oh, do Adam it. did what I always do, which is see things. Oh, that's cool. Fire him, yeah. Huh? Fire, 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 fire. Isn't he on your team? Your vehicle is about to blow up, though. Oh. You won. Yeah. Game over. <laughs> Wait, purple team won. Do you I like it? So does it matter which ball goes into which hole? Yeah, it think... looks like it gives you points. I would guess like they're, they're different amounts of points. Yeah. Oh. You think the purple one's worth more? No, no. I mean, like, that one has a bomb on it. Others have skulls. Well, why are you going around the backside, then? I don't really have much of a choice. So does it matter which pole? Yeah, Everyone looks at James and thinks he has the perfect butt. Well, why are you going around the backside, then? I don't really have much of a choice. I'll start. This is just a normal thing. But first, so. do the double finger. He's shooting you. You're going to die. Fuck that guy on a motorcycle. Are you joking? He's gonna kill you. How did how did he kill me? <laughs> <laughs> That's like losing a fight to Chucky. All right. Man, I just right into it. Okay. Did you know you can't buy those like compressed air bullhorns over the internet? Why? Oh, I because guess, they can't ship them through the mail. Yeah, probably. Can't over the top! Good movie. Yeah! Oh, I tried to flamethrow you. Hey, it's like uh, Fury Road! <laughs> right in there! Oh! Uh, Alright, oh, no, there you go, that's one. Right there. Who? Uh, ah, that yeah, counts for me! That was for you. That, that was that definitely for you. That counts oh, for me, too! <laughs> Stop shooting me! He's gonna kill you, yeah. For no yeah. reason! <laughs> yeah. yeah! Nice job. Whoa! Yeah. First place? <gasps> hmm? Yeah. I, I'm never playing this again. I got first place, first oh. try. Alright, first Lawrence place. In. I'm not wearing my glasses. Take me, out, Take me out, coach. That's what all star players say. <laughs> yeah, no, I did um, really good. Hey! Take me out. I scored. Take me out, coach. I was on a Beer I was roll. on a basketball <laughs> team. Yeah. Like a kids basketball team. <gasps> yeah. Um <laughs> and uh, I remember I once I got fouled, so I got to take some free throws. I hit them both. Nice. And then the next game, I like gestured to my coach, like if you need anyone to nail some free throws or whatever, uh -huh. like use me. And he's like, "Okay, cool." And at the time, I didn't realize that he probably thought I was an asshole. Why? Well, because I had scored two points uh -oh. the whole <laughs> season, right. yeah, and it was because <laughs> no one was allowed to touch me. <laughs> that was the whole season. I don't know. <laughs> no one was allowed to touch me. That's different. You're great when you're not under pressure. Yeah, I know. <laughs> there but was I was like, I was like, coach, you need someone. I remember gesturing like this, and he was like. Uh, yeah, okay, James, okay, whatever. I mean, <laughs> in my defense, mm -hmm. the scoring of these games was probably like 12 to 8 or something <sighs> because they were all just kids. I remember going to someone's, some cousin or someone's like basketball game, but it was like real young, like mm -hmm. five or something. Not a score the entire game. Awesome. Ooh, that's tough. Oh, wait, hold on. Did the they, hoops are so did, high. Did they say they were both winners at the end? Because yeah. I hate that shit. They're both losers. They're both losers. They're going to be one yeah. winner, but they're going to be infinite losers. <laughs> Every time they'd go up and the coach would start out real strong. Like, get out there, Tim. You're going to do it. Do they, just by the end, he's on his phone. Do they, st <laughs> do they still have those leagues where even it doesn't matter? They don't keep score or some shit? That's stupid. I probably. hope not. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Kids need like to get used play? to losing early. I, yeah. Look, you can let anybody play as far as I'm concerned, but there have to be scores and there has to be a winner. Someone has to lose over and over like I did in flag football. Yeah. <laughs> what? <sighs> because otherwise you don't learn the value of losing. Losing. That's true. No, you're, you're absolutely right. right. You gotta learn the value of losing. I see, I lost in basketball, <laughs> football, karate, chess club. Do you guys ever lose and then uh, just publicly start crying and then get so embarrassed that you cried even no. harder? I no. cried in the car ride on the way sure home. It was one time I got second place in a spelling bee and I broke my medal. I was so upset. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like Bruce. I remember I waited by the mailbox 
for three weeks waiting for my karate gi to come. Uh-huh. Um, because I got the cool black one. Oh, that's what? really yeah. cool. And then I got it. I finally got it, and it looked awesome. And then I lost immediately <laughs> when oh. I lost Wait, you were in a karate tournament? Well, yeah, you pay 20 bucks, yeah. so you could, they'll let you enter anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, did, did you have any training in Hold karate? On. Well, First yeah, of all, I was a yellow belt. Oh, that's cool. Was it actually karate or taekwondo? It was karate. I did taekwondo as a kid. I did, I did mm. taekwondo. Wait, oh, but I don't think it was true taekwondo, because I remember using mm. my hands a lot. But I do remember there was Why one point they? where I was supposed to spar with my instructor, and he was like, okay, you know, all right, right, we're sparring, whatever. <laughs> and I went, I went, so you can! Are you I tried to hit him with sure so you can. You can. Nice. And? I, it was close. You missed. He okay. stumbled. All right, you missed. It sounds he stumbled. Like, it sounds like you missed. And then he was like, whoa! Like, and I was like, <laughs> I, I, remember, I remember coming in the next day going. <laughs> yeah, and he went, he went. <laughs> I had a Taekwondo instructor. He's like, okay, let's spar. This, I was in college and he's like, we were sparring and he knew I was like having, trying to take it serious and yeah, do well. Yeah. And I, I hit him with like, a, not a very good, it was a good, like a nice little jab or mm -hmm. something or a kick. He got upset because I did it in front of class. And so he oh. axe kicked me oh. on top of my head <laughs> with, oh, with I, you know those little, those little helmets that you wear yeah, for sparring? Yeah. He hooked his leg into my, and then he dragged me down with it. <laughs> awesome. He humiliated me in front of the class. Dude, martial arts instructors have the most fragile egos. I love it. That Just, said, he did teach Taekwondo to me for free. So That's I appreciate nice. oh, okay. that. It was very nice That's of him. I don't know if that was an instructor. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the, the only... The, <laughs> Did he also have a van? The only price he paid was that he got to what? humiliate you and beat you up. Yeah. And, yeah, teaching is a very loose Damn it. Yeah. You got busted. Fuck. We should all sign up for fucking martial arts class. I would love and to. And make rooster teeth pay for it. <laughs> James, I would love that dearly. Uh, There's a Capoeira studio not too oh, far from I've here. I've taken Capoeira. You don't want to. Those are weirdos. They go to Whole Foods a lot. Can we just do like a Zumba class? <laughs> no. Zumba is not a martial <laughs> art, despite what yes. they tell you. That's right. We won. Oh, look at us. <laughs> hey, you're all losers. Wait, that's us though. No, not, that, not them, the oh, other ones. Okay. I have to humiliate them, just like I got humiliated I by say, my Taekwondo instructor. Did you know that Capoeira is, uh, they fight like this because their hands were chained? Uh, did you know that? Yep. Really? Oh. Yeah, it's they, it, looked, slaves, it looked like dancing. The slaves had to make it look like they were dancing, but they were actually training themselves. We all know that Krav Maga is the. Um, the, yes, the, the most, Israeli, the most no. superior Israeli martial kill art. art, and the reason is is because you can take on seven people at once. That's why. Sorry, that's the, the Batman martial art, and it, it wins. So. No, Bruce. <laughs> Let me tell you about Salat. It's you huge Russian dude just going. Boom, Hold on. Real hard. So what, there's also art. Savat, where you stand like a dandy oh, and you only mm. kick at other people's shins. <laughs> <laughs> Have you guys seen the slap technique? No. Oh, there's a dude who just X makes arm? his arm limp and he just rolls around just doing this all the time. There he goes. Whoa! Oh, he's gonna. He's coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait for it. The sound of them fighting each other is the best because it's just Whoa. like meat slaps. He's got nunchucks. Is this on Vine? He's coming at you. Oh, Careful. he's simulating the use of a weapon with his hands. Yeah. Oh, who won? <laughs> <laughs> wait for it. And here. Whoa, that's pretty fast. Holy cow, that's a lot of strikes. <laughs> it's, it's an impressive sound. <laughs> oh, no, but. but they all only feel like a mouse hits you? Yeah. Why is he shirtless? Because he's working hard. It's just, you see, you guys are used to all the fancy stuff. Well done, this man. is about winning fights. This is about winning fights as quickly as possible. <laughs> I like that move. Who? What's he doing? Is he using his elbow? He throws himself purposefully off balance, <laughs> then uses his falling momentum to strike. Oh, this isn't good. Uh, Ow. Oh, that had that, to hurt. Yeah. That hurt. <laughs> he got hurt there. Cool. He got hurt there. What are you hitting here? You're hitting you're hitting the most defended part of a person. Yeah. The like their shins and like hips. Oh, you're right. Those aren't soft targets and it's gonna hurt Ooh, like a motherfucker. Oh, that piece of paper! Oh. I like, I like a little <clears throat> look, yeah. Get a little he didn't that. break that one. They, now imagine if that piece of paper was your nose. Oh, he did break it. Look, yeah, it's it would sting real bad. Be like, mm. ah, <laughs> you split under your eye or something. No, your skin's not like paper. <laughs> Wait, what? Why are they on a greasy floor? That's his house. Oh, yeah, this Whoa! Is, this is Russia. One, two. Uh, they were doing this all day. It's <laughs> nighttime now. You notice that? <laughs> yeah. Let's go back to GTA. Yeah, what okay. were you we doing? I'm telling you right now, all disparaged people of the world, I am your ally, even if I call you slurs directly to your face. Wow. Wow. I know I'm a hero. You sound like a YouTuber. How did you do that? You <laughs> endeared yourself to everyone. Yeah. I'm going to be president in like 12 years. No, I'm 35 right now. I could run in 2020. You could. How old oh, do you have boy. to be to run? 35. 35. Oh. Which is weird. Was that rule set up with George W? 
No, Washington. That's... Oh, oh you mean George Washington? <laughs> oh. The original W. <laughs> WW1. Or Captain Woodteeth, I think was his uh, his friends called him. I reckon Washington was a boss. I, th- yeah, I reckon I that dude I fucked. Dude, he definitely George fucked. George Washington? Yeah. 100% he fucked. <laughs> Washington might be the only president that I would fuck. What? what? No. What okay, about... we gotta get into this. In Maybe AFK. young Bill Clinton. There are way hotter... No. There was a dude who like had a fucking stone-cut gin- chin and Monroe? really awesome hair. They... That looks like the kind of dude... Who refuses to go down on girls but expects head. Hell yeah, he does. You Khaled. mean like DJ Khaled? Yeah. Like a normal okay. person? Buchanan? Oh, maybe? Jefferson. You, would you fuck Thomas Jefferson? He looked like a boss, too. Show me show me Jefferson. Yeah, I'd fuck him. He looks happy. <laughs> yeah. Damn it, who am I thinking of? Uh, FDR. Yeah. For sure. No. No. Not Rutherford B. Hayes. <laughs> Are you on uh, Teddy? Is it Teddy? Do I want Teddy? Teddy Roosevelt's the guy who looks he like he looked, wrestled bears. Who's the one that stood up out of his wheelchair? Was that FDR? The, ga- the game is starting. Nah, uh, hold on. The, the game's game not starting. starting. It's it. happening I right haven't now. started anything. They're just yeah, blowing you... me up over and over again. That guy looks like he has a shark fin for hair. Video game! This is important, Bruce. <sighs> video. <laughs> video game. Lawrence! What? Go to the video game and start the map at least. Can I get a picture of Reagan first? The video game, Lawrence. Please. Please start no, a map. No, no, no. Reagan! He won't Google anything. There he goes. Yeah, look at that. Good surname, mate. I bet he reads poetry. Yeah. Have you guys ever saved McKinley anyone's life? Have you ever saved anyone's life directly? Directly. Hmm. I almost pushed my mom off a cliff. This is dad. That's a, killing someone. I know, but I but I'm saying <laughs> the literal I, opposite. Yeah, I could have killed her, but I didn't. Oh, look at look up the Reagan puppet from the. Uh, yeah. No, no, no. Now oh, look up the, the puppet Reagan. from the Genesis video. Look at him. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Pull it up. There, yeah. You want to fuck that? <laughs> Ugh. Hold on. I know you <laughs> saved somebody. You push somebody out of the way when a car was going oh. by. I've helped a few children. So like, mm-hmm. I'll help a, like a kid who's crying because oh. it's lost. Oh, I've, or like, I've, I've returned lost children to their yeah. parents. I'll yeah. do that. <laughs> I've returned. It sounds like you took the. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, we're in a new video. We have to introduce it. Hey, Alana, what kind of race are we doing? Uh, it's a lodge ramp. I literally said oh. that. It's just a really big ramp. Yeah, everyone was talking over each other. I wanted a clean take. Mm. It just seems like we we have may have. There done are a lot of. Maps it's possible like because this. the way that I've been picking them so far, oh, I guess oh. like we used to do them. Lawrence would suggest maps to people. That's not happening. So I'm picking the ones that are the most popular on social. Got it. And trying to search to see if we've done them before, but you know, y'all been doing this shit for a long time. We have been doing this shit for almost, I think, five years. So, Bruce, I have a, I have a More running tally. Yeah, uh, she's got the the master doc. Whoa! Oh How'd boy! Front? Anyway. Oh, we absolutely did do this one. So there's a lot of ramps into tubes maps. Yeah, for sure. Hey, uh, comments. Let us know if you watch these if videos for the maps. For the, yeah, we've. Do done you think that there's oh, one guy who's like, "Whoa!" But the gameplay is the same, even though we have different conversations Abs- every time. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, here's a challenge for you. Yeah. No. Give me an original comment. Something that you've never said before that you don't think you've ever said anything like on a GTA. Oh, that's tough. Okay, hold on. Pickles can fit under the foreskin. That's a good one. Although... Um, Wouldn't it depend how tight your foreskin is? Pickle, pickle, I don't think that would apply to everyone. I just saw a video. You just want an original thought. I that gave you what you asked for. Yeah, so now I'm discussing it. <laughs> oh. I don't oh, want to yeah, talk about that. Me. That's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. And uh, then I also saw a video of a gang come, which is a bunch of dudes standing around a coffee table coming on it together. Yeah, that has also been done a hundred million times. What makes that gang times. come? It's just Bukaki. Uh, they were all black. All of Wait, what does that make? I mean, it I, gang? I, 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 the video was called gangcom.mp4. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know if the, what the color of their skin it does, the color matters. Skin shouldn't matter. It's a gang, regardless. I mean, yeah, they I were mean, talking what? like gang style while they were. Coming, I was gonna say so. if they were in what bloods and What does gang style mean? Well, yeah. Does that mean they were ethnic? Yeah, I'm yeah. just trying to say this is. You need to specify no, no, what they are. Been bloods and said a lot of words I'm not allowed to say. I know what Lawrence. While they were coming on each other, I know what Lawrence is saying. If they were dressed in bloods and crips, they weren't dressed at all. Bruce, they were very naked. Their dicks out, coming on a table. No, okay, he undid it. We. Tried to help him then, but it didn't work. We tried to help you, Lawrence. Yeah. I mean, they might have. I mean, shit, man. The framing didn't show it was on the floor. Maybe they were all wearing their fucking colors. Wait. Decided to just drop. You don't out. have to take all your clothes off to jack off onto a table. They did though. You don't huh. need to take any of them off, really. You no, can jack off the clothes on. You, yeah, it's, but it's, it's weird. not. It's not fun through the zipper. You guys are asking me to explain a work of art that I well, wasn't part of. Well, you just pull your pants down, right? Yeah, yeah. They don't even need to be off. Oh yeah, you no, you can, and you can pull them through the weird little like pee flap. That's another advantage women have. You don't even have to take your pants off. I mean, you don't, don't even have to take your underwear off. These don't have to either. What are you talking about? Yeah, we don't have to. We choose to. When I was younger, I feel like that would be difficult. When I was younger, I could masturbate over Wait, my no. pants like nobody's business. Over your pants? Over my pants. I've yeah. never been Nobody's able to do business. That. I could do it all the time, no yeah. problem. Wow. There's a, we talked about this. Yeah, this is not an original yeah. thought. You can uh-huh. pinch it. Yeah, he's right. You just kind of flick it a little bit. Yeah. When I was like 13, I could come wow. from anything. I mean, if you if you just get a really good cough going, you can that can work up into something. Yeah. I, I rubbed against some jeans once and came. Sometimes if you have to pee a little bit and the car's a little bumpy, You'll immediate come. erection. Boo bang! Oh, yep. The body just needs to get it out. It's like the bad spirits. Yeah, that's right. It's poison. It is yeah. just like the bad spirits. You gotta just cycle the stuff out, man. It's, it's gonna expire. 
the, the body's like, get rid of it. Yeah, it's like bad milk. It's fine. That's why I mean, you gotta drink it all before it goes have bad. Have you guys figured out what the largest load you can produce is? I've thought a lot about that. Mm. That was like two weeks. Because I, I was gonna say, is it, is it, a, it must be a certain number of days, like five well, days. You wait a certain amount of time, and then you'd edge. Yeah. So oh, right? does edging make it larger? Yeah, I think Bruce, so, come yeah. on, dude. Oh. Yes, of course. I didn't know. I thought, that's I why it, it hurts after a while. I thought it made less. Edging? What no, is wrong I'm with you people? Pretty sure it makes more. Jesus, of course it makes more. <laughs> Am I getting edging mixed I'm up with sure. tantric? So tantric is like you jammed your finger against your perineum so that yeah. nothing. Oh came out. god! So then it stopped like a it clogged oh. the hose. No, you know ed so edging is like getting very close to you and then yeah. not. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Does it back up in women? Does fluid back up in women? If you blow yeah. hard enough. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Still no. You can't just make it stop and like suck it back in. <laughs> What? Suck what back in, Bruce? There's fluid, Alana. The juice. How do you not know about but this? But how would it back up? <laughs> Where would it back up? I There's don't a giant know. hole there. Like it comes out of everywhere. Were you also... It just weeps. <laughs> were you also confused as a kid when they'd show... They're like... It's like a divine wound? <laughs> Remember they'd show the wings and then they pour a giant vat of blue yeah. liquid in there? Like, I was like, blue? As a kid, you're like, what is that? Yeah, I never knew. What are we watching? Are we watching He's trying to find a blue back again. I want to see them pouring like a gallon of milk into a maxi And to be fair, it should have chunks in it. And yeah, it, it should. <laughs> That's when you know a woman's healthy. Uh, is this race starting? Yeah, I've, I've thought a lot about what a uh, on is in. what a dude's yeah, oh, yeah. drive. what a dude's period might look like if nature were at even remotely fair. No. Is that we'd have to piss out our urethral lining, like it would just come out like a like a sock or like no, a it straw. would it would be from your mm -hmm. balls because no. that's the equivalent of ovaries. Right. So, so your okay. balls would shed. You'd have ball goo like flying out. It of would your be dick. yeah. Oh, it like would be probably like um, uh, <laughs> what's the the stuff in semen that's not sperm. Oh, are you viscous? Just like the the, the mucus, like no. ejaculate. Well, yeah, but it's that's like it's all the goo, uh, like seminal fluid. It's all the stuff that the sperm oh, yeah. eat, yeah. right, to stay alive, so and also neutralizes that. the acid in your dick. And then some blood. I thought you were getting into the conversation about having like kidney stones or something, because one day it's gonna happen where you go, huh? I can't pee. Oh. I want to die. Do wait. Do kidney stones are those more common in men than they are in women? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Oh, fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, all you have to do is drink Another water. Another outrage yeah. for the white man. <laughs> I know. Like, be, just be dick strong. Man. Dick strong. What are you talking about? It has nothing to do with your dick. Yeah, it does. It's your you gotta, kidneys, dog. You gotta, you gotta squish a, a fucking kidney pebble out of there. Ugh. Be dick strong. Man. Fuck it. I'm gonna take this on. Ah! That's not theatric at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh, I was doing so well. That was cool. Yeah. I got distracted that by was the like bad boys too. <laughs> <laughs> when is Michael Baby gonna? Bad Boys 3. He's We've doing it right now. He's yeah, making the movie made. right now. Yeah. Oh, really? It's happening. Yeah, yes. right now. Hey, good job, Michael Bay. Yeah, it, he made, your Thanks wish, to you, Lawrence. Your wish is his command. That's how movies are made. Uh, directors are like genies. You just kind of tell them what they want. They, hey, Russo brothers, I want this one. Got it. Got Schnick, it. Bub, bub. bub. <laughs> <laughs> Telling you. Yeah. We didn't Avengers. have to cast no one. He was just there. Avengers is already out, and I was right. X Men in Avengers. <laughs> Confirmed. <laughs> Confirmed. Hugh Jackman, what's up, bub? Snick, snick. And then it. Dun, he dun, never dun, said dun, 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 bub. Dun, 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 dun. He said bub. He said bub. He said bub. He He has to say bub. He bubbed. He totally bubbed. <laughs> I think I'm done with movie theaters. I watched 95% of Us and it was the worst thing. 95%? What? Yeah. Did you walk out? Mm, yeah, basically. There was a. Uh, wow. There was a couple who was talking through the whole movie, and they oh, would like no. show oh, that was, each other that their wasn't phones. The movie's fault. That was... Yeah, and that's pretty passive aggressive. Like, I mean, I went. No, no. You should just be aggressively passive. I no, I was fully aggressive. Oh. Near the end of the movie, when the so there was like the there was like a the sound or the soundtrack was had like music it was like dun dun dun, and then the dude was like dun dun dun, <laughs> like back at the back at the screen, and he was talking the whole film. So I was just like, dude, shut up, and he was like, you tell me, shut up. And he's like, you were louder than I was. And then you just started swearing at me. So I was wow. like, oh, God. You had a confrontation. Yeah, so, so you I, gave him your number, right? I got up and left. <laughs> uh, I got I got two free passes out of it, so that's exciting. I'm always very polite with strangers. Like, if someone does something terrible to me, I'll be like, hey, I'm really sorry. I super don't mean to be rude, but um, if you'd be, like, a little bit quiet. Fuck off, bitch! <laughs> I try to watch us! So wait, hold on. You're saying uh, you saw 95% of a movie, walked out, and got free movie tickets? There we go. Now we're talking. Yes, I did, Adam. If the sun is up and people are making noise and listening to music, fine, sure, fuck it. But if it's 2 a.m., shut the fuck up. Yeah, like, unless it's care. a Friday or a Saturday, then it's party time. Again, actually, don't care. I think, so, the only thing that I, because I'll get worried about a domestic disturbance. Oh, real unlucky. Uh, if I hear people yelling at each other, then I'm, like, I'm going to be awake. Yeah. yeah, there was some... Well, I want to know how it ends. <laughs> exactly. Who was, wins? Like, I think last weekend there was some dude following a woman down the sidewalk, screaming at her. Oh, shit. Wow. Yeah, and I was like, oh, that doesn't sound good. So I went outside, and like, I went out just, I guess, as the dude was giving up. Oh, yeah. And I was like, 
and she kept walking and the dude was like, oh, if you were over here, I would be yelling at you, like that kind of thing. And uh, yeah, it wasn't, wasn't good. Hmm. And then I just kind of stood there for a second, like, is it, is it time for me to get involved? And then he just kind of walked away. And it was me. Like, yeah. None of it would feel safe. Oh, I don't know. Very unlucky. <laughs> yeah, the, oh. the goal for me is always to not get involved or get involved as minimally as I have to. And well, if you intimidate the, the guy doing it. It might get not worse. The, the, well, the best way to intimidate them? Stare at them. Take off all your clothes. I was going to say, expose your genitals. All your clothes. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. then you stand there naked, and they're like, this motherfucker is crazy. But then mm-hmm. isn't that also sexual harassment to the woman? No. No, you not work. To turn around. Mm-hmm. You say, turn around, don't look at me. Yeah. And then you stare at the man. <laughs> she thinks she has two crazy <laughs> Dude, Yeah, but you know what? It prevented a rape, and I'm in for that. I'm sorry, what? It prevented a rape. <laughs> you okay. might not have even had, they might have known each other. Bruce, you're a hero. You're like, but I prevented a rape. Uh, your I mean, honor. Look. The mayor's, Things could go bad. The mayor's giving you the oh, key to the city and you still don't have any clothes on. <laughs> I know. Thank you, mayor. This yeah. man is a hero. <laughs> Would you like <laughs> to put on rape. some pants now? <laughs> it's a key that has minus one rape on it. Yeah. Uh, see? I did it. I did it. Uh, doesn't Alamo Draft House just like kick people out? They do. Yeah, they, 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 they're really life. good about that. They'll just come over and be like, get out. Well, yeah. guess what? I was at an AMC, so. You can do whatever the fuck you yeah. want in an AMC. Yeah. yeah. People yeah. fucking in there. Lawrence, next time, take off all your clothes. Yeah. You're right. Stand there and take off all your clothes. Don't say a word. Yeah. Except to the women. Tara! Turn around! <laughs> Do not look at me! And then the men stare Stop at you. Stop it! I am demonstrating dominance! <laughs> you get in front of the screen, you take all your clothes off. You do that thing where you tuck your dick so that you like kind of see it through Absolutely. the back. Buffalo Bill, 100%. Yeah. Yeah. But you would need to get a little bit hard for that so you could like fit it through, so right? I, I, well, no, you have to a little soft. bit. Well, you want to be halfway. A little bit. You want the length to yeah. go through, right, but also right. to be pliable enough to bend. Exactly. So, so what you're saying is you tuck it back, you then I turn around the women and bend over. Around. Yes. So, so they're all you, stacked. You <laughs> Always but tell the women to turn around. Don't look. First step is yeah, ladies, don't look. Do not look. <laughs> don't look at me. Well, I think we all learned something here today, yes. but I'm not sure what it was. Yeah. I said I love being naked. Cool. Cool. Can you snap your fingers? Yeah. Some people can't do that. Wait, do you use your Snap. middle finger or your index? I use my middle. Same. Well, people can do it with their index? Yeah, you can, you can, not as good. I just snap middle. Middle? It's, it's all middle finger. Right. It's because isn't the sound finger. coming from, it's actually a finger hitting your palm quickly? It's not from the friction. Oh, I think you're right, yeah. Oh. What's the test too, if you wanna, if you want your meat a certain way? Um, what? Wait, what? Touch this, this is like how Early soft you want your meat. Early that's like medium rare. rare. What? Press that and tell me that's not a meat you I eat. I feel uncomfortable watching you do that. Because yeah. I imagine the steak that Cypher is eating in the Matrix. I, yeah, that's, there has never been a better foley of some dude chomping on a steak than that <laughs> one scene. I think about that Merovingian scene every time I eat cake. There's nothing I've wanted to see more than computer code flying into a vagina. When you're in the Matrix, do you reckon they, oh, I see uh, do they come on themselves? But I don't know if they come on themselves because the robots would then harvest the cum. You think so? Absolutely. They don't harvest their sweat. They harvest their waste. It's They're true. like pissing shit, right? They harvest that. They would harvest their cum. I mean, we're basically watching it right now. No, we're not. Yeah. Sploosh. Is that the G spot that we just saw, Lana? <laughs> <laughs> what game are we playing? We're playing Grand, Grand Theft Auto 5. 5. <laughs> this are we, is are we Ocean doing, Grid. This is a death match? Death match, baby. What's Bang. the hook in this Bang. one? Bang. Good shooting, Tex. Thanks. It's just got a lot of He's places coming. to hide. He's coming. Boop. It's a pretty oh. If I died that way in real life, where a man Jesus literally Christ. serpentined all the way up to me and then bopped me in the head, J-O-B. I deserve to die. My choice. Really sad. How Jesus would you Christ. die if you could hmm. choose? Freezing to death, I think, is the right way to do this, right? Oh, because you just kind of go to sleep. Because you go numb and then you die. Getting Wouldn't shot into space it. would be quick, right? Yeah. Well. Oh, yeah. That'd be quick. Also, falling off a very tall building, I've heard again, I don't know if this is true. <laughs> But I've heard that you go into shock before you even hit the ground. Apparently that's a myth. I looked it up off the Lost I didn't, spoke about it I GTA. thought so, because I skydived, and I didn't do that at all. It would be inefficient if your body, anytime anything vaguely dangerous Just happened, shut down. Shut down. Yeah. I'm going to throw this out there. Let's say, let's say you're in free fall for about 15 seconds. Do you sure. think you could get fully naked before you hit the ground, just yeah. to make that, it funnier? That's a great in idea, 15 Lawrence. seconds? That might happen against your will. Well, you pretend that I'm skydiving. Okay. All right? Okay. Now, I don't need any leverage to do this. Oh, well, here it goes. Right? Whip. Bang. That's true. Right off. Wow, you did that quickly. Right off, right? Here's the now, thing, though. You're going to have wind whipping yeah. around. And... <laughs> oh, oh. Bang. Okay. Look at that. That's easy enough. I can't. Okay. Dang it. It would be a HR violation. <laughs> oh. Yeah! What would people celebrate? Because they won the lottery when it comes to GTA. And they go, yeah! I did it! <laughs> battle well, one of them concluded. does have 35 kills. Shut yeah, up. Lawrence only has 12. How's I'm gonna get him! He did the doing? same thing. There's the same guy that did that to you twice. Oh, From far away. Yeah. That guy looks like Greedo. <laughs> oh, Greedo. And we all know Greedo shot first. Ah, 
shots, a classic joke that everyone loves and is not overused. Reno Dang. shot first, guys. Don't oh, ever, brutal. ever think. No, wait, I'm sorry. Han Solo shot first, guys. <laughs> you really fucked that Don't up. Don't ever, ever think. <laughs> yeah. You had two options and you went for the wrong one. He slouches in his chair and his head kind of weirdly blurs to the side because he's got Matrix power. Star Wars didn't exist until Dubax were in it. It's oh, true. Yeah, that's right. No yeah. CGI do bad. I remember seeing Star Wars for the first Ooh. time and going, oh. "This movie's missing giant lizards." You see that new, uh, the new poster? Don't oh, see that's that? fake. That's leak. Oh, it's fake. They said it was like basically an internal marketing oh. episode nine thing. What's Wait, the name? This airs in like three months. It's fine. People already know the name. Star Wars is probably out by the time but it says. I'll tell you what the actual name should be if it ends up not being this name. Star Wars Episode Nine. Not a joke. Skywalkers. There are no Skywalkers left alive, though. Lawrence. It could happen in episode nine. It doesn't make sense that she's that strong. I don't understand. Okay, <laughs> unless she's a Skywalker. Luke did a backflip on Dagobah, and that's why he became a Jedi. I don't see Rey doing that, I even though thought, she was trying. I thought it was cool. I thought Skywalker sounded cool. I'm all right with if it. You, if you want a cool name, go with Rise of the Dewbacks. <laughs> I feel like it'll probably have something to do with the Knights of Ren. <laughs> They're not going to call it Star Wars Episode Nine Knights of Ren. That doesn't make any sense. Uh -oh. no, what like if they call it the Star Wars Episode like Nights of, of Ren? Ren? Oh, I like that. Nine okay, all right. Yeah. Cool, yeah. Well, I can't wait to see that Photoshop. Yeah, add a Z in there, too. <laughs> Why not? A couple of backs on the side, just for good measure. <laughs> Everyone you love's back. Carrie Fisher's a puppet. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone you love's back in CGI form. <laughs> yeah, that's Carrie Fisher. Put Harrison him on a Ford, Ford, Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill's alive. The thing with Leia is, like, in the end of... Is it uh, Rogue One that it happens? Yeah. Like, you just didn't need to get that close. You could have no. just like been like, oh, cool, Leia, and yeah. then just keep the fuck away. Oh, the but longer you stare at it. Why? Zoom right in and it goes like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why do they, Man. they have every facial feature just moving independently? They could have all of them, though. We could get young Robert Downey Jr., <laughs> yeah, Moff oh. Tarkin, uh, Clue. And it's, it's just Henry Cavill's upper lip. <laughs> oh, yeah. That is a bad one. That's, maybe, I'm sorry, that's the worst goof face. Yeah. Oh. Do, you, uh, do you guys think Tom Cruise would ever be in Star Wars? <laughs> Ancillary question, why isn't Tom Cruise in Star Wars already? <laughs> Star Wars is always about exploiting people without a movie yeah, background that right. they can cast for cheap. Or Benicio Del Toro, whatever. <laughs> Because <laughs> yeah, who were, gives a fuck? What established <laughs> actress have they ever put in a Star Wars movie? Benicio Del Toro. <laughs> they put uh, Carrie Russell in the newest one. <clears throat> Speaking of Carrie Russell, Lawrence, you'll like this. Uh, Bruce and I were just flying over here, and they had uh, Mission Impossible 3 on the old uh, in-flight entertainment. Good movie. That it's, movie is fucking solid. Well, it's a J.J. Abrams movie, but he does what he does in all his movies, like where he goes, yeah, he goes, hey, remember that one guy who had a weird face and alias? You're in the movie. You're he's in the back. party scene, yeah. J.J. Abrams just casts everyone he's ever met in his entire life, and I forgot Carrie Russell shows up. Then one part, and their head gets all zapped, and her eye gets yeah. all funky. It's awesome. If you could direct a movie, would you not cost people that you like and are friends with? 100%. No, because I want to make friends. new friends. Oh, well, okay, all right. That's <laughs> why I got in the movie business. You could pay Scarlett Johansson. And I would pay Scarlett Johansson to be my friend, yes. Yeah. Darren Aronofsky basically pays a woman to date him for a year every time he directs her in a movie. <laughs> Paul, w, Paul W. Anderson does the same thing. W. S. Anderson, yeah, yeah he, he ends up what? marrying a lot of his leads. Wait, wait, wait. wait what That's the, what you would do. You mean Mia, Mia Jokovic? Pretty much Mia, yeah. I guess that was it. I see you. It's more Mia marries her director. Here I go! Here it goes! Oh, Chris, oh, oh, it really paid off Watch for him. Think like Harry ah, Russell. Ah, you sound like go. the mole rat in uh, Banjo Tooie. Did you see your shadow? What happened there? <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> oh no, that's bad news here for Bruce. Okay. Run like Tom Cruise at the end of Mission Impossible oh, 3. Oh, oh, go! Oh, so, oh, uh, he's got good aim, Bruce. He's got good aim. There we go. Kill Fred Durst! <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was gonna say, since you were on a plane, yeah, that one scene, I bet the land speed of Tom Cruise was about equivalent oh, to yours while you were uh, sitting there on a plane. Bad news, I didn't oh, get to finish fuck. the movie. What? I know. Damn it! I, that one scene is so good! The movie's actually aged really well. Yeah, it really, really has. Did you know that, what Bruce? What the fuck? Bruce, did you know that? What? That movie. What movie? It's Age of Impossible really well. 3. What is it? You're talking about Mission Impossible <laughs> 3 in every gameplay. <laughs> yeah, I know! Because yeah. it relates to everything! Holy shit. Jesus Christ, Snoop. You're mine, lady! Oh, that dude had oh. aim your gun, Bruce. Oh, no. no, he refuses. Oh, she turned right around. <laughs> and put her down. I was just gonna ask. <laughs> have you seen Mission Impossible Three, Alana? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I have. Yes. Does the line when you're mine? Oh. 
When, oh, oh, no, you all said that Bruce we, was wrong. We squared up. It was Bruce who was his. When, when Ethan Hunt goes over the wall of the Vatican, when he says, Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall as he stares uh. right at the camera, does that part still age well? Does that age well? Oh, yeah. I, ah. That's what I get off to. <laughs> they got you. Okay. You yeah. want me to, hey. I also pissed myself when he uh -oh. said it. Oh, no. Ah. Guys, you aren't watching all the action that's in front We're of you. We're discussing yeah, Apollo's Mission so, Impossible 3. We're talking about so Mission Impossible 3. GTA. You, you got to watch the actions right here. Bang! Mission Impossible 5. <laughs> 7? I think you all know this independently, but we're on a video now, so I'm bringing it up again. I just watched Pulp Fiction for the first time. Hell yeah. yeah! What do you think's in the briefcase? Oh, oh I've heard, I actually have, have read a lot about Give this. me your the theories, sirs. Yeah, they, they think it's the soul of uh, Marcellus Marcellus Wallace. Wallace. Marcellus Wallace. Yeah. You know what's awesome is that uh, Jules lives in Inglewood, which is close to where I live. Oh no, you know what's really cool? Gonna go see seeing Captain Marvel opening night, that's right. and people pointing at the sc screen going, We are there! That's my stop! Fuck off! <laughs> this motherfucker has been camping the entire time. Look at him. Yeah, he's doing great. He, no, you know what's it? weird? Oh, no. what? Where'd he go? Oh, oh, oh. Better. I swipped over and picked him up. Oh. I swipped over and picked him up, sir. <laughs> Every major American city has like a protector or like a, a superhero. That's what? Good job, Bruce. Los Angeles has Moon Knight, which sucks. What are you talking Wait, about? Wait, I like Moon Knight. Los Angeles doesn't have a good hero. I like Moon Knight. What's the DC equivalent of, of Los Angeles? I don't know. They never go that far. There's not really a coastal city yet. Yeah, they don't really do that. Star City is the closest to get, and that's Seattle. Gotham <laughs> is Chicago. Oh. Yeah. Because yeah. it's a lot of crime, it's like it's mob territory. Oh no, I want to go to Chicago twice as bad. I haven't been there. Oh, oh Chicago's, Chicago's great! It's, it's awesome top of my city. list. I want to go to DC. I want to go to Chicago. Get the pizza. Don't no. worry about this. They have what? mermaid school. <laughs> Whatever this is. Yeah, you're don't... actually losing me. Just Lawrence. go to the what pizza. Mean? You learn how to scuba. They do tell you to swim like a mermaid. Do the camera lock. Because you can't use your. Oh yeah. You're not supposed to use your knees. You gotta like use your legs as a big pendulum. I was sexy. Say. There's nothing sexier than a dude with puffed out lips and bloodshot eyes crawling out of the ocean. Oh, uh, I agree. Lawrence, want to do Oh, this I agree. Do okay. it, Adam. Thank Run up and yeah. bop him in the head. How many? Look, he's the he's AFK. <laughs> oh. Huh. We did the same thing at the same time, but he won. <laughs> bang, bang. Go, go. Uh, Chris is using his Whoa. pro go. controller. What? Ah. How did he beat you? Andy Mills hacking. Oh, oh, a I ninja! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, girl with a dragon tattoo! I want to yeah. see the dragon with the girl tattoo. Yeah, that's hotter. Whoa, that sounds cool. Can Dude. reptiles come? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so yeah. Have you question. seen those videos of turtles coming? Yeah, they got. Oh, it's. Yeah, it's some <laughs> shit. <laughs> that's exactly what it sounds <laughs> like. Whoa! Whoa. Is that guy? Oh, he's he, hacking. No, yeah. he's raptured. Right there, pick him up. Oh, you're gonna shoot him. Oh, oh. right in the back you, of the head. Do quad damage. What would quad damage do? Quad damage. It quads your damage, obviously. Doesn't matter. Somebody never played Quake, this guy. I loved the, the Hell yeah. fucking guns in Quake. It was, like, it was like Quake 4 had this, this gun that would shoot this like big purple orb. Oh, Quake 4. That Quake. Oh, watch out! And that's not Quake. Yes, no, it actually, is. It's still Quake. What are like you nerds arguing quake about? The best. We're playing a real video game. <laughs> that was the next to last game Raven ever made. This is a brand oh, new yeah. video game. No. <laughs> this is, We're uh, ch changing this channel to be all Quake Champions all the time. Oh, Hope you guys that's are a good idea. Oh, boy. You can is be it, Doom Guy. That's a bad man. Is it Quake Champions that has that Snack Naps thing? <laughs> snack Naps? Oh, they had this thing that they were trying really hard to sell that was like Snap Naps. Snap Maps. Oh, Snap Maps. Snack Maps. Is that Doom? That was Doom. That was Doom. Snap Maps. Snap Naps. Explain what a Snap Naps is. <laughs> How does the name not explain That's everything about it? What I is just, it? Snap <laughs> nap. Oh, nice move. All I know is that it's a snap nap. We've, we've talked about the Machinima app where you would snap that snap on your Xbox. Imagine app. if you were snapping the Machinima app and a snap map on Xbox. Xbox snap, snap map. <laughs> Some douche tried to brute force my Usenet account way back in the day. I still remember that. People try to hack my shit a lot. I hate that guy. And what'd you do to him? Guy's a bitch. I just never talked to him again. Cool. <gasps> That's awesome. He was like, oh, he wow. was trying to be Damn. like, hey, I'll troubleshoot it for you. Just give me your username and password. And I was like, fuck you. <gasps> and then he like brute forced it and locked me out of it. And I was like, fuck you twice, dude. Oh my god. What is this? Like Cyber Vigilante. Savage. Lawrence Sontag. The only other conversation he had is when he made fun of me for not watching CSI. That guy can <gasps> fuck himself. It sounds like a, you might have known him as a friend. Mm, barely. I went to a LAN party at his place once. I think that counts as friendship. He made fun of me the whole time. Oh Granted, I deserved it. I was not easy to get along with back in high school. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? And I think I think everybody needs a little a little bit of like getting made fun of, a little, a little just bit. a tiny bit. Of course, correct. Because then it, then it teaches you that, hey, I've got a bigger dick than that dude. So I know that. I do. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. You seem like you had a real Always think to yourself, I have a bigger dick, unless you have a micro penis. Then I don't know what to tell you. I have a smaller dick than you, and at least I can say that one thing with confidence. That's a good point, actually. You can always say, I have a smaller dick than you, and you know And I know that to be true. You know it's a fact. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Penises are cool. Hey, guys, what are you playing? Nothing yet. It is belly grinding. 
Oh, Ooh. yeah. I respect the belly grinders, their people, their music. It's wonderful. Yeah. Here it comes. I gotta use the restroom. <laughs> this Red Bull is coursed through my system. No way that thing already went through your body. Not even Red Bull? Gives you no. wings. It gives you... UTIs, maybe. Bleeding. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, when I got fat after leaving high school, it was because of Red Bull and vodka and M&Ms. Man, that is a devil Yeah, that would do it. Is this like... You had vodka Red Bull in one hand and a bowl of M&M's in the other. And yep, and Halo Reach in the other. That sounds awesome. Yeah, I was having really regular asthma attacks, so I had yeah. to lose Oh, boy. I, my mind went somewhere else. Asthma? Ass attack? Like, yeah, I kept having ass attacks. We've all had anal leakage. It happens. I've gotten a lot better about being like, I think I need to go white. This has never happened to me. Whatever you're talking about, I have never had. That's because you're still young. No, it's well, just... the, it's like sharding. So you're like, you're oh. going out for a run, you have headphones on, you fart, you're like... Mm. Is... Is there liquid that, in there? Like, yeah, did I? That was a little too hot. Yeah, it was like, and yeah. then you then you clench a little bit, and then you jog a little tighter. Who wants, who wants to then you go to the bathroom and you go, oh, thank God. Yeah, the older you get, the less piss? confident your farts. Whoa. That they're just going mm. to need that. But they're getting better. That's the thing. It's like I'm flying closer to the sun every day. Tubbid picked this one. Thank you, Tubbid. Don't uh, throw him under the bus. Oh, boy. This is your doing. Well, no, I'm thanking him. Oh. I've actually been trying oh, to compliment right. people oh. less recently. You're trying to coddle people less? Compliment. I give a lot oh. of compliments. Oh. And I think that sometimes. People just assume that a compliment means something it doesn't. <laughs> like, oh, like I need to stop being so nice, yeah. Guys just assume that everything they see is sexually attracted to them all the time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe but it's just, also it's a thing where I feel like men probably don't get complimented as often that as women. That is absolutely 100% Right? True, so yeah. then I like have this weird balance of like, do I continue to compliment them or do I not to be careful? Well, I think it's sort of the way like dudes say no homo. You just go like, hey, you look great. Don't not attracted you. to you. Don't want to fuck you. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say it just depends on the type of compliment. Like you just say like, oh, you uh, look nice today. Well, that's just... It's kind of basic. I wouldn't. Yeah, yeah I never be. Like, you said nice like, bulge, like, and I'm like, oh, okay. On the flip side, I feel like I can't ever tell women you look nice today or anything like that, because then it's like, wait, so I don't look nice other days, or why are you hitting on me? Like, wait, no, does no, no, that no. mean men take it that way when I tell them they look nice in a particular day? No. Also, no. no, not really. Guys don't it's usually it. intentional. It's always sexy. No, we're just we're just happy to have anything. I think okay. you can. I mean, it, it's obviously a lot into who's receiving the compliment and how they receive it. Yeah. Because if you say to a guy like, "Oh, you look nice," and they're like, "Oh, thank you," but well, that's usually Perfect. how they'll reply. But if a guy's like, <laughs> "That's when you know never to compliment them ever again." Oh, Ooh, you're, good, you're good. We'll you're good. make it work. Uh, that's you got how it, babies you got it, you die. Got Someone compliment me. Crevice. Say I look good. You look great, Adam. <laughs> you did a good job there, Adam. Thank you. Here's the thing, though, and I, I know it's hard. I'm just going to throw this out there into the universe. There's a tendency of somebody to, like, self-deprecate or re re reject a compliment because you think it's it's humble. Don't do that. Don't do that. Mm. Just take it. Yeah, just take I'm it. I'm very bad at taking compliments. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's, But it's usually because I disagree. <laughs> well, that's the thing, right? I'm like, well, you're wrong. Uh, real quick, I'm going to do a compliment. Um, Alana, you said uh, Turbid picked this map, right? Mm -hmm. We did this one already, Turbid! You yeah. fuck! What's wrong with your memory? Do you think there would be a way to tell someone that you think that they'd be good in bed without it being creepy? No. Uh, I know that I could do that to a go. I think to Adam's point, though, you gotta be point? real careful about the oh. audience surrounding the person you say that to. Yeah. Because I think somebody can receive that well. Like Adam, if I say you probably fuck like a demon, that I'm sure is wonderful news to him. Mm. But then John's over there wondering why I said it to Adam and not him. Also mm. true. So, I think if you're in a one on one. Yeah, what creature do I fuck like? Oh, I'm a starfish. Let sure. me think. Oh, you just kind of hang on? Just limbs everywhere. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I just lay that. John, I'm, I'm, Bottom. I'm iterating through, through creatures right now, I'm trying, to, trying to figure it out. So I feel like it's all it's all highs and lows at the right time, though. I see John as a passionate lover. Sympathetic mm. is the word I would use. Yeah. John, John you can says. You feel the rumbles and the, yeah. and the mumbles and, and yeah. John, do the right thing at the right time. John will put in what you put in. So it's yeah. like. I, am, like, I hey, am that type of person. You take care of yourself, I'll take care of you. I mean, that's but, code for I don't want to eat bush. Hey, second place, doesn't matter. Hey, nice. Oh, good job, good job. One of the things that I've lamented a lot, and, and it didn't occur to me until, oddly, did pro, the pro wrestling thing with James, is that, yeah, men typically never compliment each other, but I did learn that backstage before a pro wrestling event is the most emotionally supportive for men place that I've ever seen. It's all yeah. dudes busting out their jackets and everyone's complimenting each other's boots and their physique and... Oh, everybody's worked so hard, and I'm going to try this new move, and I'm sure it's going to go great, and everyone's going to mm -hmm. love you. It's like I didn't hear a mm -hmm. single like negative or machismo thing. It was all just, just dudes supporting each other and hyping each other up to put on a great show. And well, that's, that's what female restrooms are. Uh, good yeah. time to remind everyone: drink water so you don't get kidney stones. <laughs> yeah, yes. I've had this for the past. Yeah, hour you should and probably half. stop. If you're dehydrated. Cut back on the milk too. Milk? Mm -hmm. I haven't had milk in. So many years. I like milk. My body doesn't like milk. I oh. ate some Fruit Loops last night. Booyah. Booyah. <laughs> While I was watching, there's some lady who all she does is sit around and make cocktails and cookies all day, and then two gay dudes show up because they produce Chicago and won awards for it. 
and all they do is sit around and drink and eat cookies and cuddle cute dogs. Why can't that be my life? That sounds incredible. What are you talking? Is this we a fantasy you had? What happened? Yeah, we could pitch a show like that. Oh, I have been dude. pitching some kind of series I'm where I get to binge that. drink on the clock to rooster teeth for <clears throat> four years. Once again, well, that's what the drunk th- The pitch on. usually ends about there, though. I want a show where I can get drunk next. And they're like, but what's the show? Me drinking. Who yeah. cares? You could do like a drunk stream once a week. No one would stop you from doing that. I think as a friend, I would stop him. He's going to get drunk anyway, Adam. He's going to get Lawrence. kidney stones. He's going to get drunk anyway. Why not do it at work where we can look after him? I'll, Support system. I'll make my problems your responsibility. Yeah. That's how we do this. John hasn't played anything yet. Yeah, oh, I'm all g- I like <laughs> just being here. <laughs> Yeah, we could do it. I more. was getting frustrated on <laughs> my computer. That's why when Peek oh. asked me, I was like, yes, please. Ooh. Oh, got dick. dick. Ah, oh, shit. <sighs> and bush. I always wanted to end up right in, in the bush. bush. No, you don't want to. The bush. <laughs> I mean, something oh, you're thinking of Australian, Australian bush. Yeah. I'm thinking of my Puerto Rican girlfriend no, from high I'm school. No, I'm talking about Australian bush, mate. A lot of spiders hanging on that bush. Wait, I'm going the wrong way? That seems No, you're good. No, you're fine. Those guys are passing you, so that's... You shut your your mouth, Adam. I didn't need to hear that. We're we're trying to be supportive here. Compliment each other. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was a reverse compliment. Yeah. You're You're doing really good today, Alana. Thank you. (laughs) Ooh, Ooh, that's another pit. That's two. Nope, just get in there. Go ahead. Yeah, just go back the way you came. Hey, what is Australian bush? bush? That's like the outback, right? Uh, it's just like a different kind of forest. I I enjoyed your documentary, Mad Max Fury Road. Thank you. (laughs) Enjoyable. People are very proud of that one. Yeah, that's good. No script. Did you know that? No. The movie had no script. I'm not kidding. Wait, what? It was storyboards only. Really? Mind blowing. Really? It was like 20 words in the whole movie. Yeah, exactly. That kind of makes sense. It makes total sense. Nice. We're right with that. And they also started Nailed production it. on it. Nailed in 1989. It. Oh, bitch. I think you got it though. You got yeah. the checkpoint. You're there. Man, Fury Road's so good. It's, it's fantastic. How does it? How is it so good? I don't. Because there's. There's no script. <laughs> <laughs> one big improv show. They released a version of it that's uh, entirely black and white. I don't want that. Ew. No thanks. And um. Good. What's his name? Old mate George says that's the best way to watch it. What does he know? What has he ever done? Yeah. Make a film before you talk like that, you, George. Yeah, you think I'm going to trust a guy who made Thunderdome? No, thank you. Yeah. Jokes and jokes and jokes and jokes. The joke is that he also made Fury Road, so some, someone's not going to get it. I know they're not going to. Who is George? Why are you talking about Game of Thrones? I just hit a point where no matter what I say, I can say something super nice, mm-hmm. someone is going to be mad at me. Yeah, that's, that's life in the public eye. Yeah. Well, that's the wild thing, like, to form a hateful opinion about somebody off of a 10 minute hmm. cut out of context clip is wild as shit. Oh man, whatever. People do never the met them. That's, that's part of the fun yeah. too. You know what? I'm going to say it. Sometimes it's fun to just fucking judge somebody. Mm-hmm. Be like, oh, there's a piece of shit over here. And you're like, down in the comments, you fuck you guy. I mean, I don't leave comments though. Well, I, yeah, if I, I don't like something, I just kind of keep leave. moving. Yeah. I mean, and, and 99% of people do too. So the 1% who do leave comments, it's just the game they're in. No, right. if I don't like something, I find everything related to it on Amazon <laughs> and Steam, and then I review that poorly. And you dox them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> just That's there. what every true red, blue, blood, white American does. Burn, Burn it to, to the, the crown. crown. We get to be Z-tier internet famous, and in return, some dude who had Shit. a bad day gets to dunk on us in the comments. Z-tier, oh, man. We're like... Grade F meat. Not a real grade. Taco Bell uses, the rumor is that they use grade F meat. In the U.S., meat is not even graded on a scale represented by lettuce. So, so no one would ever see crates of meat labeled grade A or any other letter <laughs> grade. Be- oh, hey, I found a cool trick. Yep. Um, I found a way to make food taste really good. Is it mm. salt? Seasoning? Yes. Yeah, salt. No. Is it garlic? It, it's the easiest thing in the world. You actually don't Butter? have to do anything. Cheese? No. Don't eat. For like, ah, starve yourself. Like yes. 20 hours. Yeah, how's oh, yeah, your fasting you're going? Fasting. Uh, yeah, we're trying it. I tried that. It didn't work for me. What's uh, it called? What's IMF? It intermittent intermittent fasting. fasting. That's what I do. You could just not eat or hmm. put this out there. You can eat a lot and then just force yourself oh, to throw it all up. You could do you that. You could do that. Does that work? Well, then your fingers think Yes, it time. does. Why no, do you think? You just get it out of the way before you throw up. Why do John? you think models look wonderful? I think they don't eat. I think they just have diets of cocaine and cigarettes. And throwing up because the body needs nutrients. But then we gotta purge those motherfuckers because <laughs> they need to look beautiful. <laughs> they'll make you fat. Yeah. No. Look, I'm I'm doing the same thing because, like I said earlier, you have to watch the previous video. But every time I see myself on camera, I'm like, "You look fat. You fat motherfucker. You you said you said the Impossible Burger was good for you." It's not. It's not, you fat fuck. Here's right. the thing, like Adam, you've never fully been full fat. I get um, I get chubby. I think uh, anyone that calls you fat, they're just projecting. I'm they are fat. They're no, fat it's not in the that mind. They call Adam fat. It's that he looks at himself since he's fat. I'm well, just No, there's there's always one. I saw one of the comments on the uh, Childish Gambino This is America video And one of them was like How can you look so fat And buff at the same time I was like Fuck you yeah, fuck He's not guy. fat Fuck you And judge, judging this art But he's right <laughs> He's not fat He's got a little belly 
Yeah, uh-huh. I want to have his size. confidence in my body. I just want to be uh, him. I want him in my body. I want to be so Teddy man. Perkins. I'm not, shit, I'm off to a good start. Hold down one. No, that's fine. Your, your body weighed down the car. <laughs> wow, <laughs> you committed suicide. Here's a question oh, for you, John. You might recover. Oh, you oh, got it. Chad. You got it. That. You too, Lawrence. Not for Alana. I'm sorry. These are only for people who live in houses, not apartments. Fine. Yeah. How hard do you get when you go to a Home Depot? Oh, very. Oh, I'm, look, listen. I'm wearing these gray sweatpants right now because I'm going to Home Depot later, and I want everybody to know. I as most manly men do, installed a bidet hmm. in the home. And it's a it's a dual function bidet. Dual function meaning that it works for the women also? Well no. Water hot and cold. Oh. That's right. Adam if you're you want it hot? if you're not gonna invest a hundred dollars into a yeah. sleep app, what what what's the difference in philosophy that had you invest into a gadget that shoots pressurized streams of water in your asshole. Because Cleanliness? you want to have a clean butt. I want to have a clean butt. I prioritize hygiene over sleep. Mm. So, like, if it even if it means that I'm going to cut down on sleep, I would still take a shower. Mm. 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 Is that, would you agree with this, Adam? I was asking Adam. Adam's opinion. Thank no, you. yeah, it's fine. I'd rather have a uh, tired, good-smelling person than a person who smells terrible but is well-rested. In fact, someone who smells bad but has a lot of energy kind of sounds like a nightmare. It's an asshole, yeah. Well, that's just uh, everyone They're at probably, like, convention. still running around, yeah. shit's all on their butt. <laughs> <laughs> they smell bad. Moral of the story, everywhere. I'm a man. Because I installed a bidet. It's weird how many things I'm used to because of this job. I'm used to looking fat on camera. I'm used to randomly seeing weird flakes of skin inside of my hair. People tell me I look homeless a lot and ask if I brush my hair. And I'd be like, yes, it but just But what do the comments like say? Oh, <laughs> nice. Yeah, thanks, thanks. Look, you work here long enough, you're going to look homeless. You're going to look homeless. That's true. You said that the day you started and you didn't listen. <laughs> burn her up. Burn, 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 burn. Hold on, it's gamer time. Is that sugar free? Go fuck yeah. yourself. Oh, what? I have a flashlight? I'm not gonna have a flashlight in this game. Oh, is that a tank? Can I get into this thing? Alana, what are we playing today? Uh, Monster oh, Apocalypse 2019. Tron! Whoa! Why, am I, why is my tank not moving? Yeah. He had to move forward. Oh, there it is. A or X? Oh, well, I'm not dead. dead. Man, it's been a long time since I controlled the tank. Whoa! Oh, okay. I did not expect that to happen. <laughs> Good down, job, Bruce. Daddy. Here it comes. Here it comes, Bruce. This is it. Get all the kills that you won't expect death from above. Or below. And here the kills come. Oh, no. And we've here? come to the end. This doesn't break the game? No. Mm. Think I can get a shot from here? Oh, there's one. Ah, I, got yeah, I got a kill, wow. I told you. This is fair. All right. Whoa! What is going on? Did GTA, is it a different game now? Or what the fuck is happening? I guess it's a hacker. Yeah, I think we're getting hick hicky hacked. <laughs> I don't know that oh, we are getting God. hicky hacked. Hey, if, if you're hacking out there, awesome. Hey, free jet. Alright, well, cool. You have you machine guns on your yeah, shoulders. I am You're not getting, war I'm definitely <laughs> You have a rocket for a cock. Oh, oh boy. Fuck, it just happened. Don't worry oh, about it. Boy. Yeah, it happened. It's, oh, this is what fun is. Plans. This is fun. this is new to you? Bruce, I told you we needed fun. another firewall and you didn't listen. I didn't want to spend the extra five hundred dollars. It's fine, just drive around the plane. No, I got him. Hey, you're winning too. That's nice. And this nightmare will only exist for another two and a half minutes. How did you die? Did you get a plane dropped on you? I don't know what happened. People don't know this, but Red Bull, instead of uh, using the bee honey for all the sugar, they just grind up bees. Oh, really? No wonder it tastes so good. It's great. It puts my tongue to sleep. They don't make sugar, they make honey, Adam, uh, number one. And number two, they're drones. They're all robots, and we already know that. You're a drone. They're all government oh. drones, and the thing is with bees is that when they die, those are actually them running out of batteries. It's time for Funhouse's 100% relevant pop culture conversation! Yeah, yeah. Alana, have you ever seen Lawnmower Man? No, that sounds made up. Okay, I will say three facts about the hit film Lawnmower Man, and you, Alana, have to pick the one that's fake. Oh, two truths and a lie. Okay, okay, let's do it, let's do it. Let's one, do it. it stars a future James Bond. Two, after you go into VR, you get jacked. Three, getting stuck in the internet makes you call every phone in the world. Which one do you think is fake? The third one. False. They're False. all true. <laughs> uh, yes. Back us out of this map. Well, we, have mean, to, we have to kick whoever. There's a scene where we don't know who the hacker. Well, I know we'll have to ban whoever we don't recognize. Basically, yeah. this is what Battlestar Galactica was all about. Who do we think is the hacker? Who do you think is the hacker? Predator. I'm gonna go Predator. Any yeah. namers? I'm gonna make it just a Predator. Uh, Tyler J. Kimchi. He's even a Joker. That's He's gonna destroy society. Get rid of him. Hurry. You load a few planes up and they all go crazy. Oh, cool. Don't worry. We'll go to a new server. Hey, uh, ha if you're a hacker. Uh, don't listen to this. Hey, everybody else, we're gonna go to a new server. <laughs> and now, even more relevant pop culture conversations. 
So wait, what is Lawnmower Man about, and why does it have VR in it? What are you talking? The hacker is going to – we can't share a secret. That uh, was his answer. Yeah. Damn, all okay, right. Well, wait, that's that music video wait, with that? Carly Rae Jepsen. That's just a lawnmower guy. That's not part of the movie, I promise. Oh, shit. I mean, that's no, a dad. Excited. There he is. That's him when he's Simple Jack. And then there's him in the future cyber war. That's true. Wait, that's in the same movie? No, second that's movie. the second one. Yeah. This movie sucks. It sucks. And no one knows about it. What? Nobody, Everybody nobody cares or talks about it. Why is this on eBay? Hold on. <laughs> Let's buy I'm eBay really gonna, pictures. What? Oh, wow. Black and white lawnmower man. I need by 10. Photo. <gasps> Look at Lawnmower Man's we? cock. Wait, who who am I kicking? Brainwash. Predator. Oh, brain. Magic Willy really Wonka. Get rid of Magic Willy really Wonka. Guys, those guys are with oh, us a bunch of times. What? <laughs> Sorry, this is what I said. Blame me. <laughs> we got a new t shirt. Yeah. Whoa. Hello, best That's friend. You're okay, though, somehow. That wasn't a hack. That was just a man in a tank. What is the first game you would introduce your child to if they asked you, like, what to play? The game of responsibility. Yeah. Who do you think would win? In a fight between the thing and it. Lawnmower man. Well, I guess the thing probably wouldn't be afraid of it, right? Yeah, yeah the thing absolutely the thing wouldn't be afraid of it. Not be afraid of it, afraid of it, afraid of it yeah. no. Uh, we, but well, let us remember. But you could just use fire if you were it. Pennywise was destroyed by a group of kids in a baseball bat. Well, it's because, <laughs> yeah, they, they understood the But the thing game. can't become that. It wasn't destroyed either. It's coming back. Yeah, it in comes it back part in part two <laughs> this summer. I can't wait. The What's editing. This? What about it versus a Tremors from Tremors? Hmm. I don't know what that is. Hmm? Tremors is pretty cool. Is it an earthquake? It versus an earthquake? Yeah. Probably. Okay, John Landis versus the guy who shot Brandon Lee on the set of The Crow. John Landis. Oh! oh. That's fine, he's cool. Right there, right there! <laughs> well, there he goes. My hero. Whoa! Nice! I win. Nice! Lawnmower Man director, you can tell he was really building up to it. Stop he's... talking about Lawnmower Man. How the fuck is in a helicopter? Oh, oh shoot! Oh. Bruce was once the student and is now the student giving a lot of tips. <laughs> Ultimate test. We name this video Lawnmower Man versus Tron. Who wins? <laughs> oh, shoot. And we see how little views we can get. Yeah. Whoever wins, we lose. <laughs> uh, both Tron. Stop talking about Tron and Lawnmower Man. Talk about <laughs> something. <laughs> hey Bruce, do you like Game of Thrones? Yes. Well, then you're gonna love the Spanish princess on Stars. Are you interested? What? what are you talking? She's about? got a crown. Okay. First things first, you need to get Stars. Okay, do you know what channel talking. number that is? Oh. Good answer. No I, one does. Get us out of this. Jeez. <laughs> Wasn't it Rex Manning Day like last week or something? Sick Empire Records reference. Ah, uh, maybe. No, absolutely not. It's a reference to Empire Records. Sick reference. Your Empire Records reference. You're so funny. <laughs> if you take a, if you take a flight to Shanghai <laughs> today. Uh huh. You can go to Disneyland or World or whatever they call it out there. Oh, and right guess what, my Bruce? Knees. Yeah. They have a try and ride. Ha! We brought it back to China. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking <laughs> look! If the Chinese love it, it's gonna come back. It's 100 right. The Chinese yeah. are told what to love. <laughs> you, I don't know if you guys know that it is a communist country. Everyone loves Tron. Well, well I'm just saying, hot take. Would our country not be better if our government told us to like Tron? <laughs> <laughs> the people love Tron. Oh, you don't love Tron, loser. Eh. A girlfriend for every man <laughs> and a Tron in every DVD player. <laughs> And now, relevant dating advice with unlicensed sex therapist, Dr. Lauren Sontag. The, this is why you guys don't know anything about women. It's because you don't watch Twilight all the time. Bella didn't have a personality. She wasn't interesting in any way. In fact, the story goes out of the way to say she wasn't. She's there not, was just something about her that was so magical. She's not real. <laughs> what? I know. <laughs> Where did the movies come Lawrence from? Lauren talks about Twilight every GTA. <laughs> it's because I love it! You're losing real bad. Yeah. I know, I just keep dying as soon as I pick anything up. Oh. Wow. Wow. Bad news, guys. Gotta go to the orthodontist. Bye. That really sucks. I'm sorry I had to stop talking about Tron. Bye. Uh, While we wait, you want to throw up that Lawnmower Man trailer? Yeah, let me see that oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, it's been see. a couple days since I've seen it, so. The story of a man with the mind of a child. <laughs> Lawnmower Man. Wait, what? <laughs> We're going to find out who the guest is. I've been kicked in the balls and I've been fine. Mm. But it's like, then I've had someone just give it a small tap and it's yeah. it's all over. Yeah, it's, it's uh, that's actually a very good way to put right. it out. Hold up, your balls stick to your legs? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really? Oh yeah. Is that why men adjust their balls so much? Yes. Huh. For a lady who likes big balls, there's a guy with big balls out there and they just be drawn together. I do not think about nope. testicles that much. It's a flesh vice down there 24 hours a day. Can you fit a ball sack in an a-hole?
You don't want your normal, you know, face shaver guys and your ball shaver to be the same device. You Feel. gape it and you then gape you just it. gotta tuck yeah. her in. Yeah. And you gotta be the I would recommend it. Shave your balls if you can. My yeah. flashlight accepts whatever I give it. Exactly. I went to a friend's house once and there were three men staying in the house and I got chased with a used flashlight. Make sure that your balls and dick kind of droop down over their nose. What's going on with CNN? Stupid shit. I think GTA is offline. Yeah, maybe our internet's dick. Well, yeah, we're having a good ball discussion. We're having a nice time. Usually, used cum does smell bad. Yeah. Unused cum usually smells bad too. Does anything spoil as fast as cum? I think maybe like a banana? No, I ew. Sometimes you just have good DNA. You got good cum genes. Mm. American men mostly don't wear cologne. Stephanie says she likes my natural scent. I'm glad she likes the smell of balls. This is not a video. Yeah, this isn't there's a video. no video here. It could probably be a video. This is us bullshitting for. That's what GTA is. Minutes. I know, but at least there's something happening. People show up for the oh, fucking gameplay. I know. We're good. We're good. Do we have to film anything else? Yeah. I went to a drag show at Senior Frogs <laughs> oh. that had unlimited mimosas. My body thought it was nine o'clock, and I was like, "Let's go!" Oh my and god. They... I think we're gonna have to call it here. Maybe. I'm sorry. Oh man. Yeah, that's GTA for you. Welcome back to Troubleshooting GTA <laughs> with Funhouse. I was gonna say, it's not troubleshooting anymore. Now oh. it's just trouble. We just know there's a problem. Yeah, mm -hmm. you develop back. workarounds, you know? Just figure this, it out. This You're a homeowner, a... you get a leaky roof, you don't repair the roof. Which the worst. You just know where not to stand to get mm -hmm. wet. What would you like me to do? This is gonna sound mm. insane, but you may have to restart GTA. No! I mean, I'll restart GTA if you that want sounds... I'll do it. Like a crazy idea. idea. I'll do it. But you may have to restart GTA. This has happened before. This is Here I what, go, I'm doing it. This is what Leo Laporte would tell you to do on a call for help. What are you talking about? He's an uh, old man who tells you how to fix your computer. Oh, uh, you idiot. You're a fucking moron. I know what it is, but... Yeah. Alan is here. Are you sure this isn't broken? No, it's no one broken. said they were sure. Someone? At a certain point, GTA is just a podcast anyway. Then you we do need, need the gameplay, though. We need a game. <laughs> we do. Because you need something to ignore. I just got a great idea. What's that? We should do a gameplay. Yeah. Like a GTA. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Except while we're in the room, it's filling with water. Oh, that's and we a have to idea. get the gameplay recorded oh. and funny before we drown. <laughs> that's a great idea. What uh -huh. if it's not water? It's like one of those bullshit esports energy drinks. Okay. Oh, like uh, okay. Gamer Fuel or Gamer yeah. Balls yeah, yeah, yeah. or whatever. Game yeah. Goo or. Edge uh, spelled with four U's. We do costume gameplays. Uh, I'm gonna wait. We do drunk gameplays. We need to start doing stunt gameplays. That's a good idea. Like stunt we're doing, gameplays. we're do, trying to do a gameplay on a roller coaster. I, I did a gameplay on, on uh, Zero Gravity. Yeah, was, there you go. Yeah. Stuff like that. Okay. Lawrence needs to beat Tetris 99 Battle Royale before he hits the ground, otherwise we don't give him a parachute when he jumps you, out of a plane. Let me tell you this much. I watched him play, and he didn't beat it without Oof. jumping out of a Yikes. plane. But think, very of, disappointing. think of the views. Really? Very disappointing. That is disappointing. Yikes. Very disappointing. Wow. Mm -hmm. I thought he liked Tetris. Am I wrong about this, that tequila is the only upper as an alcohol? What? No. Tequila's an upper? I thought that it was. Tequila totally. makes me black out. Seven ways tequila is good for you. Oh, this is going to oh, be a nice sure. article. Did, it's written by Lauren Sontag. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's a, it'll elevate your mood. Yeah. Unlike other alcohol options, tequila is said to be an upper, not a downer. Okay. This it's one may be, be. What does that it's, fucking I mean? No, yeah, it says, it it says this one's said to be a myth. Okay. Oh, that yeah, seems I was legit. Say. I read it on the internet. But have you ever seen anyone upset while holding a margarita? <laughs> I mean, I've seen some rage <laughs> come out of people. <laughs> I have seen that yeah. as well. Uh, it it kind of doesn't matter which alcohol. My twenty first birthday, a shot of Montezuma's Revenge is what sent me spiraling down <laughs> into the black circle from which I did not recover for about twelve hours. Well, guys, we did it. We found out tequila is an upper. Confirmed. If we could open up Bruce's head, look at his brain, all uh -huh. the things he knows. Yeah. Right. What do you think the ratio is of completely wrong oh, that's really to bad. pretty yeah. accurate? I'd, really, I'd say he's about forty percent uh, yeah. right. Yeah, and oh, then maybe, the 60, maybe. But this is stuff that We're talking Bruce, about like thirty percent. This is the stuff that Bruce 20%. knows. Like if you ask Bruce, yeah. what do you, do you know this? And it's not like everything in the world. <laughs> But it's, it, do yeah, you know? Yeah, but I knew that tequila was an up. See, not like that. <laughs> like that. Okay. He's got it wrong 60% of the time. <laughs> but very confidently wrong. Very confidently yeah. wrong. Here's the thing. If you're going to be wrong, you got to be confident. I, I love that stuff. I love when you're, when you have, and then you think about how you've repeated it 40 <laughs> times over the last two weeks. You're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell it everyone you know, strangers on the street. And then, and then you actually look it up and you're like, that's, that's like, not whoops. right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. I think there was, there was Braveheart. That was a fun one. Well, that was my dad. Blame yeah, my yeah. dad for that. But I mean, I, th I feel like most of us... But you trusted your dad, which is your first absolutely. mistake. Absolutely. Most of us are guilty of that. We've had a parent lie to us. Absolutely. Where they're like, you know, 
blah, blah, blah. You grow hair in your hands mm. if you masturbate, yada, yada. You go blind if you stare at the TV. Mm-hmm. Things. You know that noise planes sometimes make when you're parked and it sort of sounds like a dog barking? Oh, it's like yes. A yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, like yeah, the wheels. Yeah, yeah. I had a friend who, until he was like 28, thought that that was actually dogs in the cargo bay. <laughs> and then out loud was like, wow, the dogs are really loud today. And someone was like. <laughs> I think I was told every time you turn off and on a light bulb or any like light in the house, it costs $5.42. <laughs> <laughs> what? See, all of this, is, as an adult, is so obvious yeah. shit where some adult was like, oh, I can say anything to a kid and they'll believe it. So how can I lie to them to manipulate their yeah. actions <laughs> into what I want but them wh- to be? Why would my dad manipulate me with Braveheart was shot in three weeks? Was he trying to get me to be an uh, Academy Award winning director Maybe he wanted to encourage you to yeah. show how possible the impossible was. No, he, I think that his dad lied to him. Or the, yeah, yeah. the great Braveheart lie has been passed down your family for generations. <laughs> I, I, think, I think he knew you were going to work in entertainment one day, and that was how you're gonna, you were going to hobnob your way to the industry with that story. Mm. Oh, yeah. he, like, just you know, gave, he just wanted to give you something. You know, yeah. Braveheart was shot in three weeks. They go, wow, this guy knows his stuff. Oh, there you go. Mel Gibson, no, Gibson's looking at you. Yeah. Going, <laughs> if you weren't white, I'd hit you in the yeah. nose. I don't know that we're going to be able to play GTA, guys. Mm. Yeah, this has been an issue news. basically oh, every week. Happened? Well, not every week, but every this third, sucks. maybe. I was going to tell Alana about Airborne. Aw, oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, really? Dude, every week you do that. Oh. Not with Alana. <laughs> People, uh, after we mentioned it on a GTA recently, kept asking me to see uh, Demolition Man. Yeah. Mm. And I have no idea if this is actually going to be a video, but I would like you all to know that I have seen it now. Okay. And I thought it was quite good. Okay. There was a point. Where I think Bruce suggested turning it off, and Alana said no. Look at that! That's fresh, Bruce. That is fresh. That's fresh. fresh. That is actually the lowest you can go. I'm sorry, the highest you can go, but still being fresh. Is it better than Anaconda? Let's find (laughs) out, shall we? Research Anaconda. Uh, Anaconda. Anaconda. Yeah. See? That seems right. Below average. Uh, seems, yeah, of course it's bad. There's a lot of movies from the 90s that are worse than Demolition Man. All right, what else we got here? What else do we want to compare this to? What's um, worse than Demolition double Man? Double Impact. That's yeah, a good way, one. That's it's a good way one. worse than Demolition This one's got to be worse than Demolition yeah. Man, right? Basically everything Jean-Claude Van Damme did. Yeah. 20%. Worse. Time Cop is probably worse as That's well. That's 20% bad. Same, similar premise, too. Yeah. Two cops traveling through time. 45%. Yep. Yep. Sounds right. I mean, these are all garbage movies that I never saw because I knew they were garbage. You didn't see this? Time Cop? No. Oh, really? Bruce. No. I, why don't we spend time with that garbage? You want I'm not Lauren Sontag. But if you want to get a true glimpse in the future, watch Time Cop and Demolition Man. No, I don't. Between I don't, those two no, movies, don't you get either of those. How's Ugly Dolls doing? Ugly dolls. I just want to see. How's it doing? I saw. I didn't realize this was. Who could have known? Not good. I didn't realize this was a movie. What else? What else we got? How did the beach do? Not good. Wow, people didn't like the beach. That was not good. Sixteen. And I'll practice at the real. Bicentennial Man. Bicentennial Man. Also a really good one. Thirty-six. Okay. K packs. I bet. I wonder if the reviews have gone down since we know what we know about. But none of that's in the movie. He's a banana. Yeah, you can't judge the movie that way. 41%. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right, 41%. That's about right. What's k Pax? I haven't even heard of that. Like, Kevin Spacey's an alien. It's I mean, really dumb. Uh, end of end days. End of days, yeah. Oh, I actually like that movie. I did too, but I know that it's not good. Right. See? Yeah. yeah. Wow. That's stink. This is a real stinker. It's a real stinker. <sighs> Sixth day. Sixth day. Also Ooh, not a good movie. Yeah. We're going to find that out right now. 41%. Yeah, you're right. Is that Gary Sinise? No. Who's that man with the glasses? Somebody you've never heard of. <laughs> <laughs> it, there's a chance it okay. may be the guy from Ghost. Who yes. pays the guy to kill Patrick Swayze? I think that might be it. Detective Pikachu is as good as Demolition Man. Just I wanted to. Oh, say I like better. Demolition Man. I'm cool with that. That's good. But Demolition Man strives for more. <laughs> <laughs> I would say it's a world builder. Or is it Detective Pikachu already has so much oh, lore built that. around it? Oh, uh, Mystery Men. Sixty percent. Sixty percent. Yeah, okay. yeah that's, that's good. slightly worse. That these. Hold on. Wait. Wait. What? What? Look up the cover for Suicide Squad. Wait. What? Suicide that looks like they ripped off Suicide Squad. That's your problem? Oh, you mean Suicide Squad ripped off Mystery Men? Yeah, yeah. It's all the yeah, characters wow. in the same it color. What? You should put Holy that on shitty movie shit. whatever. We got to the oh, bottom of it, boys. Hold on. Turns out see. Suicide Squad is bad. I'm going to leave you this this last comment. Yep. We're going to stop. Okay. okay. Lumifier says, editing can make anything into a good video. Yeah, but it, it still makes their life miserable. All right, everybody. Hop in. We got some GTA to play. When do we get that new vibe, guys? <laughs> Vive Index or whatever. I don't know. What it's if gonna, we did an about our, our personal race to bankruptcy? 
Like we each race to bankruptcy. Yeah, yeah. So we race each other. Fastest? It's Brewster's Millions, but Brewster's go out of business. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's uh, like I had another idea that I wanted to do called Blood Wars, where listening. you basically are you go to give blood and you start at the same time as someone else. <laughs> oh no! I'll try and it's racing to try and fill the bag before the other guy does. I'd watch that. Yeah, you're gonna be in it. So if you win, you get resuscitated. Well, you don't die. You just have to fill a regular oh, okay. bag that gotcha. you would. Your body but will the live. difference is, as opposed to having the normal regulations of you just lying there and then eating cookies or crackers afterwards, mm -hmm. you can get up and run. Oh, okay. You can like get your heart rate you're, you're going because you're trying to fill the bag as quickly as possible. Gotcha. What are we doing, today, Uh I have no idea because the <laughs> I just the pretend. Is called just H go with it. HT15. <laughs> Thank is. you, Alana James. <coughs> How did they all do that? Okay. I mean, I think... Wait, where's the ramp? Oh, there you go. There's somebody knocked down some fences for you. <laughs> no, not the right fence. Oh, there's a door right there, Adam. There's a door. Is that a to door? To your left. And then, hold on, oh, go left. Yeah, there, right there. Right there. Yeah. Are we sh that's the right way to do yeah, this? Yeah, that's the only this way to do it. Good map. <laughs> no, it's how above you, us, though. What, yeah. I think there's a ramp huh? Oh, uh, well, there's a ramp down there. Okay. Yeah, but how do you get the fuck that to that? I think you jump off the... I think you jump from the... Airport. Okay. Everyone's confused. I got you. Yeah. You go out here. There's so, a, I think there's a bump. Where's that bump? bump? Yeah, they, some of them went into some the sky went, somehow. Some high. I saw them do it. I just don't know how. I feel like I'm missing something. Uh, is yeah, there supposed to be a specific vehicle for this one? Did it load for some people? Why? Do some of them fly? <clears throat> Has anyone finished? Uh, were we supposed to use the flying motorcycle? People are, in, people are taking positions and stuff. I saw them go ahead of you. Yeah, but I mean, if no one's hit the first checkpoint, do you need custom vehicles? No, yeah, no one, no is, no one has actually that. made it okay. near any of those checkpoints. Look, see, somebody just jumped. Hold I'm on, watching them do it. Wait, follow, follow those people. Follow those people, Adam. Follow those people. Yeah, just, I want to see what they're doing. They're using their flying bikes. There's an invisible bump, like on the, uh, these little red spots. Are you saying there's a physical bump? Wait, I think I know what to do. An invisible jump? Hold on, follow the guy who says he knows what to do. Who is it? Who said it? Stop well, talking yeah, omnisciently. Go back, go back and wait okay, for them to do that. I got this. Real quick, anyway. go over here by these red <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Which one are you? What's your username? <laughs> Speak Spectre. Oh, Twisted hey, Anthony. 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 Okay, so I think I understand uh, a little bit of this. Okay. Yeah, I trust him with my life. Is that Anthony? So, Where is he? When you hit, when you do a bat, when you uh, pull back on your bike, you're supposed to bounce off these little red poles here. Glitches, <laughs> and you're supposed to like fly. Oh, okay. wow. All right. All right. All right, Adam, do it. The physics on bike races in race mode are just broken. You can nope. just fly indefinitely if you pull back on the stick. Thanks for letting us know. Yeah, we've never played GTA before. Really. <laughs> oh, you know, don't don't act high and mighty. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we Obviously, were way I would have figured that out by myself. <laughs> uh, yeah, Alana would have figured it out. She already knew. She just was waiting yeah. for us to figure it out. I just thought it would be a fun challenge. Everyone teamwork, to work, yeah. work together, and figure the puzzle out. I'm really surprised right. that people. Hold back. Hold back. Okay. Oh. Missed them all. Oh, you missed them all. You didn't hit any. Oh, all, right. <laughs> all right, I think I know okay. what to do, but I don't know how to execute. Yeah, but this is problem. still somehow better than last week. This is this is what I like about this our community. Game. I like about our community. Our community wants to help each other. Yeah, yeah. no, they're yeah. good people. Uh, help each other except for Turbot. Don't help Turbot. No, I never help. <laughs> yeah, I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> I know, Turbot. I know you heard it. All right. <laughs> That's so why we said it. Pulling back. Oh, okay. Uh, I see. We have to pull back further. Okay. By the way, if you do get some air, try fluttering the back, like kind of like pull flutter. Back. It's a flutter tank. It. It's a okay. pull, then a flutter. But he has to hit the jump. Then a release. Says, yes. hit, People are going up the on the right side while of it. Doing a wheelie. Follow the follow them. Yep. They know what they're yeah, doing. Right you side. Don't. There we go. Now we're talking. Right side. Follow just to the right of that line. Yep. Just to the right of that line. Wheelie, wheelie. I'm pulling back. Wheelie. I'm pulling back. No. Not even close. Great, Drake, progress, that was great though. job, though. Great progress. job. So we're doing it. An awesome job. And you flutter. Did you flutter? Yeah. <laughs> well, you you, sure you, you, you saw it. <laughs> it's like right. Farah, Adam. You got this. Just, just like Farah. <coughs> You're really good at Farah. What? No, there's nothing like Farah. Farah is, is exactly a button. Like flutter. This is a series of glitches. No. Nope. <laughs> oh, use that. Is the, oh, Fuck. you didn't wheelie over it. Do you think that we could have people sacrifice their bikes so that we can <laughs> jump off of them? Okay. I don't know. The Wait. So when someone's Oh, it is cool watching I think you have to go it. up the middle of that red thing. Potentially? I think, I think you have to bump, and then when you bump, you hit that first oh, little man. thing on the bottom that and is, it launches you. a lot oh. of series. Yes, I managed it. Oh, oh wait, no. Someone, right. no, no. And no. that's my head. This is Are like you the, the one who just committed suicide? This is the first time in a long time we've actually paid attention to the map. Whoa, bring your bike there, get asshole. that bike out of there. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Feeling so, good about it, Adam. No. Oh. Uh, you this, gotta have this, a little bump. Bike doesn't wheelie very well. Dirt bike's wheelie great. Oh, so this this is bad. 
I mean, it's been bad. You got it. Yeah, you well, yeah. Well, because you have to break. Start with a break, and then. Oh yeah, yeah. Hold the hold the wheelie. Can't. Can you hold the wheelie? No. Not, hold the wheelie. Hold the wheelie. That's the, what people do in real life. I would only ever do a wheelie if I had enough money just in my hand to afford five more of the very same bike. What about your body? I mean, I don't care about my body. Okay. <laughs> my body heals. Bikes don't. That's never been true. Alana. Mm -hmm. Question for you. Mm. Yes. You so. see, two of the same man on the same bike driving by you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, picture that in your okay. head. Okay. Like motorcycles? Yes, like motorcycles. Two of the same man, both shredded, driving by, blasting your favorite song on the radio. Mm. Okay. One of them's doing a wheelie, one of them isn't. Which one do you go with? How's that possible? They're wheelie, which one same bike. Which one? Definitely wheelie. Really? But they're both on the same bike. What did I tell you? Uh, I said you gotta go way fast. I, no but way. I, the thing, so here's the problem with the bike we chose. It doesn't do wheelies. It's not a wheelie bike. Well, it can do a wheelie if I choose to do this. I don't know that getting passive aggressive at the bike is the right call when there. I don't know that anyone has made it. Hold the wheelie. Oh, Let's try it. No, it, no, he's super yeah. So I'm not going to be able to get enough speed because the only way you wheelie with this thing is you start off so, as a wheelie. But has anyone pose, made it? Let me pose a new Probably scenario, not. Alana. Yes, sir. And Adam, you can also weigh in on the attractiveness of this man. No, he, no, he can't. But what if the guy who wasn't doing the wheelie was going like... 120 miles an hour. Would be too fast to see him and hear the song that I like. More theoretical questions, James. Go. Um, okay. You can't, remember, they have to be perfectly equal, except one's doing a wheelie and one's okay. not. Okay, all right, okay, uh, okay. Jeez. Uh, Donald Trump doing a wheelie. Uh, okay. Or Donald Trump not doing a wheelie. Mm -hmm. Wait, there's two of them? And, uh, and also the wheelie colluded. Damn it. That's not equal. <laughs> Trick question. Both of them too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess I go Wheelie Trump. Nice. That's what I thought. Yeah. Always. I would choose neither. What about those weird looking twins? Because there are actually two of those. Weird looking twins. I mean, that the, could be anybody. The, the French ones with the, uh, the French ones. with all the plastic surgery. Oh, do you know what he's talking about? Oh, yeah, oh, I know. The, uh, like Adam deported. always brings these fuckers up. Because yeah. they're beautiful. <laughs> they're not beautiful. I mean, if you could be the perfect man, which looks like a cat, they're both, you would be that. You look like you look like Ron Perlman from Beauty and the Beast. I said it a hundred times. <laughs> and if I well, said let me it once, ask you this: uh -huh. Would you rather, Alana, yes. and Adam? Yes. No, not Adam. Would you rather have sex with Ron Perlman as Ron Perlman or Ron Perlman as Catman from Beauty and the Beast? <sighs> Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, Beauty and the Beast every time. Because I have to cover. I get to cover his hideous face. It's a good question. Alana, what about you? I think I'm probably gonna go Beauty and the Beast yeah, because that's what I thought. it'd it's be exotic. very different. Uh, his cat men are attractive. It's exotic. <laughs> well. Not everybody looks like a cat. No, Not everybody looks like only a man. the most perfect. Well, people. yeah, I know, but the thing is, humans naturally want to kiss something that has a divot in the front <laughs> <laughs> and big puffy yeah, cheeks. Yeah, big puffy cheeks. Giant forehead and squinty yeah, eyes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's biology. That's why we made the the Navi the way they are. Mm -hmm, That's mm -hmm. right. Perfect in blue. Avatars. Is gonna rule the box office. You watch out, Endgame. It's not called Avatar. It's called Avatar 2. Secret of the Use. You're an Avatar. <laughs> the chat keeps telling you guys to take your shots off. Yeah. Can I report Why? them for harassment? Here's, here's the other thing. Don't call it the chat. Call it that one guy. Yeah. No. Because <laughs> it's the one dude. Yeah. Look at him go! Uh, the ones that I tried too hard. Come on, Adam! Oh. Damn it. Well, it's been 10 minutes. Have you guys Wait. ever soaked before? Isn't soaking what, like, Jehovah's yeah, Witness do? Is that when you just sit in there? Just yeah. Sit there. Wouldn't you lose your trilbies? Hell no, no. Never lose trilbies. Not when you think about Jehovah. You ever, you ever been inside war something warm and wet? <laughs> Actually, Alana, have you besides your mom? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, come on. She was when she was born. When she was born. Are we still soaking? Yes. Okay. We're still in there. Also, remember, focus literally. on the game. Yeah, click it. Yeah, there you go. Only, only, only give GTA your utmost attention. It is a needy <laughs> little baby. Come on, faster, baby. Alana, faster. Yeah. <laughs> she had a big slug. We're all going to have ant leakage later in life anyway. I mean, who says I don't have it right now? Alana, I pooed probably 7,000 times in my life. Never. Dang. Joining GTA it's going, Online. It's going. <gasps> 90 degrees up and down. Does that sound familiar to anyone? Let's do that one. Cool, let's do it. Here they come. Here they come, everyone. Welcome, one and all, to our GTA lobby. Have I ever told you the story of the, oh, never mind, hold on. The race will start. Hey, Lana, what are we doing today? Uh, this is a racing map. Wow. <laughs> yep, didn't pick it, my bookmarks want walking. <laughs> Don't pull back my curtain. First place, look at this, baby. <laughs>
Oh no. <laughs> Sorry. Why would you do that? Bruce, you had a story, what? Oh, I have a story. Did I ever okay. tell you the story about the guy that he had sex with a girl with a condom? Okay. That's good. Safe mm -hmm. sex. Yeah. Nice job. But then job, went and met up with his friends afterwards in Las Vegas and left the condom on. <laughs> and they discovered that he had a condom on because he was like, yeah, you know, like, I'll come play blackjack, but I just got to take my condom off. And they were like, what? I think you have told this story. Yeah, like, but why, just tell it again because I love it. What do you mean? What, why would you? Why, Leave why, it why, on. Why is your condom still on? And he was like, oh, I don't know. I was just lazy and just left it on. Lazy? Ugh. What does it require? Like, it requires with his own, nothing. Like semen in it? Yeah, I think. Also, generally, condoms will fall off, I think, eventually at some point. Not if you got a big dong. Even a, that has to be a giant dick, like <laughs> flaccid. You tell me. Also, it's all slick. <laughs> Go up, go up, go up. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Well, like that, Bitcoin, that all really the way hurt, to the top. That really hurts my eyes there. there You're good. We go. Don't worry. You'll live forever. That's a warning. James and I have perfect eyes. Mm -hmm. I don't have- I wear contacts every day. Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that I did not tell the condom story on content. Mm. I may have just told you guys. Oh, okay. Um, quiet, one of our quiet nights. The chat <laughs> determined that that was a lie. Fuck you! You never heard that story? God. What was his name? One chat? of them did say they Where does he live? live? How would you ever be so busy that you can't take a- Condom. He wasn't busy. He was oh. trying to brag, I'm sure of it. <laughs> he was trying to brag. <laughs> what a strange badge of honor. I had protected sex. <laughs> no STDs for this guy. Well, to be honest with you, that's, that is a, I think that's a reason to brag, that you had protected sex. Good for you. Is it? Yeah. 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 I feel like most dudes brag about going bareback. Yeah, we need to change that stigma. Oh, that's cool. Let's, how about this? Every time you guys have sex with a condom, leave it on for the rest of the day. Tell yeah. us about it. <laughs> a badge of honor. <laughs> A vag of honor. <laughs> nice. And then when it starts sucking through your pants, then you can throw it away. Yeah, once that big old bacon-like grease stain starts <laughs> will know, showing like, on the other side of your jeans. If we can jeans. really start this, uh, get momentum for this movement, then women mm. will be like, oh, did you see the stain? He <laughs> definitely yeah. used a condom the last time he came. <laughs> You're right. Wow. Oh, they would love, a lot of, would, that, would that turn you on? Absolutely. A female will find a new lover based on the size of his stain. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's yeah. call him. Let's call it staining. Oh, Good. No, land flat, and reverse. Oh, nice. Yeah, 50 up. RP, baby. When you stain and you get laid because you stained, uh -huh. tell him your friend Bruce sent it's you. It's even better than yeah. abstaining. No. Oh, get it? Yeah. Nice. Get it? Well, that's a really good Sexual joke. Education. Don't abstain. Stain. <laughs> Come your pants. A washing machine. Hey, who's doing that? Fuck that dude! Second place, James. I'm disappointed in you. Well, nice work. I'm just glad. I'm just glad I knocked whoever it was who tr tried to smash me yeah. against the wall off into who the fuck knows where. Yeah, what the fuck? Who was that? Is that a specimen? No, not this time. Yeah, I got I got fucked yeah. real hard. Way back at the bottom. Whoa. There's oh, yeah. 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 He left his condom on. <laughs> Way back at the bottom. <laughs> Show me your stain. <laughs> Show me your stain. How do women indicate that they had protected sex? Oh, that's how, tough. How about if you guys double bag it and then you each wear a condom? Oh, you wear it like around your neck like a promise ring. Stain. Here, Lana. We can do we can do one more of these. Sure. Since James got second. I Alana, I know can get first place. Right, Alana? That's a promise. She yeah. said yes. She's not talking. Her eyes are yeah. kind of off in the anything? distance somewhere. Yeah. Did she say anything? She said it. Yeah. Non verbal. Yeah, I can't see your face. No. I'll tell you when. Now. now. Oh, oh God. James always does that, and we always blow it. He knows when to do it. I know exactly what to do. But he doesn't do know when to say it. That's not true. <laughs> no one listens. <laughs> Alana is in first place, and she'll never. Oh, never mind. You shut your mouth. I think you go pretty straight, honestly. I think you go pretty straight. Oh, like up. straight up? Yeah. Whoa! Oh, you just can't get hit. Oh, you're going too vertical. Too vertical. Oh, no. You let her astray. I said kind of vertical. You let her astray. You said you can go pretty much yeah, straight up. I think you go pretty straight, honestly. Yeah. You did. You That's let her astray. That's not straight up. That's difference. <laughs> let it fly, Alana. Oh. Bang. Nice 25 RP. Boom. Fucked it. Great. Whoa. Oh, easy. No need for those that language. Yeah. Just because you didn't get stained today. <laughs> Is that this video? I can't remember. Yeah, I think so. Right, it good. can be. You're doing great, Alana. 15 so. places. <clears throat> Not great. Well, well you're 13 gonna, is better. You 14 will be worse. Great. Yeah, 15 is bad. You'll you'll be great. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how oh, to correct this. Control reverse. Yeah, you'll be great. You got to think back. The trick. So the trick Ten here buttons. is there's Five. no checkpoint at the top, mm. which means you have to jump, jump to the other track. What are you talking about? Get the fuck when out of here. When you're coming down the bottom of that oh, loop, oh, okay. jump to the other track. Wow, frame rate. Oh, you're going so fast. Did you guys ever think that when you were a kid? Yes. Oh, there we go. Thank you. I know that in cool countries like Amsterdam, people skateboard and then just hold onto the back of trams. You should do that with rollerblades. It's also not very cool. There's a term for it. It's called skitching. It's called skitching. It's, it's not, called skitching. Skitching is lame. 
and riding on a hoverboard. Uh, is cool. If it was lame, why would they make a video game about it called Skitchin? <laughs> you know what's faster than any car on the planet? What? A guy hanging onto the bumper of a fast yeah. car. <laughs> That's not With, true. Yeah, it is, because yeah, you can whip. As fast as this car's going, you can always go faster. Let's, let's do a little, little thought exercise oh, here. Right, a little math for you. We'll do okay. How many wheels does a car have? Four. How many wheels are on a pair of rollerblades? Eight. Yep, exactly. Right. So more wheels equals more speed? I'm just saying, if you're on the back of a Formula One car, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you're hang you're hanging <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the Formula One car's going 213 miles an hour. That's right. You can go faster than that. How? By whipping yourself off. That's the yeah. that's the premise of skitching. But you yeah. can't be strong enough at 213 miles an hour to push yourself forward. You always can. Hard right, hard right! Oh. It's so risky, man. Eleventh <laughs> place, like you got to risk. Yeah. James's theory checks out. It I checks feel like out. you could do that for you, a couple of seconds and then you always die. Go faster. Well that's the problem, is the car doesn't have Arms. No, no. Also, Careful. you get under the wind. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. That's where it's you're under the wind, mm -hmm. so it's going over, and then whoo, we no, come yeah. out on the side, and then <laughs> <laughs> you, you gotta skate real fast, but you can go faster than the car. This for sounds, even just a moment. Skitchin yeah. sounds stupid and you look dumb doing it. Alana, did you ever rollerblade when you were a kid? I did a little, and then, you know, tried to after that YouTube event, but the airport took my skates. That's not rollerblading, that's roller skating. Sorry, uh, I did rollerblade, yes. Don't get them confused. Rollerblading is cool. Did this, I just yeah. offend One's cool, someone? The other's not. This, yeah. is, this is it. This is right now, this video mm -hmm. will determine what is cooler, <laughs> roller skating or rollerblading. James. Rollerblading. Alana. Rollerblading. Skitchin. <sighs> Which you can only do on rollerblades. Thank you. People Hello, will all. come, Ray. Yeah, but People now I've probably broken GTA Online, so... I'm just give it some time. I can do hat tricks all goddamn day. That's can you, all I can know. Can you do three in a row? Well, it's also it's against a black wall, so you can't see it. It Hold just on. looks like I don't have a head. Oh, yeah, that's cool. You can just... They could put things spewing out of my head. Editor? Did you quit out of GTA? Yeah. Oh. We Because it was working, and then I pressed B on something, and then oh, everything Oh, you don't want B? I know, I know. The internet's been okay today. I think it's something about this room. Oh, really? When something happens in this room, it all goes yeah, it's down. it's the lead paint. Mm. It's the lead paint, yeah, mm. the conditions. TGIF, right, y'all? I know. I know. I Every feel like weekend, Urkel too. and both of the Olsen twins combined. Did y'all have TGIF in Canada? They didn't have, thank God, it's Friday. They had, say, said, sorry about the week. Yeah. <laughs> that was theirs. <laughs> if we could make MASH 2, what would be the plot? Well, what, what was, was the, the plot, plot of the first, first one? <laughs> MASH was the medical Soldiers. medical army yeah, like, something hospital. Yeah. Yeah. It, so it was a, basically a medical unit mm -hmm. stationed in Vietnam. No, yeah. I think no, it was Korean, Korean War. Korea. I, I just realized the modern day MASH, Barry. Barry is really a military oriented show. I don't know is if it? it's modern day MASH though. I, I would it's say modern. it's, it's, it's Breaking Bad 2.0. Yeah. Oh, Breaking Ooh, really? Bad. You just sold me on it hard. Okay. It's got it's got Breaking Bad. You laugh at it, but you're like, ah. well, except for Noho Hank. And there's there's a gray no morality to yeah. it. Noho Hank is crazy. You know they're supposed to kill him off in the first episode? Noho Hank. Spoiler. He doesn't actually have alopecia. Really? Because I looked up his bio and it said he did. No, I, I heard that uh, he came up with it himself and he showed up on set day one, no eyebrows, no hair. I looked up he the He even actors. shaved his pubes and the, mm. like, Bill Hader was like, it sounds like why'd weird. you do this? I mean, it sounds like he has alopecia. What I, you're describing? He yes, might have alopecia. Hank War, John says that actor doesn't have alopecia and that he's a liar. You say that the actor does have alopecia, and most but people has a bleach their pubes penis. anyway. What? I'm getting so annoyed with GTA. Uh, yeah, it's not perfect. You know, it's a new wow. game. I mean, mm -hmm. we can go back to Red Dead for a bit. They got some dead horses on the map now. I don't yeah, know if I you guys have that. you seen this. Have what you heard about up this? With that? There's yeah. just dead horses. We should do a mash too, but it takes place during the Civil War. That sounds exciting. Let's That'd call funny. it mush. Yeah, we call it mush. <laughs> the American Civil War is. Um, being Canadian, something that I don't know a ton about. Mm -hmm. It's like well, I have a little, I have a little mm -hmm. bit knowledge of it. Who were the principal parties involved? Uh, Denzel Washington and Matthew Broderick. Well, you, when don't we were driving to that. Texas, you Florida. mentioned the Alamo and that uh -huh. that was where the, a lot, the last stand happened. Mm -hmm. Is that Civil War related? No. Oh, is this is Mexican War. Mexican, Mexican American. Mexican American Civil War. This is where David Crockett Who are the players died. there? David, David Crockett. David Crockett. Died. It was David Crockett. Yeah, was there. David Crockett. After he quit 
Congress. He was a congressman. Did you know that? No, I always thought Davy Crockett. He thought he just wandered the woods. I did with like a raccoon skin cap, and he just Davy Crockett. That's okay. what I was. That, well, that's I mean, he the did song all, he's famous for. He did yeah. a lot of that, but he also was a congressman. What he But then he told Congress to fuck off. Oh. I'm gonna do this myself. But I'm going to Texas, and then he went to Texas and fought in the Alamo. And they said no one's taking the Alamo, and everyone died. Oh. John, what are you doing this weekend? It's oh, a long, it's a long it's weekend. Memorial Day weekend, three day weekend. What am I gonna do? This video is not gonna be up for four months. What? Well, I was going to speak about uh, it in past tense. What I did was I planned. I saw on my way to work. I saw a sign that said "Healthy Family 5K," and I said, "Hey, my dad likes running. Maybe I'll do a 5K with my dad. Oh. That can't be too far." Uh huh. How to uh, go? He looked it up, and it said that five kilometers is about three miles, and that we yeah. and that 3. the race 2. starts at 8 a.m. And I said, "Oh, I can't do that." And he said. What, run three miles or wake up at 8 a.m.? And I said, both. Boo this man! No! And it got a big laugh out of my mom in the chat. She she typed, ha ha. Oh, oh, ah, your mom yeah, likes jokes, huh? Time. Just so you know, if you ever plan on running for office, well, like at an event, no. like that, uh -huh. like a 5K, they I'm all good. start early. Remember when I used to race miles? I would go to the tre not the not the Rooster Teeth. Miles? Guy, not the rider. But I would, really? I, you get on a treadmill, You'd run a mile, and then the next time you have to go up 0.1 speed, and you keep doing it until you can't run a mile. Is that the one where oh, that's cool. you shit yourself and then you had to have Elise come pick you up? <laughs> no, that was different. I'm sorry, what? I didn't shit myself, but there I have had one workout where I felt so sick and ruined afterwards, remember? In Burbank? I to, yeah, I had to yeah. call you, and I was like, I can't walk home. Yeah, but yeah. you I like, didn't shit That was a long time yourself. ago. I didn't shit myself. Trust, trust me, I have a plan for shitting myself. I've told it many times. If I ever shit myself at the gym, which is entirely possible, I just collapse and pretend like something way worse is wrong with oh, me. Oh, there so, you go. So like you, the best thing you can do is if you shit yourself, load up the bar with a lot of weight, go for the rep, collapse, yeah. like you're really hurt, and then just lie there, and then when people check on you, like peek with one eye, but then like wait for the ambulance to come, because if you passed out, you can't control what happens to mm, your body. That's true. That's true. You know how you can choice. pay someone to uh, like come to your house after you die and get rid of all your porno mags oh, <laughs> and yeah. clear your hard drive? Can I you? have someone that after I die goes to my gym and puts more weight on the bar. <laughs> oh, is it very me? Cool. No, it's someone I pay, someone I trust. Oh. Someone, someone that's gonna outlive me. I, hope, I mean, I hope you outlive me. No, I want to die first. I'll race you. You got an eyelash on your face. You have an eyelash on your face. Do you Same. make a wish? Sometimes you want someone to wipe the eyelash off your face. And when you did, they'll stack your ways. You want someone that you can trust to wipe all the dew to walk your butt. You wanna be somebody that knows your name. I mean, I've said we before, when it works, we should just record the screen. Oh, yeah. Just and then the whatever happens, and then we just remember to pass the controller around every 10 oh, minutes. Yeah, here, or so wait, during can you the hand me the controller? Whoa! No, that we don't even good. react too much. No, if Bruce good. isn't here, then it won't oh. It won't matter. Oh, what do y'all uh, have planned? It's a three day weekend. I'll tell you Everybody what I did. Everybody is freaking gone. I went to Seattle. And I ran with your dad. Alana, how was the weather in Seattle? Oh, yeah, it was weathersome. I mean, this one feels there like a safe There were various bet. temperatures. Really? Like yeah. In Seattle? Uh-huh. From, uh, varied by at least five degrees. Oh. Throughout Celsius or the day. Fahrenheit? Was it hilly? <laughs> Seattle often is. <laughs> yes, okay, I was like, it's Seattle hilly, <laughs> shit. <laughs> What's wrong with this? I don't know. What happened? It's yeah, also turning even though I'm not turning. Like, I'm not this game doing real that. Bad. The Photoshop filter. Have we been hacked? Yes, I mean, yes, it's GTA. It almost <laughs> certainly has been hacked. Like, I'm not moving the camera. No Michael is. <laughs> this is scary. Hello, friend. This is how the game was meant to be played. What if we took a bunch of toys that were popular in the 90s for kids uh -huh. and made them again for adults? So, like, what? like Nerf bow and arrows, except they're really powerful because now they have, have they have that. <laughs> That's already a real thing. 
How could he? I had been working on that bit for months, many late nights. That's not an original idea! Training for the perfect delivery, only to have it stepped on in seconds. Go back to the drawing board! He doesn't even realize what he's done to me. My soul is broken. Next idea. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's a slip and slide, uh -huh. but it's longer than the length of a male human body. Oh, so it's actually of, a mile long. It's actually a mile long with an actual crocodile. Ooh, yeah. I like that. Yeah. What about crossfire? Mm -hmm. Except crossfire. it's from the commercial. Yeah, it's in the commercial. Except the board, you know, you had that little thing you shoot the balls, but it's two real guns. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> yeah. And you're racing to load it as yeah. fast as possible shooting the person next to you. That'd be cool. What about um, Skip It? But it's an actual like ball and chain. It's like razor blades on it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> around no. your leg. Do you ever wish you lived in a time period where you only had one name? Socrates. Oh, well, yeah. Wasn't that his surname? No, nah, that was his whole name. Because there, there were only so many people that there was, that you didn't have to come up with clarifiers. So it was just like Socrates. What's mm -hmm. your name? Socrates, got it. First name Soccer, last name Tees. For most of my adolescence, uh, I oh, everyone called yeah. me John Smith. That's an interesting thing. I went to school with some people that you'd say their full name, and usually it was because if there were like too many Johns in a single class, then you'd say one of them was John Smith. Well, it's like Bernie. Bernie's not his name. It's his last uh, name is Burns. Yeah. yeah. And, and so they called him what Bernie. Is. What is his first? But then name? he made his first name his last name. Bernie Burns. Bernie Burns. Bernie Burns. But it's not his name. And then he became famous, and he's like, "Well, I'm stuck with that now." He also continues to wear frames for glasses without glass in them because mm -hmm. people got too upset when he stopped wearing glasses after he got LASIK. Yeah, you know, life's life's hard. Because you have a very, you're like, like default, like your parents I'm didn't John care Michael at Smith. all. They didn't care yeah. at all when uh, they named you. They said, this guy's never gonna be president. <laughs> they made that decision before you were born. My parents chose hard mode for me. They did, how's it going? <laughs> Oh man, <laughs> you right on the edge. Of <laughs> <laughs> Grand Theft Auto. What, it hit, uh, what if you worked? It's gonna happen, I feel it, I feel uh, this one. I even bought a prop. Yeah, you brought the hat prop. <gasps> hey, launch, shut Video up, I don't game. care. Hey, Lon, what are we playing? You definitely want to purchase oh, wait, super heavy armor. Well, oh. I didn't do it. Oh, what happened? Oh, that, that doesn't seem good. Mm, I think it's going. It's loading. Is it? I think it's going. I'm not positive. Here we go. Oh, hey, Lon, right. what are we playing? This is Fight Funhouse Fight 2 that I guess was made by someone who likes Funhouse. Oh, it's Funhouse Look colors. Oh, it's oh, it's cool. Cool. Am I supposed to be in first person? Uh, yeah, it. I think it's yes, it's meant to be, oh. but it doesn't matter. Okay. And then you just go punch some people, really. Oh, right. oh, oh that's a glitch. Homie was it punch. lagging out? Yeah, who would have guessed? <laughs> Ow. Ow. Stop. Can't believe Damn it's it. not working. <laughs> Boom! Nice. Um, Boom! Right now, Boom! Just fine. Suit. You're the only person who's. No, no, you know. Where, say where is Turbid have an axe? Put that axe away, Turbid. Oh, maybe you I have You cheater. An axe? I it's a hatchet. Boom, get out! Uh, it's a hatchet, actually. Boom. I'm sorry, Tuff. <laughs> Don't push me off! Don't push me! Shut Don't push me! Let's get these boys! Oh, wait, Turbid's on our team. Never mind, Turbid, use that axe! Love that hatchet! Boom! Big fan! <laughs> Boom! Boom! Oh oh. oh, oh, oh. That's a nice bathing suit. Yeah, you're down. Yeah, you We're just knocked deep. out a woman, James. This map's Whoa, way bigger than it. It's all the way down yeah, there. Yeah, it's way bigger than you think. Nice no, 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 Nailed it. You didn't even oh. take any damage. <laughs> well, yeah, you barely even Boom, you. saved you. Boom. Very good. Keep it up. Oh, he's he feigned an injury. Oh, he's like, oh, you got me on my side, brother. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, he goes, you're dancing. Oh. No. Ooh, uh, oh, it's close. We just need one more. Punch one more. Boom. Nice. Most valuable player, Turbid. He had the axe. God damn. Hatchet. It's so, an axe, Turbid. Oh, hatchet. Oh, oh really, Turbid? That's ugh. what you that's went the, Yeah, that's the one you oh, chose, all right. Turbid. All right. Come on. Ugh. May I? Sure. Five, Five minutes? minutes. Okay. Yeah, dog. All right. Are, wait, are we going to do a race after this, too? We don't need to. I like the races. You like the racists? What? <laughs> John, John, I heard you say Hey, it. I like all people, Alana. Including racists? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I like people of all races, creeds, uh, philosophies. Doesn't matter if you're a pedo. Prejudices. Doesn't matter if you uh, are racist or a murderer. Don't know if that's good. Yeah, are you, are you sure you want to be saying this on camera? see you as human. Well, so yeah, you can okay. see them as human, yeah. but you also have to understand that human beings are fucked. Yeah, but they still deserve love. Oh, hatchet! Get the hatchet! Nice. 
Nice. I forget what the controls are. B. It's fine. You don't need them. A A makes you go. B makes you swing that. I magic. forgot. It's floaty too. Yeah. Be He's careful of that. Oh, no. John. What are you doing? Oh, look. It's a party. Yeah. Right, get those it's, kills, John. It's way too much blue. Hit him. Get, already okay. dead. Right. Already dead. Right, that you, guy's uh, arm. You contributed. Get over here. Get back here. I like the strategy. Meatloaf oh, strategy. Oh, Drop it one at a oh. time. Oh, he tripped. Oh, no, to the wolves! <laughs> oh, Come on down, here you, here you go, get a kill, get a kill. Yeah. Now that you're miles away. Almost. Why? That was close, they really though. Don't Real stand close. A yeah! Nice well, job. Man. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! No, yeah, don't use your you feet! Kicked him. You don't have axes on your feet. Okay. Oh, that person already dead. Yeah. Oh, that wow. counts for you. <laughs> John, yeah, that sure. counts for you. Here they come. Okay, 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 okay. okay. I was close. Mm. Uh oh. Oh, they got walls on fire! Oh, no! What? Oh, he got burst into flames. Did you see that direct hit? He's coming in, fireman! Hit him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Yes, yeah. John! I think you may have gotten a kill. Maybe. Yeah, I think he did. <gasps> yeah! Oh, he's gonna beat you. Yeah, he's gonna beat you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. they're chewing you up! <laughs> yeah, I don't. <laughs> I was. I was. Oh, that, I, 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 it was a noble effort. No. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sacrifice. Nice, good swing. It's close. Nice job. Gotcha, Whoa. bitch. Ooh, oh, gotcha, that's bitch. a kill! Hudson, that's not oh, the that way this works. I didn't mean to call her a bitch. Everybody, everybody on blue team, kill yourself so the round will go longer, so I can play more. That's it doesn't. Not it's time how based. It works. <laughs> nice, good kill. Hey, John, good. I love you. Oh, oh no, uh, stormtrooper guy wrecked. It's gonna be close, fifty-one to ten. Yeah, this, they, they, they can make still, it back. Yeah, it's still anyone's game here. Twelve seconds. They really are. Yeah, nice. nice. Oh, it was a good hit. Yeah, you got him. I think maybe mm -hmm. Tubbin did. Jump off at the time, everybody. Jump no, off. It, it doesn't. You, this is just some suicide pack shit, John. One second. Frankly, it's fucked up. Here, I John. got him. I got him. Yeah. Oh. He did say he loves everyone, even Charles Manson. <laughs> Your words, John. <laughs> I do love Charles Manson. All right, I'm gonna do one more. He deserves more. love too. He's dead. What? Sorry. Since when? Man, I don't get his his thing. He had it all figured out. He was like, I just convinced a bunch of hot chicks in L.A. to just. Bang yeah. all day. Yep. We're just gonna live on a ranch, and then his stupid ass was like, "And murder." Yeah. No, just do the banging. Yeah, you really had it all. He was living in paradise. Well, do you think the driver of the bang bus will ever go on a murdering spree? Probably. They probably the already have. He's probably a serial killer. The more sex you have, the more people you've killed. Fact. Mm, never thought of it that way. Does it count if you're having sex after you killed the people? Wait, do you mean like necrophilia? I do. Yes. That's not necrophilia. They have count? To be, they Are have you to allowed be to morgue. count that sexual partners? Yeah, you still had sex with someone. And okay. just, they were dead and it wasn't consensual, but it was still sex. What if it was consensual? Yeah, what if they said it's okay? You can when fuck I'm my dead, corpse. You can fuck my corpse. Then it is consensual yes. necrophilia. Is that yes. legal? If so, yeah. if in their will they say, I want my husband. Is necrophilia no, illegal? No. Yes. Why? Because you're fucking a corpse. <laughs> but, like, why does that matter? <laughs> I mean, you're right. There's nothing wrong with that. If I was married and my like, I, I, you know, I got cancer. I'm gonna die. And my husband was like, "Listen, I want to continue just get to have one sex more with in. your corpse for at least a week." I'd be like, "All right, hey, I get it. Go for it." Well, um, I guess agree to disagree. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe well, it's one of those um, old-timey laws, so. like you're not allowed to walk your alligator in public. Yeah. You know, yeah. like one of those yeah. relics it's it's outdated. of a bygone era. Yeah. Human beings hold their remains in very high regard. Yeah, I don't. Throw me in the trash. <laughs> Have sex I with me. I don't care. <laughs> Do it if you want. <laughs> Cremation is almost as much energy and resources as burying someone in a casket. Yeah, it's supposed to be bad for the environment. Yeah, it's not great. Again, really? put me yeah. in the trash. Why oh, all the gas? Oh, There's one that it's like, it puts you in a bag of seed or some shit. Mm -hmm. So a plant grows your out corp, of you. Yeah, a tree grows out of your corpse. Blood basically. tree. Yeah. As my, it'll have my face on it. Now let me so stab you. So you can be like you. a long con stab. Stab. Mm -hmm. for environmentalists. Yep. Okay. Shank him! I'm trying, shank him I'm trying real hard. Nice. I think that I got him. Keep Think stabbing. That guy survived a long time. Stab Turbid. He's on our team. We don't want to do I'm that. I'm aware of that. But yeah, I don't know. I mm. had, I had always planned on getting yeah, cremated. Did pretty well there. Because I just wanted. I just don't want anything left. Yeah. I don't want anybody to be able to frame my frame me for a crime I didn't commit <laughs> using my dead body. <laughs> <laughs> but now I think I'm gonna have to bury myself oh! in the woods. But what I might do 
is I might leave a treasure map, like a very elaborate oh. treasure map to find me. If someone wants to say their goodbyes mm -hmm. or lay flowers, then they'd have to follow the treasure map. Would there be any reward, like? Me, I'm the reward. Well, and it's like this. <laughs> Because I'm only half buried in the ground. Oh, okay. <laughs> you drink molten gold. That's a good idea. Okay. Like one of those ant hills. Yeah. I'd be down for someone to molten my. If they could make me basically like Dr. Manhattan when he comes back the first time and it's just a brain and nerves and <laughs> eyeballs, that'd be cool. That did they, they, they did that in, in like the Chinese bodies exhibit. Uh, did, did you ever see that? It's all prisoners. It's like a lot of Chinese prisoners who didn't really sign up for it. Yeah. No, uh, get out of here with a hatchet! Really? No, Wayne, you can't no. Win. a dick punch! If you were gonna nice. be in the bodies exhibit, uh -huh. what, would you want to be like the one that's like playing football or whatever, like doing a Heisman? I'd want to be one oh. that shows oh. the how the digestive system works. Okay. okay. I'm eating a hamburger on the toilet. Oh, uh, like a human bodies exhibit, but with real human bodies. Well, no, that's what that the bodies is. exhibit is. The human bodies exhibit is real fucking dead people. All right. That's GTA. We done did it. I mean, it's an hour of recording. We said that dead. So, yeah, your guys' sweet uh, conversation about delts and Trats and Let, yeah, we were trats. talking about uh, lap pull downs. Pull downs. A guy at the gym today corrected my form, but I think that he was wrong. But I didn't have the heart That's to good. tell him. I didn't want to argue with him. I just do that. Okay. And then he was like, "You should lean back." So he was telling me to like do this. Mm -hmm. Two different exercises. And I was like, "Okay, well mm -hmm. I will, but I think that you're wrong." The nice thing to say in that situation is. Mind your own fucking business. Alana was like, some guy came and corrected my form. I was like, did you ask him to? And I, she was like, no. And I was like, then he's an asshole. <laughs> yeah. Whether or not he's right or wrong. So I have this at the gym a lot where I'll see a dude who's really muscly but has bad form. Yeah, he because it's because he does steroids. Because he, he doesn't so, have to do anything. And if he hurts himself, it doesn't matter because it heals in literally 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. Is that what steroids do? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's the point. That's, that's how steroids work. Your yeah. body Why heals faster. Why are we all just taking steroids? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> look at that machete. Alana, what are we playing today? I actually kind of yeah, like what, it. What are we doing? Uh, this is like something v sumo v something. Well, you sold right. me on it. Uh, but this is a lost man standing. Oh, Adam, don't, don't try. Adam, you may want to turn it yeah, off Adam first person. Adam may have gone off. I was handed the controller. Oh, so you go down there. You got it, Adam. You got it. Oh, you have to survive. Ah, uh, he's Ooh. out of the area. Wait, what happened? What did it, he's did back it, in the play area. launched you up? Just go down. No, I mean, it'll, yeah, so it'll knock me back well, up. Don't get hit. See? <laughs> oh, almost. Hold on. Are you supposed to be going I down? think you're supposed to go through the thing. You think that's where the fight's happening? You can't go up. So you gotta go down. Wait, didn't we think any Nama's last time was a hacker? Uh oh. Oh, no. So were we back. wrong? I did actually have people tweet me being like, you kicked me, dude, and I wasn't a hacker, dude. Mm -hmm. And I was like, sorry, dude. Sorry about your one hour on your Friday afternoon, my dude. So maybe it's whoever just survives the yeah, longest I think the in this. Yeah, I to not fall down here. This weird. There you go. Perfect. But now you're just gonna be eliminated. Yeah. Hold on, no, you can go up the ramp. Yeah, if I could turn, please. Oh, you don't get hit by that fan. Yep. Oh, oh that oh, was that fan, yeah. you got hit by it. <laughs> yep, oh, there it is. No, Ooh, it's still there. It's still in that way. Son, what are you doing? Still in the same 40 spot. Seconds. Go around it. For that fan. Go around no, it, Adam. Go you're turning it directly into yeah, it every there's time. There's a car in the way Adam, in which... Go around it. Don't go this way. You keep turning into it. Move your hands, please. Oh, my God. You have 30 seconds. I'm trying, man. Right, now, there you go. Now drive up All the hill. All right, you got it. This is not. Uh -huh. huh? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, nice. okay. You're back in the race. Oh, oh that fuck. was oh, just no. utterly no, reckless. No, no, you're good. Oh, you're good. You're good. You're good. good. Oh, you're good. Uh, I don't know. You can also is. get out of the car. This graphics are hurting my. Why is it turning into Borderlands? It was doing this before. GTA is getting better. Or worse? <laughs> is it possible for software to age? <laughs> <laughs> it is in the Matrix. That's true. Yeah, in the Matrix, they do that, get older. That mm. woman in the red dress gets all saggy titted. <laughs> oh, no. Is that the technical term? Saggy yeah, saggy titted, titted yeah. yeah. Do vaginas sag? Oh, yeah, they do. Oh, Why are you asking Idiot. us? I mean, continue. Oh. I don't think I'm old enough to have dealt with that. No, no, vaginal but, surgery is one of the most popular surgeries on the planet. I also because assume, vaginas uh, sag? I, ass, I assume that if, if I've seen my dad's penis in the shower, you've seen your, your mom's vagina Why in the is shower. this the second time today that I've heard about someone seeing the dad's dick in the shower? Because that's what happens. Because you went to the gym piece. earlier. But. That's what happens, though. When you shower with your dad uh, when you're a kid, you see his penis. I don't think I showered I know, with my dad I mean, when I was I a kid. I know what Bruce is talking about because it's a smart technique. You show your kid, your your young child, your dick. <laughs> we talked about this. So that way it seems big for the rest of their lives. You assert domination. Even if it's not. Alana, you must have seen your mother's vagina, right? I don't think so. 
Really? I don't shower with my mum. Oh, minigun. Yeah. Not even once? Yeah, come on, you must have done it once. Not that I recall. So, I so now just you just stand you over do. that hole and shoot down into it. Yeah, oh, parachute? Good. There's a parachute oh, over there. That's actually a really good idea. That's body armor. Go to the funnel and shoot down into it. Oh, no. <laughs> nice try, mate. Get, off, get off my hill! Yeah, nice try. Alana, have you, haven't you ever heard the term beef curtains? The thing is, I have I heard think, beef curtains. I don't, yeah, okay, all right. Well, that's what it I is. I don't know if the oh. vagina will just sag over time, mm -hmm. but a lot of women have babies and it destroys them. Yeah. I know that. Because yeah. they're supposed oh! to die. Oh, how did you not see that? Oh, you're talking, you you oh. had my attention. But you could still look around. Come on. You don't know about like a vagina literally sagging with age like balls do. Well, I mean, it must sag with age because if you use it enough, you're going to stretch it out a little bit, right? I yeah. also don't think that's true. Does your anus stretch the more you use it? Yeah. The yeah. more you poop? Yeah, of course it well, does. Well, poop is soft. Disc, yeah. Poop is soft. That's true. Penises are hard. Penises are very hard. That is true. And dildos and cucumbers and bottles, mm -hmm. whatever else you put up there. Yeah, lots of bottles. <laughs> Hairspray, I don't know. Hairspray, right. There's a high school in the city that I was from, all girls school, where cucumbers were banned because a girl got caught in the bathroom you, uh, just masturbating with a cucumber. You can't ban that sounds vegetables. Reasonable. So they banned cucumbers. That's no. reasonable. Yep. Get rid of them. It was a Christian What's school. What's next? Bananas? God does not approve. The banana proves God is real, according to a couple of idiots. That's yeah. right, because they <laughs> monkeys open it one way or whatever. Yeah. You ever seen a monkey do it in the wild? They do it the, the other way. Number one, you ever see a banana grow in the wild without science? <laughs> <laughs> it's filled with seeds and looks like trash and is impossible to eat. <laughs> and then number two. Oh, 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 oh it goes right no. down. That's what you want. Okay. You want to get through. Okay, get you got through. it. Oh, I like what Alana's doing. She's using strategy. Get through. Oh. Uh, I thought I had it there. Anyway, bananas? Bananas are stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. You're mocking me. That's what? funny. No, no, we're not. We're not. No, 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 mocking no, no. Christians. We're, 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 we're mocking Kurt Cameron. We're allowed to say bananas. Yeah. Why can't we say bananas? I love bananas. And tomatoes. Alana. Why yeah. can't we say banana? And oh, potatoes. Oh, oh, it was very close that time. Does that mean I should call you muck, muck, banana? Muck, muck. I'm sorry, Alana. Did you guys hear that uh, Rihanna? Mm -hmm. Said her name, so right. and uh -huh. it's pronounced Rihanna. I've been saying it right, but she has an accent. I'm just telling you the way yeah. she Wait, told other people to say it. people pronounce it? Rihanna. Rihanna. If I said my name Bruss, would you say Bruss? What? Yes, I would call you Bruss uh, no, if you said your name not. was Bruss. I think I would actually say you probably had a stroke. Oh, quite a hill. Oh, so you, you got, got it. Ooh. You got right over there. Right. There you go. All Reset right. the timer. Out of area. There is oh, also an slow. RPG there, I think. Oh, no! the part where I was like, you're not mocking me, right? We and then weren't. everyone just went hard on it. What hey. are these things floating on the aisle? Oh, there's a plane over there. Uh-oh, he's going to try and kill you. Yeah, he's gonna get, there's a, there's luck, a red sir. plane. Oh, shit. Oh, that was <laughs> reckless. Well, well, come on, come on, come on. That's what that was a weird about. thing yeah. that you did there. Did I get him, though? No. I think, did score one yeah, you did. You did. I, did. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's on Airplane over there. There's one up nice. there. Land your other air, Airplane up there. Oh, it's Aero because it's... Never mind. The Americans say Airplane. What do you say? Airplane. Aeroplane? Aeroplane? -E so you, because so you say more aero. syllables? That's inefficient. Yeah. Airplane. Yeah. Look, I know they got a lot of time in Australia. <laughs> what do you breathe? Yeah. Okay. But it's an aeroplane. Why would you waste time in what's what's the point of delineating <laughs> oh, no. between an airplane and an aeroplane? Well, it it it's aerodyna it's about <laughs> to yes. what aero is related air? to the way that it was engineered. They have us beat though for elevator and lift. Yeah. Do you say lift oh, in yeah, Australia or do you say fast? elevator? Here's the problem though. There's too lifts. many things yeah. that are lifts. Oh yeah, I didn't think about You that. could lift someone. You could lift weights. You could mm -hmm. lift weights. Yeah. You could give someone a lift. What does that mean? Press a button in an <laughs> elevator? Yeah. I you guess. need that. You need that word to yeah. Be specific. So that must confuse a lot of people. Are like, I'm gonna call a lift, and like, you're gonna call an elevator. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Willy Wonka. Yeah, it happens a lot. <laughs> a lot. Yeah, yeah, a lot. Time. I was doing a time, British actually. one. I, I wasn't in. Australia. That wasn't Australian. It's like cookies nah. and biscuits. I was driving through a McDonald's with someone <laughs> who was drunk, this. and they yeah. asked for biscuits and gravy, and I was right. like, what the fuck Why would is you ever wrong have with cookies you? And gravy? That's disgusting. Well, I'll, I'll concede that some people, because biscuits are generally, it's a. Morning time food? Yes. Biscuits and gravy should not be a morning time food. Oh, uh, but so I do good, think people, people use it as one, and yeah. that's not good. Isn't it's this where I go for plane? Yeah, yeah, keep yeah. going. That guy has a plane, so I don't know. There's if a plane respond. over there. There's a red plane over there. Can right. I get in the red plane? I see him flying around. So free. Oh, just, you gotta surprise this guy. Okay. Gotta, like for his go birthday? Get see you in hell! Oh, oh, shit. He just moved a little bit. Like, oh, I'll do oh, it. Oh, no, you, you got, got it. You got it. Oh, I did. Oh, yeah. it, was, it was Sandra. You killed Sandra. If you, it you was get it, to though. the plane, if you jump up, 
and then you go along that path, that long path, to jump out to okay, the so outer rim. Okay, so go to rim. the pink. Get, nice. in the, get, get in the pink. You sound like uh, high school us. <laughs> you sound like uh, present day us. If you get on that shit pink kick. one, yeah, what does that do? Then you can take that platform. It'll take you to the outer edge. Oh no! Oh, we gotta miss our all over. Now, James, what if she happens to fall down the hole again? I have no backup. Do you plan. think maybe oh. she's in the stink now? Pink in the stink? <laughs> is that what this is? This whole I call thing it is just punk. Uh, this is the stink. Ugh. The oh, pink boy. was up there. The oh, stink is boy. down here. Oh, there's only five seconds. seconds left. Hey, hey we right. did it. Yeah. James, 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 James. Hold on, hold your horses. <laughs> Just please get the plane. That's all we want to see. Also, Remember the part in the original Lion King when they're like, let's go to an elephant graveyard, but Nala's getting her ass licked by her mom. What? Yeah, I there's, do. There's ass eating in Lion King? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's I weird. It's like, what? I'm taking a bath. But she's like, says in a real sassy way, like Renana would say. <laughs> it's Rihanna. Oh. Ooh. What's my name? Rihanna. <laughs> Eat my ass. That's, That's my right. favorite of her songs. She's in Lion King. We brought it all back together. Is she? I didn't know that. I know Donald Glover is. Donald Beyonce Glover. is. You, you just saying that because she's black and no. <laughs> yeah. <I'm>... <laughs> oh. <laughs> I am DB Lion King. Yeah. Seth Rogen. Okay. Yeah, here we, go. we know he's Donald in Glover. it. Alfred Woodard. Billy Eichner. Eric Andre. Say, no, Rihanna. Confirmed racist. It's not a confirmed racist. There's just <laughs> a lot right, of names that hit you at one time. You I mean, he's right him. about that. Look, I understand why he made the mistake. Yeah, because sure. he's a racist. I'm going to say right now, Robert Pattinson is going to be the biggest Batman we've ever seen. The biggest like muscle-wise? No, Ben Affleck is the fattest Batman we've ever seen. Yeah. Well, I've already been they proven all got wrong. pretty muscly. Ben Affleck didn't. Ben he Affleck got, was okay. He just got in, alcohol. He was okay in Batman <laughs> v Superman, it. but Justice League, he was not. Yeah. He was wearing a spandex suit with muscles on it. <laughs> don't jump off. Please you don't, don't jump off. Get the, plane, get the plane, get the plane, get the plane. Landed. Okay. Could you imagine? Nope, your door's door. gone. <laughs> There's a little dent there on the- Hey! Hey! So if you do this, you got to go faster. Because last time you didn't you didn't go fast enough. Mm. Uh, he didn't. Okay. Oh, I'm not even on the right side. He, he went yeah, short. I can't went short. Do Why it. don't you just go right down the, the funnel? You know, and play it safe. <laughs> it's easy. Oh well, you turned into Gollum. <laughs> Everybody's trying what you're trying. Okay. Okay. Mm. No. That's okay. What I okay. To do, and then land it. Oh. Uh, and then land landed it. Landed it. See. And Flawless. Then I, now I'm perfectly mm. lined up. Uh, you didn't. You didn't get up speed. No, no. 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 I don't want full speed though. I want this much speed no. to get up there. A tiny bit more speed. How much are those? Um. Harry Potter wands cost fifty dollars. What Harry Potter wands? The electronic ones. Yeah, you buy them at the Universal Studios. Yeah, they're the electronic Harry Potter. Oh no, they're sixty. Thanks. So when you um, walk up to certain attractions at Universal Studios and you wave it, they have like a little infrared sensor that activates something and it looks like you did magic. Lawrence isn't here today because he's at the next version of Harry Potter World, Star Wars Land. That's right. Yeah. This should end one way. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Oh. There we go, you got him. You got him. Cool. <laughs> Alright, your job oh, here no. is done. Also dead. No, he's not dead yet. Oh, come on. Hey, do you there think uh, do you think Lawrence is building a lightsaber right now? Uh definitely he is. Yeah. Well yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Lawrence has also drank, I wanna say five tiki drinks. Already? Even though it checks out, yeah. Well, even though he's not even there aren't tiki drinks in Star Wars. <laughs> so, They'll yeah. find a way. Uh, yeah. They're like blue milk tiki bar. Yeah. I feel like that's something. What? To What's get up this way. Mm, I don't know about that dog. You gonna try and walk it? No. Ooh, that's dangerous. Oh, there. I don't oh. Oh no. Oh. You, you got this. There's no way. I feel it. There you go. Yeah. Oh wait. You're doing yeah, you great. Lost you're doing great. Doing I mean good. like just keep keep doing it. No one's gonna shoot Ooh. you. They don't even know you're there. Look at this, huh? Yeah. You're doing great. Oh, Doing great. Oh, you're doing it. Oh, oh why'd you do that? Oh, I told you, you the first person. I didn't turn that way. Oh no. Land it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> he should have started running. <laughs> he still landed it. It was just yeah. with his face. I saw somebody like, "Where's Lawrence?" That he's at Star Wars Land yep. building a lightsaber, and I was bringing that up. That Guys, can we start I was going to ask the question. Galaxy's Edge. I'm sorry, Galaxy's Edge. Galaxy's Thank you. Right. Galaxy's Star Wars. Go ahead. Land. Go ahead. Finish your story. I want to hear your story. Everyone's going to call it Star Wars Land. Yeah, yeah. To the end of time. Galaxy's Edge. The same way we're going to call it. Um, Rihanna. Live, die, repeat. Oh. Oh. I was gonna ask, does the lightsaber do anything? No. Oh. It lights up. It God, that's magic. gotta be such a profit. Just uh, an absurd they cost, profit. They cost about $250. Yeah, so they I probably saw. cost well, 20 much, bucks to make. Yeah, I was gonna say, how much do they cost to make? I'm gonna say $13. It can't yeah. be that much. You do pick your own kyber day. crystal. Well, also there are $42 no. cocktails. Okay. No. What? Yes, there are. The be my favorite part about Trinidine? all this <laughs> is that the, the middle class is suffocating to death. Yeah. Yeah. Under fin financial strain. Cocktails. But I guess we're we're already living in a world where people are going to be working 
every single day until the day they keel over and die. Two hundred dollar lightsabers and forty two dollar cocktails. Yeah. But look at how cool that is. I mean, it looks awesome. Yeah. There's I mean, no one there though. It's not gonna look like that when they're right. there. I'm gonna yeah. go. Where is it? Yeah, yeah you're right. Because there's gonna be a thousand people. Give your forty-two dollar drink and a Wookie walk. Yeah. Oh, 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 fuck! Carbon freeze. That just looks like beer. That's a. Well, no, I mean, that's, a, that's oh, dry ice. Okay, it's doing something. Lawrence has that right now. Yeah. Right now he's drinking that. I'm going best play. of five. Let's do this. All right. I'm in. Wow. All right. Bruce driving a car. I'm doing it. To the right. Where did you oh, think the road was? No, <laughs> I wasn't sure. <laughs> just quit out. We're done here. He was so confident, but didn't Wait, watch. Wait, hold on. <laughs> you did not even come off the gas <laughs> Oh, look at that perfect landing. All right. Guys, I have a, a reveal at the end of this. <gasps> There's a reason that I sound weird and have mush mouth. Dentures? Oh, I've been wearing fake teeth the whole time. Oh. Take those what? out. Put them back in right yeah. now. Oh, yeah, dude. Put them back in right now. It make me gag. So put them. You, you have to. On? You kept to put those in for like 22 hours a day. In 22 hours a day. And oh. taking them out, your sh teeth they're already shifting back. No teeth. They make me gag. <laughs> uh, I really fought it. My hands up. Doing what? Bicep curls. Oh, like calluses, yeah. or, or is it a bruise? Yeah. Fighting. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. The whole, the whole thing came off. You do off. have permanent calluses. Yeah. That's wild. I'm gonna start wearing gloves, I think. Just callus them up. The only problem with calluses is that they can get caught. Like, that's what happened to this, is like the callus will, is so strong that the rest of the skin around it is weaker, so it basically ripped a circle around Yikes. the callus, but the callus is still there. Did it bleed, or was it? Oh, yeah. Ugh. Oh, sorry, Lana, what are we playing today? <laughs> uh, this is just a death match. It has an illegible name, because a lot of them do. Oh! Welcome to Grand Theft Auto. Why don't yeah, you just start right. shooting at people from there? What? He's you, trying to get to the top. Can I see somebody? Oh. Oh. Who are you, stranger? Oh. Oh, it's a friend, it's a friend. Oh, oh you, you gotta go. move! You that means go. you gotta move, Adam. Whoa. You gotta right there. What happened there? Oh, they're everywhere! Yeah, but- Start shooting down on everybody, rain them! Oh, you gonna it's snipe them? Not with that. No, shoot, shoot your rockets, man. I don't know, I think yeah, the sniper is a cool. One shot. Boom. No. His aim's terrible, but- soccer ball. What? It may be a good guy or a bad guy, but I'm not sure. Either way, fire at him. Lead him. It's three of them. Damn. Oh, that was a great shot, yeah, though. They can probably see it coming from a long way away. Well, they don't know that it's coming from above them, do Dang they? Dang it. Oh, they reacted a, a minute ago. Um, well, I guess just... Here we are. Yeah. I mean, I can probably just, like, land on one of these platforms. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's true. There we go. Okay. Oh, nice. Wow, that was actually pretty sick. <laughs> <laughs> um, dying you make that. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, that was for nothing. Nope. Miss. That's okay. Right. Now he knows you're there. Now fire in front he of him. He feels threatened. Oh, come on, he's gonna reverse. He'll be erratic because he feels fire. threatened. Oh, oh, you got it once. It doesn't matter because this, this thing's indestructible. Ow. Hey, how is he not? There's you're somebody behind you? Pick, 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 pick. Yeah, I think. Ow. Yeah, oh. he was hitting you. I think you got stabbed to death. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Could you imagine living in a world where you don't know you're getting stabbed? <laughs> you know that people have been struck by lightning and lose all sense of pain? Like a superhero? <laughs> Isn't that cool? Wow. They can do whatever I they mean, want. I mean, it's not cool. No, it's probably terrible. It would probably be very difficult. If you can't feel pain, you probably also can't feel pleasure. But imagine if you broke your leg and could still go on. That's well, a but James that's the Bond issue is, is if you can't feel pain, then you would just repeatedly hurt yourself and not know. Like you could burn your hand and not know what exactly. Was How cool is that? Watch out! Oh, mm -hmm. too we all miss. Oh. Loser. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 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 gonna say right now, I'd rather not feel pain. Even if it meant not I feeling pleasure. What? I mean, oh no, I didn't say that. No. Well, yeah. <laughs> I only get pleasure. Aren't there people who can't I orgasm guess... anyway? I don't think you know about most of them. I mean, eh. yes, I had a girlfriend once that couldn't orgasm, <laughs> <laughs> and then right after we broke up, she told me she had an orgasm. Yeah, I cured her. <laughs> How do you think people figured out that you can eat, like, blue cheese? I've realized human beings have been around for a really, really long time and spend most of their lives being bored. This is not... Yeah, they're experimenting. And so, generations and generations of people will be like, no, I'm gonna figure out this fucking cheese thing. Okay. Why do you think people eat ass? But I think blue cheese is kind of an exception in that it's like, oh, it's cheese, it's definitely moldy, I'll try it. Hmm, it tastes disgusting, but what if we keep eating it anyway? Well, mm. some people like the taste. You tell me right now, what what don't you like to eat? I don't like mushrooms. Do you like eating ass? I've never eaten ass. Okay, well, yet. you might like One eating day, ass, but you don't like mushrooms to eat their own. Be yeah. like your forefathers and experiment mm. to you eat drink, their own. You might find out you like monkey wine. I've just never dated anyone what who asked me to wine? eat their ox. Thank you for asking, Oh, Adam. see, so no one's asked. <laughs> no, if I, if I was seeing someone who was like, I just, I really need this one thing from you, then maybe mm. I'd consider Ow. it. What if you just put alcohol in it first? If That'll affect the taste. If their yeah, butthole is puckering, then they might have poop in there, so they also have to give themselves an enema. Ew. Oh, turbid. <laughs>
<laughs> this episode is brought to you by ass and the act of eating it. Monkey wine. Oh, What's yeah. monkey wine? Is monkeys take fruit and they'll hide it in trees. Oh. But under certain scenarios, the fruit will sit there for so long that it'll ferment. Oh. And when you come back, you dig it out of the tree, you get monkey wine. Well, wait. Do the, apparently it tastes terrible. Do the, well, of course it does. But do you the, can get trashed. Do the, monkey, do the monkeys drink it and get trashed? Yeah, yeah. That's awesome. Oh, monkeys, monkeys out there getting trashed? You ever see drunk, uh, like, squirrels or something? No. no. Let's go, let's go! Look at this, huh? Squat up. Da, 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 da. Dun, 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 dun. Dun. Oh! Got it, got it, got it, got it! Ooh, you got it! Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, sorry, oh I, bro. No, 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 I didn't mean to do that. I didn't sorry, mean to do that. Bro. Oh, dead. Oh, you killed him. All right, good. Hey! Wait, is that a good guy or a bad guy that I just... Ran over. I mean, did it ever stop you before? Oh, okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Oh, the three of them. Oh yeah. Boom. Oh, da, 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 da. Ten years ago, this crack commando unit was sent to prison by a military court for crimes they didn't commit. These men promptly escaped from the maximum security blockade to the Los Angeles underground, where they play video games all day. Let's go, let's go! Look at this, huh? Today, still wanted by the government, they survive as soldiers of GTA. If you have a problem, if no one else can help, and if you can put up with the smell of Bruce's farts, maybe you can hire the A-Team. Ah, nice, Alana, get into the spirit. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Here, hop in. He's dead. Yeah. Oh, look at the blood streak. <laughs> There's no Bruce and team. I'm the A-team. I mean, oh, wait. Da, da, da. Shoot him! I don't care. Shoot him! No, no, no. Bruce, I didn't, oh. Oh. I didn't oh. do any of that. I know. I was you... worried that you would, though. Classic episode of the A-team. Nah. What are they doing? Why did they jump out of my car? Well, there wasn't a lot of exciting stuff going on in your vehicle, so. Oh! Someone's oh. dead. Oh. Seth. oh, he's gone. Seth, get in. Oh, he's Seth. gone. No, he's alive. No, he's, he's alive. alive. Seth, what are you oh. doing? Seth, get in. Get up. Get up. Uh, throw his dirt. Oh, uh, Seth. Shit. I think that one oh. got him. Yeah. No. Nope. Oh, no. No. No, he's, he's still he's there. Now he's dead. dead. Now. Nope. Wait, his Seth. name's still there. He's Seth. still going. Seth. <laughs> Seth. He's okay. <laughs> Seth! He's all right. <laughs> He's dead. Oh. Give him time. I see I see the man. There he is. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Uh-oh. Oh. He felt that breeze, though, huh? Come on. Oh, oh he killed himself. Oh. He, definitely did. he definitely killed himself. Everybody <laughs> hurt. Oh, wow. You see him high stepping yeah. down. The I'm a hero. Keep in mind, you were in that car the entire video. I know. I've been True. doing great. Yeah. Thank you. Agreed. It's fine. Just saying, you can break it. Yeah, I don't right think up. so, bud. Oh, Game's over. Fucking loser. Yeah. That's because I'm the best. What? Uh, who's who's next? Four this kills, is, huh? This is awkward. Well, I guess we should leave. Where am I on the leaderboard? Down there at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Very bottom. That's at the bottom. It's highlighted. Maybe I should do one more. I'll just make it short. Oh, yeah, do one okay. more. That's fine. Fuck it. We can literally talk about anything. And we can win over and over and over, just like we've been doing. Woo! I need a fool, mate. Look, when I feel like I'm a winner, that means I'm a winner. It's true. Did you feel like a winner when that girlfriend was telling you that she can't come? <laughs> Every time, because I came. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's known. A lot. Most women cannot orgasm. None of most of them can't. Yeah. We say this in every it's, GTA. Well, it's, I know, it's but it's known. It's <laughs> school doesn't do focus it. they all do on it. the female orgasm enough, so a lot of women don't know that they're unable to have an orgasm. Mm. Mm -hmm. You know who does focus on the female orgasm? Your old pal Bruce. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. What's the uh, the oral etiquette? So we get the oral. That's yeah. the oral etiquette. Oh, who goes first? There is no first. Yeah. We get it, and that's it. <laughs> Yep, every time. If Bruce can't cause one, mm. nobody can. That's fair. <laughs> Got it. If you're like, I'm not like the only cause. one edging here. Cause. Sure, but I might drop out of this after What if you just it. shifted? Shut up! I'll <laughs> do it to make you come! Yeah. I'll cause it! I'm gonna hit that J spot before you know it hits you. Open up your buttholes. What? I got a okay. bounce. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Bruce, it's actually the shut your mouth! <laughs> just let me do my work! <laughs> yeah. I'm almost done making you orgasm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> Isn't that right? Yeah, that's how it goes. Yes. It's a man's pleasure that turns a woman on more than anything else. <laughs> uh, Can we have one of those? Queer eye conversations where they talk about their feelings yeah, while they're be, driving. Be a great oh, with driver. the hot one. The hot one. They're all the hot. Yeah. Ones. Who do you the think is the hot one, one in uh, Queer Eye? 
All of them. All of them. They're all beautiful men. Yeah. Well, that is true. No, there's the hottest one. Really? All right, it's, yeah. Who does everyone... It's Karamo. Come That's on. Karamo? exactly. It's Karamo. Whatever. Absolutely, it is Karamo. <laughs> well, Anna, who do you think is the hottest one? Kamara. Karamo. 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 Who's the... I, she said it wrong with that. I, I know. Did. Who's the hot number on yeah. uh, Game of Thrones? Jonathan Van Jonathan Van yeah. JVN. Yeah. Wait, you think he's Jonathan's just, the hot one? Shit, I blew my being attracted to him is not fair. Because he's... Yeah. Because he's so effeminate. Yeah. That it's just like being attracted to a woman with a beard. I just... Oh, get him! I just find him entertaining. But which one do you want to fuck? Um, I'm, I'm just not well, really in a... I'm gonna say man. I don't want to fuck any of them. Oh, that's but disappointing. I'm gonna say Antony, I guess. Antony is pretty ripped. Like, he's, mm -hmm. he's thin, but he's... He's got like not an ounce of fat on him. I think if women get below like 16%, they stop having periods and it's like a mess. Yeah, no, well, women's supposed to have a higher body weight. Yeah, yeah, way higher. Alana, have you ever Shred. thought about that? How if you wanted to stop having periods, you could just lose a lot of weight? It's so easy. Yeah. Well, I actually get an injection every three months that prevents me from getting them anyway. Well, how do I get rid of my poop period that happens every day? Your what? You mean your. I mean, that also works. If you dropped enough weight, you'd stop pooping. That's, That's true. true. You just eat wait. vitamins. Well, no, if I take too many vitamins, I have a worse poop period. Well, if not, there's nothing in you. Yeah. You'd just be a vitamin drip. Yeah. You'd only pee. And it's just yeah. The only time I ever like feel a... like I have a poop period is after drinking a lot of alcohol. You're lucky. You don't just, need just, no spicy food. <laughs> just right, for the record, we're talking about blood coming out of your anus, right? Oh, no. no. I was just talking oh. about, just like, talking about like a liquid. really, yeah. An excessive liquid. poop. Oh, man. Jesus. <laughs> Online's Holy working man. today. On live is working today? I said online. Oh. Can you imagine? What could be more exciting than on live coming back to battle the giant behemoth that is Google Stadia? Out of business. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Stadium Arcadium. It's Stadium Arcadium. One of the best albums ever made. Best albums ever made. I was not Ugh. joking. I was not serious. I've never seen the Peppers. <laughs> the Peps? <laughs> They're not, not called the Peppers. The hot Peps? <laughs> yeah. In the community, they call them the Peppers. You know how many Show Peppers shows have been doing? How many? I want to say five. And there's a man that introduces the show and he says, Wait till you see Anthony Kiedis and these peppers. And they're backstage right now. And they're peppers. Gonna come in. Yeah, these yeah. peppers. You didn't purchase super heavy armor. Super heavy armor? So my oh. mouth's all fucked up because of these stupid fucking plastic it's teeth cool, I got in my man. face. It's cool, man. No, it's fine. I hate them. Haven't you ever noticed my now. face looks like this? <laughs> I haven't. That's where I'm I, around, aren't I? Uh, Lana, what are we playing today? This is a Lost Man Standing that's like called SIB something special 2019 something something. All right. Because they all have do? really dumb names. Yeah. Definitely special. I guess we'll find out. I think Tubb had picked this one too, so blame Tubb if what it's bad. What do you mean Tubb had picked this one? Yeah, he sent it to me. He's doing research for us now? You have yeah, private correspondence with Tubb? It's kind of a full-time job. He, he <laughs> uh, regularly sends me maps. Wow. Okay. Yeah, he's great. Stop messaging my friend Alana. Yeah, uh, message Bruce. Not, not <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, well, I don't understand your problem. I oh, feel jealous. I'm on a, a terrorist train Whoa, course. Whoa, careful. That looked like it was a PG ana or J a JPEG <laughs> animated. <in. laughs> don't get I hit like by the car. these kind of ones. Yeah, yeah, monkey bars, monkey bars. These are actually really fun. What's it called? The uh, obstacle American courses? Ninja Warrior? It's called an, an obstacle course, yeah, you're Alana. Right, you're right. An obstinance course. An abstinence course. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Good thing people are really bad at driving yeah. cars. Did we win? You won. Did you win? Uh... What happened? I got into the car. Well, I have a gun now. You have an atomizer. That's cool. When did, when did this gun come out? Oh, uh, cool. I got in a Tesla for the first time the other day. And? Uh, I didn't know how to open the door. Oh, yeah. The, hmm. the, little, the little things pop out, right? The little, uh... When they press the button, the things pop out, the... I don't know, he just opened the door for me, so... Where am I going? Wait, who's he? You don't want to talk about it. Oh, hang on. Somebody besides me. Is it a ride chair? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Absolutely it was, yeah. You're cheating on me with another ride chair! <laughs> oh, hey, Alana, I know we you won. mentioned those two tickets to the Peppers concert, and yes, I will concert. go with you. It's chili I will, Peppers. I will be the one to go with you. Chili Peppers. And also, she's my friend, and only my friend, and she's taking me. Did you get an email about the Peppers concert? <laughs> the or? Chili Peppers? RHCP? No, peppers to the fans. <laughs> Name yeah, another yeah, band well. member besides Anthony Kiedis. John Frusciante. Damn it. Name another one. Flea. Fuck. Here you go, Alana. Why, thank you. <laughs> I didn't hand it to you to give to Alana. Yeah, it was like very <laughs> weird to me, but I'll I'm take it. I'm not going to play. Alisa's yeah, going to play. Yeah, uh, I know. We're best friends. Is there I, no other band that we can name all the band members of? Like the Red Hot Chili Peppers? We pepper? must. If we think hard enough, we'll come up with the Peppers drummer. I know it. Is uh, Dave Matthews' band just one guy? <laughs> no, it's you wish. 17 yeah, I was just saying, yeah. name any one of them. You pronounce it no. way wrong, too. It's Dave Matthews' band. <laughs> no, it's not. Is yes, it really? it is. Yeah, Dave it's Matthews his band. band. Okay, well, aren't there some bands where it really is only just one person? Like, I feel like... John um, Mayer? Uh, Nine Inch Nails. Good Trent point. Trent Reznor, yeah. yeah. I mean, I think it's just him and Andrew WK that I can think of where they just produce all the music themselves, but then they need... Uh, they need... 
They need folks. Band. They go. Unless he's gonna have like a giant drum and a harmonica in his mouth like all those dudes on the oh, street. Oh, like a one-man band. Yeah. That's what Trent Reznor said he wants to do. <laughs> I wish he would do a one-man band. I'm tired of his industrial goth garbage. I love Trent Reznor. He's great, actually. Yeah, Academy Award-winning uh, billionaire. He makes great music. He's fantastic. He's I love the him. president of Apple Music. I also music. saw him on a flight. Oh. He seemed like a really nice man, but either way. Oh, well, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> you said you saw him on a flight and he seemed nice. What he, does he nice like, look he like? He saw an interaction with him yeah. and a stranger. But can, you think you, you could see a human and be like, they seem nice. What what does that require? So, for example, have I told this story on about uh, Dennis Quaid? Well, you better not oh, have, because yeah. if I, you tell a story yeah, twice, we will kill you. This is when he yells at the. Or he goes, "Do you he, know who he I didn't, am?" He didn't yell. He was very nice, but also it was really sad because <laughs> he was trying to get upgraded to first class. Because uh-huh. and he went like he was like, "Yeah, you know, like uh, my family's back there, but is there any way?" And also, he was leaving his family behind to go to first class. Just no. to get that. Um, yeah. And he's like, he's like, "Yeah, you know, like is, is there any way I could get a first class?" seat because like people are recognizing mm-hmm. me and blah 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 and the American Airlines uh, oh. flight attendant to their credit was like I'm sorry sir uh, you don't have an upgrade so we can't do that mm-hmm. and and he went like this he went yeah but mm. and he shrugged and she went no I'm sorry sir and I was like oh, oh Dennis Quaid I'm oh, so yeah. sorry I was sitting in first class at the time because I had gotten upgraded <laughs> 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 and I was like wow do you think if you had offered Dennis Quaid your seat to switch he would have taken it and you would have sat next to his family <laughs> <laughs> you would have become the father of his kids. You're like, I got some movies on my phone we can watch. Dragonheart, uh, Enemy Mine. Yeah, what other, By what the other end movies? of the flight, uh, we would be calling you dad and, the, and him <laughs> Uncle Dennis. <laughs> um, Stolen his family God. like like Russell uh, Crowe stole Meg Ryan from him. That's what I like about Russell Crowe. He takes what he wants. Mm-hmm. Well, that, that's what Angelina Jolie did to uh, Brad, Brad Pitt and, when uh, Brad was, uh, mar- was it married or dating He's Jennifer, married to Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer Aniston, Aniston right? Years. Yeah. But what is Hollywood marriage, really? I mean, they got married and had a bunch of kids. They well, adopt. Yes. I That's think they might have had, like, four, maybe. They have, they have, like, three biological kids. Prove it. <laughs> it's the white ones. <laughs> the racism in this conversation. <laughs> There's no racism. They were, Why are you crying? Don't <laughs> cry about white. this. Uh, Alana, she's laughing at her own joke about white people. She's <laughs> choking on her supersized soda. <laughs> <laughs> Just drink more soda, Alana. It's right there. It's huge. By the way, for the audience, Dennis Quaid is an old actor. That's all I've got for you. He's Randy Quaid's brother. Audience, Randy Quaid is an old actor. <laughs> He's Roseanne's ex-husband. Audience, Roseanne Barr is an old actress. Racist. She said something racist when she was on Ambien, which happens to everybody. Uh, uh, has anybody in here have, ever taken Ambien before? No. Yeah. I've actually taken it, and it makes you sleep like a motherfucker. But also... It makes you sleepwalk and hallucinate. <laughs> uh, and tweet things. Uh, I don't know about tweeting things. Okay. I don't know that I ever would have done that on Ambient. But I definitely walked around and felt like I was in a waking uh-huh. nightmare. But then when I slept, I felt great. Okay. <laughs> so well, I, w- I woke up non-drowsy. It was awesome. I did something similar. I had to wear one of those hair nets <laughs> last night because I had a bunch of oil in my hair because my dermatologist is like, stop having dandruff, you oh. sick fuck. Uh, <laughs> me with your That's incredible fine. stories. He's got a fucked up head. Okay. I got a fucked up mouth. I have a question for you guys about soap, bars of soap. Yeah. Do me. you do you do this with the bar of soap and then put it down? Or do you actually put the bar of soap to your body and clean? I put it to my body. I put it clean. to my body, yeah. Do you put it to your body as well? Embarrassingly, I use a loofah. I think that's the correct that's way fine. to do James it. James uses the loofah, too. Loofahs are fine. No, no. I'm asking only about bar soap. To be fair, it was Nothing gifted to me in an gay. X body wash gift set. Nothing wrong with being gay. If you put a bar of soap to your body, yeah. doesn't it make the bar of soap dirty? Soap is self-cleaning. Jerry Seinfeld already solved this, I like, right. think, 20 years ago. I mean, it, it is the... Sol- he's not a doctor. Because <laughs> imagine if you jammed it up your, like, your ass crack and then used it. And then use it to done. also well, wipe I mean, your it's face. It's the perfect shape to I go mean, in your ass. I always wash my butt last with the so- bar I do, of soap. I do too. I do too. Uh, but I, I also don't use the bar of soap. Because I feel like time heals all stuff <laughs> by the time I'm going to use the soap again. Yeah. And you're supposed to douche. I do douche. Are I have you a supposed second, to douche? I have a you're, second shower. If you really care. You're not supposed to douche their vaginas. I thought, yeah, I thought that was bad, bad for you. Wait, they are? Well, how can they no, sell douche? Not. You're not. Oh, I'm sorry. They're not. How can they sell douche then? Because men control that industry. Wait a minute. Men control the douche industry? Yes. How do I get in on that industry? Expose. I gotta right start now. selling douche. This Bruce is, why, is douche. This is why you've been trying to befriend all the women in the office. <laughs> oh, that's office. You, you need to douche? buy your douches. <laughs> when I walk up douche. to you, I was like, at least I got this new brand new douche I'm making. You want you want some douche? Is there not a different name for an anal douche? I mean, you can get a bidet. That's an enema. Uh, <laughs> it's Adam uh, is the other name. <laughs> 
You know I'm so close to you. You know I'm so close to Everyone you. Everyone was talking. I missed the joke. You Nothing. always say that, by the way, after you say a joke about somebody. You say, yeah. no, I'm your best friend. How much are you are you running these douches for? How much does douche run normally? I don't know because you're not supposed to use them, so I don't buy them. A douche has got to be like 30 bucks, maybe? $30? <laughs> it's just water in a tube. I'll give you small douche for $10, medium douche for $20, <laughs> large douche for $25. Is, is a douche reusable? Can you use it more than once? Yes! <laughs> Will it make me feel more confident? You bet! Bruce's douches <laughs> will make you feel the most confident woman you possibly can because you'll have me directly up inside you. Right now, you smell like vinegar, but you don't want to smell like vinegar. You want to smell like Bruce's douche. Can I use it in my anus, too? Uh, what? Are you talking about your butthole? Yeah! Yes, you can! That's Bruce's anus douches! <laughs> Isn't it a bottle that you squeeze up into you? I don't know because I've never used one because you're not supposed to use them. Almost one in five women oh, uses a douche. Yeah. Well, that's what they look like. That's yeah. just an enema <laughs> for your vagina. I can't wait for all the men in the comments to tell me that you're supposed to use douches. <laughs> it's going to be great. Can douche you Google if, if whether or not we should be using douche? Should you use douche? Most doctors yeah. recommend that women do not douche. Yeah. Apparently, you have to make sure women have the correct natural acidity for a healthy vagina. You are putting your dick in a pocket of acid. Hell yeah, <laughs> okay, I am over says, and over. Yeah. I'm going to make some more acid inside you, if you know what I'm saying. Douche can change the necessary balance of vaginal flora. Mm. What do you say to that, Bruce's douches? Are you off balance for Bruce's douches? <laughs> well, then you should buy vaginal flora. Ew, what is that thing? That's vaginal flora. Blech. That's the stuff that you eat. Douche that out. Let's play GTA. No. I was at an airport once and saw Kevin Costner, as you guys know. He's a huge mm -hmm. movie. He's very handsome. He like was a I huge never movie thought star. Kevin Costner was anything to write home about until oh. I saw him in person, and I mm. thought that's a handsome man. Would you have then, because of his appearance, uh, slept with him? Oh, so you don't hear that very often. I don't get to ask Elise what she's attracted to very often. Mm -hmm. Apparently, old things. <laughs> Alana, which version of Kevin Costner would you sleep with? Field of Dreams. I, I can't answer that question. Alana, you know who Kevin Costner is, right? No. You really? don't? You have to know who Kevin I'm, is. Like, I might. I knew How do she I spell his know. last name? Uh, audience, just so you guys know, Kevin Costner is an old actor. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know this dude. Oh, thank God. All right. He was the father of Superman. No, son, I have to teach you a lesson by going up this tornado. He goes, no, you don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> I saw Justin True. Bieber very up close, and it was maybe like 2010. Mm. Most beautiful girl I've ever seen in my Hello. life. No, I mean, he was he was just, like, stunning looking. Mm -hmm. Like, his face was... Yep, you know why? Because they're perfectly more. symmetrical. Mm -hmm. uh, you know who's not perfectly symmetrical? Your old pal Bruce. Bruce. Wait, I thought we were doing a race. Like... Hey, I'll do it. Okay. Yeah, we don't have any races. <laughs> what are we doing? Oh. Wait. oh, wait, we already did this, Alana. Uh, we, I think we've done one that looks extremely similar All to All right, okay. I'll do it again. Here Turbid, we go. would know. Uh, <laughs> okay, but if right. we... Get him, Bruce. I'm pressing the button. There we go. Oh, there he is, there he is. I, I, pressed, mean, I pressed B. I think we've, we've already established that we can... Play the wrong gameplay Oosh. footage. I've also just like it's been hard because I have to get Lawrence to bookmark all of them, and you know Lawrence has job, so. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to use Lawrence as a camera. Oh, no, that okay. right in the face. Watch this. Bang! Oh! Oh! Yes. <laughs> Damn it! You could try shooting. No, I no, like no, hitting. No. Watch this. The heavy hitter, much like uh, most of the, the All Star lineup. Watch this and feel the dreams. <laughs> oh, coming oh, up! Run, run, run. you. I know. If. Okay, Alon, if I was going to pitch a movie to you, yes, sir. circa 1992, I okay, guess, yeah. Whoa. I and it's called Field of Dreams, and it's starring Kevin Costner, what do you think the plot's about? It's a movie that is, it's a Christmas movie, no. and Ooh. it's about a football match, and mm -hmm. a family who, um, <laughs> Such just, a uh, they have a shitty a, mm -hmm. a kid, and they want him to be a good footballer. That's a great idea, but we're going to go with the one where a guy makes a baseball field in his backyard so his dead dad will come back. Ooh. Okay. Well, he makes it so Shoeless Joe Jackson and the Yankees can play on <laughs> oh, it. Oh, do you know who Shoeless but Joe Jackson ultimately, is? Ultimately. You ever hear that, that famous phrase, build it and they will come? Yeah. That's from Dragonheart. If you build it, he will come. If you build it, <laughs> they will come. Oh, come on! Moonlight Graham. That's what I always think of. Is that from Field of Dreams? Yeah, what's his face? Mufasa, what's his name? James, James Earl, Earl Jones. Jones? Moonlight Graham. Alana, don't watch that movie. Why? Because you cry? it doesn't matter. Oh. Uh, no, it's a good movie. It literally doesn't matter. What do you mean? I mean, I saw it a hundred times and it doesn't matter. Baseball Sorry. movies, whether it be Rookie of the Year or <laughs> Angels in the Outfield, will always make you cry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Baseball does make me cry every time. Yeah. Is it because you're so bored? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No, it, no. Suck it, baseball burn. Nope. Who's going to get there? It's going to be Pence who slides, makes the catch, 
Goes home, and they got him! You guys know that when I go on planes, I put on the end of Rudy just to feel something. Oh, I yeah. love that yeah, every movie. time I fly. It's the, always on American. The first two hours of that movie is really boring, but then the, mm -hmm. the last half hour is amazing. All right, Alana, I got another movie pitch for you. Okay. Oh, we no. take one of the hobbits when he was younger and better looking? Okay. He is a runt. His name's Rudy. Can't play football for shit. The friend's but, a janitor. But he wants to play for a college sports team because it's his dream. Even though he's like shitty short kid. That's shitty short. And the whole movie builds uh -huh. up to one moment where he gets a sack when the team's already winning by... Are they up or are they down? They're like way up. Oh, anyway, yeah, that's right. who's your favorite Lord of the Rings character? <laughs> <laughs> that's a more timely conversation than the Rudy. Probably Alwyn. No, the correct answer is the mouth of Sauron. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's seen Xander, right? We've all been there. Obviously, it's all the yes. good stuff. There's a part where Strider, Aragon, he's like, you know, I'm like 180 years old. 87. And you can Ooh. see the part where the editor went, we should probably cut this. Well, she doesn't the Duna Dane usually live around like 200 <laughs> years? Humans? Duna Dane. You're saying. Doesn't matter. We're talking about Rudy? <laughs> oh! Oh, Alien got me. Oh! Fuck! Watch this. Thanks for your trailer. Oh. I got him. You did get him. You right? Did. Yeah. Did. did he murder? No. Just John Landis. That lineage is. John Landis, uh, for all of our audience out there, John Landis. <laughs> I know who John Landis is. Oh, you do. Fantastic. Really? Yeah. He's what an old director. He killed two people in a Twilight Zone movie. He didn't. The helicopter, helicopter pilot killed him. I just wonder how weird it is that <laughs> you could call action on someone's death. Yeah. Like you're behind the camera, you go and action, yeah. and then that thing had to go. Cut. I gotta go. You guys remember in Red Dragon when mm -hmm. uh, he makes that blind woman give him a blowjob? I saw Dark Phoenix last night. Yeah. No. Woof. But there's a scene in that movie involving Professor <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sorry, who's laughing about Professor, Professor Xavier? Xavier I love and it. his legs that Aww. cracked me up. I was, okay. was, it, was it supposed to make you laugh? Though? I don't think so, Aww. but it's hilarious. What possessed you guys to see Dark Phoenix? Um, because it's the last one. Good for you. I wonder if they had to mean like, guys, we could really impress Disney. They're buying us. We could knock this one out of the fucking park. No, they don't give a and shit. And they're, they're gonna let us work on X Men. And they said, Nah, let's just fart something out. Yeah, and they go took home. their paychecks. Ambien is awesome. What if you're like Elise and I, where you have a crippling uh, addiction, or I'm sorry, dependence on z -Quil. non Non-habit forming. At some point, my piss is gonna sorry. turn purple. <laughs> do you guys have the z hangover afterwards? Because I always do. No, I've, no. I'm past it now. Oh, Once again, the bottle says non-habit forming, but... You've been taking it for years. <laughs> James always says, like, he's like, non-habit forming, but you need it to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> That's like with me, I need Chipotle to live. Whenever I travel, both mm -hmm. Elise and I are in the toilet pretty much mm -hmm. the entire time. And that's because I'm not eating Chipotle mm. every day. It really cleans you out. So those rice and beans, baby, they form the, the, the perfect protein. That's not a joke. Because we're supposed to be evolving past the stuff. We should have web feet and Sh like no pinkies, just right? Just like the Mariner from West or uh, Waterworld. <laughs> I almost said Westworld. <laughs> no. I know. I would never talk about something that's timely. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh Billie Eilish got you. That's so oh, funny. Yeah. Sometimes at a child? people on the street do ask me if I am Billie Eilish. I've had that like three times. Oh, we get that sort of stuff all the time. People are like, Are you Steven Seagal? I'm like, Please don't. I know. Me. I get that all the time. They go, Oh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. That's weird. <laughs> Kathy Griffin. We did name old flabby people. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I do that? We could do it. Oh, 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 no. oh, I can't. I panicked. Then he got it. Oh, oh, oh. When I panicked. Oh, oh. oh Turbid. Oh, I can't shoot Turbid. You got to go get him. Blow your kneecaps out, Turbid. You get away from me. Oh. <laughs> I'll never play baseball with his dad. Oh, Turbid. Oh. Huh? Nice. Kill that horse. Know. Woo. Get it's him. Bang. Butts. All right. Cool. We'll just killed Johnny Cage. <laughs> that was easy. Nice. You just killed Buckethead. But he was wearing a Funhouse shirt. Yeah, so what? Yeah. They're all Funhouse fans in here. I want to kill him over and over. Did we ever find out what Buckethead looked like? No, he had a bucket over his head. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously not. Oh, nice shot, at least. Oh, no. Billy Eilish, enough. kill her. It's there. not enough. Oh. Well, why were we talking about Billy Shatner? Billy Shatner. Oh, that's that's what you call him in bed, huh? <laughs> that's true. Billy Shat? I mean, I know he goes Billy, by Bill. Billy, Billy Shat. <laughs> nice, Elise. Oh, cool. That was a great shot. Oh, thanks. Try my best. Oh, 27th. How many players Beautiful. are there? Out of 30. Oh. <laughs> hundreds. Oh. Hundreds. <laughs> Thank hundreds. you. Question. Yeah. The newest. Yeah. Is Sylvester Stallone a good actor? Yes. Yeah, I think he is. I yeah. think he is, too. I mean, especially since he wrote... And did he direct Rocky as well? No, he, no. Wrote it, so. no, he just wrote he it. He wrote it. He wrote it. But like, if you watch like, especially like Rocky, you watch Rocky Balboa. He's great in. Man. He's great in Creed. And the answer is yes. Also in Cliffhanger. No one should be able to play that role seriously. John Lithgow. We already know John Lithgow is a good actor. He played a guy with Alzheimer's. <laughs> Rise of the planet of the apes. Yeah. Do you think depressed. you can be too hot to be a successful comedian? Like you can be so hot that people won't 
take you seriously. Yeah, That's like won't serious. find you funny, That's or like if you of, have self-deprecating humor, it won't work. Sort of the Ryan Reynolds <laughs> conundrum. He is funny. Are we talking about you or Adam? I think we see it in this room. What, because we're all good looking? What's the compliment, Elise? Yeah, are you trying to say that you, we're good looking? Yeah, well, yes and. Have you seen my face recently? <laughs> no, Bruce, you, the jaw's looking great. <laughs> You know it's not. You ever, have you ever worried that you'd give yourself a stroke? Yeah. No. I know that if you are feeling like you're having a heart attack, the advice is to cough as hard as you possibly can. I thought I was having a heart attack at RTX. It was just anxiety? Farts. It was after I picked up James. We were doing some, some bit, and I exerted a lot of strength very fast, and I remember afterwards it's like, like, is this how I die? Like, this oh. this sucks. I don't want to die. Gay? Like <laughs> Am I gay? I pick up James. <laughs> I like James. But heart hurt. You <laughs> feel good. My heart hurt. <laughs> I'm <laughs> gay. <laughs> oh, 20. We got a pride, we got pride shirt. Yeah, I like our pride shirt. Exact same yeah. I just like rainbows. I lift James. I like rainbow. <laughs> True answer. I don't want to have a stroke because I don't want to be like the dad from Legends of the Fall where he has to write everything on a chalkboard. Oh, yeah. Guys, Legends of the Fall is an old movie starring Brad Pitt. It's a story no, about one boring. woman how she bangs no, a whole family. It's boring. This was like the shit in the 90s. Hell yeah. Look Gens how hot he is, though. Yeah. Brad Pitt's always yeah. hot. Also, he was like, you can see, what's his name, Aiden Quinn yeah, before Aiden the fall? Quinn. Aiden Quinn is an old is actor. <laughs> Julia Ormond's in Legends of Fall, no? Uh, Julia Ormond is an old actress. It's the most depressing movie yeah. I think I've ever seen. I don't remember it because it's fucking Anth really old. Anthony Hopkins hooks up with her, the dad. Yeah. yeah. After a stroke. Wait, hooks up with the daughter? <laughs> no. Remember, Adam, didn't we, weren't we with, weren't we somewhere recently where like someone without <laughs> being prompted started talking to us about Brad Pitt? Well, that's the end of the video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lightheaded right now. because I don't know. I don't know the release date. You just got up from the basement. Yeah, like, I felt, like, incredibly hot all day. Like, do you know what it might be? What? It might be that... Menopause. Well. Probably. Uh, that's it's long past. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it might be we are getting gassed. Oh, We're getting oh. Dr. Manhattan in this building. Maybe. Oh. They're gassing us with stuff so that way they can do some sort of lawsuit, cancer mm. lawsuit later. Mm. You ever think about that? All those people that worked around asbestos? Mm -hmm. We could be in new asbestos. We could be dealing with new asbestos right now. My high school had a major asbestos problem. Were you, was your mascot the asbestos? Absolutely, yeah. Breathe it in, kids. <laughs> Let's win the, the new soccer match and mm -hmm. breathe in what we, we football there. The football. Alana, what are you doing today? This is a race that I think was in Russian, so the title no. uh, now says no translation. Perfect. Great. Okay. Do it for Russia. <laughs> I mean, look, we're all yes, doing it yes. inadvertently. Yes. Yeah, we don't have uh, have chat because that might. Oh, oh, I didn't see that. Sorry. You thought that was road, huh? Like that gray I, road? You thought it was like gray road? Gray road. <laughs> is that a Liam Neeson movie? It sounds yeah. like it would be. Why is your car changing color? Don't know. I don't know either. Okay. So it really Why? is though. That's all. Huh. Were you, oh, are you changing? No. Oh, did you allow customs? Yes, I did allow customs. Why would you do that? But, but that wouldn't make your car change yeah, that colors. Wouldn't make your car change color. Yeah, but that. Oh, oh, you might be getting hacked. Hacks. Time to hack. That looks. That looks like hacks. That does look Who like did hacks. you accept a friend request from, Alana? Uh, what stranger? I uh, love it when they do this. Uh, huh. Well, back in the race, I guess. It looks visually interesting, but it's yeah. also a bummer because I actually like this map. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe the hacker is just making it better. Maybe. That's a good point. I when might, a hacker's oh, ever made anything worse? I just might be uh, just, uh, I'm just an innocent bystander and the hacker trying to make this game better for all of us. He's yeah. he's coding it. Yeah. Maybe it's some guy who works for Rockstar who's doing updates live mm. right now. That's right. That's how that works. Yeah. <laughs> is that yeah. how it works? Yeah. I honestly don't know. As far as I'm concerned, making a game is the commercial where the guys are going to tighten up the graphics on level four. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey guys, finished testing that game yet? I've got another one I need designed. We just finished level three and need to tighten up the graphics a little bit. Great. And then they go back to using a controller. No, well, they're using a controller to program the game, which mm -hmm. is my favorite yeah. part. It's like Thank they're making you. a level in Mario Maker. <laughs> God, those guys were living the life. Being game dev is great. Yeah. Nobody ever works overtime. We sit no. on a couch. There's yep. only one sound. Unions and residual pay. Yeah. Lambos and guineas for everyone. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Not just the select few. All their uh, women in their lives are naturally beautiful. If there was a magic <laughs> machine that existed that allowed you to live mm -hmm. inside of any false reality uh -huh. like for example like 
like oh, that something commercial. Something you see in a movie or that commercial. Mm -hmm. What would you choose? I want to live in the world where women's um, periods are blue. All ads show a bucket of water being dumped into some sort of. Oh, oh a okay. Yeah, yeah, I, I see. Because yeah, yeah. the red's okay. too offensive. Yeah. It's funny. That's funny. <laughs> that's funny, Adam. <laughs> it's, good, funny. it's good when people say yeah, that's funny. That's hilarious. Yeah, yeah. That's You're hilarious. hilarious. Yeah. All right, James. What's your Jetsons? Absolutely Jetsons. Really? Yeah. yeah absolutely. Sometimes they don't even move. They just have conveyor belts everywhere. I There's just hidden was, conveyor belts all over the place. I feel like the Jetsons oh. conveyor belts, though, was more of a symptom of Hanna-Barbera being cheap. No, it was mm. the future. Mm. They didn't want to animate the characters no. walking, is that what you think? Uh, it was the future. You, you get a conveyor belt, takes you right from bed mm -hmm. into your car. <laughs> how, how much better could it get? I feel like he could have just teleworked. He didn't have to fly in. Why are the household staff so sassy in the future? The you ever robots? notice that? Yeah. It's because, I think it's because there was a phase in the Jetsons universe where they were like, all right, you can have robot servants, immediately treated them like garbage and mm -hmm. like harass them and abuse them like immediately because they seemed like these husks. They were basically sex dolls for everyone to use. And the only way you can get someone to not react that way is if you give them some sort of social activation in Rosie's case sass oh. I mean there's tons of there's tons of robots in the Jetsons universe that are mm -hmm. there to be fucked but the problem is you would never get your house cleaned because you'd be bending Rosie over the dinner <laughs> table or something I don't know I mean, you can't get anything done that way that's okay that's normal that's actually not this so bad oh, where's the architect oh. watch out for that plane uh, did you know that race car <laughs> drivers are like true street <laughs> racers you should know this Alana yep. don't have rear view mirrors because you're always looking forward. Yeah. You're never looking behind you. you. got no True reason to look back. I only learned that because I watched the director's commentary in the first Fast and the Furious movie. Can any of you, and I know this is like awful of me to say because Lawrence is not here, explain mm. to me the plot of the Fast and the Furious movies. Yeah. Paul Walker was going to go undercover because there was a criminal gang mm -hmm. that was stealing DVD players. They believed that it was related, based off the tuning of the cars, that it, it must be someone in the street racing scene that's doing it. They hire Paul Walker, he's mm -hmm. a cop, but he also looks young and cool. So then they were like, we need you to go undercover, infiltrate this scene. The gang that he suspects of being responsible is not the gang, it's the gang he befriended that did it. <gasps> because he immediately oh, no. suspects Asians. <laughs> 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 and he thinks the white guy couldn't have done it. So then it's like, oh no, my friends did it. And then at the same time, they also find out that he's undercover, but he's so much friends with them that he, he would rather just save them. And they're in danger because the truck drivers are rebelling and they're carrying shotguns. Because the DVDs have because been Because they've lost stolen? so many DVDs. They're so upset of the loss of DVDs okay. that they are now using shotguns. So Got it. in the end... They figure out who done it, and then they save everyone's life, except for that one guy, one guy who drove the Volkswagen Golf. Oh God! Well, to be fair, the guy who drove the Volkswagen Golf gets murdered by the Asian guys who are falsely arrested. Yeah. <laughs> so rather than being like, I didn't commit no crime of robbing DVDs, but I will do a drive-by and murder this person. So then that's that's the end of that. Then two, that's just the first one? That's There's so much happening one. in this franchise. No, two is Paul Walker uh, now goes to Florida. With Tyrese. With Tyrese. And at this point, Vin Diesel was way too big for Fast and Furious. He moved on to huge franchises like Triple X. Right. <laughs> so anyway, something happens in Florida. None of that matters. Nothing, nothing mattered, yeah. Then three, things get really interesting. Yeah. Because we go into the past. Oh my God, you're only on three. They were trying to turn it into a brand, so it was called Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift. And it was about the kid from Sling Blade racing the kid from Home Improvement. <laughs> and then the kid from Home Improvement crashes his Corvette mm -hmm. and almost dies. And then they blame him. So then his mom sends him to vi live with his dad who lives in Tokyo. He goes there and the first person he meets is Lil Bow Wow. <laughs> Naturally. Who owns, a, owns like a Honda Element or something or a Scion Cube. It's unclear how he affords it. And then he meets this girl, and she she has a really heartfelt conversation with him while drifting around mountains. And then, but I think her ex boyfriend is also like a gangster. He's like yakuza. Mm -hmm. 
So he pisses off the Yakuza guys. With his drifts. With his drifts, because mm. he's used to racing fast and straight. And then so he races this other guy and then beats him in the end. <laughs> and it then it's a, good or something? I don't know. And then I think the fourth one happened and it was good? Or that it was called Fast and Furious. When yeah. did uh, Paul and that Walker was, die? At what point? The seventh uh, one? Yeah, yeah. yeah he got a couple more. This is when I stopped paying attention. Right. Yeah, but Lawrence swears this is where it got good. Yeah. So then I think mm. Fast Five, there's a Frenchman. All right. And then there's Fast, like, a, is that the Bank Heist one? Does mm, Fast no, Five introduces The Rock. Correct? As a bad guy? Okay, that sounds right. Uh, well, he's an antagonist. I okay. think he works for the government. He's he's deployed to stop them. They, but then he joins them in Fast 6. Mm-hmm. Now he's on their side. Mm-hmm. Yes. And so Jason Statham is the bad guy. And then Fast 8, a.k.a. Fate of the Furious, is the most recent one. And yeah, that's Fate of the Furious is the most recent. To the recent. moon! All of them no. on the same team, I think? <laughs> I think, yeah, everyone's best friends now. Yeah. It's like It's like Dragon Ball. You okay. show up as a bad guy, that means that the next time you're going to be a good guy. That's right. I see. And he's either Hobbs or Shaw. I think he is. <laughs> I think you're right. Shaw. He is either one of them. The Rock oh, is Hobbs. Oh, GTA yeah. crashed. Surprise, surprise. Well, it's a good, I mean, it's a good ending point, yeah. I guess. Yeah. We didn't even get into the setup for Hobbs and There's Shaw, so where Idris Elba shows uh, up, who will almost certainly become a good guy in the next one. <laughs> That's a good point, because these movies make billions of dollars. Uh-huh. And they make good men of us all. My favorite thing is getting an email like fill out the survey or do this thing for a chance to be entered in to win a thing. Just don't waste my time. Either you won or you didn't. Give me. <laughs> this waste of my time is give, insulting. I, and I do not like it. And this all stems from when I was a kid and I entered to win the dragon flute from uh, Power Rangers and, and I didn't win story. it. Oh. They said send a random letter to this place and enter for a chance to win. Alana, what are we playing today? This is a death match that I picked from uh, what Rockstar gun? made mm-hmm. because yeah. uh, the ones that I tried to add didn't add because bookmarks are pretty broken. Right, yeah, we're celebrating Rockstar Day. Woo! Uh, Is it Rockstar Day? It's abso- I mean, have, Turbid. You seen, have you seen the made-up holidays that we've been doing? National Burger Day, Donut Day. Oh, oh yeah. I was just shot in the head. Just shot in the head day. Love big Fuck. capitalism. Okay, what holiday is it today? Is, I think that, it's is that what Juice it would day. be? How would, that, would that be what I search for? I think. Oh just, my gosh! You just ask Google what made up bullshit holiday is oh, it today? Oh, I mean, it's um, June solstice. Is that like for pagans? What? Well, I think that that means that it's. Oh the, shit. Jeez. It's oh oh of course it is. It's fucking National Selfie Day. Ugh. If it's something someone does every day or people do every day, when there's National Donut Day, is it the guy who's stuffing himself every morning with donuts who goes, Oh goody! <laughs> he eats more, more donuts? <laughs> now it's my day! Hold on, this death match yeah. is not easy. I'm just letting you know. You have a mouse. Oh you're right, I do. Yeah, you can play yeah, with it. That's one of the first Watch times. this, I'll just hide here. Yeah. Oh. I've actually never played GTA with mouse and keyboard. It seems like that would be strange. <laughs> no, it's totally it, fine. It works. Yeah, it's, it oh, works. yeah. I mean, look at it. Look, watch. Okay, here we go. I'm going to get this Switch person. weapons with tab. Look at that. See that precision? <laughs> you can't do that with a controller. Uh, <laughs> he hasn't missed one. Do you see that? Look at that. Every shot on target. Flawless. Well, you see? And all, even though the guy is running in a... Pre- <laughs> 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 I got him! How do I duck? There's that yeah. duck. That's it. You're doing it. Ah, oh, right in the head. <laughs> Wherever Bruce aims, he will hit it. See that he building? Him. He's hitting that building. Because he chooses to. <laughs> <Damn> <laughs> <laughs> See how I'm shooting around the Precisely character? when he means to. <laughs> we need to get you a trackball or uh, a magic mouse or That's something. It. Yeah. That's about right. <laughs> that was very quick. Oh, it's National Chocolate. Uh, uh, National Kissing Day. How did you find that out so fast? National Day. Wow. Okay. National Kissing Day. National Onion Ring Day. Hell yeah. National Hydration Day. Do you think so you can kiss with onion rings in your mouth? I Fuck can, yeah. I'll make it happen. Probably, but I would yeah. pause if I could, actually. That sounds great. You know, when people bitch at you about how your breath smells like onions? All the time, You yeah. tell them it's good for your bones because there's lots of calcium in onions, right? And then when your so breath smells like Wendy's. alcohol, you say, alcohol gives me more confidence. So I could talk to women. So fuck off. So yeah. fuck off. I get really funny when I'm 
drinking, and everyone gets real pretty. <laughs> Except for that face there. Huh? No, I'll make it work. <laughs> Go right I'll, there. I'm. This is. I'm Overwatch. You got the high ground. Yeah. Good Whoa. shot. Good shot, Adam. Good shot. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, who's who? Who's the real one? One shot. One kill. Uh, that mime cowboy's coming for. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Your reaction time was perfect. Ah, yeah. That was like Annabelle. <laughs> Never seen it. Get him. Oh, uh, good shot though. I, I mean, I yeah, shot where shot. there's yep. Daredevil. Yep. Good. I this is him. all people do uh, is serpentine. Yeah, I know. All right, hit B. Go. Ah, oh, he beat first. That's a bummer. I don't know. <gasps> no, you're still okay though. Yeah. Look out. G'day, mate. Wow, that was cool. Yeah, that was like a movie set you were on. <laughs> Thank you, I did do that all myself. Uh, oh, you're gonna get hit by this up. van yeah, if you're yeah. not careful. Well, oh, maybe you're not, not really putting in work wow. here, fuck. Turbid's oh, okay. Shit. Hmm. Just truly, you really somehow still alive. Lining it up, lining it up. Oh, oh you see him get hit yeah. by the car. Get <laughs> okay. yeah, dead. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, well, that was some glitches. That's not on you. Okay. Um, Auto aim. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, did you see him pop up? <laughs> so I didn't watch. The Elon Musk and Todd Howard interview. Oh, I do want to watch I, that. I haven't. I, I really. So I got watch to watch that. the clips where someone asked, "What's your biggest failure?" And neither one of them wanted to answer because Wait. they're both rich. So they didn't say anything. Well, Elon Musk just looked at Todd Howard and goes, "How about you go first? Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Well, Elon Musk would be a lot of. There's a lot of those that you could throw I mean, to. It was For him, his, it wouldn't be that hard. It was his fucking tweets. It was his tweet. Yeah, that that actually cost him thirty million dollars. Fuck. Oh, he ran <laughs> as soon as I bombed you. Like a Borderlands <laughs> character. That was cool. Anyway, it's fun to see rich people try to outrich each other. It's cool. Elon Musk is surely more rich than Todd uh, Howard. Absolutely, he's more sure. rich than Todd Howard. And more influential and has yeah. been in has banged more celebrities. So was was this like I reckon Todd Howard fucks. Oh, sure. Yeah, he definitely does. I, I know, but Elon Musk can go like Hey Grimes, you want to be my girlfriend? And she goes, sure. Yeah, but he had to go with Grimes, and it was because they fucking both made a Rokos Basilisk joke. A what? <sighs> I can't talk about it. The AI community will get angry at me. The what? Are, the the what AI community? community? Yeah, it's like it's a real thing. So no, Jess told me the story, and it it pissed me off then. It's gonna piss me off now. So tell the story. What is this? Rokos yeah, Basilisk. It's basically um, it's considered to be a thought hazard because as soon as someone knows about it, they are in danger of Got it. Got it. I get it. Uh, but it's basically just like an AI that could retroactively punish you if you didn't uh, will it into existence. If you didn't fund it existing, then it would it would punish you because yes, once it came into existence, yeah. yeah. Um, so they both made the same joke, and he, I guess, looked it up to see if anyone else had ever made that joke, and found that she had, and that's how they started taking. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Wow. I didn't know that. Which I think is actually pretty great. Oh, well, you're doing great there for a second. But they're still, still together in a best. long and happy Boom. relationship, Yeah, exactly. Right? It all three worked kills. out great. Gotcha. He just got three kills. Kill streak! We got a highlight reel over here. Oh! Whoa. Nice. Alright, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Cool. Look out! No, you're not, not going to survive that not one. That's fine. Yeah. It went from the still, Disneyland I mean, stunt no. show to the Universal <laughs> Studios <laughs> stunt show. Oh, man. You yeah. don't want to be at that one. People oh, die there. Yeah. Alana. Bop them. B. Oh, oh. Or, you know, well, fun, there's, fun a, there's a the challenge for this one is to win it using only the pistol. I am using only the pistol. But the winning is the pot that seems to. Mm, oh, you're not gonna win. Cool, 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 cool. Love it. You so, also chose ten minutes, and well, yeah, because we have time to fill. You know, this is your fit. Content creation in that. Look Dick at that! Right. You can't hit him. Ha! Can't hit what you ha! can't see. Hit B. Boom! Yeah, bitch! <laughs> Nobody ever wins that. They always serpentine up to you, and then you hit B and kill him. Stop with that. Turbid's got a bus. Hell yeah! Cool. Shoot him. Kill him. Oh my gosh. Man. You didn't kill him. He's somehow still alive. Wait, really? Yeah. Uh, I think that was another. Was that another person? Yeah, die. Sure. What a cuck. Do you think all oh, the, all the made up <laughs> bullshit holidays are making normal holidays like seem more worth it? Or are we Fuck devaluing you, bomb guy. All of them? Fuck you. No. No. Uh, I think they're devaluing. Sorry, Adam. What was your question? I'm just saying, does Christmas mean less now yes. that we have like. National yes. present day, national dress like a fat guy with a beard, not Santa. Mm, no, I love. They're Christmas. devaluing all of our holidays, and I hate it. I'm gonna take right. to Twitter to talk about how much I hate it, how much it affects my life. Hashtag holidays are canceled day. Right. My family, uh, one year when people were having financial troubles, did Christmas early. He's got, he's got a grenade. Oh. Fuck your grenade, son. <laughs> I mean, he's um, dead. Had Christmas early because everything is cheaper and then everyone could afford it. Yeah, that makes cool sense. With that. Oh, yeah, that's why you're you're a fool, I tell you, oh, if you uh, if you got to dinner for Valentine's Day. What if you just didn't fuck with those holidays and just took a bitch out to dinner sometime? 
Yeah, why not just take your bitch out to dinner? Just take a bitch out to dinner. <laughs> These are not my words. Adam. What? No, I mean, I, I, we go to lovely dinners all the time. Oh, yeah, just, do you? Why not yeah. just take your dick out to dinner? They, just take your dick out Take to your dinner. prick out to dinner. Yeah. Hold on. Have it over with. If there is Valentine's Day for women, and there's Stick and Blowjob Day for men. Are you okay with that? Yeah. Okay, cool. All right. This but that said, like, I don't really fuck with Valentine's Day that much. Yeah. So wait, they have to eat the steak and then give you a blowjob? Yes. What's happening here? Yes. So they have to give you a blowjob. Wait, steak. I have to, oh, they, if they I have to eat the steak, penis, then I'm out. They wrap your penis in a steak and then they blow it. That's weird. Yeah. Um. Oh, well, now I'm slightly less on board. Oh. Uh, hey, I can also... Oh, shit. I thought I was, I was also... No, I was, I was, I didn't. Fuck, I pressed B! You I did. Bet. It's a mini Cooper. I heard it. anyone if it wanted to. No, you don't. No, you don't. B, B, B. Nice. <laughs> got him. There he goes. Oh, oh and he was running over. Correct. He killed that Jabberwocky. Oh, no, that's Turd wants you to get in. But I'm trying to get in. Oh. You little shit. You little fuck. It's like the Italian job, Bruce, remember? Oh, yeah, that movie. <laughs> With Mark Wahlberg? No. I'm yeah. Not. Is he in it? Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's right. him in a... Oh. oh. Charlie's Theron? We just circle back to the idea that there's a steak and blowjob steak. Does uh -huh. that mean that you are obligated to go down on Valentine's Day? Because I don't think many men play by that rule. You should be. I agree. I'm all right with that. Boys That's out here official. not giving enough mm. head. You have to go down and give a woman head on Valentine's Day. With pasta, probably. With pasta. Bitches love pasta. Oh, in they your said mouth. A, they said a pastor. <laughs> I, I speak I like, a lot. Why does Tim have to be there? With, with pasta. Mm -hmm. She means Italian pasta, like yeah. spaghetti. With the food. So on Valentine's Day, go down on your woman and eat, pasta eat and the pasta day. out of her. Pasta and pussy day. Hey, Perfect. if you're watching DJ Khaled, <laughs> go down on your woman once in a while. He's, right? not, he's her, not going to. They like let it. Her, let he's her not, sit on your face. He's not going to. He's rich. They he have a good time. He doesn't have to. They oh, really okay. enjoy it. I guess pay they, someone to go down on your woman. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Be a man. Um, so I guess we all have to race the same car? Okay, fine. Whatever. Is that true? I guess so. What kind of race are we doing today, Alana? It's Rainbow Road! Sing the song if you know da, it. Da, 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 Rainbow Road. It's a road where you die. <laughs> it's yeah. where you go where you die. Oh, uh, it's a go where you die. Oh, yeah, you've got a... weapons. That's cool. Yeah, and there's... Well, okay. I mean, it's like I'm Mario turned yeah. over. Oh, look. You got Bullet Bill. Did I get the missiles? Yes, I did. Uh -oh. Yeah. Oh, I could—I should have shot my missiles, and I didn't. Watch out, Bruce. He might have the blue <laughs> shell. Fuck. Well, <laughs> Bruce doesn't need to watch out. He's yeah. lost. I don't like Mario Kart. Yeah, you don't like Mario Kart? I'm not good at it. How do you not like Mario Kart? Oh. I'm not good at it. It's one of the only games that I am confidently good at. Yeah, I think I quit in the middle of a race playing with you. You did, yeah. 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 Someone in the chat said uh, Alana is horrible at games, to be honest. It's absolutely not true. It depends on the game. Fuck you. I've yeah. seen Alana be good at games. Yeah, I've seen you be good depends at games. On the game. yeah, no, she's great at Mario Kart. She'll... I am very good at Mario Kart. Destroy me at Mario Kart. Yeah. Probably good at Smash Brothers. It was an issue in a previous relationship. You really mm -hmm. wanted to beat me at Mario Kart and never did, so I had to put a Mario Kart ban in our relationship because it stopped being fun. Hmm. <laughs> like he would sit there in silence, furrowing his brow, <laughs> trying to beat me in Mario Kart. Your goal They'd be like, I don't really want this. <laughs> your goal should never be. I never let him be, win. But you to should beat never... your significant other? No, and he no. would just sit there in silence, trying to beat me. And I was like, I don't want to do uh, this anymore. <laughs> I don't know. How do you feel, Bruce, about. Dominating a significant other. At a, I either. love dominating a significant other. Nice. I am the dom. Adam okay. is not in last place, so that's a that's plus. That's true. He's not in but last place. There's more place. players now. Also which, true. Yeah, it's working in my. It should work in your favor because generally, sure. when you put more humans together, that means there's going to be more garbage. Uh huh. You just described sure, a bukkake, yeah. essentially. Hopefully, well, hopefully you rise to the middle. <laughs> Of the bukkake? Just what everyone wants in bukkake. <laughs> Just finish right in the middle. Right in the middle. Not on the top, not on the bottom. If you're the first guy, that's embarrassing. If you're the last guy, you I, don't, I mean, you just... I don't know. I mean, oh. sometimes it's nice to beat traffic, you know? Just be the second guy. Oh, okay. You know, be the bukkake. second guy. Alana's right. Gotcha. Alana's right. You don't want to be the last... The last guy everybody's waiting for. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's awkward, and they're all flaccid, and they're like standing around, it's, like, kind of oh, like we get it, you're not coming. Yeah. Oh. I know, but the first and the first guy is everyone like, whoa, what's what's his deal? Yeah, he must have a problem. Came way too fast. Yeah. But isn't it a Japanese sex act? Didn't they come up with it? I think it is Japanese, but it might be like porn specific. I can't imagine you gotcha. can actually get that many men in a room and convince them to gotcha. come on a woman's face that easily. I would never do that. Never. To a person. No, because you're a gentleman, as I'm, we say in the industry. I'm, well, I think that sometimes women can be into things that are demeaning, though. That's the thing. And that was a lesson that I learned last many night. years nice. ago. No, no, I not. mean, I'll be honest. If someone was like, hey, Alana, would you like bukkake? I would be like, I'm good. Sure. I appreciate the offer. <laughs> All your sexual... Uh, Whoa. What just, happened there? I don't know. Oh, did we get hacked again? Probably. Uh, all your sexual that. desires apparently uh, are created between the ages of like 12 and 14. Really? That is when your brain is being molded sexually. But I've changed so much. I feel like I've changed a little bit too. Yeah, but here's the thing. Don't you still enjoy it when you're uh, alone in, uh, in a, with a computer? And all of a sudden you think, well, maybe I should masturbate because I'm alone. Like, 
you're home alone and you're like, you get those inklings, you get those feelings. I get those that's, now, and I'm 37 years old. That's what old. I mean, because you did that when you were and we're both in the room. 12 or 14. <laughs> I mean, to me, that's yeah. alone. I feel like if I would have want to masturbate every time I was home alone, I would not do anything ever. <laughs> That would be all I would do. Yeah, you live by yourself. Yeah, yeah. I guess you can so burn. So I can't it. have. That well, no, no, no. But but that's the thing. Okay, so your surroundings right now are that of you. You live alone. Yeah. But if you had roommates or someone lived there and then they left and you're like, ooh, I'm alone. I have free time. I think time I actually now. did do that the last it's time a, I had roommates. It's yeah. about that. Well, yeah, it's about the, the fact that you have free time because I lived alone too, and that wore off really quick. Also, it's lonely. It's lonely. Yeah, it's mostly just that I have sex. If I want, then. Uh, Maybe I would. I think we talked about this before. But how long have you gone without masturbating? Adam. I think it's two weeks. A lot. I think I did like two months. I did 45 days. That's more than Josh yeah. Hartnett in the film 40 Days and 40 Nights. That's right. I, it, it is. Intentionally? Intentionally. Was it painful? It, it was a contest. Painful. It was not painful. Not painful. Uh, although at the end, when, I think when I came, it was painful. <laughs> huh. Because it was like... So pent up, you know, mm -hmm. I'll always remember that orgasm for as long as I live. <laughs> well, it was memorable. I remember trying to go as long as I could just for fun. Sure, yeah. But Why then not? I was on I was in, on a Puerto Rican vacation with my girlfriend at the time and her family. Okay. And we all slept in separate beds or whatever. Uh, but I remember Puerto just Rican. having a dream that just the most nondescript woman was just grinding on me and I came in the sheets. That's there not was, your that's not your fault at all. I know, but I'm like I so I think being the person that I am, my body's like, I will not allow you to go more than two weeks. That's what it's supposed to do. You are not in control. It's, it's supposed to do a nocturnal emission yeah. so that it can regenerate your sperm. Yeah. And but to be fair, this was in the morning. At least that's when I woke up and saw the cum. Wait, wait, wait. So... <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. It was in the middle of the night. I um, mean, it could have been. It didn't happen in the morning. Wait, so mind. you have like a time frame you put on yourself now that you're like, I can't go this long. I, that's what I assume. <laughs> What's the time and frame? I hit two weeks and my body said, Bleh. <laughs> Do women have wet dreams? Uh, no, I I did sort of have an orgasm in a dream once though. But only the one time? Yeah. Mm. I think I had And a... I was like alarmed and woke up and was like, what? I think, <laughs> I think I've had them like probably once a year oh. between between... Let's say 12 and oh, okay. 22. And then you just stopped. And then I just stopped. Well, yeah, because... It was a sad time. It was a sad <laughs> time for me to not have... I wish I'd had wet... Wet dreams are great! Are they? Because, yeah. Sounds like a mess. You gotta get rid of those boxers right away. Well, no, you, you just naked. throw them in the wash. <laughs> just throw them in the wash. So what? And they get all crunchy. Ew. <laughs> Gross. Uh, I tell you, tell you how I have, like, uh, morning nightmares. No. I have, no. I have this... Oh, uh, me hacked. Are you? Yeah. Yeah, that's, those are hacks. Okay, there we go. I don't know. Oh, no, I think sometimes people activate things that, like, make your car go funky. Oh, really? Really? Yeah. Remember, we've done those. Those, those like, goof, goof okay. races. Oh, that. That. You got to be like, uh, it's a Mario Kart. Boost. Anyway, so I, I do this weird thing where uh, we all do this, where you make wake up in the middle of the night, go to the bathroom or whatever, yeah, and yeah. then you, you go back to sleep. Yes. I've been remembering the second dreams I've been having more and more these days. Okay. And this... This morning, I had a dream about a one-legged dog that would hug me and not let go. How does it? It was only a only had one leg. How did it stand up? It it would just like dragged itself around okay. or like hop around. So I had this very recently, but with an octopus, and it was basically the same <laughs> Wait, thing. What? Yeah. Okay, but the, and I, I found this one particularly fascinating because it has to mean something. No. Where an octopus, it wasn't like I knew that it really, really liked me Aww. and was just clinging to me, and I would try to yeah. run away from it because it was like. Just way too fucking much. Octopi are really smart, you know that? Mm -hmm. They they, they, they want to be your friend. They like They're know so you vivid. and like you. Yeah. They really do. Well, I think sometimes they want to kill people. Though. Sometimes they yeah, want to yeah, murder I mean, people, yes. Those little guys are fucked up. Not all people are the same. Not all octopi are the same. It, exactly. They're people want to murder other people. Octopi want to murder, murder other people. They're yeah. allowed to think whatever they want. They Fair. can shoot ink whenever they want. The crabs have it the worst. Only because I saw that security video where there was like an open pipe under the ocean. And it just had a little like a air pocket that was just sucking everything in. And you see the crab walk on it, and it looks almost like a cartoon. It just gets sucked into the hole. Oh. But it, it, like, it crumbles into pieces. Ugh. Whoa, really? Yeah. It looks like, uh, I don't know, something like Transformers or something. It was, oh, it was, that's really it was sad. It's fucked up. I'm trying to think. Oh, there's a movie. What is it? It's the, uh, it's like a sci-fi movie or a horror movie where they, they throw in like a cube or something, and it just sucks everything into the cube. Oh. What am I thinking yeah, of? Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Oh, it's going to kill me. Um, 
It, it also happens in a lot of sci-fi movies. Well, there, there is the, the movie The Cube. I've seen that. And there's also Wait, the, the Cell. Wait, The Cube or Cube? Whatever. I don't okay, care. I've only seen Cube, I think. That's the there's one where cell. They, they, they wake uh -huh. up and they're in a cube. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is that what that you're talking about? Moment. No, God, no. Oh. They're... Oh, it's going to kill me. Because <laughs> it, like, implodes, right? They implode yeah, it's the like cube. it's like a grenade or a bomb or something where it's like... It just sucks everything into it. You cube and hypercube. People are saying it's cube, but I think it's cube. I've only seen cube. Cube's I've... the one where there's, like, several different traps in every room. Yes. Great idea for a movie, but the movie's not so great. <laughs> it's, yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. It's sort of like when you show your friends Primer. You go, Primer's really good. It's not a well-made movie. You need to watch it, it three times with subtitles on, yeah. and then you'll need to read the wiki off the... Here, but it's a great movie. I printed this chart for you, so it makes sense. I actually love Prima, but that, you're right. And it, no, watching I, that movie is not fun. It's the experiencing that yes. movie is what's fun. And it's it's also is made for 10 bucks or whatever, so it's like... Yeah, I think it was like a grand or so. Like yeah. It was a very small amount of money. Yeah, it, I love Prima. I think it's a great movie. But also, it's like same with like, yeah... I don't know. I, I've been noticing this a lot lately where people will post things like, I'm not going to spoil the movie. Just watch this movie. It's pretty good. And you watch it go, I could see why you thought this was good, but it's not. <laughs> so, so, I love uh, it so condescending. Evan Gillian's on Netflix today. Oh, is it really? Whenever you're watching this video. Wait, wait, hold on. Ago. Live yeah. action? No. What? Oh, the, thank the God. I was, I was so excited <laughs> no. for one you were, second. Oh, you were excited about that? Yeah, hell Jesus yeah. Jesus Christ, Bruce. I'm so excited about live action Evangelion. Uh, I kind of actually want to see what that would look like. The, have you, the Evangelion anime has about six good episodes in the course of 45. Wow. Yeah, I've watched all of it twice. Okay. <laughs> all right, so Adam, people keep asking me if they would like Evangelion. And I don't know that I can recommend Evangelion no, to anyone. No. I want to be like, I don't know, dog. I told you, watch the six episodes that are good where the robots fight the monsters. You can just watch the movies if you The movies are great, too. Do that. So they added three things to Netflix. Mm -hmm. They added the show. They added the end of Evangelion right. where people couldn't uh, swallow the last two episodes. Like, Psychological, These, man. It, it doesn't make sense, even though it's actually kind of really fitting in with the show. Uh, but then there's a third one, the death of Evangelion. Which is just like a super cut of everything. Oh, okay. That's yeah. cool. So if you want to watch the entire show, essentially, in an hour, you just watch that. But I really like the movies. The but here's the thing. Alone movies and all that shit. But yeah. the yeah. thing that great. got me into that show was a guy in my film class brought the death of Evangelion, and we oh, watched wow. it. That's the first thing you saw of Evangelion. Yeah. And I had no idea what the fuck was going on, but I was like, I have so many questions. I want to wow. know what's happening. Right, it's like this is this is good shit. Cool. So then I watched the entire series because of that that weird thing. I watched the entire series with a bunch of other boys <laughs> at a log cabin with their dad. So like, how much sex did you have that weekend? I was nineteen. <laughs> okay. I don't what, know what, what your did, age? What did the age have to? Like, yeah. Uh, because I want to make sure you knew it was legal. <laughs> <laughs> it was legal for you to not have sex with men. It is, it is legal. In your it's, gay anime cabin weekend. It is technically legal for you to have sex at any age, as long as the other person's that age, right? I think he's right. Yeah. No, I don't. I don't think that that's legal. I think that like probably someone's parents can sue someone's parents or some shit. But I know in Vegas, if they're sixteen or seventeen, your parents can write a note to give you consent to have sex with someone who's over 18. Man, I fake so, so many notes. You can notes. get a note from a 16-year-old to yeah. be like, Adam can bang Jenny. Love, Ma. When do you think we can get back to the point where men wear jackets around their waist? I never stopped wearing jackets around my waist. I know men. you're referring to men specifically. <laughs> men. Okay. It uh, means nothing coming from you. If you did, it'd probably make you look more muscular. There's no way. Wow. By making my hips look wider? <laughs> No, I don't think so. The human body is all about proportions. Mm -hmm. We know that. Tell me about it. So, you know, if you have a very small Big. waist, oh. obviously, mm. it's going to make your muscles look bigger, right? It's going to make you look broader. Well, if, if you have broad shoulders and a small waist, then yeah, you don't have to do anything. You just wake up, true? get out yeah. of bed, and people go, who's that jack guy? Adam, what about you? I'm a broad. You're like triangle man. Yeah. People say that about me. Who? People. My husband. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just <laughs> comment on each other's bodies hear, all day. You keep you referring to him as such. I'm taking over for Alana today. She's out sick. Boo. She entrusted uh, this hard work to me, or I was just the first one to come up in her contacts list. It's good to be A. She's right calling points. herself first. Well, no. Adam is technically still alphabetized. <laughs> okay. Straight. I'm not, I'll never okay. hit you again. <laughs> <laughs> We're playing a, a race called Stunt Ooh, Loops. Should I have the car in the air? I guess Always. I am. You were playing Stunt Loop Skywalker. Five James, seconds. you better come in Obi-Wan in this race. Obi first. Oh, oh, never mind. Oh, I can't let anything happen to this car. It's a Kylo rental. 
Uh, is this a team race or am I Han Solo? Enjoy the race. Oh, okay. You guys are done. You guys get to make your little jokes, but I, when I make some really good ones, suddenly I, it's no I fun. Don't, I don't feel good making those kinds of jokes. You should. I got a headache. Controller died. It's going to be a comeback. I'll be there in a second. Hold on. Hold on. You got this. And race. Nope. There yep. we go. There we go. We're going. I'll just get rid of this. All right. Way. I'm on my way, guys. Okay. See, look. They can't even do it. I know. Watch this. First place after all that. Mm. Excuse me, fellas. Okay, so James, you know what I did, though, right? What? I rigged the controller to not work. You rigged the controller to not work because you know I'm such a good race? If you remember, in the original Jedi race, uh -huh. episode one... Yeah. Anakin's vehicle putters out at the very beginning. Because Sebulba sabotages it. Because Sebulba sa sabotaged. It's a trap! Yeah, <laughs> Close Sebulba! Oh, that's okay. fine. I'm the Anakin of the office, first of all. What makes you the Anakin? Because I whine. <laughs> I whine <laughs> you so hate much. Are you guys seeing this uncredible performance? Wait, why is it uncredible? Yeah. Why are you yawning? Well, yeah, please don't yawn. It's good. Because I'm the the per, the performance is so riveting that it exhausted me. You always oh. say stuff now like I'm energyless. You always say stuff like when you talk it makes you yawn, but I don't think mm. that's true. I think you're just tired and afraid. What are you so afraid of? Being tired and people knowing how tired I am. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't do well in the wild. So when George Lucas was casting mm -hmm. for the role of the soon-to-be Darth Vader, uh -huh. first he cast a little kid because he wanted someone innocent, but then uh -huh. the second one he said, "I need someone." Brooding and boring hot. and Canadian. Uh, Did he just say hot? Yeah. That was probably I mean, it, right? Someone hot. He's like, I need uh, a boy with some um, lips. No one's gonna fuck. believe that that little baby fucks Natalie Portman. Mm. <laughs> That's what he said. She it is kind of weird when you think about how like she was at an age where she was like having probably having urges, what? you know, yeah. finding dudes attractive. Mm -hmm. And, they and there's the baby. little boy. Later, she's like with. I mean, it's all weird. How do you explain it? Did you see me finish that race? That was good. I got clean. Here's clean race. Here's the other part, James. What? You're usually known as the joke guy. Uh huh. We're I gonna made that Kylo Ren joke. We're gonna up the ante. <laughs> oh. Increase it to two laps. I have to make jokes and, and, and race. race. Yeah. <laughs> the ultimate challenge. <laughs> I'm starting to think that maybe. Adam's been rigging controllers this whole time, so and that's why I'm not good at game. Here, Elise, why don't you race at the same time with this controller? Yeah. Oh. I'll just sit behind you. <laughs> <laughs> You're like the fireman that thinks he's doing something back there. What? You he's have to the drive the back of it. You have to. It just works. Okay, if I've you were on a car. fire truck, who would you? which position would you be? I mean, I guess I would be one of the guys who's ready to fucking chop out there. Okay, Adam. Hose want, guy, want, end of hose guy. I want to be pointing the hose. <laughs> I want to be the drive-by hose guy who's hanging off the side, spraying the fire as we drive by on the real fire. I'd be the Dalmatian. Don't! Just go straight! Jesus Christ. That Just go straight! It makes for an interesting race, James Athen. You! Shit! I hope you're dead. <laughs> I've never seen Men in Black 2. What? Uh, it's I've... arguably one of the top three best <laughs> Men in Black movies. I only saw... The ending on television, and Tommy Lee Jones looked more bored than he's ever been bored in his life, and well, he's bored in most films. Tell. Tommy Lee Jones is the type of actor that doesn't ever look like he wants to be in the movies he's in. Remember, he's in Captain America, and he's just sort of like, no one yeah. else can do this. I yeah. guess I better do it. It's like, thousands of people will literally do that job, Tommy. You don't need to do it. All oh, right. All right. Okay. I don't All know right. why the wheels stopped working. That's weird. I might be getting hacked. Adam, I mean, it's is going, this you no, again? This is, I'm, it's going the wrong way when I turn. You did the controller prank. That's weird. <laughs> Not me. Oh, nice, good bump. Oh, Perfect nice landing. landing. Wow. Let's hey, see. you're a regular Parzival. That's two times this week. I hate myself. I know. Yeah. What is your deal? I don't know. Because remember Ready Player One, they race? No, I watched that movie and I immediately wiped it from my brain. You're smart. One of Steven Spielberg's most forgettable films, I believe, is what the critic said. No. How much would you pay to watch Helena Bonham Carter and... Tim Burton have sex. I would empty my savings. Yeah, me too. I feel like she probably reprimands him a lot. But he yeah. asked for it. She doesn't care about She's not actually... I feel like she's probably not... She's like, stop drawing and get over here. <laughs> oh, that's good. Maybe we can do some role play. <laughs> uh -oh. I'm going to wear a greasy black wig that's all straggly. And then I'll get out my notepad. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. And then I'll like draw some stupid scarecrow or whatever with long fingers or whatever. And then you come up and <laughs> yeah, you say I'm gonna that. Yeah, like, I'm going to have like 
striped leggings on mm-hmm. and like bottle cap glasses yeah. goggles okay <laughs> scream something hair. about hair looks like it hasn't been washed yeah my yeah. hair in looks six like years. a fucking tumbleweed it's on my head and yeah. you're gonna you're gonna say that and scream something about harry potter yeah and then uh, <laughs> i should have been harry potter <laughs> what? that's how she feels that's genuinely how she feels about she was she, people don't know this but helena bonham carter she auditioned for the role of harry, of harry potter, potter yeah. which went eventually went to daniel radcliffe and it was weird because mm. in that audition after everything she'd done she was just shouting i was in frankenstein mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was in Frankenstein. I think that Helena Bonham ben- Carter and uh, oh. Tim Burton are no longer together, are they? Didn't they get separated? You think they never correctly. were together because they, they lived in, in different houses. They lived next in different to each houses other. that mm-hmm. were co- connected through a Which tunnel. sounds <laughs> fucking awesome. What? Custom no. vehicles off. Catch up off. This is the hard this one. Is the purest one? Yes. Anything else? Destroy last Lord, place. Destroy last place. That's fair. All right, James, the final All right, race. The purest race where mm-hmm. everything's fair and I start in first. You are the Speed McQueen. You are the Days of Lightning Thunder. McQueen. You, who? Lightning McQueen. Who's Speed McQueen? You're thinking of Steve McQueen. But you applied on, speed uh, the, to Who him. is Lightning McQueen is based. Ooh. Oh, wait, how, what happened? I People don't are know. using shortcuts. People are cheating. Has anyone? No ever, one passed us. Has anyone ever made a movie about the pit crew of a race car driver? Yeah, probably. Like made them the hero. Mm-hmm. Probably, yeah. From this their is, perspective. Uh, it's like ninety-four, ninety-five. Pitman. 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 Yeah. Never saw it. Who's in it? Brad Pitt. Bob Hope. Tommy, Tommy Jones. Jones didn't want to be there. Tommy. Yeah, he's the he's the cranky old landlord. Well, um, I, I feel like wasn't there more to it? Wasn't there like Tommy Lee that? Jones is like this old curmudgeonly pit crew guy? Yeah. And then some young upstart. Mm-hmm. comes in and is like, hey guys, we gotta change the way that we do things mm-hmm. here. And they're all like, no, this kid's crazy. But then he fucks Tommy Lee Jones' daughter. Yeah, yeah, well, that happens. And, but uh, definitely in it. But then that doesn't work out, and that story ends. Oh. And then Kevin Klein, Ooh. Oh, wow. who used to be the young hotshot. Top of his career back who, then. Yeah, who had left, comes back uh-huh. to Unseat fuck Tommy this- Lee Jones' daughter. Wow. Okay, wow. Yeah. So she only has sex with two dudes in this movie, right? Just two dudes. But you see it First all. First or second You see act. everything. Yeah. Like close-ups. Mm-hmm. They like shots that oh. have, have the insertion of the penis in her mm-hmm. vagina and shots of her face. It's just two dudes <laughs> in the first act. Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. There's there's a shot where the sound guy gets in on it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a little bit of a boom in the shot. Yeah. If you know what oh, I'm saying. Oh, that's a shortcut right there. Oh, that you was missing it? that shortcut. Yeah. That's what, you, if you jump off, if you leap it. That's exactly what happened in, what was the name of the movie, Adam? Pittman. Pit, that's what happened in Pittman, because mm-hmm. Tommy Lee Jones went, why don't you try taking a shortcut? Try taking a short, I don't know, I don't know how to ta- do Tommy Lee Jones. Pr- pretty much, it's like, try taking a yeah. shortcut. Try taking a shortcut. Okay, James, you're going to do the shortcut this time, right? Let's do the next one. I know. It's not this section. I know, not yeah. this one, but this last lap. Yeah, yeah. He this is why you're my Parzival. And I'm your Artemis. <laughs> Marvel only, Marvel only drives backwards. That's Did how he gets watch underneath. This movie that's how he gets underneath King Kong. Okay, okay, James, where's that shortcut? It's oh, oh shit, I missed it. Oh, it was over there. I think it. maybe just turn around. Oh no no no! I missed it. You gotta keep going. You gotta keep going. Shit. Are you just go? Uh, oh, I got an idea. Now, what will, this is the exact top. What would what? Parzival do? Oh no! I think you no, want to go no, the no, other no, way. No, 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 Hold no, on, I got it. No. I'm back! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this Tommy Lee Jones uh, podcast is brought to you by no sponsors. Jim Carrey, friend Jim, of Tommy Lee yeah. Jones, but friend not. of Sonic. Do you think okay. that Jim Carrey, now having made the Sonic movie and ha- having hated it, mm-hmm. giving interviews to indicating as much, mm-hmm. understands how Tommy Lee Jones felt? making Batman Forever with him. Do you think he understands now? And he's like, I get it. Mm-hmm. It's so people can be miserable. I think Jim Carrey was at the top of his career and he couldn't understand someone coming up or, you know, in a restaurant telling him that he didn't like him. I don't like you. Yeah. I don't care for you. Yeah. I he don't said. want this laugh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, go check out Tommy Lee Jones in theaters this weekend. I almost grabbed your butt, remember, when we were streaming. No regrets. Well, some. Okay. Save it, right. Bruce. I'll do this. New episode, new episode, new episode. Deathmatch? Yeah, yeah, I'm uh, you're just. Deathmatch? You're back, Bruce. <laughs> Bruce, I got first place. Yeah. I didn't, but you can't take that high five back. It's mine. <laughs> no, what do you five think? Five minutes? Ten minutes? Five, five minutes is about right. How about ten yeah. minutes?
25 kills. Oh, okay. Sure, yeah, You should yeah. be able to get that in five minutes, yeah, Bruce. that's no problem for Bruce. <laughs> Who will go first? <laughs> you bet. I did a, a unique episode where we made James race three times. Each race got progressively harder. First place, first place, first place? Yep. Uh-huh. Hold on, look, look. Yes. <laughs> your teeth? <laughs> you ever do the thing where you watch ventriloquists, but when the, the dummy's doing something, uh, you just look at the ventriloquist? Oh, all the time. Oh, yeah. Always. They're, just, yeah. they're like, they look like they're in hell. Look yeah, they're, yeah. Like, yeah. They look like they're a hostage. <laughs> it's like, I'm the ventriloquist. Oh, hi, Bruce. Didn't see you there. Yeah, well, that's right. I don't you're know. The, you're, I'm the ventriloquist. You can Wait, just talk on. normal. Who, who, who you're, I? The, you're the puppet. Okay, I'm the puppet. So I'm okay, the ventriloquist. Got it, got it, got okay, okay. Oh, hey, Bruce, didn't see you there. Yeah, that's right. I was sorry, 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 sorry. I know. Wait, what I am know? I? You're the puppet. Hold on. You okay, can talk right, normal. Okay, right. You can talk normal. All right, all right. Okay, I, I you think talk I normal. Okay, okay. Right, here we go. Yeah. Oh, hey, Bruce, didn't see you there. Hey, James, how you oh, doing? No, <laughs> Hey Adam, what are we playing today? Oh, oh we're you doing can shoot. Mofo cart, big donut. Pick up rockets and shoot, oh, Bruce. No. Uh, any problems you, you have with this how? map? Oh, it's Alana's man. fault. Watch that. Look at that. Me flip around and nice. then to the perfect vantage point. This is oh, how right there. how knights used to feel while oh. jousting. Yes. Are those homing missiles or are they just missiles? I think they're just missiles. missiles. Well, why is it right. called homing missiles then? You guys know why homing is called homing? Tell why? me. I figured it out the other day because okay. I was listening to an NPR story about homing pigeons. Because they go home. Yeah. They go home. Yeah. Okay. Wait, did you not realize? No. <laughs> you didn't know that? No, I thought because you think homing hom missile. Oh. Homing oh. is something that tracks oh. onto something, but okay. it's only because ori the original things that tracked onto things they just went home. Ooh. Okay. I don't care for your They're ignorance. <laughs> I got angry honked at today. Oh no! You know I'm those sorry. ones where they put their arms up in the air. Oh yeah, I love those. Wait, were they well, behind you? Th it was a a three way stop. Mm. It was a three way. There was a. Uh, Hold on, stop it! Just three way. I <laughs> wish it was I'm a three way. Yeah, it was you and what other two dudes? <laughs> <laughs> well, one of them was fixing the sewer. <laughs> Bruce, what if you could have a three way, but it had to be with one other guy? I would just say no. I've thought a lot about this. You can't this. say no. What, you're tied I down. Have to have you're one? tied down. He's you're your tied best down. friend, and, yeah. and he's dying. You know what? At least. She got me on that one. I'm in. Okay. All right. Wait, he says. Which guy? Are we saying? No, I'm just telling you. You have to do this. Oh, <laughs> it's not a question. Well, then what do I do? Is just I have to fucking. Well, first dude? of all, you sign here, here, and here. Also, we get to film it. Can I pick just, the guy? All you, the only camera we get is the ones from Fear that are attached to your <laughs> uh -huh. chest, so we can oh, see your face yeah, the whole time. And it's a, right, it's in your apartment too. You're gonna have a three-way. Uh -huh. Another guy and <laughs> a woman. <laughs> My apartment. What part of her do you choose? To have sex with. How did you miss I that? don't know. <laughs> I don't know how I missed. What what are you gonna have? How are you gonna I'm have I'm so sex? distracted by this recent okay. now. Which hole do you want? Are it's you get you have so many options. It involves you putting your stuff in stuff, but it also could involve something going into you. Now what here, do you choose? Here's the thing. Oh, wait, if it's what? the vagina, there's Who's a chance what? that you may touch his dick with mm -hmm. your dick. Two pieces have to go into one vagina. No, 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 no. there's no. plenty of holes. Listen, yeah. human beings are oh, yeah, built you can fire backwards. crammed full of holes. Yeah. We're, so you can pick whatever hole you want. We're born to have multiple people in us. I'm just saying, in this particular scenario, it's <laughs> you, a woman, and another man. Okay. How are you going to have sex? I thought a lot about this uh -huh. again. I don't know why you're thinking a lot about um, this. Because I've seen videos and I've been like, why would why would you ever do this? Like, why would you ever get your penis next to so close to another man? Uh -huh. You ever ask what she wants? No. Oh. She, if she wants a threesome, then that means she wants guys all over, right? Well, yeah. two that she loves. Yeah. <laughs> loves? Yeah, she's yeah. in love with both of you. Uh -huh. Respect her. And one that maybe she doesn't have much time left with. Uh-huh. Right, mm. yeah. What? He's dying. Oh, he's, he's, dying. Dying. he's terminal, okay, Bruce. Right. Um, okay, anyways. And uh, he may be contagious, but go on. Okay, so <laughs> she has to be doing things with her hands while I am having sex with her. Like knitting? What? <laughs> <laughs> so then we have to be the furthest possible distance from okay, each other. Does so that make you sense? are okay. having sex with her vagina yes. while she's jerking him off? Correct. Well, I was going to say, here's the problem with that, Bruce. You're going to oh. spend most of your time watching a guy get a hand job. I can look away. No, the but only you're, vantage you're, point you're just you going. have. You're yeah. just going to be looking there. That you're only mm -hmm. going to see that. And he's oh, crying. <laughs> he's the so other happy. option is she's he's on so top happy. of you. She's on top of you, uh -huh. right? You're, she's riding you. But he's having sex with her butt. No. Oh. So I don't want you can't either. see him. No. You might the right angle. You might not even know he's there because she's filling your yeah. whole field of view. Yeah, but I'll yeah. feel but it. I'll, you I'll might, feel it. But might feel his great. shaft or his balls through the vaginal touching wall. Your it stuff. went over him. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I would be. Would you want to do that, or would you rather the hand job scenario? And it stinks. And what? Well, well, okay. It stinks. <laughs> yeah, it's all lube and vag. And there. Also, you yeah. could also do the one where you're having sex with her vagina, but then she is giving him a blowjob. 
Yeah, but, but that's then a full she extension. Has to kiss you afterwards. Oh, <laughs> come on! <man>. Sorry, <laughs> these are rules. I don't make them. I'm gonna ask you this question mm-hmm. outright right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Adam. Yeah. Would you ever have a threesome? Yes. James. Again? Yeah. Oh. Elise. Would you ever have a threesome? No, probably not. Okay. It's so much Liar. pressure. Liar. Uh, Elise and I. <laughs> Elise and I. Well, James and I got two. Uh, I know. Hey, you guys are going to go. find a one. We, just we, just find we have an opening for a third. <laughs> we have to find a third. <laughs> that's not, well, that's a gay threesome, guys, but. Uh, what? No threesome is gay. No. I, that God, sounds no. like a gay threesome no. to me. No. 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 I think the gay community think just, would beg to disagree with me. It's only, it's only gay they if it's two dudes. If you go, uh, if it's three dudes, it's not gay anymore. Now it's just like sex crazed. I yeah. just feel like with That's a threesome Roman. you've got to be responsible for the sexual needs of two other people now. No, you don't. I'm not even responsible for one. <laughs> okay. Why would I suddenly be responsible for two now? Okay, it'll be clear. Lisa doesn't want to do this because of the pressure. <laughs> yeah. The, like the I just think it's a lot the of obligation. It's a lot more yeah. clean up too. You don't have to mop up. You just, yeah, you you don't do. have to clean. Maybe you Listen, don't. Yeah, this, you got, if you're doing it the right way. You don't have to clean anything up if you just roll over and go I to was sleep. at this, um, <laughs> I was at this. Threesome? No. Oh. <laughs> I was at this, um, like, f- not really a flea market. I guess it was like a designer creator market, and someone was selling these, like, little mats mm, yeah. you can put down mm-hmm. during sex. Mm-hmm. Sex mats? Do you mean just it's like, like a, a blanket. Yeah, it's basically like yeah. a, a garbage <laughs> bag? <laughs> it's a tarp. <laughs> Elise and I were in a hotel earlier this week. Using a sex bag? Well, no. Close, though. The mini bar had, uh, had like, peanut M&Ms, popcorn, cookies. But then it also had adult, oh, like yeah. an adult. Oh. Uh, but I feel like you only see those in Vegas, whatever. really. Yeah, 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 it was like it had a, a men's self pleasure sleeve. Yeah. You mean a condom? I said, I said, wait, wait you mean a woman? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I, 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 <laughs> Good joke, sleeve. It was like a box <laughs> labeled like adult. I'd like, stuff. I'd like to see this. And I, and if you took it off, the, it was weighted, so you yeah. only had thirty seconds. Oh. You know what? So I saw, I was like, what? And I tried to look at it, and I put it back down again. It's like Indiana Jones. Jones. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> If you want to see it, Bruce, maybe you and James take a trip to Vegas for research. Mm-hmm. We, we need a third. Adam along. We you need get, a third. You get a room. <laughs> okay, you only need one room Road to do the trip. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it's like a thin sleeve, like almost, you know, when. It's a condom. But they also a had condom. condoms in there. Uh, but it would be it would be like a condom, but thicker, slightly thicker, I think. Little electrodes or something. <laughs> electrodes. <laughs> so it would shock your dick. Is that what? Wait, hold on. Is that what a vagina does? At least, do you yeah. think a vagina shocks a penis when you're having sex? With I just it? think yeah, it's I would, funny. Well, what I do is I take a balloon and I rub it against the top of my head <laughs> uh, beforehand. I just think it's funny th- to presume that a man is in a hotel room, right? Uh, yeah. And he's like, God, I gotta fucking jerk off. Yeah. And then he goes, he goes, but. I don't want someone else to have to clean up after me. <laughs> someone no, else? No, I mean, it's a fucking hotel room. I, mean, I guess you, you can just, jerk off ju- anywhere. Just, yeah, that's what the other side of the bed is for. I never even you thought of that. Jerk, uh, <laughs> and then, you just, then you just roll back over to your side. Hey, let the maid deal you with know, it. Why would you ever need a self-pleasure I, sleeve? I, I actually, I'm not going to pay twenty five ninety nine yeah. so that way the maid doesn't have to clean up my jizz. I have a... <laughs> Here's what I think the, the self-pleasure sleeve is there okay, for. You, tell me, you go to Vegas with your bros. You know, there's a group of you. Mm-hmm. You're not going there to sleep. You're going to the party. You're going, there to party. You're going to oh, crash wow. on the floor of the room, you know, whatever. That's to prank your bro. Yeah. He wakes up. You've put a self-pleasure sleeve on his dick. <laughs> got you it. got him. Uh, you gotcha. got him. Prank. Oh, wait, hold on. You had to pull down his pants and his underwear, get him hard, and then put the yeah. self-pleasure sleeve. No, no, he you didn't got have any him. of that on. Funnier than that. You pranked, you pranked your bro so bad. I also don't. We do Bruce, you have to be hard to wear a self pleasure sleeve. I don't even know what Think it is. Think about it. Think the lo- about the look on Adam's face. Okay, when he Got wakes me. up, he realizes you've pulled his pants down, jerked him off, put the sleeve on him. <laughs> oh my god! And also, by the way, it was his credit card, so he's the one getting charged twenty five dollars. Oh, that's a great sleeve. show, guys. He is going to be so fucking. Embarrassed. He's gonna be pranked, and you, and you got it on film, yeah. yeah. So that when you take it home, you, you upload, upload it to it Live to, Leak, upload it to Pornhub and Live Leak. Oh yeah. And then when you jerk off it, off to it, it's another prank. It's hilarious. Yeah. And you can use that same self pleasure sleeve which you stole from the toilet after he got that's disgusting and threw it away. But you <laughs> went in there afterwards and you got it out again. Oh my you, god. You wrung it out and dried it off. That's the one that you can have sex with when you are also. Are you uh, selling this to me? Uh, <laughs> when you're also watching the video again. You look like such a fucking goose. You got pranked. Prank. You guys know I love prank channels. Have you guys ever put those packing peanuts in your mouth that are biodegradable? No. I did yesterday. Oh, yeah. He did it as a joke, and I made him swallow it. You're, yeah. you're supposed to. Well, not You're supposed to. Awesome. But you can. Mm-hmm. I don't think it kills you, right? It's guys? not supposed to. Wait, how many have you eaten? 
Bruce. A couple hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes they get hungry. You can buy biodegradable underwear. Yeah, edible yeah, underwear. Yeah. Travel underwear. Yeah, edible underwear. All my underwear is biodegradable. Yeah. Are you allowed to throw, like, biodegradable stuff out the window as yeah. litter? Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. are, right? Yeah. Underwear. Yeah. You can't get fined for that. Underwear. No. <laughs> edible underwear, mm-hmm. uh, s- sleeve condoms, or whatever you're talking about. So do you think if you threw, you threw, like, your underwear... But it was edible underwear out the window, and a cop pulls you over. You'd be like, "It was edible," and then yeah. you have to run over and put it in your mouth you to show them. Yeah, see, em. num 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 num. Yeah, you show them. <laughs> we should start doing edible underwear, but healthy. <laughs> So oh, it's like oh, chicken. Like, yeah, like chicken. Yeah, yeah. You want fucking chicken or at my broccoli. party? Yeah, no, like, I don't know or if broccoli. Put, Let's I don't get... know if you put raw chicken next to a vagina. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you want me to put this raw chicken underwear on, yeah. and you want me to sit on a grill like my Benny Hanna. Yeah. yeah. Well, it doesn't oh. need to sit on a grill, babe. Oh, Man. yeah. That, Spends that much time next to that puss, it's going to get fucking hard baked. You're going to yeah. get all cooked up because you're in heat. Oh. <laughs> God. I changed the way she looks. Okay. Do cool. you guys like it? She looks like Do we jo- like it? Joanne yeah. from uh, Lady Gaga. Is this the way you wish you looked, Alana? No, I basically did it in a way that was like, what would be easy for people to cosplay? <laughs> oh <laughs> nice. my gosh, a pink cowboy yeah. hat. Is that, Some overalls uh, and a black shirt. A trucker's <laughs> wet dream. But I did want to give the three of you the opportunity to name her. Mm. What's her name? Uh, well, it's, she's got three names. We'll each come up with one. Okay. okay. Josephina. Mary. Beatriclus. There we go. Josephina Mary Beatriclus. Okay. Ah. Okay. Uh, well, Joining... uh, it's going to be so easy for the cosplayers to remember. So every time he says it, he goes, Beatriclus. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, it's, tough. So it's, it's supposed to be sour. <laughs> it's like you can taste oh. it. All right, Lana, what are we doing today? Uh, I don't remember which one I picked. This is a stunt race that had 77% rating because the one I was going to do didn't show up in the menu. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> is this is You missed it. Whoa. It doesn't matter. Oh my gosh. Okay. That was awesome. This seems cool. How's he going faster it's than you? It's slipstream. Slipstream. He's oh, drafting yeah. you. I don't mm. think we turned that off. Also, did we turn off custom cars? No. Probably. Don't you pit me. I like custom cars. You, are you allowed? But it? they have custom cars. We have junk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we have. What? I don't What's know what we name? have. What's her name? Oh, uh, Josephine Joseph- and Mary Beatriclus. <laughs> yeah, we have her junk. <laughs> she has the free car. No! <laughs> you went with Mary. <laughs> yeah. I appreciate it, actually. <laughs> I tried to go short. Yeah. Land it, Adam. Land it. And in. And she's oh. from New York. Yeah, from New York. Buffalo. Ow. Former oh, actress nice. turned stunt driver. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. She loves pink cowboy hats. Mm-hmm. It's Whoa. Yeah, it's all that stuff happening. It's mysterious. The excitement. They're getting all experience cowboys all in New York. Oh, Absolutely. There's cowboys cool. everywhere. That was Mysterio. First place. I know there are cowboys in California. Ow. Yeah, there are cowboys yeah. in California. Oh, they're in New York? Of course, sure. They're there? everywhere. Yeah, yeah. It's America. Nor- uh, up north. Did cowboys originate in America? They did, right? Yeah. Of course. I think so. Was it in, or was it in Italy? No. Cowboys <laughs> one, of the, one or the other, of course. Because uh, they're on the range. Oh. The closest, oh. thing, the closest thing other cultures had to cowboys were like sheep herders. Oh. Shepherds? That sounds boring. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like oh, yeah. Jesus? Like Jesus. Boring like cool. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus is like, how could I be more boring than a carpenter? I bet Jesus got beat up tons. Oh, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Well, there's that one time. Before we get started, does anyone want to get out? I always wish they had made Passion of the Christ too. Yeah. Because uh-huh. then he would have come back yeah, and revenge. used all his superpowers for revenge. Nice. <laughs> that would have been rad. I like, go, oh, no, Jesus, you're the chosen one. He goes, not today. Okay. I win. I want to. <laughs> we don't have a mic on, though. I can't change settings when we're in this menu. You have to do the setting. Yeah, when we're in the game, you can change I should have done that. I'm sorry, right. but I wanted to sync. You blew it. Pretty it, doesn't blow it. it doesn't matter. I'm tired of all these copyright strikes we get from music. Uh, we actually don't ever. That never happens. It yeah. literally never happens. Yeah, we get so copyright like, strikes from film house. So we can play any music mm. we want right now? Whatever you want. What do you want to play? Sing it. Let's see if the editor can think of what song I'm thinking of. I just put. My dick in a blender, turn it out. It feels good. Shred it all to pieces. Oh well, don't really need it. He got it. He nailed it. Yeah, he got it. He I it. I have a a music device that I a new toy that I got. Okay, what is it? Oh yeah, I know. Should I bring it in? Related, there are sex toys that you can synchronize (laughs) with music. What? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. They vibrate according to To a bass or whatever. Yeah. (laughs) Those (laughs) exist. (laughs) What? You're like, I want to get off to Lil Wayne. Mm. You can. And then you do. I mean I already have. And Lil Wayne is inside of you. Oh, you got his Oh that's that's right. (laughs) Wow, it's like there's a marching band in the room. 
this, this actually really yeah. lightens up it the game. It actually sounds part. really good. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to play this the whole race. The ultimate race. Is this a remix of that song? Yes. Yes. Uh, this well, is not the actual song from Robin Hood. Yeah, what the hell song is this? Robin Hood. So they ripped that off from a Disney movie, and Disney yeah. was like, that's cool. No, we love no one was like, that's cool. It's it was a on a website somewhere, and they yeah. couldn't do anything about it. Yeah, that's a yeah Disney they, loves it when you rip shit off from them. They didn't have content <laughs> They ID. particularly are like, copyright's overrated. We don't need that. We I mean, don't they, care. They okayed that one dude, Pogo, or whatever. The guy who did all the Disney remixes, like all the music, oh, and, yeah, they're yeah. Like, and they're like, you know what? The way you do it, it's so cool. Mm -hmm. Like, we want to pay you to do it. And then he said a bunch of weird shit online oh, yeah, where he was, like, happy that people got shot up in a nightclub oh, in Orlando. No. And he's like, you guys just don't get humor. Did I do better or worse than Alana? You did better. Just really? Better. Oh, just thanks better. for noticing. I appreciate your support. <laughs> <laughs> My Diablo 3 account got hacked. Oh, And no. I, I, beat, I beat the campaign once. How many things did they sell on the auction house yeah, for you? Yeah, I was going to say, the, were you all up in auction house? I could <laughs> almost sense the disappointment when they got into my account and only a few things moved around. Oh. And they just went, this guy's got fucking nothing. Yeah, I know. That's what I like to think if someone were to try to rob me. They would just be like, what the fuck is any of this? No. They'd be very disappointed. See, that's why it's I always carry $500 cash on me at all times. So, so that not way if I get robbed, they won't think I'm pathetic. Hmm. Oh, But it's all I have. Okay. All I, right. That's I, good. I, I had a teacher tell me one time. It was in a class called Strategy, by the way. Cool. This I don't. I never really strategy understood of what? it. Okay. Like life strategy. Oh, just it's basically like what you strategy. call life pro tips. But okay. he said, if you ever get robbed, what you do is you take the money out of your wallet and you throw it on the ground. And you keep the wallet. And all I could imagine was the guy shooting me and then picking up the money. <laughs> yeah, what was the what was the goal? Well, I think the goal you is to throw get throw it away. To, we'll get the robber to go down for the money, mm -hmm. and then what you do is then you go, boom, like that. You need power bomb. No, no, sit down, power bomb. Suplex. I think the idea was like, like he'll pick up the money and then move on with his life. Except in my mind, he picked up the money. Goes now, give me the wall. Now give yeah, me the give wall. Me the wall. Yeah, because that's where everything good I go is. Down. I think I think his idea was that you run away. Yeah, you make yeah. the move. You, you throw, throw the money, so you throw the money and run, and then you go. With this, it's not gonna work. With these three seconds, I'm gonna get so far away. That's like if your teacher said, "We this if you get robbed, shout." Is that a ghost? <laughs> <laughs> I just don't think that I could be at a club and hear this and yeah. be like, "I gotta get, I gotta get up, get on the dance floor, I gotta get <laughs> into this one." Right, I'll come Let's with it. it. I'll come with <laughs> this is the one. <laughs> I just, just, I just, I just match us in the club going like, "I'm gay." <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I got one. I'm just realizing now, <laughs> but I'm gay. Do you want a drink? Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> this is the best night of my life. Thank you. Is there going to be a drop? Of course no. there's going to be. This is just like, Bruce, let's get out there. I uh, love this song. Is there a drop, though? I'm only going out there. Oh, drop. yeah. Dig it, dig it, dig better not be another hip. There it is. <laughs> is this the Blade soundtrack? Hey, James. Yeah. I just realized something. What's up? I'm gay! Hey! That's awesome, dude! You want a drink? Yeah! Well, we finally got Bruce to admit it. Oh, no. <laughs> Sit on it. Oh. Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna break it. Yeah, it's fine. It looks pretty steady. I mean, you can just maybe squat on it. Yeah, just put your balls on it. Uh... <laughs> James, I just realized something. What's up? You're gay. <laughs> <laughs> this is the greatest night of my life. I want a drink. <laughs> Hi. Wab, wab, wab. Uh, it's still not working, I don't think. No, it's not. Oh, well. Really? I mean, we can hear him. I know we can't, but we're not talking to them, so. So they can shout at us. Just All like right. they want. Yeah. Oh. It's want. my ideal relationship. I'm not proud to say it, hmm. but I'm sure that when I was like 17, and I was playing games online, and I hear a girl, I'd be like, is a girl playing Counter-Strike 1.6? But would you say I, that into a mic? Would I only ever got, a... how old are you, young man? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 12. Young man. I'm pretty sure people got said, like, who's that little boy? I Keep got, it down, I got that a lot, man. but then sometimes I, may I would been be one like, of those people. no, I'm a woman. Yeah. <laughs> and then they would just be very nice, more so than mean. That's what I would do. I'd be like... Uh, hey, Pink Rose, how are you? Like, I would just talk to them like they were, uh... Will you marry me? Do you want to go to date? They'd usually be be nice, and then, like, later you'd get a, a message that would be like, I want to come on tit, and you'd be like, damn it. Uh, yeah, yeah. 
We all want to come on, uh, too. We all do. I do always get the, I want to pee in your butthole. <laughs> you think that's what Mozart intended when Absolutely. he composed his piece? No, because it was Beethoven. It's transformative. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've heard this. So yeah. I, I listened to this when I was in high school, when I was like 14 or so. It was oh, all man, about this it's shit. so different not having it on my winning. <laughs> with an alien skin or something. Oh, yeah, I remember this. <laughs> That's like a good 150 BPM. It's ridiculous. I'm, just, I'm playing tribes right now with my hat on, <laughs> dipping marshmallows and frosting. My friend would knock on the door and go, I got Ghost in the Shell on VHS. <laughs> Let's watch it later. Let's jerk off at the same time. I just realized I'm gay. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Can I get you a drink? <laughs> the best night of my life. Someone's done anal to this time. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> in a bathroom. Okay. Do you guys what? know Zach Efron has a YouTube channel now? You've been telling oh, me that. What does he do? Oh, no. Fitness videos. Oh, no. Famous people. Are they good? Everything he does turns to Gold. He's gonna take Silva, all of our subscribers and viewers. You know the worst thing about it? I was watching a video where he had on Alexandria Daddario. Mm -hmm. They were working out together. I'm mm -hmm. aroused. He was talking about how difficult they were because they were both in Baywatch. He's talking about how difficult it was to get into shape for that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He was like, he was like, but that was the, he was like, that's the most jacked I've ever been. Mm -hmm. He's like, I wasn't able to drink water. He was honest about it. But then later on in the video, he takes off his shirt and he looks just as jacked. <laughs> And I'm like, but what about it now? <laughs> this is off season? Well, that's off season. <laughs> James, hold on. Yeah. Did his YouTube channel have this? Nah. What the hell? Ooh. <gasps> what are you what? flexing? What are you flexing? I think he shot himself. Oh, oh okay. Oh. You your toe. There, You're right? flexing your toe. Oh, okay. <laughs> when you point out the muscles, that's mm -hmm. how you know they're uh. good. <laughs> See, that's the thing about him. He doesn't flex. He doesn't need to. He just uh -huh. looks constantly flexed. Uh -huh. Did you see that people this week have been saying that uh, Aquaman thinks they, they think Aquaman got fat? Jason Momoa? Yeah, yeah. he did. He gained weight. That oh. doesn't mean he got fat, Bruce. I Whoa. said he gained weight. We discussed he said, this yeah, before. He did. Jason Momoa was never ripped. He was jacked. He was jacked. Okay. Jason oh, that's right. We've discussed right. this. We've talked so, about this. So ripped, ripped, ripped is when you dehydrate yourself and yeah. you look like ripped. Wolverine. Ripped yes. is okay. the only thing further than ripped is shredded. Okay. Wolverine, uh, yeah, Hugh Jackman, when he's like he's, that in yeah. uh, Days for Future Past, is ripped. He's yeah. Ripped. Okay. okay. Like, you almost can't be big if you're shredded. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not into shredded. Which is why I would never <laughs> talk for me. Not personally. into it. Oh, is this first person alive? I, I decided to make it first person. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Get him! It's, oh. a, it's a maze. I feel like we've done this, but it doesn't matter because it's awesome. Yeah, I was going to say. We've done one that's similar. Yeah! I don't think we've done he this one. He can't see you, Adam. He's blind. He is blind. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> he's playing blind right now. <laughs> they did a thing at the end of the workout. Um, where they got oh. into a cryo chamber to freeze their bodies back to normal. That is not at oh. all what anybody can do. Well, what? I mean, they did it. Should we collectively freeze the fat? All of us go and freeze the fat, but yeah. in different places. I've heard about that. Like what place, it's called? Uh, I think it's like, uh, when James uh. said cryo sleep or whatever. Oh, yeah. sorry. No, you can freeze your fat cells. Yeah, What's yeah. it called? Generally, it's called freezing the fat, but <laughs> cryo... Cryoplasty. I've seen a video oh. on it. They put like a clamp on wherever you have fat and just like leave it on and then like freeze your. I don't understand For how, how it wouldn't. Like I don't hours. Know. I, I don't yeah, actually like know a long the, time. Well, the, the, the idea works. is that some guy almost froze the death in like Everest, but then he was like, I didn't die. And I'm ripped. Yeah. Well, they essentially kill the fat cells. It's, right. it's like oh. liposuction, but with ice. And yeah. they don't suck anything out. I don't think it's an actual surgery. Well, but I don't know how it doesn't fuck okay. your skin up. Well, that's like cupping, like what Michael Phelps does when, yeah. he, when he puts cups all over the back yeah. and like sucks up the blood to his yeah. muscles. Why do oh, people do out. that? I've seen that. But why do they do that? The jury's still out on that. But the fat out? No, no. Apparently, it brings the circulation to your muscles better. It forces circulation. Okay. By, by drawing the blood to the it surface. Blood. Sure. Okay. So most most doctors have said it doesn't really do anything. But. <laughs> most doctors, reliable statistic. Yeah. Most doctors I mean, have nine said out of ten doctors <laughs> say don't try this. Yeah, I mean, there's always that one dick doctor. Well, there's the one doctor that's Michael Phelps' yeah. doctor. He's like, yeah, man, keep doing it. You're fucking winning gold medals. You have to buy a new cup every time, or it won't be efficient. That's ten dollars. <laughs> what if we What if we started a show called Fitness Fads? Um chicka, um chicka, um chicka, um chicka, um chicka. Um, now take it to the right. Where we work out using only the worst. Proven, proven bad fitness, fitness fads? Oh. strategies. What could go wrong? <laughs> we so hurt every everything. Week. Bruce will have on that Bane mask thing that oh. basically just suffocates you. That is, has no proven cardiovascular oh, yeah. benefit. Wait, I'll people use, use a mask when they're working out. Yeah. Have you ever seen yeah. these people? No. They, 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 it's Watch basically a Creed mask one. that goes around like a gas mask. It does. But it has different filters that you can put in there, so it, it's harder to breathe. 
But study, okay. and they're like, oh, well, if it's harder for me to breathe, that means more cardiovascular no. ability no. is required. But I what would it actually, die. Some, one doctor wrote, it's the equivalent of trying to work out with someone wringing your neck the whole time. <laughs> also, apparently, uh, like those things that volleyball people have when they have like the tape. Yeah. I guess that doesn't do What's anything. That? It looks like someone just like, it's smeared like, shit on their like, side. Well, it's like heat, like, I don't know what it's called. Something tape. Flex like, oh, tape. Gosh. I saw this boat in half. So they'll tape along the muscle fibers this tape on the outside of their body and they'll go, ah, there we go. But it doesn't actually do anything. Also, waist anything. trainers, which is people just wearing tight things around yep. their waists. Yeah. How about this? What? Why don't we do all of those all at once? Mm -hmm. Adam's having in a real <laughs> battle. There we go. <sighs> Got him. You lit so that man on fire. Oh, oh man. and then you caught on Either fire. Either way, I think we should all just, as friends, we go in the sensory deprivation tank, we freeze the fat, mm -hmm. we do it all together. Yeah. I would like to go in one of those sensory deprivation oh, tanks at some point. Don't I'm very go, curious to try that. Don't go in with a cut on your finger like I did. What? Because it's Epsom salt. Oh well, yeah, that'll sting you. Yeah, and, and it's it was, actually uh, heightening your senses. <laughs> it was a uh, it was a Valentine's Day gift uh -huh. that Jess was like, I want to try this out. I was like, let's do it. And I've never been more depressed in my life. Oh, that's a shame. Because yeah. it's like you separate from everyone and you go in this room alone. Uh -huh. And then the the dude who runs the place is also looks like his eyes got burned out from doing too many drugs. The last thing Adam wants is to be by himself. That's all I want in life, <laughs> a, really. Uh, well, in a lot of you should be doing it Absolutely. every day. Absolutely. Can I live there? Apparently you can learn like Mandarin or something in those I, things. I found <laughs> out that you, when you use a separate de different sensory deprivation tank, you're not supposed to do it face down. Because that's what my, the first time I tried it, you'll kill yourself. ruined it. You'll kill yourself. Me. How would like, you I'm breathe? Not, I'm yeah. not learning anything. No, you'll kill yourself. But like, oh, is it got, pitch black and silent? That's yes. what I yes. want. It has to be soundproof. Oh, so basically, as since all of your other sensors senses are dulled, right. it causes your brain to go crazy well, you're supposed and to, like, flip out. You're supposed to hallucinate and think about things you wouldn't yeah. normally think about. Joe Rogan said it works. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Rogan says, like, work. salvia and everything else. Every other drug he's yeah. tried works. What Didn't is a Joe Rogan? Like, I've seen bits of his podcast. What's his thing? How did he become popular? Well, well he's a, he's a okay. stand-up comedian. Oh, okay. Okay. But then, then he was on news radio. But then, yes. Yeah, then, and he, then but then like he most stand-up comedians, he acted in the 90s. Yep. And then he moved on to hosting, and he hosted Fear Factor. That's right. Which was a show. Do you know what Fear Factor is? Yeah. Okay, so he hosted Fear Factor for several seasons. Like, eat this cow he, But he was very charismatic, very good. He's good, he's great. And he's then great. he also was really into MMA. So he did UFC. And so then eventually he got a gig as an announcer mm -hmm. for MMA. He's still doing he's it. pretty fucking great at yeah, that. He's still doing it. And then he just kind of, like, created this, through his Twitter and social media and stuff, created, like, cult of personality kind of thing. Like, okay. Uh, he basically became an influencer. I've listened to him talk about animals on his podcast. Yeah, he talks about everything. That's mostly it. He yeah. loves animals, drugs. UFC, uh -huh. comedy, yeah. conspiracy theories, conspiracy mm -hmm. theories, kettlebells with gorillas on them, like gorilla <laughs> head kettlebells, <laughs> uh, DMT. Yeah, any drug. Yeah. yeah, it's safe to say if there's a drug, he loves it. So if you want to become a, a better man, Alana, listen to Joe Rogan. Cool hammer. What, what, what do you think is more strong, hammer or axe? Axe. They're the same. Axe. Well, why would they have the hammer as a pickup then? The skins. Oh! Run away the other way. Oh! You're never gonna be faster. Oh, oh, oh. hit him! I guess oh. The, wake up! Man. Josephina! I don't know, but look at this. Watch, I'm setting a trap. Great. Do you have For anything yourself? to light that on fire? Uh, I guess I if you hit an axe on the ground, it would create a spark. And GTA is all about realism. Do you think it would? Mm. Yeah, it'll definitely. Not a Let's hand. Try it. In theory, if you yeah, if you axe the ground enough, you could probably spark a flame. Wait, what's crash? I There's mean, this, it's crash. not gonna work like I'm this. This it, isn't Red Dead. Nah, it doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna wait there though, just in case somebody throws a Molotov. <laughs> This is my lair! I like, I like the covered in gasoline now, by the way. <laughs> <I know. laughs> it's raining, it's fine. Coming to my. Oh, here we go. Perfect. There we go. All right, now Did you just you... gotta wait for someone to so fall into your trap. The same thing that Where happens if you Where just throw it, it at him. Oh, he would just walk past your trap. Oh, 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 go, no! Oh, you, you missed it! Oh, you missed oh, it twice! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I really did. What the fuck? Mm. If you hit those barrels, you think they'll explode? Yeah, I'm gonna push them. Oh, spark it! Taunt him. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh, 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 oh. oh the person right oh. there. I don't understand how the game misses. Oh, the game goes, I see a guy. I'm going to hit this dead body over here. It only yeah. came out a couple of months ago. That's I'm sure they'll figure it out. Remember when he said it's not Red Dead? Because Red Dead's a game that has come out since this <laughs> game has come out, but we still play this game. That's staying power. We baby. probably we play, should go back and yeah, play Yeah, we need to play Red Dead. Dead. Yeah, we were waiting for an update. There was an update. There was. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. The boss is in there. Yeah. But that would be a multicam, right? Yes, it would be because we'd all be on horses. 
I saw The Godfather for the first time the other night. Nice. And what did you think? Thought it was fucking incredible. That's you almost beat Lawrence. Yeah, I know. Oh, wait, did Lawrence see it? No, but it was like a running joke that Lawrence hadn't seen Godfather, but right. had seen like American Ninja 4 and, or 5. Yeah. Samurai Cop 7. He's also like, saw Scarface. Didn't think Scarface was that good. Scarface. It's a little, uh, it gets a little up its own. It's, uh, it's, it's a very, product it's, of its time. It's very stylish. The product and of its time. the performance is incredible, Force but is as a great. film, I was like, I... I mean, look, both, there. both that and Cujo nice. were written. Oh, oh the unicorn! Oh, oh, <laughs> worst nightmare! Uh, I was recommended a thing on Amazon. It was like a butt flex tape, mm -hmm. but it was like it's for like the ladies. You can it's, have a nice butt too. Well, you know, you they have those ab like shockers, yeah. but it's for your ass. So it's a butt vibrator. Yeah. I mean, they just have they have those. They're called vibrators. Okay. But it's it's like it tapes around. You don't put it inside your ass. No, no, no. Oh God. Why no. not? I mean, you, I guess you. I want to. I. I clicked on random article on Wikipedia. Yes, at work. <gasps> on company time or no, lunch time? No, hey, I was exporting you a video. You VPN? I was exporting a video. Rooster Teeth sees everything you click on, just so you know. Uh, I was playing the game Five Steps to Hitler, where you click random article, mm -hmm. and then you see how quickly you can get to the Hitler article. Okay. And lo and behold, I said, is that? Q Lori? For some reason, not all Hitler pictures, but the Wikipedia article photo looks like Hugh Laurie. Of Hitler? Yeah. Actually, that Wikipedia talk gave me an idea for Hickopedia, the redneck Wikipedia, where it's like you have, you know, rednecks write articles for mm -hmm. it. The article on extraterrestrials, uh -huh. because they are real. Yeah. yeah. I met one. We huffed paint together. Yeah, you're not allowed to cite any of your work. Micopedia? Which is the Irish? Oh. There is a website uh, called Encyclopedia. Oh, I remember Encyclopedia, Which is yeah. a parody of Wikipedia, yeah. where you can submit articles. You submitted some, huh? I sub I did a lot of writing for Encyclopedia. <laughs> I wrote a, a first-hand account of how Matt Damon and I got into a fight once, and got into a bar fight, and then... Did I that really happen? No. Oh, a lot of wasted time. That's all I can say. As a, uh, I don't know, maybe 12 year old, I used to, it's not sexual before anyone questions it, role play on okay. forums, mm -hmm. okay. which is basically just a less cool version of that. So you would like make a character and they would interact with other people's characters and you would write your bit and then you'd wait mm -hmm. a day and they would write their bit. Mm -hmm. And I spent a lot of time doing that, mm -hmm. but none of it was funny. It was you and like 60, 30 year old <laughs> men pretending to be 12 year old. You know what was also lame? Because I was probably the same age, which means it was older, which means it was more niche and probably worse at the time. I did fantasy wrestling. <laughs> What is that? What it does that entail? It was a fantasy <laughs> wrestling. Sorry, sorry, James. Let me proceed. <laughs> it, was a, it was a wrestling website where you would create a character, submit a description of that character, and then they had events. Well, you basically submit monologues. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. They would say, "We're going to give you." five minutes of time on the mic, the admins yeah. of the website would say, we're gonna give you five minutes of time on sure. the mic, and then depending on how good you were at promoting your own storylines and stuff like that, then they would give you more and more face time. Ooh. I would submit monologues in character to this website, and the admins would read it, and they'd be like, all right, we're gonna give you a spot in our Monday show, which was just a text document that they released on Monday. You could have made wow. your own text document any day you wanted. They, they would read your monologues and then based, you would, you would say monologue. what some of your moves were, Thank like you. your signature move or your finisher, what, the, what your moves were and mm -hmm. what they were called. And then ultimately when you had a match, they would book it. Oh. So they would write the action description for everything that happened in the match. So you'd be reading, you'd be like, did I win? Did I win? Wow. I, I won a, not the championship belt, but uh -huh. I ended up winning like the equivalent of the intercontinental title. And then a bunch of people would message me asking if I want to be on their tag team. So uh, Alana, how old were you when you did your forum? 12 to 14 maybe? So you were 22. I was at, say 38. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out if that makes you a jock or makes you a nerd. That's the question I've been wondering my whole life. Don't know. But millennials don't I have jocks a, and nerds I was anymore. a theater kid. I was a theater kid that I was also a varsity athlete. That's true. Straight out of a Disney movie, I Disney was... Channel movie. What I really liked about that movie, that Beanie Feldstein oh. movie that just came out, Booksmart, is like ah. it's kind of like defies those roles of teenagers being like, totally, like, yeah, yeah. Oh, maybe school was like that, and it's just not anymore. <laughs> like I mean, that. John Hughes didn't have any friends. 
Why do you say that so fucker. defensively? <laughs> <laughs> if we were recasting Funhouse in a Breakfast Club remake, Adam would be Ali Sheedy shaking his dandruff. Oh, yeah. Uh, for definitely. sure. Though I wish mm. I could be that. I'd be Molly Ringwald, and I would not come out of the bathroom. In theater, I performed a scene from... Breakfast Club, and I played Emilio Estevez. Lana, you're the nerd, I guess. I'll take it. Who's your favorite evening game show host? Mine's... <laughs> Pat Sajak. Or, you, it was. This is the most... No, one, this is going to get cut, but he was the... Uh, <laughs> he was one of the hosts of Wild and Crazy Kids, and he also played the, like, pervy friend to the older brother in My Brother and Me. Omar Gooding? Wait, is that who it actually is? The original famous Gooding. Not Cubes? Cube. Cuba Gooding Jr. became famous after Omar Gooding. Wait, is Omar and Gooding he... his brother? Yeah, they're brothers. What? <laughs> now they can't cut it from the episode. <laughs> Lunch pizza <laughs> from school. All of you, Lunch shut pizza. up! What was your favorite Nickelodeon I game show? It's okay if yeah, both I of you can I didn't answer. have Nickelodeon. You guys can offer up other childhood game yes. shows. I'll tell you what. It's right after Go. I mean, I liked. Did Carmen San Diego? No. Carmen San Diego air on Nickelodeon for you? Keep shooting out my tires. Oh, lasers! Rain. What the Rain. hell? What? Oh, it worked. Uh, did it? He fell over. He Run. did fall over. I got him. You are twenty fourth though. Oh. We went to Rooster Teeth a long time ago, and we said, you know what, you guys should do? License a bunch of old game shows that nobody wants anymore, and then put talent, Rooster Teeth talent, in it. Ooh. And they said, uh, Who are you? They said, <laughs> Shut up! Your mic is broken! I had an idea. I've developed it a little bit. Okay. Funhouse Arcade. Nick Arcade, but mm -hmm. Funhouse. Oh, okay. I have it all planned out. But it basically, I had the idea. Remember when I did Date Night on stream? Yeah. There are people just talking in the Date Night chat. I can't tell if they like date night or if they want to go on a date. I love and that. I, so cool. And I dragged that uh, that waiter in. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, you can like do stuff in real time. You never had us as guests on date night. We were, we were supposed to go on a double date. That's right. true. I was going to bring a hot chick. Really? Yeah. Who? Well, maybe no one never know. I'm trying to make like a cut down of date night uh -huh. so that I can then share it and then I would, it. I would love to try that if you could give me that format. Uh, no. I didn't. I didn't invent it. I came up with it myself. But that's invention. Uh, that's the same. Little thing. Wubby, little pay money Wubby does it. We should do all kinds of knockoff game shows. We're not going to get any money to do it. So how do we do Legend of the Hidden Temple or Double Dare or yeah. Wild and Crazy Kids or Guts? We go to the water park with nothing. Yeah, it's on Wild. I think people would love seeing us go on adventures. Oh, in the water park? Yeah, absolutely. I would yeah. love to We just go to a park. water park, and then we have someone film it, and then cut it together with some royalty-free music. Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? People would love that. Yeah. Hey, smash that like button if you... <laughs> What's that? Just doing Red some bowl? Foley work. Did you juice before you came to do this gameplay? You know it. I don't consume any caffeine, sugar any free. stimulants. There's no I'm caffeine in this. See, it says sugar-free. I bought powdered vegetables because sometimes I don't feel like I ate enough veggies so now you can basically take a scoop and Are then mix serious? it in you and you can it. Do you guys know that evil can evil didn't die in a ramp? Yeah. That's wild. Could you imagine living such a life and then not dying <laughs> in the bottom of the Grand Canyon? You ever seen Viva Knievel? When Evil Knievel was like still starring in movies that were essentially propaganda about what a cool guy he was, and it starts with like him going to the orphanage at Christmas and bringing them all presents. And he has to jump over the orphanage yeah. to save it. Get ready. Here we uh, go. Well, there is a point later where he has to s basically save the day through stunting. And then there's a very skeptical journalist that's like, so, why are you so famous? And he's like, why don't you hop on the back of my bike, woman who's half my age, and I'll show you. And he pops wheelies, and she's like, wow, I do understand why you're young and attractive. Oh, already off the track. You're living you're the good. Dream. Oh. oh. Search for powdered veggies. It's not that hard. That's the problem. Why'd you move know. to the passenger seat? Uh, no, I didn't. Oh, oh, oh. What's nice. Oh, bold move. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Hang on now. Just, no, this is part of the Rainbow Road hack. Yeah, this, this is, is how you do that thing when you jump to the edge. Uh -huh. like the this is going to save version. her literally seconds. Nice. See, and now that second door is open, so that's going to create some drag. Uh, I've never played this game. How do you use the stuff you pick up? Uh, click in on the Stick. left. Oh, there yeah, there it was. Laser beam. Look at this guy having the time. Nice. Oh, come on, guys. That's you got it. Damn, what the fuck happened there? They decided to all stop in the same place. All right. Oh, to the no. checkpoint. Come on. No. Oh, unlucky. Ooh. Wow, you exploded before you were able Very to cool. hit the ground. Oh, 
Oh, sort of movement. Oh, nice dear. dear. <laughs> when you say things that sound like enthusiasm with zero enthusiasm, <laughs> it's, it's a weird. I'm focused. Oh, guys, I'm going off. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Boop. Boop. Didn't finish. <laughs> Hello there! As much as we all love Rainbow Road Mario Kart 64 version, Funhouse needs to make money and can't risk a copyright claim. So please enjoy this replacement and by all means imagine Rainbow Road Mario Kart 64 version whenever you hear it. This is the best. And it was super long. It was a super long course, so it felt like anything could happen. We've been racing on this thing for 100 years! <laughs> 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 I don't know if you're doing the nurse. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's got it. Mm -hmm. Do you guys know how to do that? Have you guys ever seen somebody does that like, crazy finger dancing? I have more of a Diddy Kong race for myself. <sighs> Jesus. Solid. When it comes to racing mechanics, Mario Kart has the like aesthetic and the presentation, but when it comes to pure racing mechanics. Oh, I get out? Oh. Uh, can someone clap for me? Yeah, <laughs> ready? No apologies. Yeah. <laughs> what do I want? He's still there. Wrong. Look, he's still there. Get out of here! <laughs> John, have you murdered someone? Could you murder someone again? I could, actually. <laughs> I've thought mm -hmm. about it a really? lot. Really? Yeah. Me too. Not like in cold blood. Uh huh. But I could kill a human. Yeah, yeah. I'm Professor John Smith. And this is Criminal Law 100, or as I prefer to call it, How to Get Away with Murder. James Alano, least show of hands, do you think John Smith could kill another human? Is the show I, of hands like, yes? Wait, hold on. Do you mean, <laughs> yes. do I think he would do it? Yes. Do I think he is capable? No. Oh, I think he's capable, but he definitely wouldn't get away with it. Oh. He'd be caught for sure. That is, that is very yeah. Does that hurt you? I shed a lot. Oh, so you the could DNA. Do, if yeah. you were going to murder someone, would you shave your all, entire body so you'd be like an Eggman? Yeah. I'd probably, I'd, I'd take a Nair bath. <laughs> what are we playing, Elise? Uh, Alana, but uh, this is Lago Zancudo Battlefield. It's basically like Battlefield. Oh, it's a okay. big, like, rainy map with, like, lots of outpost stuff. It's pretty cool. All right. One minute, 37 seconds later. You got to fuck one animal. What is it? <sighs> I can only fuck one, you say. Is it huh? anthropomorphic? A lioness. Okay, why? Uh, Strong-willed. Yep. I, I respect. There's a respect for the animal. No Absolutely. genitals, as the new Lion King taught us. No genitals, mm. don't have to worry about that. Also, because the way I have sex already looks like the way a male lion has sex, where he just you kind just of, of squats and just... Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so it yeah. wouldn't require much change on my part from mm. what I normally do. So mm. I want to get in this cruise ship. Yeah, how are they driving that? I don't know. It's, I don't think that's drivable. This it looks the game. like they beached it. Can you get in this? Someone's behind you, be careful. John, what animal would you fuck? Mm. Probably a frog. Oh, that's terrible. Several questions. Mouth fuck it. Yeah. Okay. Did you ever see that video of the ape? Yeah. That mouth fucks a frog. Wow. Have you ever what? seen that? No. Have you seen this? <laughs> have you seen this? Oh uh, yeah, I have. Oh my god, it's terrible. It was consensual. It was not. It was consensual. not consensual. It's terrible. That frog did not know which way was up. No, that frog. <laughs> he was. Bell bound. So just the way, the there. way he the, die? No, because he, he gets he mouth fucked. The frog is basically a whole mouth, and then this That's monkey. True. Frog is basically a condom. Basically, like a mouth and then the, and then uses it to fuck his own mm -hmm. dick. Oh tool. my god! That's actually you know they say that that was man's first tool. You frog? know, in, frog in uh, yeah. space Odyssey, whatever the fuck. Mm -hmm. You know, is they pick up a stick and they yeah. use it to kill someone. Yep. It was actually he looked down, he saw a frog, and he fucked it. Yeah. That's where AIDS started. That frog was shell shocked. There's a turtle. Turtles are shell shocked. Oh. Have you seen a turtle come? Uh, yeah. yeah. It's, it makes, it it's the only time it makes noise. It's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> John, you're not getting in this boat. Yeah, why? Did, and you got up I there, mean, you didn't even drive it. You did, they're impenetrable. You, yeah. Have you seen? I, oh, you yeah, haven't, I haven't seen anybody. Click in on the stick. What Try that. animals did you guys fuck? Dolphin. 
Yeah, well, dolphins, you don't really have much of a say. And in dolphins that, would be way into you. Like people. I think they'd cuddle me after, and that's important to me. Yeah, right. Dolphins flip you aside. At least one animal. Did you say you'd have sex with also a dolphin? Man, the most dangerous animal. Nice. Uh, oh. Probably. Man, I guess I've never thought about it. Well, you better start thinking, babe. Um. Hmm. Probably something tough. small like a meerkat. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I okay. Timon type. You're a woman after my own heart. <laughs> We're both looking to fuck the same animal. Yeah. I think. You think you could make a meerkat go down on you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you think you can make a human go down on you? Yes. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Meerkats like to burrow. Um, <laughs> and I would use that to my advantage. <laughs> Where is everybody? God dang it! Yeah, I mean, this, this is like, like real. This is simulating real war. It is. Right. Who it's needs... supposed to be like Battlefield. What the yeah. fuck? That's bullshit. He's hacking. Kick him. Known hacker, Electro Gypsy. Whoa! Yeah, there's a helicopter. Shh, you're gonna get that boat. I can't find anything. I mean, I'm trying to shoot. I felt like I was shooting those guys. They go get in the hell. Go boat. up and get in the helicopter chain. What? I can't. It's flight. It's there. right there. Get in it. Come pick us up. No, coming down. Come. They're sitting down. Oh, oh, oh you wanted me on that? Weird. That's what you wanted me to do? <laughs> wow. That's they sad. Landis, that real hard. You know, the irony of John Landis's name is that landing is something he was terrible at. Whoa. Zing. Whoa. I was watching uh, comedians in cars drinking coffee. Eddie Murphy was on, and he said his favorite director to work with is John Landis. Ah! The most fun I ever had working on a movie is with John Landis. What, for Trading Places? Uh, wasn't Beverly Hills Cop? <laughs> oh, Beverly Hills Cop. Who did Trading Places? Children. Was that Ivan Reitman? It looks, seems like it, but I don't know offhand. What the hell? There's a certain aspect of movies made in the 80s. Oh, come on! We're doing one thing that's fucking interesting and you ruin it. Well, if you could choose how you were going to die, you can have it be a movie set, it can all be scripted. What would you choose? Like, how would you choose to die? I feel like Wait, dying like... in an explosion would be pretty sick. Actually, I got a good question for you. How yeah. do you guys want to die? I guess I'd like drown in my favorite liquid. So milk? Cold. Oh, I thought you say breast milk. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'm just gonna put it out there. I am cast as, in the remake of The Crow. Nice one! Oh. I'm, I, and then I'm cast as a new Brandon Lee. Mm -hmm. He got shot during filming, right? He did. Yes. I want to die in a recreation of the sequence from oh, GoldenEye when Xenia on a top kills that general with her legs. That is a good okay. way to die. <laughs> It's a whole crazy story. Yes. Basically, um, I don't remember. I know the whole story. <laughs> Both of you interrupted me, but I know the whole story. <laughs> the whole story is that they had a prop gun on set, but the thing about guns that fire blanks is that all it's a, it's an actual gun. They just change the bullets. So they change the bullets um, to be blank bullets, which means that the explosion still happens in the chamber but it doesn't fire a projectile. Mm -hmm. Problem is, that still can create shrapnel and shit, and for whatever reason, that day, the wet guns master decided to go home early. And then this guy who'd never done it before was in charge of managing all the weaponry. He's like, I, I'll handle it. They went to film this scene, and he didn't check the chambers, and the last time they fired the, the blanks, it had still had some debris in it, so when the blank went off, it created an explosion, which then sent the shrapnel piece, which is basically the same as a bullet, into Brandon Lee's body and killing him. God damn. Gun safety is always <laughs> assuming that every gun is real and crammed full of bullets. Yeah. That's gun safety yeah. rule number one. One Even time I a put an empty gun. gun in my mouth and I pulled the trigger a couple times. Yeah, that's how you, that's the best way to actually <laughs> test to make sure that it is not. To answer your question, I'm in a production of Cats and they send me to the heavy side layer. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I go. Excellent. Actually, it's probably leaving my trailer run over by bird scooter. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh! Ow, ow, ow. John? Um, you have to choose how you're going to die. It can be probably super old age. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, okay. We'd set up for it pretty early, though, because who knows when I'm going to go. Yeah. So basically, I get to spend the next 30, 40 years just hanging out in bed, playing video games. Oh, that's all I'll do. 
That's face I'll make. <laughs> How often do people die of old age? I wonder what the percentage of that is. I feel like it's probably not much. Well, I mean, old age yeah. is a term for basically anything that's not murder or accident. Yeah. I would have taken old age to be like the people who just kind of fall asleep one day. Well, what if you're okay, yeah. 108 years old and you get cancer? Cancer would kills you. Would you say that cancer killed you, not cancer old age? Cancer kills you. Don't let cancer off the hook like generally, that. Cancer's a dick. But generally, old age is people dying from one of numerous causes, but it's because their body is it's feeble. It's pneumonia. It's always yeah, pneumonia. Yeah, it's, it's always pneumonia. <laughs> generally, old people die of pneumonia <laughs> or heart failure. Yeah. Why do they like the it same, so cold? Which yeah. is the same as failure. when a 33 year old dies of heart failure, except they're old. Right, so I don't think it's the old age that killed them. What about, all right, uh, maybe that's. Re- you have to so replay ha- one You're more saying time. How, many pe- how many old fucks die in their sleep? So, well, but, yeah, okay, that's but my question. Hold on. Here's a question. The person's 98 years old. They go to sleep. Piano falls on their apartment, crushes their bed. Did they die of old age? They oh, were sleeping, the and they were old. No, it's just when you peacefully <laughs> die in your sleep. He well, was no, peaceful. No, no. He had a great dream. How old is the piano? Ah. How old is the rope that was holding the piano? <laughs> very old. What old if, there you go. Old. That's old age. Okay, what if a regular clock falls on you, kills you, or a grandfather clock falls on you and kills you. That's old age. That's old age. I agree. Get pneumonia out of your system early. That's what I've always said. You didn't answer the question, though, James. How, how would you die? I did. I said crow. <laughs> <laughs> that is right. You said, said you said crow. you would die crow. Oh, is that GTA Alana? I haven't seen her character. She looks rough. She said she picked something that she wanted pe- to be easy for people to cosplay. And I was like, <laughs> where do you expect this to happen? That was the same lie Kojima said. When he made the character quiet, he just wanted porno in his video game. Yeah. That's a hyper simplification of the many factors that were involved. All right, what are we playing today? We're playing funny moments, James. That's what we're doing. Oh, right. oh, GTA yeah. funny moments. We don't make funny videos. We make a funny moment. I'm telling you, they'll come after you, Ryan. Yeah. They'll take everything yeah. you have. They will Who suck are we you dry. About Them too? because of what you said. Adam's really Adam. trying to push this re- red state, Ryan. <laughs> <I'm not> re- <laughs> yeah, it does rhyme. We need <laughs> diversity here at work, and you're the only person that voted for Trump. So <laughs> <laughs> you don't know that yeah. when you when you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You vote. It's your right as a citizen. You, you vote, can vote any for whatever democratic you want. way you want to. <laughs> if the government offered a program where they would just vote for you, something you, tells me that could be easily abused. What? No. What? It's called straight ticket. Yeah. Oh, really? You can just do that. You still have to get up though. You still have to yeah. check one box. Who has the time? The electoral college basically means that your vote doesn't count. All mm-hmm. oh, right. Yeah. So uh, well, not necessarily you true. Vote just depending somebody on what else. state you're in. You know. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I think it goes both ways. You're voting so <laughs> someone else can vote. Because, like, is, even though I live in California, where it benefits me, because it always goes to the way I want it to go. Uh huh. It doesn't benefit the people who don't vote the way I vote, and that is a problem. Real quick, we're playing GTA. Lawrence, oh, what's yeah, this we're map? playing a video game. This we don't the... want to talk about politics. <laughs> Apparently, this is just a really long wall ride, yeah, which means it's we... going to be a nightmare because we... people keep doing that shit. We may have played this one vote before. Red State later. Ryan to be uh, It doesn't vote matter. Now, now some new footage. Now that we, yeah, now that we, we got that out of the way, uh, Ryan, explain gerrymandering for all the, <laughs> yeah, the kids so, out there. Who is he? <laughs> What? Have you guys seen that picture of Henry Cavill on a boat? What, is this the toe-sucking one? No, wait. Oh, what? Oh, oh my god. Oof. Henry Cavill's gonna do the unthinkable and get people like James to give a shit about The Witcher. What's The Witch? Is that the sequel to The Witch? Damn it, Ryan. God damn it. He was on a boat, and he was wearing a white shirt, and he was sailing it. There we go. This is it. This is where everybody fucks it up. And then... Oh, yeah, this map. Uh, oh, I knew uh, it was. He was sailing it, looked exactly like Eric from Little Mermaid cartoon. What if that whole movie... Here's it. Here's my pitch for an alternate movie. It's what great. about a version of it where he's just there to adopt her? And he's like, okay. I want to adopt you. And she's like, fuck. And she turns into a fish. <laughs> and then he goes, oh, well, I hands her to that chef. <laughs> That's my version. See? I, Disney should get me, not John Favreau, to just right. cheat his way into a billion so, dollars. So when they keep... Give me money to make a whole new movie that fails. So they keep the song, Kiss the Girl. Yeah. And the whole time he's grossed out. And he goes, no, no, adopt the girl. And they're like, no, no, kiss the girl. Well, you can't do that anymore. It's 2019. That's offensive. You can't say kiss the girl? You can't do no. it the way you were doing. That ask was for his, per- you have to ask for permission to kiss the girl. Do you think they're going to have a real mute actress play Little Mermaid? Because that's the only way it would be fair, you know? (laughs) She's in the vocal booth going, yeah. They already cast her. Uh, Is she mute? No. Bullshit. In real life, Ariel is white. (laughs) It's not that her hair is wrong. (laughs) You know, she's looking down and she's not going. Her hair is the wrong color! They so can't make eye contact with their neighbors. You, it's her hair! James was one of those people who was upset that Gaston was played by such a small man. I was, yeah. 
<laughs> it's hard for humans to look like cartoons. Cosplayers have been trying for years. Who wants somebody up? Is it hard for humans to look like cartoons? Go, oh, thank you. So what do I do? Ryan, if you could remake one Disney film from the past and do a live action remake, why would it be Song of the South? <laughs> <laughs> that movie sucks. What? It's a classic. The people in the red states, we don't like the Song of the South, all right? Red State Ryan said so. <laughs> Uh, uh, <laughs> I would remake the Disney's Robin Hood, but with a live-action fox. Like, okay. are they all still oh. be animals, like cat realistic? style? Okay. You know, are they, do they still talk wearing, or? Are they still yeah, wearing like talking. green tunics and stuff? Yeah, it's like cats. They all have the CGI like fur and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But it's like Robin Hood. Oh, with, so they're like humanoid. They're like humanoid mm -hmm. fox people and stuff. Oh. But it's real life Robin oh, okay. Hood. Okay. Oh man, I'd watch yeah. that in a heartbeat. Who will be playing these characters? Probably Russell Crowe. He just reprised his role from the Ridley Scott. As version. everyone remembers, yes. I just go with the the. Trigger, right? I'll tell you when. I'll tell yeah, you when. Don't press it now. How about fire my torpedoes? I'll boost. tell you when. There's a boost. You want to get when. ahead. Get ready. As soon as I say go, go. Get ready. Get ready. Okay. I'm closing my eyes. Go! Well, that <laughs> wasn't fair. It said <laughs> one. <laughs> that wasn't fair. It said one. I don't know what happened there. Uh, As usual, the system's trying to destroy people of proud red states. They're erasing exactly. their heritage by removing Song of the South from the DVD aisle at Walmart. What are you talking about? And it's still, Splash Mountain's still one of the most popular rides at Disneyland. Yes, but they ruined Splash Mountain. People Why? have the because wrong perceptions Because if you ride Splash Mountain, <laughs> they standards. trick Br'er Rabbit, they capture him by getting him caught in a bunch of honey. That's not what happened. Oh. It was just tar, this. wasn't it? I would love to see well, the live action. It wasn't just tar. It was tar in the shape of a man. The Do mansion? you know why Splash Mountain is called Splash Mountain? Because you make a big old splash at the end. It's because Michael Eisner oh said that it needed to be it needed to have splash in the title because the movie Splash had come out and really? Splash was what? a hot term in his mind. Really? Yes. That is crazy. For, for all that he did, really Michael nice. Eisner did a lot to really like propel uh -huh. Disney into yeah. the the modern century. Yeah. Don't hit it. He was. Oh. I he was a very out of touch good. individual. Oh my god, yeah. yeah. All, the best, great. all the best CEOs were always out that, of touch. Watch they the video. They accidentally yeah. stumbled onto billions and billions of dollars. Yeah, By working seen? very hard for it, James. Go That's back. Some, some red state mentality right there. <laughs> Go back and watch the video where they're opening Star Tours Ooh. for the first time. And Michael Eisner's there, and he looks at his cue card three times. And he goes, and here he is. <laughs> three... 4 3 PO. <laughs> 4 3 PO? He, he, he butchers the name like twice. Nice. And you just see George Lucas dying inside. Well, did you guys know that in Father of the Bride and Father of the Bride Part 2, oh. Eugene Levy appears in both films playing different characters? Movie detail. No. Oh. I got to go Watch to Disneyland for free because of uh, Father of the Bride 2. They filmed it on my grandparents' street, and to apologize, they said, We're so sorry for making it uncomfortable and filming here. Here are four free tickets to Disneyland. They were also neighbors with Judge Ito. Who else wants more 90s trivia? None. Okay. My uncle worked at a restaurant with Cato Kalin. Wow. Cato Kalin had a job? He was an actor. He was an actor. Yeah. yeah, he was an actor. Come on. I thought he was just a dude who hung out. Yeah, an yeah, actor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the social commentary is strong with this one. <laughs> How the fuck did you do this? Well, hit the, if you hit it and then you land and you keep driving. I, oh, no. I just, wow, so how did you do that? I, right. I have a more important driving. question for you, Ryan. Yes. Who will be playing Maid Marian? Oh, fox. W w yeah, w w <laughs> which animal was she? It's a fox. She was a fox. Good guys are foxes. No, bad that's guys not true. Are, well, you there, don't know what you're talking about. Bear I've never there's two the foxes there's in the, the film. Don't yeah. embarrass yourself. That's the sheriff. The sheriff's a fox? No, yes. he's a wolf. That's what I thought. There's a big ass bear. Uh, big John. That's big Baloo. John. <laughs> you know, that was one of the last things Disney ever wrote was the name Kurt Russell, and he spelled it wrong. Is that why Kurt Russell's our golden boy? Yeah. He's I watched Disney Dis Golden Boy. He's yeah. everything Golden Boy. I watched Escape from LA. That movie's a treasure. Wow. Escape from that, LA. That, <laughs> that was that was always Walt's dream. What do you like more? The basketball scene or the surfing scene? Surfing scene. Okay. Without question. Bruce Campbell is a surgeon, guys. I'm going insane. <laughs> Running this. <laughs> I, I don't know. This there's <laughs> nothing I can do. Yeah, I've never done a barrel roll in a car, God. idiot. This so, is the one. This is the one. Uh to the right side. That is, oh, close. So there he goes. That's it. Now, Ah, uh, oh you didn't control. God. They don't got these weird ass tracks in the red states, man, that are just fucking I round. know, red state Ryan, <laughs> if you round. fail at someone else's fault. Exactly. <laughs> Can you do a, a Buffalo Bill impersonation? Uh, is, you mean where I tuck my dick between my legs? That was perfect, thank you. Okay. <laughs> Ryan, I don't want to take your stick, I'm sorry, but I grew up in a red state too, so uh -huh. we gotta fight for it, right? What? Who Who's more ruggedly independent? The, between me and you? Yeah. You ride a motorcycle. Mm, I, but it's electric. I do, and I That's wear a, a helmet. That's a mark against. Yeah. It's a 
because it, Lawrence is a lot of weird things Whoa. where it seems like it would be a red state plus, yeah. but it's a red state minus. So yeah, like, it really is. drives a motorcycle. Well, now we're talking. It's electric. You son of a. Do not fuck. Electric motorcycle. Car that I often see board games sticking <laughs> full, out the full back. Of shit. And um, a full size different munchkin mannequin. Expansions? Yes. Why did you have a mannequin? I had a mannequin in my van. Why yeah. do you have a mannequin? Nope. No oh. more questions asked. Oh. We got to the bottom of it. <laughs> we right. figured it all out. Uh, who would be playing the Sheriff of Nottingham then? A wolf! It was a wolf! I, I know, but what <laughs> an actor? An actual wolf! <laughs> T Taylor, um... What's the dude Lawner. from... from yes. Twilight? Is that the Twilight dude? That yeah. feels like typecasting. He already has experience That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna wolf. typecast all the people who, you know... It, you, okay. You gotta... You gotta, uh, ease people into... To... You know... He did a hit film called... Abduction. There we go. Yeah. Oh, okay. It was trying to be like a Jason Bourne shit. Scott Atkins is in an abduction. How do you not know this? I don't know. I've fallen behind on my Scott. They're like, what's another word for take? Speaking of Munchkin, when are we, uh, I feel like... I never want to play Munchkin. I never so want to never wanna play that game again. I, like I play with a few modified house rules oh, that make no. it more fun. All right? No okay. one was into it. I remember everyone was just like... Doing something Did else. Did you play? Well, that's it's that's hilarious. not that's not the game's fault. I, uh, if that was the case, I'd hate most of the games because ninety percent of the ones yeah. I pick, people are like, "Well, let's just put a movie on while we're playing the game." And yeah. I'm like, "No, this is your entertainment. Yeah. You don't go to the movies and say, let's read a comic while we're here.' <laughs> you watched a movie. Board games are the movie." This is how I defend myself. Hmm. When I sometimes I'm if I'm in a scary movie, I'll cross my arms and I'm like, "This way, something comes." <laughs> I'm gonna pop out. If my hands are down here. No way, I'm gonna get spooked. What map are you doing here today? I have no idea, sure. Lisa. I just picked it, it looked cool. Are you murdering people on a golf course? How are you missing all these I don't know. <laughs> lead it, lead it. Nice! <laughs> what? That was a direct <laughs> shot! Was absolutely oh, God. on. <laughs> she couldn't have survived that shot. Wow. <laughs> she tried. Uh, yeah, this is a Ma inspired map. Uh, hit new movie Ma in theaters. No, it's nice. gone. I only need Probably. To look at the it's not even. By the yeah. time we're the recording this, might be on Netflix. It's no. not even. It's not even relevant. <laughs> well, it's. Oh, I guess it's probably past Halloween even. Yeah. Oh, well, this. Yeah, this video yeah, is not going Christmas. up for 2020. Happy 2020. <laughs> I'm. I'm looking forward to 2020. Finally get a. Get a future year. We get Olympics. Nintendo Land. Nintendo Land. That is a straight future year. I can't believe yeah, I made it. Yeah, 2019, this far. not future enough. No. There was like the 2000s. They were like, ah, it's just the 2000s. Yeah. We get into the teens though. Now we're talking because yeah. we're deep into the decade. I think people are doing the same thing now towards the end of this decade because it doesn't feel like the future. Yeah. The sure. Look at the sniper. I like wow. how you. I like how you said it doesn't feel like it's the future yet. And we're playing like this video game with like <laughs> a dozen people around yeah. the world. This video game's like ten years old. God damn it! Line it up, nice. Nice. What Adam. an idiot. Me? I'm sorry. No, that guy that oh. you shot. You just stood there. Oh, I actually. You're didn't... cool. Thank you. Ryan, yeah. you've worked with us for how long now? Uh, seven, eight months. <laughs> damn, fucking time flies. Does it? When you're unhappy, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I am very happy. He says, <laughs> tears welling in his What's eyes. What's in that goblet? <laughs> tears. <laughs> From the last week. We do make you drink our tears. Why, what happened over the last week? Oh. <sighs> Bad, Never mind. bad stuff. Don't you hate when you keep asking questions? You're like, like, hey, you went on vacation. How was it? It was a funeral. Oh, <laughs> that's why. That's why I, when I go to parties, I sit there silently. I yeah. don't make conversation because I'm worried that that's going to happen. He has never asked me a question about myself. Never asked me a question about myself. Never asked me a question about myself. And I love him. For how it. long have y'all known each other? <laughs> I don't know. How long have? I known. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's not even about a good me. question. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, are those sailboats? Yeah. <laughs> Run aground or in the pond, Adam? There you are. Come on, Adam. Oh, oh. I can be. I don't know. Uh, is it a sign of wealth to live on a boat or a sign of poverty? It's a sign of wealth. Wealth. Okay. It takes a lot to fuel that, but is it a docked boat or is it a boat that is in motion? I, I mean, a boat in motion, no question, you're rich. Yes. But yeah. I still think that 90% of the time, you're gonna get, <laughs> nice job, Adam. Now, I think 90% of the time, you're gonna get wealth at, in terms of boats okay. more than poverty. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking the classic uh, floating down the river in Louisiana kind of guy. Uh -huh. He's only got a handful of teeth, <laughs> then, but he's got his boat kind of thing. It's more of a raft. 
I would argue that's a raft, <laughs> but uh, I think pound for pound you're gonna get wealth from boat. Okay. Next question. What if it's a boat that Natalie Wood was mysteriously Oof. pushed from? <laughs> Good reference. <laughs> then does that bring the value of your boat down? Was Christopher, Christopher Walken up? there or was he not? Christopher Walken has to know something. Of course he knows something. He was there. Yeah. So talk Walken. Quit the Walken. Yeah. Start the talking. <laughs> you know? That's what I say. Hashtag. Do it for Natalie Wood. Do the walk. <laughs> well, they don't call him Christopher Talking. Hashtag, would you tell us? Christopher Walken. Hashtag, would you tell us? You walking to Natalie him? Natalie Wood. I'm walking if he's talking. talking. You know what? And then I say, Christopher Walken, if he, I'll play, so I'll shut up. Did you all see the trailer for that Fred Durst joint coming out? I haven't oh, seen yes. it yet. The Fanatic with, uh, with John Travolta as Moose, yeah, John Travolta the Fanatic. Yeah, Chrome Dome yeah. in this movie. Here's a pitch. Fred Durst makes a movie starring Rob Zombie. Then Rob Zombie makes a movie starring Fred Durst. Mm. And then we don't watch either of them. <laughs> That's a good idea. Uh, Will Smith just fought himself in Gemini Man. Oh, man, what a thrilling movie that was. Mm -hmm. Show of hands if you were rooting for old Will Smith. Young Will Smith. Adam, he's playing the Gemini Man. Now, who made out better in that movie? Will Smith or Will Smith? Exactly. Are we going to see the make Did out? Did he get paid Thursday? twice? They used or did he get paid half well, of what he was worth. No, he got paid once, and then he got paid another 20% for his head, because that's not his body. It's Jaden's. Is it? It's Jaden's that's, body. That's Jaden's body. It's Jaden's Little body. wiry Jaden. So the scene when he's, like, making out with himself, that was him kissing his son? <laughs> no, it's technically him kissing Are his Are they gonna make face. out? Do they make out? The son is named after the mom, and the daughter's named after the dad. What? I didn't know that. Have y'all heard uh, this joke? Um, how do you find Will Smith in a snowstorm? Racing for racism in five, four, three, two. No. No. You follow the fresh prince. Expectations subverted. Yeah! Look. Yeah! Ryan, I know you're from Tennessee, so I thought you were gonna make it something racial, nope. but you wowed me. Thank like, you! Red State Just Ryan strikes again. <laughs> Just repeating the joke I heard. <laughs> what do you call it when Jeff Goldblum oh. plays at that piano bar in Hollywood once a month? What do you call that? I, uh, a... I, Jazzy fly, Jeff. Uh, Je what? It should be once in a gold Jazzy bloom. Jazzy Jeff. Oh. Yeah, what? <laughs> I like James's joke better. <laughs> that wasn't a joke. I've been going back and playing Shadow of War. That's right. In Year of Our Lord, November 2019, I'm playing Shadow of War. Mm -hmm. and I always, I want to go back in time and show Tolkien what eventually would become of his series that's based around World War One and Christianity. Mm -hmm. And it's this dude just <laughs> shanking an orc. It's great. What do you think he would be least disappointed with, that or Lego Lord of the Rings? <laughs> <laughs> I think Lego, it would at least make sense to him. I don't think he ever meant for Lord of the Rings to be violent. But I don't know that because I haven't read the books. You're going to watch the TV show? What's it about? <laughs> I'm legitimately confused because... It's about the fucking Lord of the Rings. But we already have the movies. They already yeah. exist. They have a... You're going to watch Golden Compass, aren't you? Yeah, but that wait, but they're making all of it. But look, yeah, they made Adam, they didn't make every are single they, scene. Are they adapting they, the Cimmerillion? Is that what no, this is? No, they just didn't make all the songs. Oh, the God. movies are only a mere three or four hours a piece, and a you mere? need at least. So they're doing. They, they could be hours and hours longer. So they're, they're, this isn't like a, a new like side quest. This is. <laughs> Like, this well, is, I don't believe are they they're not doing the events of see look I it, think they're doing everything they're doing it I think they're going back and they're say, going you know this has been a, was a it's movie a long story we're gonna make yeah look, we're gonna say, make it a TV show say what you will about Shadow of War or uh, War of Middle Earth or what's it called what was the first one those at least they, I don't know they're, they're different enough and they're not trying to just retell a story that's already been done like what if Shelob was a hot woman there's that okay I'll take so that. What point are you trying to make? I don't want to see the same story again. So you want to see like a a more Lord of the Rings, but the, you Maybe. want new Lord of the Rings stories told in the world. No, I don't think I want any more Lord of the Rings. Uh. I think I'm I'm I think it's done. You think it's been made to the maximum quality that it could be. I believe and you so. Don't yes. Want any more? You can never top I, the Battle of Helm's Deep. 
I would be more upset if they were like, we're doing Lord of the Rings, okay. and we're using the movies as the storyboards, but instead of Lord of the Rings actors, it's gonna be animals. <laughs> that would piss me off. Oh my god. Landed it! Ow. Have you ever seen that, that, that video, or the... The doc where uh, uh, the Edge is showing off his pedals and how he's like, this is how it sounds, you know, when I played it with you 2 and it sounds mm -hmm. like badass. Oh, and yeah, it's yeah. Like, and This was without all the pedals, just like, boom. There's a, there was a stand-up oh, comedian who did that once. Really? Where he played a bunch of, he's like, he's like, you guys love you too? And he's like, he's like, you know, like, <laughs> and he's like, now let's try it without the pedals. And it's like, <laughs> yeah. Everyone I have a really does. bad headache. Will you guys talk about soothing topics that would help fix my headache? Do you guys know that you two have been together since? Which like, one? Who has a real name? At least you oh. still haven't found what you're looking for out there. Nice. Oh yeah. Well, it's hard to navigate when the streets have no name. Oh wow. Oh, wow. Maybe you need to get some elevation. You know, in this world, we're lucky because some of us only got one love. Only got one life. One me in the night. But I've got two really good friends here today. Thanks, so Elise. Thank you, guys. We're lucky because some of us only got one love. Only got one life. One me in the night. But I've got two really good friends here today. Thanks, so Elise. thank you, guys. Apparently, uh, Bruce is live right now. He's uh, counter-programming us. Good for him. Was that good or bad? Good I mean, for well, you. Why did you tell people to go to Bruce Green's Twitch. Yeah. Twitch.tv slash Bruce Green. Yeah. Uh, but since that's been plugged on official Bruce property, that means Bruce now owns Twitch.tv slash Bruce Green. So oh, no. he didn't that, do it though. We did it. Yeah. Does that mean that we took Bruce's Twitch away from him? Oh, yeah. Yeah. We Bruce don't. Now. No. <laughs> Sorry about that, Bruce. Sorry, bud. Do you think that if we at some point stopped doing GTA races and then just started playing Sonic and All Stars Racing Transformed, oh, anyone notice? would notice? No. And then we'd be playing Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transform. I'm just saying. Let's try it out next week. I'm Call it saying. not GTA about, funny moments. All right. Here's here's what we do. It's going to take about a year. Uh -huh. um, we we just do GTA, right? But in the bottom, just like two pixels by two pixels, we got a little Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transform down there. She, uh, Alana can be playing GTA, and we're over here playing That's Sonic. a great idea. And Fine. then as time goes on, just make it a little bit bigger, oh. a little bit bigger, yeah. a little bit bigger. No one's going to notice. 50 videos later, it's the full screen. Hey, you know what we should do? Portability, we should bring in our Wii U's and just play it off that. Oh my god, the Wii U. Oh my, my yeah, my, my Wii U's like uh, the toys from Toy Story that you forget about. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's just sitting in the closet going, Adam, what about me today? Uh, uh, I know, I'm why jacking it. it. <laughs> why is it not firing? Mm. You, uh, I don't know. I do Wait, have what rockets. You, which yeah, button right are you pressing? I'm pushing, pushing in the thumbsticks. Left stick. Left stick. Press it. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. Oh, 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 oh. At what cost? Yeah. At what that cost? That jet wash gotcha. <laughs> Apparently we've also played this map. I don't care! <laughs> it's It's been 25 years! Who cares? You don't salt. watch it for the new maps! It'll be Sonic next time. <laughs> we promise. I'm telling you, we just keep labeling it GTA <laughs> funny moments, but then do some other beat-em-up game. Occasionally and then... overlay some GTA mm, footage, yeah. so it's not clickbait. Just do a fighting game. We'll just do Dragon Ball Fighters. We'll go online, Dude. throw that under there, Dude. and then we'll talk about what Whatever we want to while we're playing Dragon Ball, mm -hmm. and then we'll do Sonic and All Stars Racing, Whoops. and then we'll do that. Talk mm -hmm. about whatever we want to. Label it GTA Funny Moments. It'd be the same thing. <laughs> Upload it. Dragon what do you think the the Sonic community is like to play with online? Do you think they're Desperate. friendly or they're insane? Uh, I, I played a little online. Uh, they mostly have bad internet connections. I can see that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a there's a particular streamer I watch and I can't tell how old she is, which may be part of it, but uh, that came out weird. Anyway, uh, her stream's not very good, but all she plays is Sonic <laughs> games, uh, and I really like it because she really likes Sonic. Are you doing a takedown? Oh, like, yeah, no, I think uh, this is a roast. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm just stating for facts sure, here. Her streams aren't very good. The facts are all just very negative. It's not my fault. <laughs> They're not good because it's like it it like freezes every second for a whole second, so you only get every other second of Sonic Adventure or Have whatever. Have you she thought about donating so that she can buy some better equipment? I'm just. I'm, I'm not. I'm not getting in there. I just. I just mm -hmm. think her love of Sonic is pure, and I want to support it. Okay. Uh, you know how sometimes okay. like streamers will have their wish list. Like, if you 
you want to support me, here are the things that I'm like saving up for or whatever. Yeah. One of hers is like a, a toddler's cat piano or, the, <laughs> like, or one of those things that looks like a lawnmower but has just balls <laughs> up. Lord's is like, oh, you know, yeah. she could be yeah. 20, 25, maybe. <laughs> Somebody's on right. Amazon wish list yeah. and she's got that one carpet that looks like a city. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I love those. I love those. Wooden cars. Mm. We should start a website for babies to stream. Baby oh, streaming. Isn't that YouTube? <laughs> Got it! <laughs> so, okay, I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm. So they, the the games, games, yeah. those guys, they made that case. It's like a briefcase. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You take it with you, but they made a streamer version. Yes, I saw so that. So we make a baby monitor that's also uh, mm -hmm. a stream Live machine. Yeah. yeah. Great. This is a good idea. Watch my baby. Like you, can get, you know the thing where the babies lie on their back and they just like see lights and things that make noise or yeah. lie there for 12 hours going, this is the greatest thing in the world? Yeah. Imagine if you could have your chat donate to have this light, red light flash or whatever. Mm -hmm. It sounds like it's approaching some, uh, some like Clockwork Orange re-education yeah. stuff. I don't think well, you, I mean, no, no, it's just no. a toy. It's just, oh, the bell's ringing, oh, but you're like, oh, I did that. All it take, if you give, the internet, the ability to blink a light, they uh -huh. will teach a baby to be racist with it. Quick question. <laughs> what do we do about all the pedophiles that will be watching that content? Hmm, let the free market sort it out. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Capitalism works. <laughs> if, if society deemed that that was a problem, they would yeah. stop supporting those babies. Everyone should have to pay oh, back yeah, their dubbed. society by pay back their debt to society by, by streaming, streaming everything. Yeah, that's they the do. only way. Wow, that's some Black Mirror shit right Can there. Can you stream yeah. from prison? No, not yet. Man, I can't wait. Let's sell um, that. The second you can stream from prison, I'm gonna get arrested. I mean, they are mostly private yeah. in the U.S. I can see them Here, going for it. Yeah, here's the other thing, Lawrence. Oh. I, have, I have zero proof to back this up, but Excellent. I believe it. because I think most things in the world have happened or at least been <laughs> talked about. In some Thanks, reality, <laughs> that was awesome. Appreciate that. <laughs> some streaming service took a meeting with a private prison and said, "What if?" Yeah, and they said there. it was nice meeting you. Thank you what for your time. What are they doing all day? Push-ups, stabbing yeah. each other. What if they were playing Halo? I'm still ninth. God, how long until America's GDP is just baby streams? I give it five years. That sounds about right. Depends who we're good enough. This sucks, guys. We're not going to be babies for the baby revolution. Yeah. I would be such a good baby streamer. I just want to see the first baby vlog. Like, hey fam, whatever, hit that bell yeah, or that bottle subscribe. for you. <laughs> whatever it is. Well, Lana, you got to be careful. Please buy me a train. Oh no, you're going to start attracting a weird audience when talking like that. Nah. Is that a thing? Baby uh, talk. Nah. I mean, yeah. I <laughs> I'm going to start attracting a weird audience now. <laughs> Oh yeah, DDLG. Mm-hmm. Yep. DDLG. Where it's basically adult babies. They dress up in diapers and like have cots. Yeah. Oh yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that. Oh, we yeah. can tie it all together. Baby first. That's the intersection of all good yeah, things. You said DDLG. Yeah, oh. that's something to do with the name of the community. Well, I thought it was B. It's, it's Big Daddy Little Girl. Oh, B D L G. B D G. Yeah, that, yeah, that sounds right. Oh, okay. Because right, right now it sounds like an Olympic fuck. sport. I mean, it is. When is fucking kinking out going to be an Olympic sport? Fuck. Just like, how many can you stack all at the same time? Shove beef jerky in my mouth while you spit on me and sit on my face. <laughs> oh, have we already played this map? Oh, I didn't know! <laughs> I uh, could get the gold. In the edited it. video, people people won't see the uh, the chat, so it's just Alana screaming <laughs> <laughs> into the void. Uh, apparently it's for Daddy Dom. That's Daddy? why it's DD. Oh. oh. So I got a question cool. for you guys. Cool, yeah. <laughs> Let's say, just for fun, mm. Funhouse video, we hire one of them, and it's like, okay, we're gonna... Adam, I don't mm. know why you, but definitely you. Yep. We're gonna put you in a diaper. We're gonna have you bottle fed. Do you think you'd, you'd try it just to see? Just no. to see? No. Yeah. Why no. not? Is what? it? Do you think it would debase you, or are you afraid that you'd actually really like it? Definitely not the second one. You sure? Okay. What? What is? What? So what do I have to do? You. I'm not dressing up <laughs> as a baby fucking, and wearing a diaper. I'm not doing that. Baby. <laughs> okay, but what if you did? I'm. I'm definitely not doing that. Why not? Um, oh, I need you to do this. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think not a day goes by the whole thing. <laughs> that I don't wake up and think, thank God my kink is plain, boring, regular sex. Yeah. <laughs> I do. It's it's wonderful. I, I, I feel for people who no, have yeah, like, maybe foot fetish. No, Every no, single no, morning yeah. I wake up and I go, thank God. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I I don't, don't need, need someone to crush my testicles today. Yeah. Yeah. I, don't, I don't watch Hellraiser and go, but what if? Yeah. Well, what? I watched, um, I watched. boy, I don't know. Being in the room with Stephanie opens me up to a lot of things. Mm. Okay. Um, there was like, there were this couple who got addicted to coffee enemas. 
Like they had like five a day. Mm -hmm. um, and Yikes. it was like, the lady was super into it and the dude was like, okay, I'll try it. And the second he did, it was like, oh my God, the gates have opened literally and figuratively. Mm -hmm. Now I need this five times a day. And I'm just, I'd rather live in a cave than understand that there's some what weird thing I have to shove in my butt to feel happy. What does it do to you? Oh, uh, well, so here's how it works and I'm glad you've asked. Uh, you <laughs> brew a lot of coffee. Assumption. Okay. That you wait now. for it to cool off, like room temperature, or actually body temperature. You have a tube in that bucket. Okay. You shove the other end of the tube in your ass. Okay. You go okay. the bucket up. <laughs> The pressure forces it up into your there, yeah, intestine and your colon. And mm -hmm. then you pop the tube off and, and sit on the toilet there. as fast as you can because it's going to, quote, come rushing right out of you. Yeah. I remember that phrase explicitly. Are you explicitly. fucking okay. kidding me? No, I'm not, eggs. Alana. It is a dream come true. Oh. Um, so not only does, like, your body absorb the caffeine through the delicate tissues in your, your butt tube. Okay. Uh, but, uh, so basically you're so just the, getting a caffeine hit directly through your anus, so thus it is pure. stronger. Okay. Digestive acids are always a barrier between you and truly enjoying things. How are we going to you in this diaper. I've done a colonic twice, maybe once. 50 times. Did the second one like barely count? <laughs> it was like a punch card that I got for a Christmas gift. And I'm like, well, you got three free ones. That's and a I nice think Christmas gift. It's pretty Who gave you that? Who do you think? Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Look, the thing I didn't like, and I'm pretty sure I've told you What this if I gave before. you a punch card? That's Sorry fine. to interrupt. That's what if right. I gave you a punch card for uh, one hour? Mm. And you can wear a diaper, mm -hmm. and then somebody comes in and treats you like a baby, and bottle feeds you. You really want that? You know what my kink is in right now? You know what I? You know what I did? The dive I took. Yeah. I typed in '90s. There's a treasure trove of movies I never got to watch. There's something about VHS tracking that is very like. It's, I don't know what it, it's it something tickles. about it being softer. Yeah, it looks like it looks a little more real. Well, there's still a story there. It's like I'm King Triton and I must. Here are my get with bone. You were just watching Little Mermaid. <laughs> Did you hear Guy Fieri said he would be Ursula in the yeah, Little Mermaid movie? Good for him. Good for Guy Fieri. <laughs> I, what does he do? I want to see him on he a goes weekend. To, he goes to three different town. kinds of places. <laughs> Um, diners, dives, and drive-ins. Drive yeah. <laughs> and he consumes the food there with his hands. Yeah. The Xbox is on. Hey, Alana. What's up? Do you ever leave your Xbox on overnight to get an achievement? Any achievement? Yes. Nice. Game show idea. But then there's a huge bin of games. So you just go digging. Uh -huh. Like you go, go! And then both of you just go digging, and then you What's just try, grab the game and. Here. All right, all right, all right. Here, okay, 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 okay. okay. All right, okay. Bin, I'm down with. Maybe, maybe an arena like the end of Video Power. You have a Velcro suit. Just spit on. However, okay. you've got you got your co-driver, your co-gamer. They're back in a booth somewhere, uh -huh. and all they have is a stack of official Xbox magazines uh -huh. and a headset. Oh, okay. so they have so they're like flipping through, trying to tell oh. you what to do. Uh -huh. They're giving you the tips, but That's they got to find them in a physical magazine. Nice. The only problem is that I feel like you said Velcro suit and Nintendo Power, but I believe that was Johnny. Wasn't that Johnny Video Arcade. Power? Video Power. Power. Yeah. 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 You almost embarrass yourself. You almost embarrass yourself. I, you almost embarrass yourself. I, this part here where James said that Lawrence said Nintendo Power, he did say Video Power. Oh, I know. Patrick. Quite on set. Quite on set. Because I, I, I mean, I heard what you said, but I was just so distracted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your eyes shot going here. Uh, Pupils uh, dilate, your blood vessels explode. Totally blame. I have a better, oh. better version of the show. This is called Wood Rock. It's like a kind of a small arena where you can get pistols. Everyone but I guess starts with a golf club, and you hit the person. This cool. is probably the first time we've ever played this yeah. map. It doesn't look familiar yeah. at all. We may have talked to you about this before, Alana, but have you ever seen Video Power? Video Power. No. Oh, so good. good. What is video company. power? It it's, was a video game game show. Well, it started first as a yeah. First, it was a news show hosted by Johnny Arcade. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right. Now that's video power. And it was just video game news, but then they were like, it. "No, this sucks." So then they turned it into a game show. Video warriors on your mark. Grab those controllers, please. Get set, guys. Good luck to all four of you. Go! All right. Once again, time to hit the road with a load of toads. Now get a load of these toads, because he Bibble's in big trouble. It's Rash and Zitz to the rescue as we roll into this game. The kid who won got to go. He basically wore a Velcro suit 
and ran through a makeshift game store. Mm. And you basically would do laps around this game store in 60 seconds. Right. Anything that stuck to you or you carried out, you were allowed <laughs> to keep. What? <laughs> what happened there? Oh. Hack, hack yeah, it. It was Why awesome. did you get a call? It, it was great because you know how, like, right now everyone's trying to figure out how to make an esports show for mm-hmm. TV or trying to make video. Because, like, it's never going to work. And they no. did it. Johnny Arcade did it. No, but yeah, exactly. They did it and they redid the show three times, I think. It was yeah. twice. It, Oh, Season yeah. one was a failure because yeah. all they did was talk about games, and then they also had a cartoon featuring uh, the t- like k- the Attack of the Killer Tomatoes tomato, mm-hmm. uh, a guy from Narc, a guy from like oh yeah Arch Rivals, That's and right. one other thing that no one cares about. Yeah. yeah. That was a good shot. But one of these kids' games that was on a video game show had mm-hmm. like an eye toy type game where they would like move their hands. Yeah, that. Mm-hmm. That, so that was Nick. Ar- the end that of Nick, Nick Arcade, Arcade was the kids get sent into the game. Corey, it's not my friend. All right, he is off. He's over the first one like a pro. Down. All right. Oh, got nipped in the head. Where they have to beat three levels and no one ever did <laughs> that and, and would, never would in a thousand yeah, years. Yeah, because kids right. are bad and should feel but, bad. Well, it's basically you're like a weatherman. You're standing on a green screen and looking at a small CRT monitor yeah. like to try and decipher where people actually are. Right. And then they send a thousand obstacles at you, and every time you get hit, it takes away a life point. Mm-hmm. And they're like, "You lost." And they go, "Where am I?" Yeah. My favorite part is there's always a moment in every single episode where the kid doesn't know they've lost yet, <laughs> and they have to go, "You're done. You're done." Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, 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 they, no, 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 no. Jesus. Yeah. Pipple's in big trouble. It's rations. It's for the rescue. GTA author map. Or a map author, chill it with the fucking sniper rifles, please. He's not listening. It yeah. ruins every He's test match map I've ever played. He's unless I'm it. the one who has it, and then I have all the He's fun. He's just finishing the first video we made on this map where I went, oh, what a good time we're all yeah. having. Wow, yeah. what a good fun. I'm so glad they enjoyed my map. You come back here. You do have five kills, though. So Garb! But Axel probably has 30. Can you dodge a melee? You can dodge punches, and then you get to do a sick combo, but I don't mm-hmm. know if you can do that with melee. Here's the thing, so Lauren. So you can do it. I'll yeah. tell you how to well, do uh, it. It doesn't make a difference. It does work. Yeah, just try it. <laughs> Not your finest work. My time is over now. I hope you guys enjoyed those sick gamer plays. You are the new Johnny Arcade. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, one of these days I'm hoping in some scummy bar in LA I'll run into him and buy him a tequila shot and he's like, thanks. And take knocks him back dead. and he's like, <laughs> <laughs> Johnny Arcade sat a specific way. Does everyone remember how he sat? I mean, no. yeah, he would he would always oh, throw his shit up because right. he would always be on the couch and he'd throw his leg up over he's the arm. Always had yeah. his leg up. Oh yeah, there's there's our hero. Yeah, there, look at his leg. He's kind of cute. Yeah. Oh, he's well, super cute. That, that image, streamboat. that top image, is his, his current day arcade. He had he had loads of attitude. Did You'd he turn into him. a mob boss? What do you think the 2010 to 2020 fashion staple <laughs> would be? Garbage hipsters, like the the man bun type shit. Oh, man oh. bun for sure. But I'm more like Mumford and Sons uh, assholes that were like wear like wax mustaches. Oh. And wireframe glasses you and think that'll be straw the, hats. I don't know anyone who actually dead. dresses like that. Well, I mean, that's the thing, though. No one actually dressed like the most extreme. It's just a couple of idiots yeah, did it, I and it came uh, to define we the era. We might not be in the right places. I don't know that L.A. is the place for hipsters. I don't know that L.A. is the place for hipsters. I don't know that L.A. is the place for hipsters. Alan, I have a theory. I want to test this out on you. Mm. I think that I think that the age we're in now is the YouTuber look, uh, the influencer look. So, okay. dudes with very pretty eyes, your Markipliers and what have you. Dudes with very good voices, something deep and resonant, your Markipliers and what okay, have you. Okay, you're really into Markipliers. I guess I'm just describing Markipliers. He is the perfect. Man. I think he's very handsome. Yeah, I agree. Let me speak for you, 14 year old ladies in chat. Oh, they're here. Uh, yeah, they're. <laughs> we don't have oh. any of those in our audience. Well, I think I think ring lights and like webcam YouTube videos have made really pretty expressive eyes. Interesting. So it's out. fake. I mean, I mean, it's dressed up, but when it's is always it been fake. Yeah. Oh, that's just obvious. That's a good stretch. That was a Johnny Arcade right there. <laughs> Leg over there, armchair. Yeah. You got him. You got him. You got him. You got him. Yes. Do girls think that Jake Paul and Logan Paul are hot? Yeah. They do. I mean, they they may not find them like. It's probably one of those, like, he's big and dumb, and I take him to bed just to see what happens, but I'm not going to take him Classic home to mom. 14-year-old girl thoughts. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you know. I, don't know. I will take them to I, bed. I, mean, he's, I always like to... jacked, and they're, like, kind of childish, so I, I think it yeah. works. I always like okay. to reference the person that my adult mother had a crush on. <laughs> Boy George. <laughs> mm, your mom had some women interesting are com- we, Women are complex creatures. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, you know who I like? That Liberace. Mm-hmm. There's something about him. I bet he takes all the women yeah. to bed. I think women are more into the, uh, the, uh, the headspace of it. So like Twilight, it's more about the uh, circumstance of the relationship than it is about how the dude looks. Al- sure. Alana, if you could not add your opinion Sorry. to yeah, this, if you could just yeah. stop talking entirely. <laughs> I think women like this particular. That's enough. That's <laughs> enough. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't know why we're even listening to this. <laughs> 
Speaking of working in coal mines, so uh, as I brought up a lot, I'm exposed to a lot of, of true crime TV. Mm. Snapped uh, was was the du jour last night. Uh, however, I did see an ad for Bud Light, except Bud Light on Snapped, obviously targeting women. And uh, Bud Light typically, it's like, oh, you've been working in the coal mines all day, America's hot land. And it's like yeah. dudes like rubbing sweat and shit mm. from their face and they clink. This was a woman comes home from work and it's like this long thing of her taking off her bra and cracking open a Bud Light. And I'm like, mm. awesome. They did it. They found a way to like make a rough comparison there about America's hot land. But it was cutting intentional? out a long day work, like snapping off your bra. Thing? Huh? So I, how? I got. I, <laughs> Don't kill yourself. Drink a Bud Light. I was having this discussion. I guess this is more rare than I thought it was. Did anyone else have a babysitter that locked them out of the apartment when they no. were young? What? Okay. Wow. I never had a babysitter. That's yeah. child My abuse. My sister babysat me. I mean, is it child abuse if it's not your kid? Guys, Red Baron's a woman now. I already brought that up, but I'm still impressed. Whom? Red Baron, the oven pizza thing. Oh. Wow. She's a lady now. What are you talking about? Red Baron. Oh, sorry. That's this... not historically accurate. Yeah, this not... might be a North American what thing. What does so... he drive a tank? <laughs> For some reason, I thought cool. the yeah. Red Baron was a Nazi. Yeah, sorry. It's just okay, like... it makes Baron. I'm... That's in German. And red. Yeah, the red part. So it was always kind of weird. They're like, enough time's gone by. Have a Nazi pizza. Yeah. Do you guys? Yeah. Re do you guys remember? There's a short-lived cartoon toy crossover series called Ring Raiders. No, oh, sounds that familiar. sounds terrible. It Wait. was awesome. They were Did they have planes. holograms in their chests? No, they, oh. it was planes. But the toys were you would wear like rings on your finger, and then they would be planes. So you go like shoo and That's fly cute. them around. Okay. But there was a cartoon that accompanied it, and one of the guys his 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 backstory was that he had had a showdown with the Red Baron. Oh. That was his thing. And there's one point where he's fl flying in the storm and he's like, CURSE YOU REED BARON! <laughs> I haven't thought about yeah. that in a while, but you guys said Red Baron and made me think of that guy with oh, the big burly mustache who hated the Red this, Baron. That's all good. I, I saw a clip from Star Trek the other night where Mark Twain's yelling at one of the crews like, What do you mean you don't just take what you want? Oh, <laughs> Mark yeah. Twain? Yeah, because the holodeck episodes were A+. Oh, plus. Oh, Can you do me a favor real quick God before we uh, end this Morpheus episode? Robin yes, no! Shift tab, Ring Raiders, Red Baron. We are canceling the apocalypse! Now let's jerk that monster off! Are you clap syncing? Hang on. Uh, I'm gonna hit profile. Oh, fought. Fought? Nope. Okay, yep. I'm gonna go down to panic stations. One, two, three. You guys are editing. Oh, man. I thought he'd never leave. Yeah, now that John's gone, we can finally talk shoot about him. <laughs> now we can have a normal gameplay. Get out of here! I'm actually gonna make you play this. I would love to. I, yeah, I feel like... The one. Do you think we should oil these? Debauchery Viagra. Oh wait, no. I, I'm the best. You gotta I'm get gonna win. Seventh. It I'm is the being best. Streamed. I'm gonna win. I'm the best. I'm gonna win. And then go. Yes. Nice. All right. There nice. we go. Friday. That's today. how I roll. Yep. Tacos well, and tequila. I had a really long week because. Just my allergies have been really bad. I have allergies well, all the time. This, are you okay this week? No, not particularly. I'm worried that someone got a cat in my building and now uh, I'm just fucked. Oh, up. that dander could be that. That's what I'm worried about. And are you allergic to cats? Super allergic. Yeah, like I can't too. be in the same room as a cat. Um, the only other thing that I'm allergic to is adhesive tape. <laughs> I don't think I've encountered really? any of that no. recently. It's not <laughs> like when you to be there when you found that out. <laughs> <laughs> you know what really helps for migraines and allergies and stuff is uh. Going to radioactive chicken head concerts. I heard that. Yeah, I thought, no, you're not the plug first person to tell me that. <laughs> yeah. I'm always so torn because I, I would love to promote my stuff via, like, I guess the Funhouse social media name that people know, but I, I'm afraid of crossing uh, that side of John with oh, this side of John. Me. Well, the people, the the world deserves to meet that person, John. It's, I mean, it's ultimately uh, you're gonna want to uh, press Y. Okay. Hold Thank it. Thank you very much. Oh, reset. Uh, y. I'm the best. The outside of Funhouse Alana is the exact same as the inside of Funhouse Alana, <laughs> so I don't have that issue. But mm -hmm. I wouldn't be worried about it. If you want to get your work out there, just do it. Unless it's porn. Well, then we then really want to know. Maybe don't. <laughs> then you really want to do that. You, well, you have to go to the movie then you're to see required it. to bring that in. My porn name is Long John Silver. Excellent. Oh, perfect, all right. Big pirate porn. <laughs>
I just like bailed out of my car. <laughs> well, now you got to run the whole time. Uh, he might be lost. I just got some deja vu. This seems very familiar. That's weird that you have a deja vu because I've never been last before in a race. So it's like weird. Oh, you know oh I had to watch the video last time they play, played this map. That's what it was because I had to make the thumbnail. Okay. Was it this exact same map? Yes. Fuck. <laughs> I think by any objective measure, I'm doing fucking awesome. How do I shoot rockets? Just wait till you find someone. Boom. Thumbstick. Nope. <laughs> Wrong thumbstick. Oh, no. <laughs> you gotta be specific, Alana. I think I don't remember. I think it's the left. Yeah, I have get two canine thumbs. complex. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, uh, someone got you But you did get I him. Did, I did get Wait. him. Wait. I wasted someone. Oh, nine canine complex. You yeah, fuck. I think you maybe rocketed each other. It's all good. You, you're probably gonna lose, so. Don't. Uh, Holy shit, that was a really good hit. Nice. <laughs> Is that he just was... sitting there waiting for me to yes. respawn? Yes. They tend to do that. Yes. <laughs> they target specifically. I hate that person. Uh, JP Mac, for the record, I don't watch videos. I am in either. I do not watch <laughs> videos <laughs> aside from when I'm screening them. Oh, man, I had to edit a video one time that I was in. Oh, that was a nightmare. Yeah, it's surreal. I can't do it. <laughs> you know, I think nice. like I, I you, often leave the note that is uh, mute Alana's mic. And I wonder if that's <laughs> yeah. because I'm more harsh on myself than I am on it. So I'm like, shut up, Alana. <laughs> I watch the videos I'm in only once, just for the sake of the th thumbnail, but I do not, uh, I don't read the comments or anything like that because I'm just I'm paranoid. I don't want to start like changing things. I want to just be my authentic office self. I hear that. Sure. Uh, and so I don't want to read something and then start like subconsciously changing myself. Also, I don't want to see racist shit. I don't. I don't think there is. Our community is so fantastic. But just in case, yeah, I'm the opposite. I read pretty. I watch like every video. <laughs> I watch and I read all the comments. I know Bones watches all the Funhouse videos. That's his fucking job. <laughs> 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 Anytime I get to put like black culture references and, and shit, I like to go back and watch it to see if, who caught it or who's just curious now. Yeah, like, what right. was that yeah. thing? So, or like whenever I put the songs in, I'm just like, oh, who enjoyed the song? So, yeah. I, like yeah. stuff that I'm not in that I got to be really creative on, I love to go back, I read the comments. But if I'm in it, hell no. When it comes to comments, like I sometimes get people tell me that I'm like boring or too tired all the time because I'm monotone and my defense is always, I'm no different to Adam. <laughs> I just <laughs> yeah. noticed because I'm a girl. I think that's what it is. Yeah, I fucked uh, up. Or they tell me, that I don't look good enough, and for that, I have literally stopped wearing makeup at Funhouse. I did the opposite of what they want. Don't let them change you, Alana. I guess that's the part of the culture that I don't quite understand, and may maybe I should not spend time trying to understand it. It's uh, just interesting. The culture of people saying girls don't play video games? Because you do play a lot of games. Uh, I don't play games not. at all. As that's you can all tell I from any video I'm ever in, I'm I, do. <laughs> I feel like I probably play more than anyone else in the office. Maybe Jacob. I'm good at Tetris and Goldeneye. That's it. That is a really cool bike. This is super cool. Yeah, I'm still on that shit where it's like, as far as online comments go, like, oh if I don't God, like it, I just kind of keep man. moving. That's why I say I read them all, but, you know, because I am confident in myself enough. You to are. Know I think that if I read my, a comment that says, Ryan, you fucking suck. Get the fuck out of here. You're fucking annoying. Go back to Tennessee. I just say, you know what? I do like Memphis. Different stroke for different folks. <laughs> I'm sure there's someone right now like, that fucking man bun, get the fucking pansy haircut out of here or whatever. But again, if it's said with aggression, it means they want to fuck you. Yeah, that's what I do. I comment back, I go, you just want to fuck me, isn't it? See, look, DJ just said, yeah, Ryan, you suck. Fuck you, DJ. I'm not paying attention to that. That's not getting in my head at all. God, oh my God, fuck me, dude. I had to look up the world's biggest penis for today for a joke in a video, uh, and I feel bad for that guy. Also, like, I think it gives him... Like he gets dizzy because of the blood. Yeah. Yeah. That's fucked up. Wait, we're talking about the person with the biggest dick or something? Yeah, yeah. in the world. Yeah. And how big are we talking? And you're there. I think it was like 13 inches or something like that. It's just, it's 13 inches. That seems short for the biggest dick in the world. Are we talking 13 erect? Or uh, I don't know. No, I didn't read too I much an article because I just is. needed So that the... would be, it's even longer then. Jonah Falcon. Jonah. It's yeah, there we go. 34 centimeters long when erect. When erect. All right. We Foot can probably show an that. Inch and a half. Oh! <laughs> That's not him. That guy has He's the biggest white? dick? Yeah. Well, where's the dick? There you go. That's pretty sizable. And how I expected the biggest dick in the world to be... Bigger? Bigger. See, yeah, how can one wine bottle hide the biggest dick in the world? This, you know, that, one. this, this guy This dick is massive. Half a meter. See, that's yeah, 50 th centimeters. That seems crazy. Why is it wrapped like a Quizno sub? Yeah, so this one is 18.9 inches. There we go. I'm way more impressed. Okay, but wait, you're so saying he people... Jonathan. There's people that are are like... There's conspiracy theorists about this dick. I don't know how they confirm it, but I guess it's not well, adjudicated or whatever. Half meter dick man, go through the right bureaucratic process to get your record recognized by the world, okay? Your accomplishment well, needs yeah. to be recognized. It's you can't let Jonah Falcon take the cred. Yeah. He's getting all that big dick clout. 
which should be yours. Roberto, Roberto Esquivel Cabrera. Cabrera. That sounds like the guy who has the biggest dick in the world. <laughs> Wait a minute. I guess he just has a ton of foreskin, but his what? dick is just six what? regular six inches. What? <laughs> his dick is normal size? And you then imagine? that's all foreskin? How long he's got to roll that up? Wait, foreskin doesn't count? When the fuck? Who made that rule? It's a part of your dick. Mm. If it's on your dick. No, I feel like foreskin is a part of your dick, but I don't think you can count your foreskin when it comes to length, because then dudes no. could be out there stretching. Sure they can. Yeah. When they measure. Yes. Sorry, Ryan. No. Your dick's You're, you're, you're making up the dick it measuring only rules as you talk. What you have when you're erect. Right. But from the we, base but to the tip. From the base. But the tip includes the foreskin. Nah, man. Get that. Get that thing snipped. Don't have your dick look like a cigar. Dude, you guys are un <laughs> you're <laughs> screwing this guy out of his record. <laughs> he's wearing a Grand Theft Auto Five shirt. Hey, look oh, at that. Look how he connected oh. it. It seems like he's just trying to live his life uh, as a normal guy, and he just happens. He's he was blessed and cursed with the lo longest dick. He's going on fucking HuffPost Live to talk about it. Oh my God, have you guys seen the final member? Mm -mm. A lot. Have you seen it? No. Oh, it's a documentary about the world's only penis museum. All right. It's awesome, and it's a, and the, in the documentary, this guy has every penis from every animal in the world, uh, uh, <coughs> but except one, the human being. So he's trying to find the one person who will donate their penis. I mean, I would if I had one. Most of this video is now going to be not John here, but the dick talk. Wait, someone said hey, Ryan sounds like an angry incel. I'm going to beat the shit out of that person. Where do you live? Yeah, how do you say the word John with a hard H? John. Yeah, it's like you're a Russian friend. John. That's what I want my lover to whisper to me in the bedroom. Just say my John. name with a hard H. John. All right, truce. Um, I didn't say truce. <laughs> I didn't agree to a truce. One, two, three. Perfect. <clears throat> Perfecto. Perfecto. For the Latin American community. Sorry, Latini. <laughs> That's right. I'm trying to push Latinx is the gender neutral mm. currently, but I feel like that was made mm. up by a white person. That's mm. fine. Love languages, they use vowels. So I think Latini is the new. This sounds like pasta, though. Speaking of pasta. I heard that there was the Pastafarian is here. Do you know who that is? Oh, really? What's no. the Pastafarian? He's the gu lead guitar player for the famous band, the Radioactive Chicken Heads. The, the Legends of Poultry Rock. Well, let me go get him. Rock. Wait, so this is a real thing? I was really just talking about pasta. Pasta! Quinky dink. Oh, who's that? Could do it be not the come bar? in. You might. He probably can't do the door code. In his costume, I mean, what? Does it's definitely real. Someone talk about pasta in here? <laughs> oh, whoa! What's going on, man? <laughs> it's me, the pasta farian, dude. Uh, hey, hey buddy. Where's did Ryan, you... man? Yeah, where did Ryan go? Uh, he, I don't know. I just heard pasta, and I came, dude. We got a special guest today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, wh how do you feel about pasta, pasta farian? Oh! Okay. There's a specific smell coming off of you right now. How would you describe it? <laughs> hmm, kind of herby. Maybe d dank. A little, a little dank. dank. Yeah. What are you guys? I mean, I smelled it before you came in. Someone in the chat said the Pastafarian is hot. Another person said this seems highly racist. <laughs> what the fuck are they talking about? It's okay because I'm here, so I guess that <laughs> it cancels out the racism. It cancels out. Not, yes. I'm a are fucking chicken. What are we riff? playing today, Lana? Okay. Uh, this is a last man standing. Uh, called Sumo Sixty. Something, 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 because nobody's good at naming these. Well, this isn't going well. This isn't. Ooh. No, you got it. Just do a U turn. You think? Just do a U turn. Oh, yeah, you, you got, got this. it. You back think? Up, back up, go in reverse. And perfect. All right, that well. That was fun, all right. Uh, what? No, I thought you were going to stay here this whole time. Oh, <laughs> she died. I thought that was it, man. We do have some questions for you, though, bud, because um, I don't I don't, I don't, want the Funhouse audience to think that, like, all we do is gimmick gameplays and, like, you know, we just get in costumes just to make jokes. What you're, costume are you talking about? You're a you know, real chicken in a real band, correct? Cluck, yeah, I am. <laughs> what? Cluck, yeah, I am, bro. You heard me. That He's wasn't. Play. You didn't answer the question. What's the cluck in question? What kind of music do you The inside of your mouth is <laughs> Oh, thanks, dude. John, I'm okay. I'm poultry fine. rock, I'm really, man. Really, really John. Poultry rock. rock. Yes. What does okay. that mean exactly? It's like punk rock with chickens and stuff. I might make it this time, maybe, maybe. You got it. You got it. I believe in you. I believe in you. No, and we got. Oh! If you just is believe this what yourself. I'm supposed to do, though? Why are you? You chose this map. <laughs> this is one of the. Tell us what to do. Oh. Listen. Like, I won. Good oh, shit. Good job. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. So it was getting into that hole. You always win when you get in the hole. The lead singer okay. is Carrot cool. Top. 
Then we got Rock and Robin. We got Birdbrain. We got Franken Chicken. Wait, I said, are you deaf, radioactive pasta man? I don't got ears. <laughs> are you telling me? That Carrot Top is the lead singer of your band? Yes, Carrot Top. No relation to the comedian you know. What? A, a real carrot. I think a real carrot's better than Carrot Top any day. So his name Not is Carrot Top. that bullshit comedian, that stupid, that guy who just wears stupid props and costumes uh -huh. all the time. Mm -hmm. We're real. But I really am trying to establish that this is a real thing that... Ryan oh. uh, is doing tonight. Music. I've been looking for him. He's not here. You want to beat him I up? I thought he just sent you in here. Yeah. No, I just heard people talking about pasta, and I came kind of like, you know, when the mailman and Pee Wee Herman comes. What? It's like in the movie theater? You know what I'm talking when about. When Pee Wee Herman jacked up oh. the movie no, theater? No, no, not that kind of come. Wait, yes, did he? we know about that yeah. at the farm. Oh, yeah, that's why how he got in... Legal trouble, right? Or just yeah. like got a show canceled? Wait, so he just masturbated in a movie theater? And oh, I think it was in one it of those old, uh, movie yeah, theater. one of those old it was school a porn, porn ones. Movie Wait, hold up, movie. you're not allowed to masturbate at those? That's what it's my the stupidest thing. It's the dumbest rule. So it's, then, it's what's like, the point? The point is, is you're not allowed to pleasure yourself in public, Alana. So pastafarian. Yeah. What's up, John? Um, are you like? Do you have a love interest in your life? See, I have. I'm on the coop. App, really, what can right? It's quest. like the human Tinder, except it's called uh -huh. coop. And you, you rate how many kernels of corn out of five? Uh huh. It's like for bestiality? No, it's for chickens. Just for chickens. Oh. You Don't fucking chickens. bigot. But you're not a. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> you chicken bigot. It's hard to make eye contact with you and not <laughs> scream internally. Who are some of your musical inspirations? I love people in Guar. I love people in Rosemary's Billy Goat. I like people in the Aquabats. Hey. What about, uh, like, Bob Bucky? Marley? Is he in a cool and costume? And then A to eject to your parachute and you're trying yeah, to land so. in the middle of that platform. I love Bob platform. Marley. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> yeah. You're gonna need to go down. Nah. What about Eco Mouse? <laughs> Who the fuck is Eco Mouse? <laughs> I wanna get there, I'm gonna get there, no, I'm gonna get there, I'm gonna get there. Keep drop out. and driving. You're almost there. Oh, oh damn it. Oh, get oh, wasted. You, and you're in the water. Yeah. Yeah. Have any of you ever like said a phrase for a really long time and then realized you were using it wrong? When I was in like fifth or sixth grade, you know, uh, uh. In chicken school. Uh, so I, I thought blowjobs were like, you. When the uh, go someone bl blew on the on your penis, mm -hmm. uh -huh. you know, not I think I were, thought that too. Because it's the opposite. It's they're sucking. I don't know if you knew that. Usually, whenever I get a blowjob, the girl's like <laughs> 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 the whole time. That's what you would do to like a baby's belly. <laughs> yeah. Here you go, bud. Good. Good luck. Yep. Good cluck. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, oh dude! <laughs> I'm always looking for focus good on the cluck. game. Oh. My grandma is like 95. And she says avocado instead of avocado. Mm. Every time when I hit her in the face, that stupid old git. There's a lot of people in the South who will replace the TR in words with uh, like a CR. So instead of street, they'll say screet. Drives me fucking insane. Really? Cool. Yeah. Uh, a lot of Americans say I could care less instead of I couldn't care less. And that one drives me kind of crazy. Because you mean, yeah, no, yeah, it is, is, uh, no, it means the literal opposite. Yeah, but one of them could be sarcastic. I could care less means... Oh, I can't. Or Facebook. you're saying, sarcastically, I could care less. I think they're just making a mistake. Yeah, they are making a mistake, <laughs> yeah. but that's what how language works. Am I just dead? You conversate. Yeah, you're, you're dead. It's it's a lost man standing gameplay, which, uh, <laughs> Ryan, welcome to GTA. Um, yeah, teach you yeah, about, uh, sorry, Pasifarian. Dipshit. Or Fuck, man. Ugh. I wanted to play. Oh, my God. Here, wait. Hold on. <laughs> Can we kick Fuck. Magic Willy Wonka? They're cheating. Here. Oh, because the game doesn't end if they don't yeah. do the thing. Did you quit? Oh. Son of a fuck. <laughs> nice. We're never getting back in now. It, it was, was Ryan. John. Ryan's not in here. It was John. Give me this. You goddamn broke the I'm video game. Your chin. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're scary as fuck, pasta, I, pasta boy. Children love me. No one likes you, pasta oh. farian, especially People me. People fucking oh, love me. I'm it? the best member of the chicken heads. I bet you got a tiny chicken dick. <laughs> You take that back, my chicken dick is what huge kind of dicks do chickens have? Chicken I actually here you go. Someone take it. Someone take it. Got to Google oh, it. I'm on it. Go straight, straight into the hole. Well, no, you're gonna overshoot it a bit. Straight into the hole. Operation it. Oh. oh. I fucked it. So close. It is easiest if you do the U-turn strat that Jean Holland suggested earlier. There you go. Take a nice soft landing. Approach the hole slowly. Slide right in. Yeah. Up. Oh, uh, I have to leave for like ten minutes. I'll be back. Are you gonna? Are you another? Did he also bring a costume? What the fuck? Sometimes, 
Lunch doesn't agree with you. <laughs> you think he's gonna go take a shit? Oh, definitely. It's, it's gonna be a photo finish. Oh, uh, hey, you're playing. He's everywhere. Yeah. Oh, here I go. I'm about to be here regulating that bathroom soon. Okay. I'm inside the car. Okay. Yeah, you are. Press A. No, it's not gonna. Okay, go. And there you go. Go right for that. What's special delivery. delivery. Special what you delivery. got there? Just some um, Porto. Oh, awesome. yeah. That's why you asked what the time was. Former intern, Mr. Ramirez. Brought these in. What are they? Fuck? Got little chicken dicks. That is an exact the scale and size of my penis. Anyone want one? Yeah. I'll take I'll one. Take one. Um, mm. let's get let's get into the nitty gritty. What serious topics can we talk about? Healthcare. How about you know, like uh, what about hey, here? Let's. What about cultural appropriation? <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's talk about that. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that all these. Moana hello, Halloween costumes are appropriate. Oh. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right? Okay. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Who's with me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. You know, it's been a great right. time. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Pasifarian. Thanks for making that. me. Oh, wow. Get the fuck out You're of my here. my arch nemesis And never now. come I back. I hate you. All right. I love you, though. Oh, quack, 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 quack. I fucking hated that guy. <laughs> oh, dude. Took the longest shit. Oh, hey, oh my god, you missed the post far in. Oh, what? Oh. I missed what? 